19,000 plus once again filing into the building at Staples Center, Los Angeles Clippers. Their third home game of the young season going against the Cleveland Cavaliers. Cavaliers one and two in the year. Clippers are two and one. The Cavaliers a uh, game two of a six game road trip. Here's the way they will line up in this ball game tonight. It'll be Alonzo G at one forward. Tristan Thompson is the center as the power forward. Anderson Barajal, the center, a very young backcourt. Dion Waiters, the rookie and second year defending rookie of the year is Kyrie Irving, their head coach. He was CP3's head coach in New Orleans back in the day. Now the head coach, former player with the Lakers, former draft pick of the Clippers is Byron Scott. Well, you know the phrase, hit me, I'm open. Well, Karan Butler is saying that a whole lot these days and he leads the team in scoring in the first quarter with 6.3 points per game. And he's getting a lot of those shots going over you, Ralph. <laughs> I don't think we were pausing for a minute. That was almost spectacular. There's a basket and a foul at the other end and Cleveland is in the scorebook. So there's our first bucket by Kyrie Irving and he makes it a three point play. I talked to Vinny Del Negro before the ball game and I said, our team's making it more difficult on Blake Griffin. He said, yeah. He said, but I've been really proud of the way he's adjusted and his patience and the, his ability to find people. Waiters from outside. They're hoping against hope that he's their much needed number two scoring option. Luby Gibson is in for Waiters who's out with two fouls. Irving running left, firing and scoring. I'm telling you, he's averaging 24 points a game, throwing four rebounds, four assists, and he's 20. And off to Irving, hounded by Chris Paul, fires in his face and knocks down the three ball. That's a pretty gutsy play. He has 10 points against Chris Paul. Well, Chris loves to go, but he also loves to freeze you. Bye-bye. Oh, and Zeller comes over to help him block. And they got numbers. Gibson to Irving. Three ball, bingo. I I'm telling you what, he's the real deal. Zeller throws it down. Well, what they're doing right now is they're allowing Irving to play off the ball and play the two spot, let Gibson run the point, and showing the versatility of Irving. I'm, I'm telling you on what. fire. No, no, he's unreal. He has 16 first quarter points. You're talking about breathtaking offensive talent with a great handle and superb outside shooting. Oh, Irving oh. runs to the hole, into the corner, three balls, bingo. I'm telling you what, this guy, Deion Waiters, came off the bench in college for Syracuse, but that's not because he was a bench player. Jim Beheim just had his set group. He liked him coming off the bench because he was a scoring threat. Waiters is going to be a solid pro. Here goes Irving. Beautiful lead pass to Barajal. And I'll tell you this, most people might have shirked that opportunity to run full speed in that traffic. Irving didn't hesitate one second. Nothing happening here. Still now. I'm telling you, the guy statistically, his profile is, is that of like a, a Tyreek Evans or a Dwayne Wade. I don't know if he's going to be that, but at worst, he's going to be like a Marcus Thornton. This guy's going to be okay. Cross court to Waiters. Rise for three plus one. Yikes. The foul's on Willie Green. The third three ball of the game for Waiters. Waiters outside the arc. Tough shot. I mean, tough Bingo. shot. Ralph, he put that thing over his head from about 26 feet. That's his fourth three ball. He had four in their first three games. This guy is into it for sure. And, and he's like smiling, running down the floor. Waiters fifth three. He's got his third eight, of the period. 18 in this game. He had 17 in the opener. Waiters. Man, I tell you, he is having some kind of a game. Okay. And he has 20 points, a dozen in this quarter. And he came That's off the, in four and a half minutes. He came off the bench in college. The Kyrie Irving, 20 at, years old. Look at his change. Of Over blood zone. Did you see the little burst of speed? Made everyone seem like he was going to set up the offense, and then boom, he was gone to the goal and finished with the left hand. His first point since the first quarter. Lead pass to Zeller. He'll drive, he'll score. Might have got away with a walk, but nonetheless, Vinny Del Negro says, I can't have any more of this. Bledsoe. Down the lane. Oh, that's some move. What an athlete. Look at Cleveland, though. After a main hoop, they're going the other way full speed. Oh, that is disheartening. 80 to 71. Verizon. Does, does it appear to be easier on one end of the floor than it does on the other? Yeah, I think so. It, that, that's the way it looks. Irving. Oh. The Zeller. I'll yeah, tell you. That, that big guy's all right. He is all right. Barnes in the paint, comes up short. Collins, the offensive rebound. He's stripped to the basketball. Clippers get back defensively. Here goes Waiters. 
Wow, that's a nifty move right there. Later. From the corner. Bingo! He spins it in. Lawler's Law about to be tested again. Into the corner. Bingo! Waiters again. Their 13th three of the game. So Irving will go to work. What a dynamic young backcourt these Cavaliers are. Uh, I'm telling you. Barajan. Timeout. And it has become a guards league. Waiters. Ten on the shot clock. Back to Barajan. Left three. Dangerous in there. Bledsoe. To Griffin, left hand slam. That's pretty perfect. 104, 101. Now you got to get a stop. Yep, you don't need to foul. 17 <laughs> seconds separate the shot and the game clock, but you have to get a stop. Now watch Bears out. He's running from the top. Oh, me. Oh, my. Wow. Kyrie Irving, a cold blooded three ball. Are we watching this young 20-year-old grow up right before our eyes? The Cleveland Cavaliers have beaten the Clippers 11 times in the last 12 meetings. Go figure, huh? I mean, he challenged me to a one-on-one -on -one game, so <laughs> either he's confident or crazy. It's one, one or the other. Um, but, you know, he's uh, he, he works extremely hard. He competes extremely hard. And... Um, I was really impressed with him this summer, you know, going up against our Olympic team in practice. I mean, he's, he really came to play. Star Power Supreme is the Cavaliers lock horns with the L.A. Lakers, two teams desperate to get into the win column. Lakers really struggling. Off to their worst start in a decade. Cavaliers, of course, want to end that five-game skid, and they get their captain back, their point guard, Kyrie Irving, ready to lace it up against one of the greatest competitors this NBA has ever seen, Kobe Bryant. And Kyrie with it. Body dump. By his former Duke Blue Devils. Chris Duhon knocked it down. Doing a good job of putting him on his top and spinning him around. Knocks the jump it down. First shot by Kyrie. Opening minute of play in a 2 2 ball game. Bryant fires and hits. Bryant, bodied up by G, going to work, creating space, and knocked it down. Who oh, you can shoot the ball. Oh, that young man can put the ball in the basket. Kyrie gets up. Berejao in deep. Spins it in and he's fouled. Kyrie Irving. Doing a good job of pacing the game, floor, getting the ball down the floor, attacking in early offense. Kyrie rises for three. The bottom! Kyrie Irving, feeling it in the queue. Now Kobe Bryant, matched up with Irving, sends it over and scores. Unguardable, that shot. Inside, Alonzo G missed it, he rushed it. Because of Dwight Howard, here comes Bryant. Sends it and hits it. You see, as far as Kobe's concerned, he likes this pace. Irving turned the corner. Deflected feet into the hands of 17 and he lays it in. Well, right back to the old things. Andy and Kyrie doing the pick and roll, doing a good job. They, they are so good at executing that point. Kobe on the baseline fade, knocks it down, a la Michael Jordan. Well, Kobe is not fooling around this evening. He is on target, as he always seems to be. Ooh. Kyrie split the defense, gets inside right down Euclid. Kyrie doing a good job of crossover dribble. Now you see me, and now you don't. So the Cavs regain the lead. Kyrie's got four assists and seven points. Here, steal by Metta World Peace. Irving dishes off. There's out. Finish it. Kyrie and Anderson. Howard banging. There's out. Chested him out. Howard got away with a shove that time. Overshot it. Staying after it. Kobe Bryant in there with a left hand. Just dug it out. I mean, I don't know how they expect you to guard Howard. They're going to let him just jump into your chest like that. Kyrie jumps and hits. Kyrie and Anderson. Instead of working the give and go, he backs out this time. Kyrie dancing with it. Off the glass, a little window shopping. Cavaliers with 10 hands all around the White House. <laughs> Don't let him have it. Kyrie off the dribble. The bottom for two. Dance. Kyrie is back. Dance on him, young fella. Dance on him. His teammates loving every moment of it. They trap Kobe Bryant. Oh, he banked oh, it home goodness. impossibly. Kobe Ooh. Bryant. That Ooh. was sick. He has the cockiness, the confidence. Uh, he has a little swagger, as they call him nowadays. Uh, he has the maturity. You know, so he has a lot of those little things that Kobe had in him. Uh, that he had the drive is going to be the question because Kobe had a drive that you could see from 18 until 22 where it just kind of really took off. 
you know, and, and that's the only thing right now with, with Kyrie that we don't know. And that'll be answered in the next couple of years. And, and, and to me, that's exactly right, Fred. I mean, Coach is right on the money. Kobe's drive to be the best ever has, has got him going in, in, in directions that a lot of people don't go. And I think Kyrie has the same drive. Irving off the break. Up top to Alonzo G in the high handle. And another Laker mistake turns into two. Kyrie wants to push now. Look at the three Lakers. Foul line chain. And he hits. The attack in the open floor. That's what got him to lead in the first half. Now they get a chance to get the first bucket now. Kyrie. Against Brian, who takes on the challenge. See if Kyrie does as well. Crowd anticipating a little one on one action. Behind the back, couldn't shake him. Brian's still an all world defender, and he blocked it. See, he got baited into that. Yes, he did. Yeah, Kobe's feeling it now. Kobe's missed his last four shots. Ends that dry spell. Well, you you don't tell. want him to get going. You could tell he had that, had that little look in his eye, that little hop. After that defensive play, that usually gets an offensive guy going. Here comes Bryant, open floor against Kyrie. Puts it down, he's fouled. Now, just like that, L.A. within a 57-49 count with a free throw coming. All they are doing is playing the game and what the Cavaliers are giving them. Here comes Kobe Bryant. Spins it up, and he'll go to the free throw line for a couple. Bryant on the wing. Spins it home. Yeah, when he gets you in the triple threat position, Especially if he's anywhere around 25 feet and in, you're in trouble. Kobe Bryant looking to be in takeover mode. Finding Jameson backside. Kyrie ran him off the line. A little teardrop goes for Jameson. You know how well he can knock down that little shot. Bryant turns baseline and hits another tough shot. Ooh, he can shoot it. That, that, that was a bad angle. He still made it. So he's got a 10-point quarter. And just like that, L.A. within three. Irving, a long launch. For three! With one-tenth of a second left on the clock. How badly did the Cavs need that one? Devin Ebanks out there for the first time tonight. In the backcourt with Kobe Bryant, who drains a three. And you can see now, Kobe knows he's in striking distance now. He will be ready to play this fourth quarter. Cavaliers, I think, have a tiger by the tail now. Bryant. Off the bounce, and he hit it. Ooh, the, the Mamba is a loose. Somebody has to put him back in the cage. This is me going to talk to you one-on-one. You have to guard. You're not going to lock it. You people need 30 games, this. and some people need 11. I knew you, you are high reaction. He's got some talent, so I entertain that conversation. The trash talking began, of course, this summer with Kyrie at Team Select against Kobe Bryant and the U.S. Olympians and continues on the floor here tonight in grand style as those guys go at each other. Bryant with 31, Kyrie Irving with 19, not guarding each other, but certainly the uh, spearhead of the attacks of their two ball clubs. Caspi gave it up. Five in the shot clock. Kyrie has to create something off the dribble. Ooh. Split the defense, goes inside. Oh, he tricked him, Kyrie Irving, do it to him, and he's fouled. Trick him, now you see me, now you don't. The next time you see me, I'm at the hoop. Good move, hang in the air, take the bump. Opportunity for a much needed three point play. He knew the clock, and with that dazzling dribbling display, got himself to the rim and finished off a huge three point play. You got two of the better fourth quarter finishers in basketball in Kyrie Irving and Kobe Bryant. Jameson, it's off for three. Rebound weak side, though, to Dwight Howard. Kobe Bryant with a pump fake for three, and he'll go to the line for three. Irving against Duhan. Shot clock at five. Kyrie trying to create some space. Zeller on the run. Off the glass! The window is his friend! Bryant took a peek at the shot clock. Shows under five. Archer's a three, and it goes. Kobe Bryant with 37. Who's an ass from the crowd here at the queue? Kyrie back the other way. The bottom! They're putting on a show! Yes! Long win. And it goes! Kyrie Irving, Mr. Fourth Corner. So give him 26. Cavs have to come up with some defense now. Virgo inside. Everybody else fell asleep. They're pointing each other. Meta World Peace saying, Jordan Hill, that's your guy. He has now got his second win, and you can see the effects of the game and how he is playing right now. Kyrie has to stay aggressive, Jeff. And if he can do that, 
we got a chance to win this game. 26 points, six rebounds, 10 assists. Campy and I will have all you need to know about this one. We're moving the ball wrong. Five oh, of the yes. shot clock. Here comes Kyrie with the left hand. He was fouled. He'll dust himself off and shoot two. Under a minute to go. Can they hang on on a five-point lead? Here comes Kyrie. Oh. Weaving and bobbing. Snaps it to Berejau. Wide open look. Got it off the rubber rim. Anderson Berejau with a fist pump to boot. Cavaliers doing a good job of staying active. Andy and Kyrie in a two-man game. Andy says, okay, I can take it. You got to still be on the, on the money defensively because Kobe can do anything to you anytime. Like that, a, a turn and go three. Yep, Kobe can turn your lights out, as you say, at any given time. Kobe Bryant don't want to foul him here. Bryant, you'll give him that one. 8.7 to go, give him 42. Final seconds tick off. They rise in mass. A one and go winner. 194 as the Cavaliers made Kobe Bryant work and a nod of respect from Kobe for Kyrie Irving as they both were superb performers here tonight. Welcome back to Madison Square Garden. Second game of a six game homestand for the Knicks. Kyrie Irving and CJ Miles who's been on since he's in the starting lineup in the backcourt for Byron Scott. Varejao, Tristan Thompson, the second year player from Texas. And Alonzo G as well. Meanwhile, Felton Kidd, Chandler Brewer, and Chris Copeland getting the start for Carmelo Anthony and Kyrie Irving last night. Uh, suffered a hard fall, and he broke a bone in his jaw and didn't even travel with the team last night after the game. He had to get fitted for the mask. He came on his own later in the day today. Irving with Felton right in his face. Difficult shot. Brewer off the dribble. Way off. Oh. With a couple of bricks. Irving steps up. That's a three-pointer. In and out. And in again. That's two times for the Cavaliers. And Cavs go up by four. Irving, interesting. Wasn't he born in Australia? Yep. His dad played pro ball there. Irving's shot again is good. The thing about what makes him so tough, Clyde, obviously he can beat you off the dribble. He's got a great pace, but he's a good shooter. It's like Steve Nash because you have to guard his outside shot. It makes him doubly difficult. It's just a, a, a wonderful time. This, this franchise really now is rolling real so well. As we're speaking with John Andres, 34 years as a Nick broadcaster retired before this season. To me, you were the, you were the perfect ambassador for what the NBA is all about. Well, that's a mouthful, and uh, I, I appreciate hearing those words because that makes me feel that a lot of that work and a lot of uh, how, you, how you do things uh, stand out a little bit. That, that's really nice. J.R. Smith gets inside. Nice move. Can't finish. And John, the quarter's coming to an end, and we're going to say goodbye here at the second quarter just for the sake of the broadcast. But again, I, I think speaking for Clyde and for Al and for all those we want to thank you, first off, for your entertaining us over the years. And how about the Knicks? In just 20 games, or 22 games, and counting tonight, they have made 272. Goes to show you, back then, you know, it was the new shot, and, you know, some teams took it, but there was a hesitancy, right? And now it's a necessity, Mike. <laughs> you got, you got to have a good three-point shooter now, or you're going to be left behind. Also, that season's significant for me, Mike. That's the year. I, I've never retired. I just left. <laughs> I've never retired from the NBA, but that was my last season, 79-80. So you never filed the retirement papers? No, I just walked away. Man. Felt in the floater. That won't go, and Irving comes out of it. Good harassment by Vergy all that time. And G finishes. Kid wide open. He's been off tonight. Kid having a rare four shooting night. He's just one of eight, all from three point range. Irving's jump shot. So sweet. This kid is a lethal shooter. Here's the double team, nearly deflected by Frigioni. Irving back door. Nice pass on the bounce from Verizal. We've seen some, some centers now are becoming good passers. And Irving backs down to three. Irving's having a terrific season as well. Irving puts up a three and nails it. It's a two-pointer. His foot was on the line. J.R. Smith, short rebound, comes out to Chandler. Smith had it, gets knocked down. Irving spinning, shoots over Kidd and knocks that one in. 28 for Irving, and just like that, it's back to six again. Felton's been open. That's a two, Raymond Felton. 
Get that mask, man. And he draws a foul. Nope, the shot no, won't count. Good. No continuation. Uh, it should have been traveling. If the continuation, he traveled, but they fouled him before. So, what they say? Well, they're in the penalty, but the basket would have been a three-point play. Yeah, they allowed that to go right there. That's traveling. Right. I think he traveled after he got bumped. I just, I love his demeanor, Father. Yeah, he's old school, Mike. He doesn't do any of the chest bumping and the stuff that you see today with the young players. Irving kicks it inside the G. G gets it to go. So Irving kid wanted him. He didn't want to play too far up on it because it'll just blow by you. Yet you've got to really respect that shot fly. He's a tough cover. Marriage out to the basket, banks it in, and it's back to four again. Felt it to Chandler. Chandler inside, knocked away by Myers. Both teams coming up with big defensive deflections. Irving down the lane, and it's a two point game with 55 seconds remaining. Nick's trying to hold on. Chandler down low gets hammered. Timeout, Cavs, two clutch free throws there from Tyson Chandler. Irving gets it deep in the corner. Fires up a three and puts it in. Irving handles the three-pointer, and it's back to six. Felton in the front court and immediately fouled. See, kids should, kids should get out and make him penetrate. So you should force him to penetrate. Don't allow him to do that. I mean, he was draped all over him. Right, but you got to force him to dribble. They can dribble inside of the arc. Nick's now six for six from the free throw line here in the fourth quarter. Felton has nine fourth quarter points. Irving, again, another three-pointer from Kyrie Irving. And Smith fouled from behind. An incredible performance here from Irving now with 39. See, not a good thing about it, Knicks. They should be getting the ball away from the kids. See, nobody's doing anything. It's not over yet. So. The masked man putting on a show. I think everyone knows who he is now, though, Mike. <laughs> He's enjoying the bright lights of Madison Square Garden. Auspicious homecoming for the second year pro. Oh, it misses. Do you foul or do you let them? Kid knocks it away. Gets it back and then a foul call on Kid. Well, that makes it a one point game. Mike Woodson will call timeout. Novak comes free. Novak immediately foul. Pushed by G. Novak. Oh, misses again. Oh, another miss. First Smith, now Novak. Two point game. Irving looking. Finding Verjao. Verjao across the lane. is fouled with a second remaining. And he can tie the game at the line. Knocks down the first. Oh, this is a Smith the rebound, and that's it. You can't pull it off. You can't pull it off. The Knicks escape with a 103-102 victory and a brace for the two head coaches as Andy Barajal misses the free throw. And the Knicks remain undefeated at home. At 10-0, they win their fourth straight overall to go 18-5. And, and a heartbreaking loss for Cleveland. For the Cavaliers, Kyrie Irving is their leading scorer at 22 7 He's in the backcourt with C.J. Miles, Tyler Zero, Zeller, former Tar Heel with Tristan Thompson, and Alonzo G. Their coach is Byron Scott, his 13th season as a head coach, third with the Cleveland Cavaliers at 47 and 134. Bobcats rookie Michael Kidd, Gilchrist, and second year extraordinaire Kyrie Irving for the Cleveland Cavaliers played together in high school. You can see this picture right here with their St. Patrick's jerseys on. I spoke with MKG this morning about the relationship. He said they're best friends. They talk every single day. They vacation together. And he said he gave them great guidance looking at the pros and the cons when making his decision to leave Kentucky early to come into the NBA. I asked him, do they scout each other? Meaning, do they help each other with scouting reports for the opponents? He said they don't really do that. But this is the first time they played against each other. MKG said he's going to talk a lot of trash because he knows how to get in the young man's head. So we'll watch for that tonight. Need some trash right now because Cleveland's on a 12-2 run. Here's Irving. Irving at the top. Now they're going to a zone. Zeller goes up and under and scores, making it 17-10. Cleveland. Irving. Walton alone at the top for two. Kid Gilchrist. He looked at the shot clock to see how much time was left. Irving with a steal. Kid Gilchrist back defending, and Thompson, or rather G, will throw it down. 
Here's Irvin. Talked him right up, didn't yeah. he? <laughs> Talked him into the shot. Hey, Dell's talking about sessions. The two won't work. Walker tips the rebound, but Irving is there to intercept. Three on two break for Cleveland. Irving will finish. Oh, look at that young fella. Irving. Gets it back from G. Four on the shot clock. Leads in, and the bank is good. This is for understanding. Okay, I'm off balance. Irving at the top takes the three and hits it. We talk about matches. Maybe 20 back now. Oh, there's the cut by Irving on the pass from Thompson. Irving at the top. Look at him get chased down the sideline. 10 on the shot clock. Gordon holding his court. Here's this. Oh, what a shot by Irving. Oh, he tries to quiet the crowd. 22 points for him, including that two we thought turns into a three. There's another. Kyrie Irving quiets the crowd in two way. Yeah, I mean, Ben Gordon, good D, man. He had a hand right in his face. You don't let him drive you. This is a rhythm bounce and knocks it down. Look at his second half. He has come alive. Here's Irving. Gets down the lane. Challenges. No, but a foul coming up. They're going to call it, I think, on Brendan Haywood. Irving hits them both. Three point lead for Cleveland. Look at Irving move. Headed to the right. Two more, 31, Kyrie Irving. 10 on the game clock. Shot clock is gone. Irving makes the move, puts the shot up, got it. One second left, the Bobcats will call their final timeout. Kyrie Irving with a magnificent fourth quarter. 33 points, watch this. Taylor defended it about as well as it could be. Just about as well as he could. Kyrie Irving knew exactly how much time was left on the clock. He, knew, he said, if I get all the way to the rim, I'm going to be challenged. I'm just going to get some rhythm, get to that elbow jumper, and shoot it over the top. 16 in the fourth for Kyrie Irving. Here comes the shot by Henderson for the win. Oh. Kyrie Irving's 33, 16 in the fourth, and two with one second left. Gives the Cleveland Cavaliers the win over, Bob, over the Bobcats. Kyrie Irving lining up in the backcourt again with C.J. Miles. Alonzo G up front had a good ball game against these guys last time out. Tristan Thompson and Tyler Zeller up front as well. Kyrie, a little bit Ranger goes. Did a good job of understanding what was in front of him. Kyrie wants a screen from Thompson. JJ over the top. Kyrie faked it. Oh, and tear dropped it. How sweet was that? Well, he did a good job because he kept his head up. So the defenders, he kept them on the ground. Kyrie Weeks spins it home too easy. Yes. Right down Euclid on the score. 17 8. Well, Kyrie notices now that if you get by the front line, there's nothing waiting for you at the basket. And he's, he sees that now. You watch, he will attack more. Kyrie measures and splashes a three ball. Doing a good job of dotting the eye of his old teammate. Irving closed upon by Smith, shoots over him, and hits. Kyrie. In an early zone with 13. Carry off to a good start. A one hard dribble and a jump shot. Walton, nice shovel feed. Kyrie inside from Walton. Good pass from Walton, good move without the ball by Kyrie. Back come the Cavaliers, three on one. Running Tristan Thompson. Yes, and G set that up because he kept running on the left side. The defense collapsed on the left side, flattened out, and then Tristan comes behind to throw the hammer down. Back on defense, Thompson under the pocket. Good pass by Kyrie. Good move by Double T to throw the hammer down. Right oh, yeah. side steal by Irving. Foot race with Matthews. He wins it. Super steal by Kyrie. He set that up. He laid on the backside. Matthews forced him to dribble drive. Nowhere to go. Kyrie on the steal. Up the back of Lillard he goes. High hopping. Head scoring. Kyrie Irving. That was filthy. Nice move by Kyrie. Take the ball. One on one to the hoop. High dribble to the layup. Irving. Lost Lillard, which way did he go? <laughs> Still looking for that Ohio license plate. <laughs> Kyrie's got 21. <laughs> he left him standing still at the stoplight. Good move by Kyrie. And hits it. Big time basket there by Kyrie. Good pass by Double T. Shot clock is a problem now. Kyrie realizes it. Has to go to work against Lillard. Crossed him over. Ducks inside. Spins it up and in. Are you kidding me, Kyrie? Kyrie Irving doing a good job of taking everybody to the hoop. 
They love these lasers as they certainly seemingly have overachieved so far. Kyrie with it now. Off the screen. Fires. Got it! Kyrie! That's a big time basket there by a big time player. Kyrie in the Rose Garden for two. Clinging to a one point lead. Shot clock at 10. Maybe they can go two for one, but they want to get off a good shot here. To try to add to this lead. Here comes Irving now with Lillard. The fall back. Got it off the glass. Convenient back. He goes in the Rose City. Time out, Portland. Well, Kyrie lost control of the ball, so he had the ability to get it back. And the crowd here thinks that he did lose control of it, but the ball was hit, so he loses control. Trying to get to the basket, everybody's standing around watching him. He loses control, he gets it back. Now he can take a dribble, because he lost control of the ball, the ball was hit. And to keep your concentration in that situation. You're right, see right there, the little hit the ball, so Kyrie was, was live again, and that time he made the shot. Another chance for the Blazers, and the Cavaliers a one go winner. 93-88, and Byron Scott's applauding the effort of his guys, and he'll continue to laud their efforts in the dressing room as they get this one into the win column. Good night, Portland. Welcome back to the Quicken Loans Arena as the Cavaliers playing just their 17th road game of the season here tonight, taking on the Boston Celtics for the second time. They have two more meetings, one here and one there. Paul Pierce fires for three. Of course, wouldn't you know it? He came into the ball game really struggling outside the arc. Three of his last 19, he knocks it down. Kyrie jumps inside the arc and hits. In case you're curious, by the way, excuse me, see the uh, three-point line came into existence in 1979, so you caught the end of it. Kyrie sends it and hits it. Kyrie, Along two. Kyrie said, okay, you're the all-star. I'm going to show you what I can do. I'm going to dot the eye. Bradley missed a shot. Kick out by Zeno. See, they ain't supposed to attack. When you get in that point, they're going to let you get the ball to half court. You got to attack. Kyrie Irving for three. Kyrie was filling everybody out. He took his time. Got the shot he wanted. Deep in the queue. Here comes Rondo. A teardrop, and he goes. Rondo with the teardrop. Probably one of the best teardrop shooters in the league. I would agree. Kyrie Irving inside. Finished it off. Kyrie getting an opportunity to get inside on the dribble to the hoop for two. So it's 18-11. Rondo, hesitation drive, so good at that. Finish with the left hand. Right, trading baskets. Kyrie won, Rondo won. Garnett, again, in that zone, he's got six. Garnett's feeling it, well he knows he's coming out of the game. They have what they call the Garnett rule in order to preserve him to the end of the season. He only plays a certain amount of time. Irving. Off balance, hit it anyway! A good job of making Rondo defend. Now as Kyrie Irving matches up against another all-star point guard in Rajon Rondo, it begged me to ask the question, how tough is it to guard a guy whose mentality is pass first, shot second? Just versatility. Uh, you know, he rebounds the ball, pushes in transition, gets everybody involved. I mean, he's the true team leader of that team. And, you know, guarding somebody like that, it, it's a, first of all, you know, it's a, it's a pleasure to go against him because you know he's going to compete on both ends of the floor. And, you know, you know, we're gonna get, you know you, where you're going to get every single night out of Rondo. So, you know, I enjoy the matchup every time we play. And, and that is something I'm hoping he's learning, going to learn from Rondo, is how crafty Rondo is at pushing the ball. Great job of pushing the ball and he has an old team and he pushes it well. Back to a cut Kyrie from Morton. How about that one? Doing a good job of using the play without the ball. Nice fake. He got him a bird on the move and then laid it in. Rondo stays attached to Kyrie. Morton hold inside for two. Good pass over the top by Kyrie and good cut down the middle and he gave him a, a direct line to the basket for the move. But Rondo gets two more back. Yeah, Rondo's getting inside too easy. I mean, you, if you're going to trade baskets, you can have a tough time when they finally get everybody else in the ball game. You cannot trade baskets. Walton for that weak side of rebound. No looks to Irving. That was a great play by Walton because the Celtics all were there for the rebound. Walton found a way to get to it. Nice look away pass for Kyrie moving without the ball. Irving jumps and glasses at home. So he's got a new season high in a high scoring quarter with 19. Tristan Thompson with the left hand. So he continues to shoot it precision like he's five of nine now for 10 points he's been shooting much better in this recent stretch of games with Verizhao out Brandon Bass stepped into one and that's the Brandon Bass we've come used to seeing in past years comes into the ball game shooting 45 percent not bad for most but a year ago at 48 percent so he's been in a slump trying to work through it Irving sizing up Bradley who picked up the two fouls spins on him tough shot oh and he hit it 
doing a good job of measuring up his defender and dotting the eye with the turnaround jump shot. Well, you know, Fred, to me, when you give back to your community, it's, it's, it's a much more rewarding feeling. It's just as rewarding as making a big shot or winning a game. I mean, because everybody is not fortunate enough to, to do certain things in life. And to be able to give back and help somebody else is what it's all about, I think. Well, you look at it as a player. Tops it inside. Kyrie serving on the dime as he threw that low one. And Tristan with a good hands to reel it in, 48-46. You can't beat a good pass and a good catch and a throw the hammer down. As you've talked about, those guys earning more and more trust with each other. Ball given up. Pass out high. Hits it. Rondo thought about going the high handoff routes. Bass stepped into another, so he's knocked down his jumper. He's looked good here tonight, shooting at the perimeter J. 55-54. Carry over Rondo. Tough one. He had to will that home for two. You're right. They needed that also. They got to get separation from this team because Boston is playing at their pace. Here comes Rondo, hitting a swivel as he goes to work. Bradley tries again. Same spot, same reaction. Two in a row. Long one. Roy Shorts by Daniel Gibson, who's on the floor. Jazz now shooting 41%. Boston comes back with three. Jeff Green, Terry on the give up. Knocked away. Stolen by Waiters. Irving to Green to beat. Fires. Got it. Push the effort. Push the pace. Play your game. Pierce. Oh, nice look inside of Rondo. Beautiful pass ball, yeah. Pierce. Livingston did a good job of understanding. As soon as Pierce wanted to go to his left side, Livingston was there. But good pass by an all-pro, Paul Pierce. Irving over Bradley. Tough two. 29 for Kyrie. He measured the opponent. A couple little hesitation dribbles and then dot the eye. Rondo jumps and hits. Rajon Rondo with a big jumper. Yeah, Rondo showing why he is. The point guard of the Eastern Austin. Rondo knocked away. Livingston trying to get it down the floor. Kevin is in the run out. Jailbreak. Irving for two. Good defense. Sean Livingston started it. Zeller makes a pass. And the Cavaliers have a convoy going to the hoop to take the lead. Well, Fred, we talk about the young guys on this ball club emerging as leaders. In the last two huddles, Tristan Thompson has emerged as a leader. He's brought the team together. The previous huddle, he said, guys, Stotts is going to get this win here tonight. And that last huddle with the most emotion, he said, we've got no choice. It's all about winning. Curry with a steal as Rondo had the hustle, but Irving was there. But it all started because of a Cavalier back tap, and they lead it 86-83. Here comes Garnett. Look at the shot clock. Going to work against Thompson. Tough fade away. Missed it. Rebound. Fought for Cavalier basketball. Tristan Thompson with good D. Open for a run out. Irving dances inside for two. Bird and Akron rubber down the floor. 90-87. Good guys. Time up, Boston. The young man's got 35 and counting. Wasted no time. He did not waste any time. He twisted uh, the ankles of Pierce and took it all the way to the hoop. But what I like, this is the Cavaliers game. Get the ball off the board and get to the other end of the floor. Make the other team have to defend you. Now on the shot clock. Kyrie goes inside, finished it, and a foul. The fourth quarter is his heaven, and he takes them all to the basket. Opportunity for a three-point play to pretty much put the game out of reach. So Kyrie's got 40 for the second time in his career, and that look says it all. A wide-and-go winner on their feet at the queue as the Cavaliers roll the shoulders of their point guard. And route to 40 points, and the Cavs get a five-point victory, sending the Celtics down to their fourth successive defeat. Cleveland! It's time to get out of your seat. Let's make the starting lineup for your Cleveland Cavaliers! Starting at one guard from Duke University, number two, Kyrie Irving! Now be sure to tune in to Tomorrow night's Cavs game versus Toronto as the Cavs head back to Tristan's homeland. We'll have more reactions from the rest of the guys on the team, along with Byron and Scott. You won't want to miss it, Fred. Five and a shot clock. Irving has to create something on his own against the shot blocker, Henson. And he scores Duke over North Carolina right there. Doing a good job of really not giving the defender any idea what he was going to do, and he pulls up and knocks the jumper down. Kyrie switches the left hand somehow, wheeled it home. Doing a good job of 
getting to the basket, and he made contact before he released the ball. Carry back out there, going to work. Teardrops off the glass. He did a nice job of taking advantage of five on four situation. Went between his legs and dotted the eye. Irving scores on the back door, post up, and he was fouled. Finishes off the end one. That was our engineer to amaze play, courtesy of Quick and Long. Gary facing and hitting. Time though to get off a good shot. Thompson with a hard right hand. Kyrie measures the bottom. Cavaliers went all around the world to get that shot. Right side of the floor, left side of the floor, back to the right side of the floor. And Kyrie, that's the eye. Kyrie out high. The bottom for three. Kyrie's trying to bring him back. Under a minute and a half to go in the quarter. He couldn't shake Dunleavy. Out high, Kyrie. Got it for three. Big basket. Yes, indeed. He is down to 10. This is a situation shot here. Kyrie to the hole, and it blocked, and a foul. He'll go to the free throw line with 57 and a half left in the third. Six seconds now left. As Irving sizes up Udra, crossed him over, the pull up. Got it! Cool and calm, the all-star drilled it. The all-star dots the eye in the cube. An 11-3 Cavalier assault to close the third. Let's head to crunch time. Cavs back in it, down nine. Irving keeps Jennings on his hip, teardrops, got it! Kyrie again, he's got 29. Doing a good job of keeping the defender at bay. Got him behind him. Got it to eye in the two. Spates in the pick and roll. Kyrie fires. Got it again, Mid Ranger. The fourth quarter is Kyrie every time. Coming off the mat. They took a shot to the jaw in the third quarter. We're down by 20. But you got to love those smelling salts. As you come to life, and the Cavaliers laid their own haymaker to put this one away. A uh, white and gold winner, 113 to 108. So the Cavaliers hoping to be unstoppable here tonight. They certainly had us uh, off our seat last night in the fourth quarter. And a great fourth quarter victory over the Milwaukee Bucks as they come calling to the Air Canada Center. First of two trips up here as they uh, also will meet next month at the queue. G on that screen against Calderon. Rolls inside with a hammer. Nice pick and roll, and then G throws the hammer down early in the game. On the cut to Rosen. Oh, and a 10 lines on the one off. Whew. Here comes Dan Waiters. Head in the swivel as he goes to work. Carry open look. The bottom for three. That's what the Cavaliers need to do. Get the ball into transition situations and execute when you get down. Don't let the defense set up. Thompson on the run, floats it home with the right hand. Now see, that is what I mean. See, it was not a fast break situation, but it was a continual yep. movement. Ospates fires and hits. The big fella likes the 15-footer and not afraid to take it. Irving, run upon him, dances inside with the footwork, belted though by AC. Back of an offensive play, shot clock continues to tick. Snap pass inside, Irving draws the bump and a foul. <laughs> Allen Anderson gets inside, missed it though with a reverse. But Kyrie see, now with Ellington, two on two Cavaliers. Irving steps into one and hits. Yeah, if they're going to give you that, they let you get to the free throw line. A guy with that type of ability, you pull the trigger. Irving fights it up and down off the glass. He had to will it home, and he stared right back <laughs> at Amir Johnson. He saw that prior act. Didn't yeah, we, we got the stare game going on out there now. 45 <laughs> 38. Allen Anderson on the pump take. Still seals him. Missed a shot. Blocked, though, on the retrieval by Spates. Irving in the open floor, one against three. Somehow sees a line and <laughs> scores! They went to sleep! Boy, he's a bad man. He just, he just took the whole three of them to the basket, and he waited until he got an opportunity to use the dribble he wanted to use to get to the basket. Just kind of froze him with that dribble, 48-42. Kick, kick him, young man. Off the glass, convenient banking hours in Toronto as he goes to the free throw line for the N1 possibility. Well, something's going on out there because Kyrie is talking a lot of trash back at Calderon. Irving turns it on, spins it in the right side. He went Uncle Drew on him again. Did a good job of the, making the defender think he's going to go to the left side yep. of the basket, and he goes back underneath for a layup. Irving, Silver inside, rolls and scores. Good pro, good pass by Kyrie. Irving from the top for three. Yes, that's the way to keep the crowd very quiet. Kyrie off the bounce, fights it up and in, it says take that, he's got 20. <laughs> Kyrie fires it off the glass, put it down, the end oh, one. Sweet. Oh, that was a sweet move. 22 looking for 23. 84-83, Cavaliers back within a point now. Kyrie off balance, he was fouled. 
Ross got the block, but some contact will send Kyrie Irving to the free throw line. Not a popular call here. Every time the Cavs get a stop now, they have to score because that just puts more pressure on Toronto and it will force their offense to speed up. Kyrie swerving to the hole. 287 Cavaliers. Take him off to the hoop, young man. Calderon pops out here against Kyrie, winning that screen from Amir Johnson. Rolled inside, picked up on a tag by Livingston. Whoa. Continuing to roll inside, nearly Whoa. caught by Thompson. Here comes Kyrie. Open floor, trying to get to the rim, dances, fires, got a hot dead. Kyrie Irving ties it up. That's a bad man. 96 <laughs> apiece. Calderon, dribble driving to the hole, got it. Whoa. Timeout, 12.6 to go. Irving has been there before. He's had four game winners as a Cavalier, including one at Charlotte's. Does he have another one in him? Two to tie, three to win. Now down to five seconds, he's got to go to work. Sizing up Anderson, long three. The ball! Kyrie Irving, I cannot believe you've done it again! Point yes. seven left, timeout, Toronto! This missed the fourth quarter. Dribble down, dribble down. He says, okay, I'm going to dot your eye right here in the Air Canada Center. Get it in the basket. Cavaliers take a one-point lead. Shoot it, Mr. Irving. Corner on the tray right here. To the ball now. Up top. Knocked away. Stolen. No James Bond magic for Toronto. His name is Irving. Kyrie Irving. And the Cavaliers come up with a one and gold winner. 99 to 98. The kid gets buckets. Spun at one guard from Duke University. Number two, Kyrie Irving. Turning at guard. 6-3 from UCLA. Number zero, Russell Westbrook. Winners going against Cephalosha, threw it away. Tried to get it to Thompson. And that's one thing you don't want to do with this team is turn the ball over. They they transfer down the other end of the floor better than any team in the league. Westbrook missed the post up and a foul though on Deion Waiters. That comes Westbrook. Off that well-timed screen with Abaka. Abaka can hit that shot, knocks it down. He has worked yes. incessantly on that shot. Westbrook so strong in the upper body, going to work. Quick move with the left hand. He's a different athlete, I'll tell you. Back to our cut Kyrie. Off the glass. Yes. Now, I like that play. Move it out the basketball. Understand what's in front of you. Before the defense gets there, that is out. Thompson with the footwork. Kept the foot on the floor. Kyrie dives inside. And a blocking foul on Nick Collison, who's very good at drawing charges. But that time, it went. The Cavs went. Westbrook to the hole. Oh, once he told me that, I was off and running. Woo. <laughs> Westbrook, one-on-one. -on -one. Going to work. Against a double team. Good time trap. They left Collison open, and he hit it. McCollison, one of those glue guys off the bench, just does a little bit of everything well to beat setting that screen. Westbrook measures. That's money for him. Okay, it's amazing how many times he looks off balance. Yep. When he's going so fast, he's going too fast for himself, but he always writes himself when it's time to shoot the ball. Space lost to Hando. Westbrook on the two. They turn your turnovers into points faster than anybody in the league. Other than Miami, this might be the best two. They might be the best two transition teams going. Kyrie fights it up and he was fouled. Did well even to get the shot up off the glass. He did because it looked like he had lost his balance. Kyrie split the D, goes inside, tear drops it home right down Euclid. Yes, good job of catching that Barca sleeping. Way up in the air for two. 48-47, that might have had a little snow on it. Coming <laughs> up on three minutes to play in this second quarter. Westbrook off the bounce, gets two back. They don't panic. They just come down, set a little pick and roll. Westbrook comes off of it, knocks it down. Irving gets it right back. Yeah, it goes right Does somebody right. say mid-range? Yes, right back at you. I can do it just like you. Ball thrown behind Perkins. Kyrie flipped it away <laughs> with a second try. All the way down, Irving himself. His first dunk of the year. Perkins, Perkins was like, where is he? Where is he? What side is he on? Kyrie says, I'm right here. Give me that ball. It takes it all the way for two. So Kyrie with that soft slam at a couple of dunks last year, you may recall, against Detroit and Boston. Give and go. Westbrook, nice inside. Oh, at the finish. And he is fouled. So quick. Let me tell you, when your ribs hurt like that, it makes you want to cry. Yeah, you don't want to <laughs> sneeze, I'll tell you that. <laughs> That's right. That's the worst thing. <laughs>
Westbrook sends it off the bounce. If Westbrook says, okay, partner, I got your back. Or I got your rib in this case. 70-64. <laughs> right. Irving sends it to the bottom for three. Kyrie was just waiting. Waiting for somebody to get out of position. Westbrook on the finish. Westbrook with 18. <laughs> Seven on the shot clock. Dion on a give up. Driving kick. Irving for three. Yes. Here comes Westbrook. Sees a beeline. And he threw that foul with the attack mode. Kyrie Irving back on the floor, guys, as he misses the shots. Russell Westbrook quickly inside. Blocked by Miles, but a goal 10. Yeah, as the ball is already on the glass. Westbrook and Durant, the two-man game. Oh. Westbrook hops inside for two. Way too easy. 97. This point in the game, you can't let people go wide open like that to the basket. The Cavaliers are being contested every time they go in there. Space! And one! Here comes Westbrook. Facing and scoring. Whew. He's got 26. The Cavaliers have to keep pace. Chance to regain the advantage. Ball on a string. Kyrie going to work. Wizardry. Oohs and ahs. Kyrie inside. He was fouled. Kyrie swerving to the hole. He'll shoot two. Young man, dance on him. Take him all to the basket. Kyrie down. Back. Back through. Back again. Uh oh, come back this way. I got you all this time to the hoops of two. Kevin Durant may have to retape his ankles <laughs> after watching that. Here comes Westbrook. Elbow jumper. Missed it. A tantalizer. Rebound to space. Cavaliers on the ball in a one point lead. Can they hang on? Coming up on two and a half to play. Kyrie going to work, fights it up and in, Irving again! <laughs> Missed the fourth quarter, on the ride, taking him to the hoop. Big time, throaty crowd here at the Q, enjoying it, as Uncle Drew going to work. Irving, two-man game, Thompson rolled, Kyrie got it back. Weaving his way to the rack, right down Euclid for two! I don't know what you call it. But he goes to the basket with ease, and they give it right back. That's how good this team is. Okay, see, they are a good basketball team. They know when to attack you, when not. 106-105, Westbrook now with 28. What a duel between these two All-Stars. Thompson, some space. Flips it up and in, Tristan with the right hand. And that's what you have to have. You have to have help. He has help. A buck and a half left. Durant tries to tie. Got it. No, man. Kevin Durant has 30. You, you don't know what to do. You can't get up on him. You can't back off of him. He's a great basketball player. That's why they call him Kid Clutch. You know, KC, 108 apiece. Back the other way, Kyrie Irving. Trying to create space. Flips it up. And down! He rubber rubbed it. 110, 108. Good guys. And that's why we call him Mr. Fourth Quarter. To the basket for two. Durant, run off the three-point line, fires a two, no, oh. Alonzo G. The rim spit it back out, didn't like the taste of that one, 110, 108. Big basket here, if the Cavs can get it down. Crowd on its feet, 20,000 plus here, trying to be that sixth man. Kyrie sizing up Westbrook, fires a long one, oh, the bottom, video game again, Kyrie Irving, time out, thunder. I can't take it anymore! <laughs> Making up for last night when he says he was a little disinterested. I think his interest is pegging the meter right now. Uh -huh. He got it back tonight. <laughs> he get the same thing in Toronto. You back up, I'm a doctor. Just like Durant did at the other end. And check out the focus and the concentration. Yes, indeed. He looked like Austin Carr. That's an assassin right there. <laughs> <laughs> Yes, indeed. Deep in the queue. Yes. And the reaction, too. It's a great game. Back and forth. I mean, you got the best scoring team. You got the Mr. Fourth Quarter. And he is getting help. Just running quite an attrition. It's come up big here in the, in the end of the game. Back live. Durant to the hole. Got Boy. it quickly. Boy, that was quick. Ten to shoot. Spread floor for Irving. Sizing up Westbrook. Crossover move. He was nudged. The fall away. Oh, convenient banking hours downtown on a Saturday night. 115, 110. Here comes Westbrook. Forgot something. Ball goes out of bounds, but it's going to belong to OKC. Durant popped out for three. 
Missed it. Rebound swallowed up by the Cavaliers. They're going to have to foul. 8.7 left. So the inbound is the Thunder with a foul to give. They'll have to foul again. Unless they throw up the white flag. They're going to do it. A winning goal winner. Everybody on their feet. 115-110. As the winning goalers persevere. Riding the big shoulders of Mr. Fourth Quarter. As he lit them up again with 11 crunch time points. The Cleveland Cavaliers, what a weekend for Kyrie Irving. This guy is a special talent. Right now, I believe he's one of the top five point guards we have in the league. He's that cool. He's that collected. Uh, a very special player. A great young nucleus here in Cleveland. They should be excited for the future. Tristan Thompson was his new go-to move with that right-handed jump hook. Byron Scott said if he's on the left block and he gets to the right-hand jump hook, you can put it in the bank. Most given nights, it's very difficult for the rest of this team, and this is not a team that's loaded with one-on-one -on -one offensive players. But Kyrie Irving, he's Mr. Buzzer Beater oh. for them, and just, he does it again. Such great ball handling, how low he was to get by three defenders. There's other ways you can impact the game other than scoring. Obviously, defense passing the basketball, playing the right way as Irving. Hasn't stopped hitting three since he left Houston. Irving on the kick out. Alonzo G got it. His third three of the night for a guy that shoots 30% on the season. Thompson with the floater. Oh man, that's Irving pretty. with a quick pull up. Wow. That's pretty. Not going to find many defenders that can stop that. That time Lopez coming up short. You got to continue to go to the basket, <laughs> Irving. Wow. In a blur. Yeah. Kyrie Irving. Cross over to about the free throw line and then right to the rim to finish with the left. Irving. Starting to get in a groove here. G. Irving on the drive. Nice dime to Zeller. And Zeller finishes. Now you're right. That was a terrific pass. A little wrap around. As Kyrie Irving's going to get the easy opportunity. And Monty Williams calls timeout. Byron Scott all smiles. Irving on the drive and the finish. Almost made it look too easy. Well, see, no pick and roll there. He, he doesn't need pick and roll. Go ahead and go one floor flat and let him beat Vasquez off the dribble, which he should have no trouble doing. Roberts trying to guard Irving. Irving spins and one. That's special. That's special, folks. Yep. You're right on it. That is special. You're going to post up your point guard. He turns and faces and gives you the old Steve Smith spinorama. And able to finish. Looked like he was behind the board. Didn't have an angle. That's, that's a big time finish. You can expect to see a lot of that in the last six minutes. Kyra yeah. Irving is going to have to take over. The Cavs are going to get this home win. It's been a little time with uh, Kyrie and Jerry Colangelo this past summer in Las Vegas at USA Basketball's workouts before they went over to the Olympics and uh, no doubt you'll see Kyrie Irving representing USA Basketball in the next cycle as he continues to do basically whatever he wants they're seeing him tonight JB no, on yeah, national well, TV no I, I'm glad we got a chance to see him live I've, I've never seen him play live Irving working those ball screens so well going against Aminu now with the pull up got it <laughs> that is sweet. Yeah. This is why they come out to the queue, right? Irving. Bang. Jeez. Really? Fourth quarter magic by Kyrie Irving. Wow. Laying in the weeds for the better part of three quarters. And he's wide awake now, JB. Woo, 12 already in the fourth. He can get to the rim. He can get to any spot he wants to step back on Amino here. Knocks that one in, and then Luke Walton says the trailer is Kyrie from three. Mason. And he gets the board, too. He can do it all. Sell some popcorn, too, my man. Uh, he's in a rush. Ready to go. <laughs> Kyrie Irving on fire. It's the first time I've seen fans stand up all the evening long. This guy is... He's the show. Lopez. And he takes a charge, too. Are you kidding me? <laughs> Mike Krzyzewski's going nuts. <laughs> I mean, he gets this board. He goes coast to coast. There's four guys back. 
all the way to the rim for the finish, and then defensively steps in front of Lopez, gets a six foul, selling popcorn, blow, <laughs> blowing the streets of Cleveland, getting the snow out of our way so we can get out of here tonight. Here he is going to work on Mason. Drives all the way to the oh, bucket. Wow. Unbelievable. <laughs> Boy, that's an unnerving oh, feeling. Top of the key. When you're guarding a guy like this, a guy like Allen Iverson, when they got it going and you're on an island. Whew. Kyrie Irving with 20 points in the fourth quarter. 35 overall to put it on ice. Perfect Easter Sunday. And hopefully it'll be the same as we close things out for this homestand by the next two and a half, three hours. Starting five for Byron Scott and the Cavaliers, Irving and Ellington. In the backcourt with Zetter, G, and Tristan Thompson. Eric Gordon, tough night. Last one, three for 11 up against the Heat. And it'll be Lopez from behind. So on the attack. Kyrie Irving going to the free throw line is you too. If <laughs> yeah, you're not familiar with Uncle Drew, <laughs> YouTube Uncle Drew, and there's a long version yeah. online, and it is really funny and well done by Kyrie Irving. On the takeaway, Cleveland with the ball. Two-point lead, three minutes gone by. And strong move to the rack, but Irving leaves it off for Tristan Thompson. He's in his second season. Out of Texas, a 22-year-old first-round pick of the Cavs last year, fourth overall. Irving again, and he didn't want it with good reason. Thompson can finish. Well, that's a nice drop-off. I mean, he drew all the attention. Everybody's standing and watching him as he drives down the basket, makes the right pass. I mean, this he's fun to watch. Kyrie Irving going to the line, but giving the three-point play. Irving's entire college career was 11 games. Remember, he had the, the injury at Duke, so Chris Grant, the GM of the Cavaliers, and a lot of people say it was a no-brainer anyway, kind of like Anthony Davis, but still, is he healthy? Is he going to stay healthy? Because he didn't have a real large sample. Harris over Duke. Amundsen trying to keep it alive, but it's cradled by Tristan Thompson. And you know, I'll say this also about his injuries. I mean, if he starts getting those knees and ankle injuries, those are the ones that are troublesome. Hands and stuff like that, they heal back. You're fine. And he's still doing stuff like that because that's a nice drive and finish. In the first matchup of the Hornets, Kyrie Irving at 35 points. And I think it's funny that, that Lou uh, keeps apologizing. Uh, he really feels that bad. I mean, he's, it was an accident. Kyrie Irving gets the triple. That is their second three ball of the game on their seventh try. And okay. it'll count. It was... While the ball was in the air, the foul was off the ball on Gravis Vasquez. So when we come back, Tristan Thompson's going to the line, trying to make it a three-point play for Cleveland. Anthony Davis, a little bit of a struggle with Tristan Thompson defending him well as AD starts one for four. He's got seven rebounds, though, so he's doing it at both ends. Yeah, I'm talking about the defensive end of the floor. And Kyrie Irving starting to warm up. It'll be Robin Lopez, and he won't get the roll. Looked like it was going to sit there and come back for him. Irving. Nice little point. Stop start. That hesitation shows that he might pull up for that jump shot again. And then he has that extra burst where he can get where he needs to be. Irving sets up a wide open Ellington. So a guy that can create like that. He attracts the attention on the drive and the kick. Kyrie Irving, as I talk about threes. Kid has some serious game. And he just turned 20. It'll be Anthony Davis. Oh, athletic play. And a good lead by Vasquez. But Irving getting there to the cup. That's five straight for Kyrie Irving. So don't relax too soon. Not just yet. Those numbers work in only one city. It's Kyrie Irving getting to the cup. Cavaliers, this is the first of a back-to-back -back for them. They're in Atlanta tomorrow night. It'll count if it goes. Kyrie Irving. That's what a impressive. talent. What a talent. And you see where he jumped from, took the contact, and where he has to reach. Oh, my goodness. The English. He has no angle. He has no angle when he lets this go. What about the English? Yes. That's what I speak. Man. Looking for the three-point play, which he's got, and 29 points on the board in 27 minutes. Irving again. Soft victim. And that's his offhand. Yeah. So sensational second half. A dominant second half after trailing by one.
at the break. They outscored Cleveland by 21 in the second 24 minutes of play and just cruised to the win. Big crowd expected here tonight as the uh, Cavaliers take on the Knicks, a team trying to hold off Indiana. They're two games better than the Pacers, still play them one more, but they will own a tiebreaker with Indy. So they have a magic number of two to claim that second spot in the oh Eastern boy, Conference. Please. They're trying to sweep the season series. Carry over, Prigioni. Well, yeah, because Prigioni, Prigioni, he's really not going to try to defend Kyrie in that low post area anyway. He will, Kyrie can get what he wants. Speaking of confidence, Kyrie with a three ball. Kyrie comes out deep in the queue. Shumper missed it. But that was not a push shot. That was No, that was a jump shot. Yeah. He must have picked up that app. Basketball my way. <laughs> That's right. <laughs> Kyrie to the hall. Count it, I believe. Yes. Brian Forte played it out. Says Kyrie goes to the free throw line looking for the end one. And right away we get a look at Solomon Jones who is signed to death. So Kyrie Irving for two. So Irving with 10 now. J.R. Smith can Boy, hit him from any angle. He, 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 he's just a basketball player. He, he can flat out play the game. He's been gifted with a lot of good a good, a good talent to play the game. Kyrie inside. Nice give up. G set his feet, needs it. And hits it for three. Great assist from Kyrie. Yeah, that was a good move by Kyrie that time behind his back. He went lateral with the behind the back move. And G knocks it down. Smith does not need much space. <laughs> he got a little against Spates and knocked it down. Man, I tell you, they, they have mismatches all over the floor because of who they have to play at certain positions now. Smith on the back down, through that double team, only ducks inside, great move. Wow, that was a good move, he had two cads on him that time, and they both went for the same fake. Yeah, Smith looking at a double team, undaunted, goes to work, and scores. Yeah, he, he's a tough man to handle, boy, he, he, he's just a great athlete. Livingston, burst of speed, off the glass, no. But J.R. Smith, as you can see now, scoring in other ways, besides just hoisting up jump shots. Smith against Caspi. Behind the back. Unstoppable right now. My goodness. So Somebody Smith. had to play some defense on that young man. Contested shot. Doesn't matter. J.R. Smith in his zone like nobody else is in the gym. My goodness. Well, somebody better get on him. He's standing there watching just shoot shots all night long. Kevin Jones, good catch. Hooks. Spates tried to tip it in. Jones had it blocked from behind by J.R. Smith. Caspi fights it up. No. Cavaliers all over the rim, couldn't convert. When you want to run, you got to understand you got to play defense to run. You can't run from with your offense. You run with your defense. Well, the edge can't run when you're pulling it out of the net. That time, Cavaliers do run. Kyrie Irving of the whole defense to offense. And as soon as I speak of it, what happens? A good defense leads right to running and right to an easy basket in the open floor. Irving gets Prigioni. Oh, yeah. Reverses and scores. Too easy. Being able to go where you want with the ball when you want to do it is a powerful thing to have in your arsenal. Kyrie posting and scoring over Prigioni. Yeah, he doesn't. He has no fear of this guy when he's in the low post. He just goes right over the top of him. Kyrie for three. Well, Kyrie's starting to light him up in the third quarter. Deep in the queue. Kyrie backs up and hits it. Yes. A long two for Irving, so give him now 23, seven in the quarter. J.R. Smith took a peek at the shot clock. As Ellington on the hot seat. Drove into a double team. Kid. High rainbow three. Oh. oh look what I found. A prayer shot. He was hoping at least for some rim, and he got nothing but net. The rainbow answered his dream. Livingston on the island against J.R. Smith. Rhythm dribble, and he knocked it down. Boy, I tell you. J.R. Smith. He's 7 of 10 from the floor here tonight. Kyrie. We'll go at Kidd. Stopped on a dime. Missed it. Thompson couldn't control, but Ellington does. Good second effort. Kyrie. Good three knocks it down. Good second effort by Ellington and double T. And Kyrie finishes the deal. Deep in the queue. Smith. Dribble driving and scoring. Oh, man. They have had no answer for J.R. Smith tonight. He is out there by himself this evening. But this guy's been a handful. J.R. Oh, Smith. Oh, he's more than a handful. Three more. He's got 21. He's giving them headaches out there. Smith, face guarded by Ellington. Doesn't matter. What a display he has put on. J.R. Smith with 23. G sends it. Easy rebound for New York. Yeah, J.R. was the sixth man of the year runner-up in 09 when he averaged 15 points a game. He's feeling it right now. 
Count oh and one goodness. and J.R. Smith. One against five. Doesn't matter right now. <laughs> right. My goodness. Oh, boy. He just said, okay, I'm going to take the whole team to the hoop this time. A little crossover dribble. J.R. Smith is on fire. And J.R. Smith, the uh, storyline right now, steps to the line, looking for Good the shot. completion of the end one. Well, he is by far, when Anthony goes off the floor, he's the next best player on the floor. Kyrie is nudged in there right between the two of them. And that's about it on the floor tonight. Irving dances inside and finishes it, plus he was fine. Doing a good job of doing it when he does so good and that spin the ball off the board after he gets through the defense. Opportunity for a three-point play. Kyrie down the middle, up off the board is good. Smith, are you oh. kidding me? Are you seriously kidding me, J.R. Smith? Somebody get some cold water and put it on that man. From the Cleveland Fire Department. <laughs> yeah. Reggio on the other give up. Copeland dumps inside. Good ball movement here to Not Smith. Again. Of oh, course, J.R. Smith cannot miss. Oh, boy. So the Knicks will dribble out the clock as they virtually go wire to wire in this one. As the Cavs look early by four. But J.R. Smith took matters into his own hands along with his sidekick, sidekick Carmelo Anthony as they combine for 62 points, 31 apiece. And Kyrie Irving, 31 as well. But not nearly enough as the Cavaliers fall 101 to 91. Started at one guard from Duke University, number two, Kyrie Irving. See, the Cavs are playing a, what I don't understand, they play a coasting move. Kyrie on the floor. That's a good move by Kyrie to go straight down the middle of the defense. But they got to get out of playing a coasting pace. Now Alonzo G to the wing. It's it for two. Alonzo G. A toe in the line. He'll take it, though. Irving sends a three ball and hits. And that rotation looked just like his regular rotation yep. there. He got his legs under him, went up through his shoulder, and knocked it down deep in the queue. Kyrie Irving back on the floor for the Cavs. Against Morris. Yeah. Crossed him over. And hit it. Dance on him, young fella. Kyrie got him out in the open space. And got it there. Hawes, good hand, Jack. stolen, Jared saw it coming, keeps Hawes on his hip, finds Kyrie, bumps, scores on the run. Fast break, they run it perfectly, put the ball in the middle, spread the wings, and lay it in. Kyrie in lane, flips it up, and in! So Irving with the 11, continuing his aggressive nature, 5 of 8 shooting, Kyrie again for 3. Kyrie's on fire now. Irving, well timed, snaps it to a wide open Jared Jack, got it for 3. Yes, Kyrie doing a good job of penetrating down the middle, keeping his head up, and Jack knocks it down deep in the chair. First to speed, lost the basketball. Kyrie knows, has got your back, finding Thompson, throws it in. Kyrie is Johnny on the spot, picks it up, gets it to his teammate, and double T lays it in. Scoring, dishing, running the show. Doing a good job, Fred, of staying active, especially when he's out there with Jack because he plays off the ball a lot, and he gets a lot of opportunities to play the two guard, and he's knocking them down. Those two guys have combined for 19 points, Irving and Jack. Williams gives it up to Irving, inside, on the dish to Berejak. Doing a good job of moving the ball. It's beautiful when you move the ball and you move bodies, and Anderson throws the hammer down. Turner comes out on Kyrie on the set. Waiters run upon by Anderson. Back to Kyrie Irving, faces, and hits. Good pass by the two guards out front. On high, Kyrie Irving again against Turner. Waiters a deep one. Hits it for three. Yeah, they needed that. Irving. Didn't shake the defense. Then he gets inside Turner and into the teeth of the defense, and they're going to give him two free throws. Jared Jack swings it to Irving, faces up, and it's a three. Good movement by the Cavs to get it down. Kyrie set himself up deep in the two. So maybe it's Mr. Fourth Quarter time. 87-81. Irving well outside that three-point line. Double team. Tries to beat it with a double. Fires and hits. Yes. Two in a row for Uncle Drew. He's got 22. Kyrie starting to warm up. Fake the outside shot. Couple dribbles. Knock it down. Kyrie Irving on high as a Cavs. Five minutes into this fourth quarter. Irving trying to get to the rack. Bolts inside. Spins it off the glass. Impossible angle. Put it down. Looking for the end one. And look at Kyrie urging on the crowd. What? 
that what had happened that time, he was going to go with the left hand. The defender came over, so he changed to the right hand and went to the square. Waiters off the bounce. Hit it again. He's in the zone. He's got video game on him. He's feeling it. Deion Waiters with 18 and counting. Kyrie faces up. Back splashes it. Kyrie Irving. Opportunity to read the defense and knock the eye. Nursing one point lead. Irving got again. Kyrie Irving got the three point goggles out. He's feeling it now, baby. He's got a season high 30. Coach, uh, Coach Brown made a great substitution by getting shooters in there with Kyrie. So consequently, the Sixers got to play a lot more play a lot more attention to Kyrie, which opens up our shooters as well. Now we'll see if they can close it out. Campy and I will talk all about it coming up on Cavaliers Live. Under a minute to go now. Plenty of time in that shot clock. Waiters out high. Irving against that defense had to give it up. Jared Jack run off the line, a bounce, and a bucket. That Jared Jack, a great head fake. He got him a bird and knocked it down deep in the cheek. This was the Jared Jack that we saw in the playoffs last spring for Golden State when he took big shot after big shot after big shot in the playoffs. He was probably their best crunch time performer in the postseason. Kyrie Irving his head. He's opportunities in Boston, Denver, late game situations where he's dribble drive them, but he can also give you the pull up as we know. At Charlotte, at Toronto, you would think he's gonna be the guy to take the shot, but as you have said well in this fourth quarter, he's been distributing the ball, not forcing nearly as much. Kyrie out high against Carter Williams. Bows inside, flips it up, no at the horn. His sixth game winner goes awry. Got a good look at it, and we've got overtime. And the Cavs want to strike first now. Execute the offense. Can't get into a dribble drive in situation. Kyrie teardrops. That scores. You don't want to get caught up in doing that, though. Turner, head of steam, inside, great tag. Blocked by Tristan Thompson. He beat it up. Down the floor, Deion Waiters, a solo job. Yes. Get that weak stuff out of here. Good defense leads to good offense. Kyrie off the curl inside. Thompson. Out of the oh, top. Oh. He mashed it through. He put them all in the basket. Our palms have been sweaty here for 40 minutes. <laughs> here comes Kyrie going to work. He got a bow. Ran out of space. Jack faces. The bottom. Jared Jack for three. Yes. Moving the basketball. Getting everybody involved. And Jerry Jack knocks it down deep in the two. Kyrie pops out. Here we go. Final seconds. Irving on the deck. Floats. Left hand shot. No. And the Cavaliers have to go to double overtime. Kyrie came to the basketball. Guarded by Anderson this time. See if he dribble drives him. The pull up instead. He hit it. A big time two. They're going to review it right now to see if it was a two or a three. And it sure looked like a three. It sure did. Here we go again. Third time. Could it be the charm for the Cavaliers? Trying to get it out of Kyrie. Here comes head. Kyrie going to the work. Scores! <laughs> Point six to go! Absolutely! Third time is a charm! They tried to stop Kyrie with the double team, but the one thing they did not do, they left his... They let his left hand stay open. You cannot do that against Kyrie because he's awesome going left side. Nice little hesitation dribble. Holds it just long enough to get to the rim and lay it in. His left hand is dangerous when he's going in on the drive, and he's very good at finishing. The entire state of Pennsylvania knew that he was going to try to dribble drive to the hole, but nobody in blue could stop him. And maybe he's got his sixth career game winner. Look at the bench. Saying... Get in there, Uncle Drew. Here we go. Oh, Carter ahead. Williams on the inbound up top. Uh -oh. oh, he <laughs> threw it all the way to Euclid. <laughs> Ball goes out of bounds, and the Cavaliers are going to get it. And I'm not talking CJ, a wine and go winner. Cavaliers had to persevere on a back to back in a heck of a ball game to knock off. The Philadelphia 76ers and Kyrie Irving with career game-winning shot number six. Downtown D.C. on a Saturday night and fans excited to see the home team tonight. The first of two straight in the phone booth as the Wiz take on the 2011 number one draft pick, Kyrie Irving and the 3-7 Cleveland Cavaliers.
Back the other way. G for the jumper. Good. Up ahead, here's Rice, and the alley-oop was fouled up as the pass. A little bit telegraphed. Three on one. Got to come away with something. Irving the other way scores. Irving averaging shade over 19 points a game. He's ranked 27th in the league. It's a roll reversal. Watch out. Didn't see him. Yeah. Got to pay attention. But you've got to go after that loose ball with a lot more fervor than that. Pass for Nene. Too hard. To his hands. Another turnover. Two and three. Miles for three. Isn't it amazing how quickly the and tide how. tide can change. Yeah. It just, I, I'm not even going to say the tide change, but just, you know. Things turn around. I mean, going into that, uh, after that timeout, they were 7 of 23. Wow, that was a smooth move. Saw a stat on him where he broke Tracy McGrady's scoring record, had 56 points in the game. Kyrie Irving knocks down a jumper. In the Wizards' last 12 possessions, they have no field goals and three turnovers. Irving again, and he's hot. Wow, three ball going up. They've got to do something about this guy here. Kyrie Irving leads the team in scoring. In fact, he has 13 of field goal attempts. That's the turnover that kind of started the pendulum swinging in the other direction. Heads up play on his part. And boy, he handles that ball like it's on a string. Nicely moved there, baseline jumper. He's got it going now. Now the pass back and the shot good. As a big man, I would work on that day in and day out because, as you said, if you're gifted with a left hand, you can do a lot of things. Man, Earl Clark connects his first year in Cleveland, signing as a free agent. Thompson from 14. Cavaliers have cut it to one. They can take the lead. And they do. Wall hasn't shot many. That was way short. Irving the other way. Wall trying to block it from behind, but Kyrie scores. And a quick streaking Kyrie Irving is fouled by Gortat. Nene open, hesitates, shoots off the back of the iron. Whistle, score the field goal. Irving will go to the line with a chance to tie the game. Oh, come on. Too aggressive. Boy, boy. More pressure applied. It seems that more Kyrie Irving was given with the dribble. Two-point field goal, good. Kyrie Irving has been sensational tonight with 30 points. Screened by Barajon. Splits defenders, loses it again, and a foul is called. That's Martell's fifth. I didn't see Irving warding anybody off with the arm the way Martell suggested, but it's a moot at this point. Seven for seven at the free throw line tonight is Kyrie Irving, and Randy Whitman takes time. Kyrie Irving, after a little bit of a slow start, getting his team back in the game. He, along with, I would say, Earl Clark was really dead. Oh, especially in the fourth quarter. Knocked down three threes. Kyrie showing you his ball handling skills. Pretty good. Yep. Irving draws contact. Anderson Verajon kicks it out. Irving gets free for an open look and drains it. He was named an all-star for a good reason. that he's just tied his season high 39 his career high he had in the garden last year career high 41 Irving baseline jumper got another one and ties his career high with 41 timeout Washington Cleveland has grabbed control 103 to 96 in overtime it was all Cleveland in the extra session and most of it Kyrie Irving who was outstanding indeed is where the heart has been for the Cavaliers as they come in with six home wins here at the Q, taking on a Knicks, a ball club that has really been reeling, coming off a blowout at home on Sunday afternoon against the Boston Celtics. Kyrie inside, and it took him nine seconds to score.
Did a good job of attacking the basket. He got eye to eye with Metal World Peace and throws him right there for a second and laid it in. Drop block to Thompson. Wings and scores. Feathery touch there for Tristan. Backside Shepard to live with that. I push off. A rebound to Kyrie. Felton thought Kyrie pushed off. You may have heard him there. A battle of twos as those guys go to work. CJ Miles knocks it down. And I love, I love this way they're playing now. I like to see Kyrie push that ball. Nobody can stop him one-on-one -on -one going down the floor. And CJ is deep in the queue. Oh, yeah. He becomes even more lethal on the open floor. Yes. Kyrie got away from Felt momentarily. Had him on his hip. And you hear a stop foul. And Kyrie Irving will go to the free throw line. Here comes Kyrie Wilson inside. Oh, and wizardry at its best. And that's what it is. The Kyrie Walsh to the hoop. Big screen set by Bynum. Kyrie off the elbow. And he hit it. Early zone. He's looking right at Felt. Kyrie off the dribble hand up. Off the glass. Tough little shot. Boy, he's got great jump here tonight to start this ball game. Kyrie picked his pocket, though. Kyrie playing a lot better defense. Irving tries to split the D. Slip off the glass! That was ridiculous! Boy, they, they treated him like he was a bowling ball. Somebody bumped him back. Somebody bumped him forward, and he laid it in for two. Tough little shot. Kyrie squared up and hit it. I like the action. Yep. I love the action. Move the ball without the pass and move bodies. Everything happens good, especially against a non-defensive team like the Knicks. Kyrie, on the give up. Verjao sends it and hits it. Very big play. Scintillating shooting from that spot on the floor. High two-man game. Anthony had a steam, bolts inside, and a blocking foul as Hardaway was in that restricted area. They like to get out, like to get out and transition, look for some three-point shots, get get some uh, offense going early, and we let them do that with, with those turnovers. So again, the Knicks looking to tie or take the lead. And one brief lead, as we mentioned earlier, five to four. Stolen by Alonzo G. One man to beat, three out of one. Kyrie up top, Alonzo G. Doing a good job of two-man game. And Alonzo G throws the hammer down. Kyrie did a great job rewarding Alonzo, who made that play. Kyrie squares up and hits. Gamblers with three dunks in this quarter. Kyrie against Prigioni. Sutton hits it as he froze him on the dribble. He sure did. Did a good job with the little stutter step. Froze him flat footed and knocked the jumper down. Kyrie Irving for three. He's doing a good job of slow walking in that time. Miles attacking J.R. Smith to fall away. Oh, tough shot that he willed home. Ooh, good move by C.J. into the middle with the fall away teardrop. Barry against Hardaway. Tristan has slipped the pick and scores. He calls that shot the Mountie. They're going to try and, and, and they leave him open trying to double team Kyrie. And then they take advantage of it. Two guys to guard one. And double T goes over the top of the teardrop for two. It was just a nice read, wasn't it? It was a perfect read. He's back up by double digits. Kyrie being on the back. Which way did he go, says Prigioni. Oh, he lost him! He lost Kyrie Irving! And he made him pay for three. Kyrie inside, spins it in with the left hand. How crafty was that? Well, he had to do that to keep the defender off of him. Nice move by Kyrie. Prigioni has had his hands full with Kyrie behind the back that time. Thompson measures and scores with left hand. He can go either or. Right side, left side. Double T to the hoop for two. Kyrie turned the corner. Playing Jared Jack off a wide screen. And he hits a three ball. Irving against Prigioni. Single digit Scott clock. Sends a long one. And he got two. It's a two. He had a toe of the line, but he had nice air under that ball. Kyrie again off the glass. But right now, they don't have no one that can guard Kyrie. And the Cavs are taking advantage of the one on one mismatch. <laughs> Kyrie again. Knocks it down. Cut it out, will you, Kyrie? Cut it out. Well, that basket is as large as the ocean right now. And Kyrie is filling it up. At least Deep in the queue. Kyrie. On high, drops it off beautifully. And there he Spins it up and he's fouled. <laughs> that is the way you play two-on-two -two basketball. Nice drop pass, nice catch, up and under, and the wild thing lays it in. Opportunity for a three-point play. Irving says, why not? Oh, a heat check. Everybody get out of the gym because he is on fire. That Kyrie Irving, he's a bad man. <laughs> 37 for Irving. 109 to 94, and little doubt about our Bedford Nissan player of the game. The glittering numbers of one Kyrie Irving.
37 and 11. Knocked down 14 of 23 from the floor. And better than half of his three-point tries here tonight in the Q. Welcome to the city beautiful Orlando, Florida. And from the spectacular Amway Center, NBA basketball, an Eastern Conference matchup as the Orlando Magic take on the Cleveland Cavaliers in the first of four meetings this year. The first shot taken by Irving. He gets his own miss. C.J. Miles has had a good year shooting the ball from range and knocks in along too. Another jumper by C.J. Miles. These are teams that don't play at a very quick pace. Mm -hmm. Irving with the steal. They're going to try and up the tempo here. Producing all season for this Magic team. Well, he is just wearing out the left side of that floor <laughs> this year. A flawless. Irving on the drive. Now, I know you've got a number for me from the left side. Kyrie Irving. Kyrie Irving. Two-point attempt for Kyrie Irving. He's coming Kyrie off Irving. a 37-point game against New York on Tuesday night. Young people need to watch Dennis Scott shoot the basketball. You want to know how to build a shot, starting with your legs, your feet. And that's why I like doing what I do, because if it's a bad play, it's a bad play. If it's a bad shot, it's a bad shot. That's why I call in the game, because we play the job. Yeah. I just want, you know, I used to tell them that, you know, you need to ask Dennis Scott, I set good screens. You and Greg Kite <laughs> set the best screens ever. C.J. Miles. Running left-hander by Miles. Three-point attempt, Kyrie Irving. First three tonight for Irving. Another three deep by Kyrie Irving. Irving, he can play. He can play. <laughs> Let's look at some of the highlights. You're getting into Big Baby. You can take it to the basket. Coming off screens. Mixing it up a little bit with Jared Jack in there playing the off guard. And there's a couple of late threes that one and then pulling up with range when he gets it going Irving reverses it in a nice Kyrie move Irving. by Kyrie Irving Oladipo trapped out at midcourt boy they deck him and then take the basketball and Irving Kyrie with the dunk. very physical double team on Victor Oladipo <laughs> at midcourt Cavaliers in the lead 57-55 Kyrie Irving a contested Two with Oladipo in his face. He just wants to take this game over. Irving hits another one. And Big Baby's going to roll now back to that three-point line. Kyrie Irving. So explosive. Count the basket and the foul. I'm sure there's anybody can get hotter than this guy. <laughs> An all-star at age yeah. 20. Deion Waiters. Well, they do have some explosive Waiters. offensive players. Yeah, they get it a bit quick. Waiters and Irving in the backcourt. Kyrie Irving somehow gets free and draws the foul. Boy, when he gets a step. Well, he creates the step. Oh, trouble. <laughs> he creates the step. Fourth time this year that he's crossed the 30-point mark. Four meetings between the Magic and the Cavs, and the Cavs get the first one in Orlando, 109-100. Their second road win of the year. Well, after playing two of the best teams in the business, the Cavaliers now play four of the next five against teams with sub-500 records, but nothing will be handed to them as they take on the 5-20 and 20 Milwaukee Bucks here tonight. Here comes Knights, looking at Kyrie. Gets inside, blocked by Irving. Get that weak stuff out of here. Well timed without a foul. Kyrie's coming down, doing a good job, staying right on him. It's one of the key matchups right there. Middleton weaves his way inside, blocked by Andrew Bynum. Then he volleyballs it to himself. Here comes Gene, right wing feed to C.J. Miles. Here comes Kyrie, a bounce, open look, got it. Cavaliers doing a good job of moving the ball down the floor with the pass as opposed to the dribble. Here comes Middleton, stripped by Kyrie, got all weather. Cavaliers gave up over 100 points last time they played them, though. Yep, as a gentleman of three ball, Kyrie sweeps inside and scores! Burn and Akron rubber to the hole, it's 12-8. Taking it all the way, Kyrie. Other side of the basket for two. O.J. Mayo off the bench. Blocked by Mirajal, got all basketball. Cavaliers on the block party early on. Hey. Kyrie dances, spins it up, got it, and he's fouled! Cavaliers using their defense to get out on the break, and Kyrie goes coast to coast for two. Here comes Kyrie, racing it down the floor, puts it up, no, he was fouled in the open floor. Milton at 6-8, ducks inside, missed it. Rebound to Tristan Thompson. Kyrie again, sweeps inside, right down Euclid. Kyrie on the break, 
Up and under for two. Coast to coast. Again, the early offense. Mike Brown would like his teams to get into that early offense by 20 on the clock, and they certainly did that time. You know your numbers are pretty good when you're sick. <laughs> you wear that, by the way? Somehow I'm better with the mask. I'm better with the <laughs> I'm better when I'm hurt. You know, so I, guess I just live with it now. I'll see how I kill time on long airline flights as Kyrie playing his fifth game under the weather here tonight, averaging 23 and a half points a game in the prior four, including a, a couple against Golden State. And the Bucks have played a pretty good first half. Yep. Miles head of steam. Gets inside with a smash. Whoa. CJ with the C cut throws the hammer down. 44-43. CJ Miles on that back screen. Pop and fires. And hits for three. So he's had his best game since his return from the calf injury with 13 now. Kyrie change of pace. Got inside Middleton who fouled him. Oh, they're going to count the bucket. I thought so. 59-55. See if Kyrie backs down Brandon Knight. Again, that length is a factor. Kyrie willed it home. Did a good job of getting him down into the house. It takes him right on in there. Two mouse in the house. Carry back the other way, and he was fouled. Yeah, we want to get into some type of a rhythm now offensively. Irving step back, and he hits it as he squared up nicely. Well, see, that time the pick and roll, Bynum was going down, so the team had to collapse and gave Kyrie a one-on-one -on -one situation. And the renewal of this uh, rivalry, which began, of course, with both those guys coming out of the same draft class. Kyrie number one overall. Remember Brandon Knight? Number eight overall to the Pistons. They know each other's games very well. A lot of pride in the line. Kyrie scored the last nine for the Cavaliers and Knight the last six for them. Jared Jack sizes it up. Nope. Rebound. Kept alive by Marajal who hustled it down. It's all Will. Kyrie back to the hole. Credit Wild Thing for getting the Cavaliers to the free throw line. <laughs> All right, here we go. Kyrie going to work. Writes himself, scores! All right, the battle is on. Kyrie to the hoop for two. So Irving with a dozen points. His 10th double-figure scoring quarter of the season. Kyrie wanted to call for it, set his feet, and hit it for three. Or two, a long two, on a board. Fourth team foul on the box to the Cavs. will be in the bonus the rest of the way. Back cut. Irving inside. Nice read from Berja. Now you see me, and now you don't. Move without the ball. That's a great part of the game right there. Frenetic pace. Oh, Knight. Oh, Smash! Kyrie oh, oh, Irving. That ball will never be the same. Get that weak stuff out of here. Irving. Dancing with it against Knights. Trying to get some space. Out of it. With about a second and a half left in the shot clock. Toss to Knight on the back side. One on one. Going at Knight. A bump. Knight. Had it knocked away. I believe Kyrie got the hand in there. Uh-oh, and Irving is hurt. Kyrie guarded by Knights. They've gone in each other all night long. Gets up ahead of Steen, goes inside, puts it up, no, tapped up and in! With 1.8 to go! Tristan Thompson gets it done! Irving back the other way. Crossover, sends it. Oh, bruising ankles and egos as he hits the three ball. Did a good job of doing it. the crossover. He comes, takes a step back, and hits a Camry Russell. Three deep. Milwaukee leads, plus two in pink points. Kyrie, good again! He hit a rattler. Kyrie is on fire in the queue. Kyrie gets inside, fights it off beautifully again. Jared Jack off the bounce. The bottom! Again, Kyrie Irving did not force and found the open man. Kyrie is starting to understand that he's just as effective driving and kicking than he is making the shot. Kyrie starting off overtime, a three ball with an offensive foul attached. Then he rattled the iron for three more. And then the penetration and pitch. And Jared Jack not get it down. You're right, and he's key. Jared Jack has played a solid game tonight. He's did a lot of good defensive work, knocking shots down. He and Kyrie have really stepped up in the absence of Dion. Both teams at 38% shooting from the floor. Jared Jack sends it. And hits it for three. Jared Jack. Earl Clark came to the ball. Irving deep outside that line. Clark has to fire. Squares up. 
The Bears! Oh, Clark with his biggest shot as a Cavalier! Time out, Bucks! Cavaliers move the ball, and when you move the ball, good things happen, and Errol Clark is real deep in the queue. That was a tough shot. He was playing with house money because of the short shot clock. Gans will burn some clock. Two-point game, though. Milwaukee does not have to foul. And you got to move it. You, you get stuck in this situation. Here comes Kyrie. Writes himself inside, and a blocking foul on the books. I'll tell you, coming off the sick bed, he's done a fabulous job tonight on both ends of the floor because he has really done a good job on Knight. Knight coming off a 36-point performance against the Knicks. He's made the Bucks ill, though, in this overtime with now eight points, and it's down to one. Got to get a clean inbound. Wow. Kyrie dribbling through a maze of green. Behind the back, he went curly kneel on him and draws the foul. Now for a three-point lead. Got it again. Again, no timeouts for the Bucks. Will the Cavaliers allow them to take the three? You cannot give them a three, man. Here comes Snyder to give up. Mayo fires. No! Rebound! Knocked away! Time for another Mayo! No! Hold the Mayo! Cavaliers hang on! 1-14! 1-11 on white and gold! Winner! As it took a tremendous effort by Kyrie Irving, who probably hasn't eaten all day. 39. The one good thing about the Hawks that the Cavs had to do well, the, the, the Hawks passed the ball like all good teams do. They passed the ball very well. Yeah, they're number one in assists at 26 a game. As the Cavaliers win the tap, they'll begin the fourth quarter with possession as well. Here comes Bynum from 18. Perfect, got some air under that one. That's because that, that time he used his legs well. And Horford backed off of him and was defending around the basket. He knocks it down. Teague turned the corner, bumps that teardrop, and scores it. Kyrie going left and right. But ran into Bynum. Here comes Teague in the open floor. Nice feed to Damari Carroll. So the Hawks now with a lead of four. They like to slip their screens, which Millsap did there. Flared out and hit it. Well, that's why, because they can hit the 15-footer. Anderson Verizhao out there as well. Kyrie inside to a cutting Verizhao. That's how they roll. And that is how they do it. Bad pass. Here comes Matt. He'll attack. Strip away by Kyrie Irving. Out of bounds to the Hawks, but a great clean breakaway. Jeff Teague back out there. Goes to the left hand. The pull-up, but he hits it. See, those, that's the type of shot that's really important in this league. Kyrie pulls up, missed it, rebound to Horford. So Irving is 0-4 here tonight. Still without a field goal, nearly a game and a half against these guys, and Teague goes all the way. Rising is Teague for two man. more. It's just like Portland game, man. These guys shoot the ball. Kyrie ducks inside, spins it. He had to will it home, though. He took them all to the basket that time. Irving dancing with it, the pull up, two more! Williams off the screen, catch and shoot action. Oh, gravity took over for Lou Williams. National High School Player of the Year, his senior year. Same high school class that produced Andrew Bynum. And Kyrie again, three in a row. Carroll, short this time, rebound, ready made break for Kyrie. Will he attack? Wisely pulls up, looking at four red shirts. Sizes up Williams, crossed him over, fires, done again! Four straight for Uncle Drew! Bill Sapp, screening and rolling. Teague used the off-arm, gets all the way inside. Well, that's too easy. Jeff so Jeff Teague has 10. Jeff Teague starts the uh, second half with a pick and pop with Horford for two. Ball swing to Clark, puts it on the deck. Likes to see that, missed it though. But at least he attacked the rack. Here comes Teague in the open floor to a trailing Millsap, and he scores it. Never rushes anything, does it? He drew a switch. Horford left open, and hits that. Boy, they don't give you a chance to breathe, do they? <laughs> you, you, you don't play each play right defensively, they make you pay. Horford leans and scores two more. They're too easy. A good clean swipe, a quick one by T. Up top to Horford, running the floor. So Horford quickly has four field goals since halftime. Yeah, and, and this is what the Cavaliers could not afford coming out of the locker room. Kyrie turned the corner, faces, and hits. Gets one to stay down for him. Cavaliers have to get back in the game. Backside to Carroll, contested, 
missed it. Rebound to Verizhev. Carey steps into one. The bottom! Good look, he knew it when he let it go. <laughs> Teak looked behind and said, I don't believe you shot that ball. Kyrie knocks it down. Cavaliers regain the lead. Kyrie has come to life. He's figured the Hawks out on the defensive end of the floor. Leaking down the floor, Carroll. Teague sees him now as he attacks. And he hit that little rainbow. Jeff yeah. Teague has 12. 66-64. Kyrie uses his body and scores. Good idea. Kept his body in control so he could have enough stuff to land on the ball. Under a minute to go in the third. Head of steam. Dion again inside. Had it punched away. Here comes Teague in a foot race. Cut off by Jared Jack. Teague scores. Great control by Jeff Teague. I'll tell you, he, he's tough. He sure is. I like his game. 74-70 Hawks. Oh, backside steal. Nobody told Berger Teague was coming. Yep, and that is, is what Delhi has to say something. Irving back out there, drops off to Thompson, and he scores with and a teardrop. A big basket there. Corber on the catch. Dives in the lane, threw it away. Seller, again, good defensive play. Head of the pack, Deion Waiters. Scores off the soaring move inside. How quickly you can move the ball when you pass it first. Here comes Irving. Fires. Good again. Mid-ranger all night long. Two-possession game. Now it's time to pour it on him. Pass to Sheldon Mack, fires. Uh -uh. Rebound to Tristan Thompson. They are forcing them off the line, and when they get the shot, they are not ready to take it. Irving weaving, scoring! Kyrie Irving! Time out by the guy they call Bud! This Bud's for you! 88-81, Cavaliers plus seven! Inside Teague again. The master of that little flotation. 88-83. Kyrie turned the corner. Bolts inside again. It's the Kyrie show. Take him to the hoop, young man. Horford giving the green light for threes, and he hits it. How about that? Al Horford with a triple. You don't expect him to shoot many. That young man is, woo-hoo, boy. That's his fourth triple make of the season. T, keeping that triple alive. Barry Jow digging oh, in. Bad matchup here. Here comes T, baseline to Horford. Oh, what a great pass. A yep. slip yeah. pass right on the money to Horford. That was a bad matchup there. The Cavs should have had presence of mind to switch that back. The waiters came around. Jared Jack finding a Barry Jow. Sends it. And we've got bonus basketball here at the queue. Kyrie away from the screen, sends it, and hits it. It's important to get off the snide early, to get off to a good start. Now don't give up a three. Irving keeping that dribble alive. Verja left wide open. Sticks it. Anderson's been hitting that shot all season long. I like that play. Stoller. T trying to spin. Kyrie blocked by Kyle Korver and a foul. Got it. 103-99. Irving now at 28. He's got four in the overtime. Will the Cavaliers foul and negate a three? We'll see. Millsap goes inside. They'll give him that one as they score early on the clock. They'll play the foul game now. Della Vadova comes to the ball and he is fouled. He ought to be relaxed now to be able to fire this one right Dilly. in. Delhi. Got it! Yep. Didn't need any help that time. Now, final 10 seconds. Team, they'll give him that one. 7.2, Atlanta again will play the foul game. Got to get the clean inbound. Thompson to Delvin over again, 6.6 .6 to go, and Matthew has to go back to the strike. 108, 105. Here comes Teague out high. Open right. Yep. Jeff Teague buried it with 4.2 to go for three. Irving, oh my goodness, he lost the basketball. Millsap being guarded by Verizhau. Antich got hurt. Almost. Teague, deep corner fires. No! Double overtime in downtown Cleveland. Harold Antich stays out there. Irving sends and hits it for three. <laughs> Kyrie says, that's okay. I will take care of this time. Deep in the queue. 111-108. Teague out there with Millsap. Cover. Pocket picker. Here comes Kyrie. One man to beat. Spins it up and in. Straight for Uncle Drew and start the second overtime. Look out. And the Hawks come back with the quick two. Boy, that Teague is something else. Here comes Irving. On to give up. Thompson rolling. Fights it up. And there! Tristan Thompson for a filthy end one.
They have to execute now, which is part Irving for three. Got it! Perry right back at you! Mr. Sixth quarter tonight! Doing a good job of keeping the Hawks under control. Corner fires. Three again. My goodness. Coming up on two minutes to play in the second overtime. Kyrie backs out. It's got again! He's gone! Video game at him again! The Kyrie boy. He's a bad man. T going to work. Hops into Raiders. Finish it. And he's fouled. Jeff Teague puts the Hawks in front. We'll try to add a point to him. And Teague continues his scintillating night with 32. Now the Cavaliers down a deuce. Have to score now. Must score situation. One minute left in the second overtime. Carey caught him peeking, sends it. Got it! Good time! Game on the line once again. Teague taking a lot of time. Going to work with a step back. Oh, you have to be kidding me. A tap dancer at the horn to win. Getting ready for a long day's work on the defensive end of the floor. Avery Bradley entering the building a little while ago, waiting for him here. Kyrie Irving, one of the premier point guards in the league. It's the Celts and Cavaliers on a Saturday afternoon. Hey. Kyrie spins it home. Bradley will try it again. Back rims that one. Rebound controlled by the Cavs. And here comes Irving had with a 4-2 lead. Had four guys on the boards that time. South one of five to start the game. Irving drains a three. Clark will try and hits another one. Irving rejected by Humphrey. That was close. Well, I tell you, it is a heck of a drive. Deal was coming along for Washington. Irving, little pull-up jumper rattles it home. Irving gets in the paint and got pushed and will get to the line. 82% have been unassisted. That's the second highest percentage in the NBA. Only Bledsoe in Phoenix has a higher percentage. Irving for two. Kids nifty. Irving, strong play. Hey, Crawford cannot stay with him. 18 for Irving. That was slick by Irving right there. Well, they have taken Bradley off of Irving. Why, I don't know. Irving trying to shake press. He does and knocks down the jump shot. Bradley hustles back to cover Waiters. Lee got in the passing lane. Irving buries a three. Watch out for Irving here. Bradley back on Irving. Irving another three. Makes that one. And right on him. Yeah, he sure was. Kid's great shooter. 28 now for Irving. He's blowing on his hands. Wow. Wow. Now they forced a switch out. So Crawford's got to defend him. Oh, pretty good defense there by Crawford. He's going to score the basket on offensive goaltending. Avery Bradley. How is that? How is that? How is that a, a goaltending? That's way off the front of the rim. Yeah, I tell you. Busy weekend at Verizon Center. Hoops and hockey on tap. And tonight, Comcast Sportsnet brings you Wizards basketball. Wiz looking to hang on to the fifth best record in the East as they meet Kyrie Irving and the 16-33 and Cleveland Cavaliers. They have to focus on every game like they did against Oklahoma City, like they did against Portland, and like they did against San Antonio in the first half. Yeah, absolutely. Every game is going to be critical. I mean, at this point of the juncture, you have to start taking one game at a time. Great crossover move and two. Kyrie Irving coming in averaging just over 21 points a game, 13th in the league. Cavaliers lost to the Lakers Wednesday night, 119 to 108 in Cleveland. Sixth consecutive loss, but C.J. Miles had a big game, led all scorers with 27 off the bench. And a great drive by Irving, he's off to a hot start. Here's Beal with a nice catch and shoot, good pass. Ariza over the timeline is lipping, and let's see if he's going to be okay. Tristan Thompson at the other end. Nice pass. Ariza runs into trouble and then throws it away. Irving challenging at the other end. And a foul will be called on Wall. Miles. Shoot. 
Wall stops for the jumper. Good. Nicely done. Good steal. Absolutely. Wizards run three on two. Get it to Wall. Wow. Yeah, looked like maybe an extra step. But they often let you get away with that in transition. I've been noticing that more and more. They got scores on this team. C.J. Miles can score. Yeah. Uh, you know. And, and that's all we're saying. I mean, Irving will chase it down with six on the shot clock. Wizards on a 10-2 run. Nice move to get free and score. C.J. Miles picking up where he left off last night. Dion Waiters from the sideline. Irving with a fake. Lays it off. Miles the jumper. He is just unbelievable. He had 27 in the game Wednesday against the Lakers. Martell Webster give Wall another assist. And that's poked away. Washington gets it back. Two on one. Wall going all the way to lay it in. Looked like he looked up out of the corner of his eye just to make sure he had enough time on that game clock. And he didn't leave any left. He really <laughs> didn't. I mean, he had that clock down pat. Waiters from the top of the key, second chance points. Well, that one really hurts because Kyrie just got that shot off in time. Bennett scores. This time it's Wall for three, nothing but net. Irving on the fadeaway, good. Irving splitting defenders, picks it up, then gets the ball on the side. And how about that? Okay, they just don't have anybody missing. Five of six, three of five, three of five, six of seven, three of three. I mean, everybody shoot the ball well. For the Cavs. Collectively 63%. Gortat on the side. That's one of his favorite areas to shoot. Wall pushes it up. And draws contact as he got physical with C.J. Miles. Washington's made seven three-pointers so far tonight. In their loss to the Lakers the other night, the Cavaliers allowed L.A. to make a franchise record 18 three-pointers in that game. Nene blocks the shot by Irving, but a foul is called. Blocking foul called on Washington. Webster thought he had position. Irving, couple of great moves, get it back to him. Now a little double team. Verajon cutting inside, beautifully done. Cleveland by four. Irving with the one hand lays it up and in. Now we've had numerous conversations with him over the years. And, uh, and that would be the correct pronunciation of his name. Yeah. Irving. Jarrett Jack. Irving fires it up. He got fouled. Jack. Floater no good. Tip not there. Tip again. Tip one more time by Verjean. Wall comes down with it. Gets Irving turned around, lays it up and in. Well, that was a tough play because not only did John have to go a long distance, he actually had to elevate. He had a couple of defenders, and I think Miles was the other one, along with Ger uh, Irving. Beal works free. They need one from him, and they get it. Irving was on the floor for a minute. Now Wall drives, lays it up and in. Martell, catch, shoot, a little strong. Waiters coming the other way, knocked away by Wall and stolen. Wall fires and hits with the shot clock expiring. Nene shoots and hits. Irving back in the game after he got hit on the noggin. And he scores. Irving back to Thompson. The short shot, no good. Tip up. Nene pulls it down, throws it ahead on the outlet to Wall. Challenges Waiters, and a foul will be called. Wall the jumper. Got it. Wall drives, contact by G. Stops the clock, he'll shoot two. Wall will try a three. And 
scores. He wanted a foul, didn't get it, but it still went. Cuts it to six with 110 to play. Wall. Quartet missed the slam, but got it to fall in. 38 yeah, seconds. They, they got to go for some steals now. They got to gamble and not get some fouls. That's blocked by Wall and saved by Wall. Wall down court, and he's fouled by Thompson. So the best of all possibilities, Wall blocks the shot at one end, stops the clock at the other. Wall drives and slams it in. With 18 and a half seconds to play, a four-point lead. Irving, perfect tonight, 13 for 13, 23 points and 12 assists. Martell Webster drops in a three. Webster goes down court. Nene flips it up into the air. And that is the end of the game. A valiant effort on the comeback by Washington, but it results in a disappointing loss by the Wizards. to play here. Drop off to Thompson. Drops it off neatly to Kyrie Irving on the cut. Drop off to Thompson. Facing the soul with his life. Has time. Fought it off nicely. Jared Jack run off the line. Oh, behind the back to Kyrie Irving. Oh, sweet little play for three. And the Cavs get two. So Kyrie's got nine points now, including a couple of triples. Kyrie inside. Right down, Uke with the hard way. Kyrie doing a good job of taking it all the way to the hoop for two. Kyrie dancing with it. High arcing three goes. He's got 14 in the first quarter. 14 point first quarter. Again, his best of this young season. Coming off the first half double-double at Washington the other night. What do you like it? Well, again, Fred, they take, once you think took Kyrie off the ball, that freed him up to be Kyrie who he really is. And that's a two guard in a point, a two guard in a point guard's body, and he's having success doing it. First turnover for the Grizzlies in 16 minutes. That's how you get back in the game, Fred. No turnovers. Very job. Swinging down the lane and scores. Nice pass over the top by Kyrie. Addison does the rest to the hoop. Kyrie set his feet and hits it for three. Big basket right there. Kyrie deep in the two. Randolph flared out. Waiter stays there on the trap. Randolph stays inside. Had it blocked. Good no defense. Foul. Here come the Cavaliers. Kyrie in the spin mode. Open floor. Gets to the left. Scores! Kyrie with five straight points. Kyrie through the whole team for two. Miles catch and shoot. Ready to fire and aim and knock it down. Memphis is playing a solid defensive game, and this young man, Johnson, has just gone crazy. Missed a pirouette job. Back come the Cavaliers on the push. They need Still a basket. Time. They have to have a basket here. But got to move that basketball side to side. Kyrie dribbling, facing, and hitting. That big basket that time. James Johnson sizing up Luol Deng, his former teammate, going to work on a step back. No, decided not to shoot it. Now in the lane, Johnson lost it. Played loose by Berger, off the floor, Kyrie Irving, attacking, puts up, down, and a foul! Kyrie Irving, nice defensive sequence by the Cavaliers. They shut the basket down, once they shut it down, good steal by Andy, and Kyrie, using his speed, ball-handed ability, takes the bump, knocks it in, opportunity to take the lead. The dexterity to do it. And fling it at the rim. Ten seconds to go. Miller has Kyrie on the island. Cass cannot foul her. Randolph, the go-to guy. Five is lost the ball! Ball no way! Cameron has a 40-footer! At least we have overtime! Yes. Irving drops it off to Verja, sends it, and sticks it. He had been missing that shot two times. This time, Andy, that's the out. Irving came to the basketball. Says, foul me if you want. Oh, 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 oh. away from trouble. And eventually they have to foul. Maybe if Houdini could dribble like this, he wouldn't <laughs> have so many problems. Which way did he go? Kyrie Irving. Crowd gives him quiet sticks to first. Gets it again. 
Pelates is spurning valuable time. Stolen by Lerande. He'll back it out. Cavaliers are forcing him to try to foul. Now that came from his Chicago days. As Kyrie rolls in the first. Next twice. 27, 28 now for Kyrie Irving. Backside, Zach Rondo fires. Off the rim, rebound Kyrie. A one go winner. And the Cavaliers are 2-0. Oh. With David Griffin sitting in the big chair is the basketball boss of the White and Goldens. They bring great energy to the floor and they do it for 48 minutes. Kyrie Irving scored 31 points in the All-Star game and I thought he was the guy who was the anchor for the Eastern Conference as it withstood a scoring barrage by Kevin Durant and the West in the first half. Irving was the guy who set the tone playing tenacious defense and the other thing that he does well night to night all-star game a regular season whatever it may be he can break your defense down the Thunder will have their hands full with that young man tonight Irving coming off with a 25 point performance last night and a six point home loss to Toronto last time the Thunder saw him about a year ago as he sets up Spencer Hawes just acquired from the Philadelphia 76ers in trade Andrew Bynum was a bust. They signed him. He played two dozen games for him. Then they shipped him off to Chicago. He was there just long enough to screw up the chemistry almost. Adams is going to be called for basket interference. Count that bucket for Kyrie Irving. If you look at Irving fading away, baseline to score. Now, Perry Jones will get extended minutes in here. Boy, he was loading up for a throwdown finish, but had his shot. Altered right at the rim. That turns into a three in transition for Dang and the Cavaliers back within a point. Crowd fired up. Thompson found himself in a mismatch with Jackson. Got position and hammered it home to break that 12-point Thunder scoring run. Irving for three. Got KD in a retreat mode and backed him up just a few feet. That was enough room for Kyrie Irving to knock down the three. Irving attacking. And Durant will be called for the personal. Another long rebound for Jack and Irving by himself. What great body control as he scores deep. Deflected pass for the Thunder's 12th turnover. Dang finds the trailer. Hawes scores. Spencer Hawes back to the number he wore at the University of Washington. 32. Durant's first turnover of the game. That skip pass for this team works wonders, especially when you have. Cephalosha knocking down that corner three, his favorite position on the floor to shoot the three ball. Thompson on the jump stop scores. Tristan Thompson is three out of four. He's got eight points. Oz flat footed for three. Cleveland extending its defense. Lamb for three. Collis in the offensive rebound, then lost the handle. Delivered over the runner scores. And we're tied. Okay. On the bounce, Zeller scores on the pick and roll. G driving, dishing, Irving by himself for three. No doubt about that one. Kyrie Irving has 20 points, and he's tied the game again for the 10th time. That's a nice job of catching up with Irving, who with his penetration leaves a little bit of room for Anthony Bennett to score, and the Cavaliers have regained the lead. That's a deep one right there. Oh, it is. From Midwest City. That's Really, really deep, and uh, I'm sure Chabo was saying to himself, hey, I'm, I'm not thinking he's going to take that shot. And Baca called for the foul. Irving will shoot two. Jack following the signals. Cephalosha rotated late. Irving was by himself at the three-point line. Scott Brooks was calling for somebody to get over to guard him. Nobody did. Irving has his fourth triple and 28 points, a game high. Cleveland has shot it well here in the fourth hey. quarter. Irving attacking and one. A big basket for Kyrie Irving, who February the second last year in Cleveland scored 13 points in two and a half minutes to just about single-handedly win the ball game for the Cavaliers against Oklahoma City at their place. Yeah, the Thunder has not lost three straight home games, Grant, since our first season. Shot clock is off. Irving will kill the clock. Nothing left except for congratulatory waves to the Cleveland bench.
as the Cavaliers come to Oklahoma City and defeat the Thunder by a count of 114 to 104. Kyrie Irving with 31 points and nine assists in the ball game. All five Cleveland starters in double figures scoring. Cavalier fans, are you Favors on the block against Spencer Hawes. Favors sends it. Missed it. Rebound to Kyrie. And that's the one part of Favors' game that he has really improved. The 15-foot jump shot. Hawes. A little pick and roll. Kind of a half roll. And that's something he likes to do. Right now, you see, right now, Hawes is doing a good job of the pick and roll. Instead of popping, he drops into the open area and lays it in. Instead of a hard roll to the basket. You're right. There's a pick and pop action. Hawes off the bounce. Sends it and hits it. Back on the Cavs. Nice put a look off to Thompson. Good, nice pass by Kyrie. That was a little hesitation. He waited until he got double T got right into the, the right angle and then he made the pass. He throws the hammer down. Zelda rolling hard to the hole. That's yes. how they roll indeed. 22-18. Did not give Canner an opportunity to recover. Lays it in for two. Irving faces and hits. Kyrie knew he had the shot. Kyrie, ball in the string against Rush. Trying to extricate himself. Couldn't. Kick and pop action. Good ball fake. Hawes. Hit it. As Jeremy Evans bought it. Back to the way Kyrie flips it up. And he was fouled. Cavs with a chance to tie or take the lead here. Good spurt for this group. Inside. The major hammer throw now. And a timeout, Utah. You know, Utah wants to extend the floor again. They do with a Jefferson three. Cavs control the rebound. Kyrie in the push. They did this very well against OKC the other night as well, playing with pace. Kyrie inside, right down Euclid. Jet knife style, and he finished it. He's got six. Kyrie Irving down the middle of the defense for two. Burke to pull up. There's that back shot we talked about, but he missed it. But it's a bread and butter shot that he learned in the AU basketball in Columbus. Pass behind, Dang fights it up. And Lawal will shoot a couple. But wanting the uh, Northland Viking to do well as well as the Cavaliers win. Pause on the back down against Williams. Hooks it and scores it. Little mouse in the house, big style. This, this seven footer took Marvin Williams, who's six nine down there. In between the legs of favor for Tristan Thompson. He went five on him. Yeah, that was a pass there, baby. Nice pass by Kyrie, and Double T throws a hammer down. Irving, or excuse me, Jack, dancing and hitting off that screen from Tristan Thompson. Yeah, because Haywood was backing up. Burke found Williams. Puts it on the deck. Real short. Rebound to Thompson. So Tristan won that duel. Down the floor, lead feet. Hey. To Irving, who was fouled. As Jared Jack put it right on the fingertips. Utah looking to regain the lead. Williams. Rooms out to the Cavs. Carey immediately pushes. Rises and hits. Deontay Garrett floats. Just it short off the glass. Again, Hawes, Clinton glass, Kyrie, inside. Very accurate rubber all the way to the hole. That was a smooth play by Kyrie. He switched it over to the left hand, back to the right hand with a little smooth layup to the hoop. Irving steps into a three. The ball! Kyrie Irving gets the three goggles out. Time out, Utah. Yeah, he's trying to beer the third quarter performance in Salt Lake City. Favors wide right. Aggressive rebound by Kyrie Irving. He's got five of those, so you got to be thinking maybe triple-double. Who knows? Hayward fires. A glancing blow wide left. Drop off. Cantor shook the challenge by Zeller to get there in time. Here comes Burks inside. He missed it. Good, Good score against the Bigs. Here comes Kyrie. Off that outlet between the legs to Della Vidova. Probably didn't need to pass it like that. G backs up. Fires. Picked up by Jeremy Evans, who's out there with Jefferson. Along with Alec Burks. Good cut by Irving. Great dime by Zeller. That's North Carolina to Duke. Ball denial by Irving. Jefferson got away. Missed a shot. Down the floor, Irving racing. Almost scoring in one motion. He, he had one hand tied behind his back. Carey, no space to go in between there. Keeps that dribble alive. Skip feed to Hawes. Fires. 
for three. Give Kyrie Irving another dime, 11 of them, and give Hawes a three ball. He's got 11 points. The Adlers are converted. 24 of 37 second half possessions with Kyrie on the floor. Ducks inside, and it is. Beautiful spin move. He's got 21. Canner faces. It is Canner missed it. Rebound. There's number nine. Oh, I think he smells it. Gary tapping it. To oh, it's a touch to his feet. To Patterson with a hook. The Williams fires. Nope. Clancy Brown. There it is. Rebound number 10. There it is. And the first Cavalier triple double in four years. And you know who had the last one. He wore 23. So 21, 10, and 12, his line as he comes off to a standing O. Listen to him. How we deserve it? Very deserving of it. I mean, it's a triple-double, big time. But what I'm more impressed with is the way he ran the team tonight. 21 points, 10 rebounds, 12 assists for Kyrie Irving in 38 minutes. We'll talk more about it coming up right after the game on Cavaliers Live. A standing up for the guys that want to go. And the New York Knicks trailing the Cavs in Eastern Conference standings, losing as we speak. A one and goal winner, and the Cavaliers on triple-double nights. Kyrie Irving, his first career TD. Well, the Cavaliers, five games left. And, of course, with their playoff hopes still flickering, they must get a win here tonight. And the idea is to try to run the table. They're taking on a team, the Charlotte Bobcats, that can make sort of history, if you will. Their second playoff berth clincher could be theirs if they get a win. They've only been in the postseason once, of course, and that was four years ago. Kyrie left open. Made him pay for three. Jefferson for a better shot for Walker for three. No, clanked it off the backboard. Yeah, that was a brick shot there. Here comes Good Kyrie, pass. right in the post pad, and it's gone from that QB, Spencer Hawes. <laughs> Quarterback Hawes to wide receiver, <laughs> Kyrie for two. Dang, could not get away from Kid Gilchrist. Irving posting up, center. And hit it off a rubber rim. Kyrie's got eight. They did a good job of waiting because that is the advantage Kyrie has. Mouse in the house. Turnaround jump shot. Irving overplayed on his right side. Squares up and hits it. Creating space. He's got 10. Can Gilchrist miss it at the rim. Woo. Challenged by Berejot. Can't spread the floor well. Kyrie in a catch. Fires for three. Got it! Nothing but the bottom. Kyrie with a very hot first quarter. And a low scoring first half because of cold shooting on both sides. But that does not include one Kyrie Irving. He is 5 of 6 in 11 productive minutes. He's got 13. The rest of the ball club is 6 of 30. You're right. And, and that's what the, the elite is supposed to do. When things are not going good, you have to step up and get things going for the team. Right now, Kyrie is doing just that. Inside, Hawes takes his time and scores. Kyrie ran off the line, finding Thompson on a two-hand. That time they made Jefferson guard two men. Good penetration by Kyrie. The double T throws a hammer down. Kimmel Walker foul line check. Hey. Easy rebound for Waiters. Kyrie fires the bottom for three. Has a look on his face like finally we get one to go. Waiters squares up and hits. Good looking stroke there, Berdian. He's got seven now. Irving sends it high. Rainbow had to adjust that shot in midair. Kyrie dancing with it. Next whistle puts him to the line. Kyrie on the back. The fadeaway knocks it down, so he's got 20. Kyrie Irving was fouled. Now he's in a three or a two. Yeah, still down five. Tyler Center back out there. Kyrie keeps Douglas Roberts on his hip. Mirage out wide open. And he sticks it. Kyrie drawing three guys to him. Anderson pops it over there and knocks it down. Kyrie walks into one. The bottom! Oh, a tantalizer knocked it down, and the Cavaliers finally climb back to tie it up. You can see he was feeling that one, Fred. Jefferson sends it. No, wide left. Boy, this has been like a root canal trying to come back from this. Kyrie steps in a long one. The bottom! Kyrie Irving feeling it right now. Don't you love Monotony? Time out with 107 to go in the third. Heat check time. Marriage out. Left side. Got it! A mirror image in the other one. Thompson. Got a hurry here. Tristan bumps. Off his spot. Kyrie with time. Sends it. The bottom! Gunslinger bucket by Kyrie Irving. 
Inside, Irving from Barajas. Anderson kept his patience. And he did a good job of not giving up on the play. Kyrie moving without the basketball. Cavs gonna break two points. Side, teardrop. Got it off the rubber rim, Spencer Holmes. A nice pass by Kyrie. Under a minute to go. Kyrie, jitterbugs inside on the finish for 52.6. Good guys back in front by one. Got to have defense now. Kyrie's going to have to dig in against Walker. Can't give him a three. Walker fired. Oh, my goodness. You cannot give that you shot. You can't up. give him that shot. You can't give him that shot. Kyrie rises. Got it. Tie ball game, 82 apiece, and they could possibly get another possession. Do not need to foul here. Obviously, with the game on the line. Kyrie doing a good job of taking care of his business. Still have that foul to give. Walker came to the ball. Game on the line. Sizes up. Irving rises for the win. We got bonus basketball in downtown Cleveland on a Saturday night. So a clean slate as we head to the OT. Where the Cavs have been pretty good this year. Five and two. As you can see, the uh, second half shot making that the Cavs came up with led by Kyrie's 37 points. And he's done a good job, Fred, of understanding wh what the defense is doing to him. Irving rises, he was fouled on the jumper, hung in the air just long enough to draw the contact from Walker. Here walk by Walker, got it up with a short shot clock, Cavaliers come away with it. Chance to run now, here comes Kyrie Davies, an open floor for Kevin and he's fouled! Kyrie Irving gets the ball, takes it coast to coast. Now you see me, and now I'm at the hoop for two. And again, with him in the open floor, as lethal as anybody. Oh, yes. That, if he did that for four quarters, nobody would touch the Cavs, I think. Irving around the screen, faces up. Again! He can't miss! Light him up, Kyrie! Light him up! He's got 44. Here comes Hawes out high. Pumping for three and hitting. 4.1 left. Missed it! Down the floor, Hawes! Nope. And the Cavaliers fall short, and the Bobcats begin the celebrating. 7-5. Last year averaged 14 points a game at career best. Kyrie on the aggressive drive and draws that foul. 10-6 to score. Burke coming in was 2 of 17 outside the arc. Kyrie over gets two back. LeBron did a good job of setting the pick for Kyrie. Kyrie did a good job of waiting, letting LeBron get set. Then use the pick properly. Kyrie choosing inside. Nice little spin move. Yes, move. Well, he had a chance to read it because everybody was afraid to, to attack him. So he just let the defense stand bay, at bay and then he takes it to the basket. 22 16. Ingles, a lefty, fires. Yep. Rebound to Barry John. Did a good job of making him have to take that extra pass. On the floor, Kyrie Irving. Got to hurry. Sends it for three. And hits it at the horn. The breakdown is coming. After one or two pick and rolls, they seem to have, they get confused on the defensive end. Harry change of pace. Oh, man. Somehow swoops it in with the right hand. Well, he saw the defender on his left side, so he went back under the basket. It's a crafty move by Kyrie. Irving, sensing a whistle is coming, so immediately went into a jump shot mode. And the foul on Burke. They were double teamed. Used the dribble to extricate himself. Kyrie on the steal. Foot race down with Burks. Gets inside him. And he, oh boy, what a burst of speed by Kyrie Irving. Gary trying to get through the rim, does the left hand, and it rolls in. He got a chance to turn the corner that time on Burke, straight to the basket. Kenner threw up a medicine ball from 23 feet. It's a little breeze on that side of the, the basket. Well, that's why they... It's coming down. No, it's not. It's going away from him. That's why the bigger guys go for those corner threes, because it's <laughs> the, the shortest three on the map. Gary for three. Got a bunch of time left, over 16 minutes. Gary gets inside, fights it up and in, he gets favors. Good job of keeping the defender on the ground that time. Kyrie did a good job of getting into his body to make the layup. Dante Axel to a rolling hunter. Nope. Gobert attack. Almost got that to go. You know, it's almost like when Gobert is on that side of the floor, you cannot switch that. You you gotta fight your way through that pick so Andy can stay in front of him. Kyrie Irving drinks it. And again, Kyrie now, 24 points. Irving off the screen, dancing with it, and hits it again. Got it dialed in right now. Kyrie came to the ball against Burke. 
Kicks him inside. Flicks it up and in. A one-man wrecking crew is one Kyrie Irving. Yeah, Kyrie is starting to really keep getting hurt on his heels now. Now the Cavs got somebody to play off of. Get that defense to go in there. Well, on the block, instead of Kyrie, foul on the arm. Is it three? Yes, yes sir. Yes, sir. Burks run upon. Off the bounce. No, sir. Rebound to Kevin Love. Toughest shot in the world. Wide open. Why is that? Because he just, it, it, it's just a funny feeling when you're about there by yourself. Barry inside. Off the glass. Somehow with a rubber rim involved. He went Puxy on him. First late of the game for the Clevelanders. All right, Kevin is at first. It lead of the ball game. Now it's time to tap down on the defensive end. Shot clock is short. Rolling his favors. Stolen oh, blind side. Kyrie Irving gets it back from LeBron. Spins it up and in. Somehow, someway. 56.3 to go in the camp down a deuce. Defense, defense. Kyrie, great move to the basket. Cavaliers down two. There's been lights out. 14 for Mr. Fourth Quarter in this final session. Yeah, he's come to life now. And the uh, Cavaliers have an opportunity now to get themselves tied up. An opportunity to take the lead with some good defense. Put the defense beautifully there. He's had some tough traffic shots. LeBron the trigger. With a very good crowd. They've been in for it. Pass for Love. Knocked away to LeBron. Deep corner. Fires. Got it somehow. Are you kidding me? 13.4 oh, to go. 98-97. Yeah, they're going to have to foul here. And Kyrie Irving fouling Burks. They'll need a three. LeBron James sizing him up. Stepping in. Looking for a whistle. Oh, and he got it. LeBron James with foul. A chance to tie it up with 3.4 to go. A trifecta with a game on the line. LBJ. Ingles to trigger. Hayward as LeBron fell down. Thompson has to pick him up. Hayward fires. Got it. Can you believe it? In the identical spot that Sundiata James beat the Cavaliers. Years ago, and Hayward does it again. Started at one guard from Duke University, number two, Kyrie Irving. Davis from the elbow came up short. Like I said, he's a pretty good, better jump shooter, just hasn't hit the first couple. Believe me, those will go down as yep. the game goes on. Cavaliers got to be a little careful with leaving him open. Love his sweet spot for three. Kevin Love and the Cavaliers in a 7 nothing getaway. Well, that's what you want to do. Keep Davis away from the scoring area. Kyrie backs up and hits it for three. That's what we need. Under two minutes to go in the first quarter. Evans guided that three ball, missed it. Irving, bounce feed to Thompson. In deep, scores it. Nice delivery by Kyrie. That was a good pass and a good catch by Double T. Kyrie keeping his head up, delivers the pass. Kyrie spinning on the shovel feed. Ball almost ripped away. Kevin Lama bump on the bucket. Well, Love has five. Inside for two. Kyrie Irving. Ten to shoot. Inside LeBron James with a rim rocker. If you move it enough against this project zone, you're going to have success. And LeBron throws the hammer down. Pick and pop action. Love some space. And he stuck it for three. That was a nice move that time. They set that play up. Deep in the two, Taylor. Holiday fell down, leaving Irving open. Ducks inside, put it up and in. Kyrie Irving. About an 8.5 degree of difficulty. Davis, the passer this time. Turning, touch shot, missed it. A rebound, good position by Marajet. There's good defense by Love, Keep making him stay away from the basket. Kyrie Irving pushing the pace, finding Marajet. 16 foot box. Oh, the rubber rim, it goes down. Kevin is within two. Irving with it. Given the right hand, so he ducks inside. Too easy. I think Holiday was expecting help behind him. You're yeah, right, and no one was there. Kyrie to the hoop. Kyrie trying to create space, puts it on the deck. Good hard drive, and he scored it. Nice penetration to the basket by the Cavaliers. Moving to the other side of the floor. Kyrie straight to the hoop. Irving's got 11, six in this half. Gordon fires, rims out to the Cavs. Down seven as they go back to work. Kyrie steps into one, and it's two in a row. That's Tyree Kevin, still with a dribble. A nudge, using his strength, missed it. Tipped in the air by LeBron James, Cavs control. Trying to push the pace. 
Kyrie, burning back for number, scores it! I'm right at Gordon! <laughs> oh my, his tires are smoking, he's got 15. Oh, he was going at a fast pace that time. Kyrie, wise decision now to run a play. It'll be a two-man game with Thompson. Kyrie Arches. The ball is Kyrie Irving! Mr. Third Quarter taking over! Cavaliers not at 78! Kyrie Irving! Deep in the queue. That's a bad man. He's got 18 now. Irving shadowed by a double team. Looks inside. Drop off to Thompson. Inside yes, with a deposit through Anthony Davis. Throw him out in the hoop tonight. Double team. Throwing the hammer down. Cavaliers for their first lead since 1817. Backside. Love is in the air. For three, though. Yes. Kevin Love. Love is deep in the air. Tyreek Evans. Blocked by Tristan Thompson. Says enter at your own risk. Cavaliers trying to get the rebound. One against four was Davis. Kyrie Irving hit a steam and he draws that foul. Kyrie loves to get you back penalty. Ball swing to the corner to Irving. Has the baseline, so he rises anyway. And sticks it. He cannot miss. Kyrie Irving. Kyrie lost Gordon. Lost the ball though, too. Jitterbugging inside. Caught it and one. Here comes Evans, overplay to his right. Left side is his weakest, just a rebound, ripped out of there by Irving. And that was overplay on the right side. The left side, because he doesn't shoot the ball well, but his left hand, that time, he used the right hand on the wrong side of the basket. Yeah, normally he'll do a pull-up jumper if he has that left hand. Irving, go again! This is ridiculous! Kyrie ridiculous! 110-99! Kyrie Irving! He's a bad man. Here comes Anthony Davis inside that arc. Long rebound chased down by LeBron James. And New Orleans will say, we tip our hats to you. Standing on for the one and goal. Our one and goal winner, 118 to 111. Here at the Verizon Center in Washington, D.C., the Wizards hosting the Cleveland Cavaliers. The fans filing in on a brisk night. A capacity crowd expected sold out to see LeBron James' first visit to the Verizon Center in his return to Cleveland. And it should be a tough matchup. John Wall and the Wizards off to an excellent start. They're 7-3 on the young season. Nene hits his second in a row. He's not an all-star, but he's a guy who just, when he's healthy, he's been an excellent NBA player. Well, and his presence for this team is critical as a beautiful drive there by Kyrie Irving to the rim. Nice defense from Kevin Love, and Irving gets it tipped out to him. Irving drives, can't finish, but got knocked down. And this is going to be fun to watch, John. Irving and John Wall, two of the quickest in the league. And I think it's been really frustrating. He's got guys out here that haven't played in any meaningful games in their career as Tecla misses the three. I mean, you're talking Kyrie Irving, like, oh, oh what wow. a play! The pass was a little bit behind, then Irving comes up with a steal and throws up an air ball. James right there. That was a sensational a catch. How in the world did he do that? Just to get a hand on it, number one, and then it goes in the basket. Obviously, Bosch and Wade were at different stages of their career, but it still, it takes time. Varejao gets it. Nice play from Beal to break that up. Beal throws it ahead. Good look to John Wall and an easy transition bucket. Good steal. Pierce ahead to Wall. Already five turnovers for Cleveland. Wall to the basket. Count it and one. Went right at Irving, who was backing up. And John Wall with a chance for a three-point play. Wall had his breakout season last year. He's still only 24 years old. Finally made an all-star. I shouldn't say finally. Oh, what a quick move again. And a burst of speed from Wall. Oh. We just see LeBron force up a shot there. And look again, John Wall pushing out to Beal. Three-pointer, knocks it down. What a stroke. He got up the floor in about four dribbles. And Beal off the bench already with seven points in five minutes. Up assignment for Joe Harris guarding John Wall. Harris, the second-round pick for Virginia. A little shake and bake. Flashy stuff here from the Wizards. They've scored seven in a row. Mike, if John Wall can become a consistent jump shooter, he'll be unguardable. Irving Hall, pretty crossover move from Kyrie Irving. That was sweet. Wow. Are you with me on this handle? I mean, really? Look at that. In and out. 
pull it back. Humphreys turns his back. And Kyrie knocks down the fadeaway jack. Irving trying to find a spot. Slip pass to Bergeon. Nice pass from the big man. And Kyrie Irving will go to the free throw line. Seraphin nice again. Nene wrestles it away. John Wall to the basket inside Seraphin. A very active Kevin Seraphin off the bench. Seven points, two boards in six minutes. 37 year old Paul Pierce in his 17th year in the league. Spots up for three. Wizards by 18. Well, one of the things, don't you think? Oh, Wall on the steal. Great anticipation. And the finish. One of the things the Cavs players have to get used to is they're getting everybody's best shot sure. every single night, and they're not used to that. Oh. Irving, pretty crossover, draws the foul. As Wall with a bump. Seven to shoot, John Wall. Flips it up and puts it in. Well, we saw earlier in the game, Mike, we talked about when Cleveland wins, good steal there as Irving's going to get the breakaway easy one. And who had his, got his hands on the pass? Sean Marion, 36 years old in his 16th year in the league. Well, a little bit of defensive energy here, though. I mean, that was some good rotations as Wall knocks down the three. Second chance opportunities. So often they result in wide open three point shots, and Wall knocks that down. But Cleveland playing with a little more energy, better defense right there in the half court. Temple's recent shooting woes continue. Irving gets away from him, finds Farage out, coming to the basket. Pretty play. We talked about this on Wednesday night during the Spurs game. He's a super finisher. Think about Chris Anderson and what he meant to the Miami Heat. He always seemed to be in the right place at the right time. Make yourself available. And Verjao does that as good as anybody. Marion's tip doesn't go. Gortat, the rebound. James saw that one coming. Comes up with a steal. Finds Kevin Love. Love, wild shot and pierced the rebound. Yeah, probably didn't even have to shoot that one. That was... A good recovery by Gortat as he runs the floor. What a finish by him. Nice play. Gortat's been quiet offensively, just four points. Well, that was pretty. And John Wall sees the floor so well. And he's really improved this year after year. Wall hits it despite the Heat's 9-8 and eight start, calling for Eric Spolster's job. Well, he wound up in the finals that year as John Wall got a nice smooth jumper and a lead back up to 14 for the Wizards. Barajal's going to try another jumper. That one rolls in and out. Mike, why would you start doing LeBron when he gets the ball? That's not smart. <laughs> Wall, another oh, jumper. John Wall, eight straight points by the Wizards. Largest lead of the night. Timeout Cleveland. Wall, that time pass. Too strong, comes right back with another steal. That's his third steal of the night. Thompson on Wall. Wall gets past him, flips it up, and gets knocked down hard. Just that little quick burst so of quick. speed. Yeah, he's just incredible speed. Oh, wow. nice move there. Yeah. Beal just his second game back. He played 26 minutes the other night. He's played 21 so far. Waiters, nice defense. Irving tips it ahead. There we go. Reverse. Oh, man. Boy, tough angle shot with defenders draped all over him. Gortat sets the screen. Wall jump shot again. Wow. 11 for 16 from the field. He's got 26. 15 here in the third quarter. Definitive analysis day in and day out. That's something that you have to get used to, correct? Yeah, well, sure. I mean, do you think Kyrie Irving's How about John Wall? <laughs> To the rim, finishing with the left, and he feels like they can't stop him right now. You know Cleveland's going to come out with now, a burst. We well, do a, yeah, we got to do a better job taking care of the ball. We're up 15, but we threw the ball away at least eight times, turned it over eight times there. We've got to make sure that we get a shot each time down the floor. We can't give them easy opportunities. How can you get your team to play the way you want them to play if LeBron's not out on the floor? I mean, so you have to have him out there. You have to have Love out there. You have to have Irving out there. For the majority of the minutes, good finish. Uh, Irving, Irving finds a way on the angle off the glass. He's so good going to the basket. The difference tonight has been John Wall. Uh, absolutely sensational, pushing the basketball. He's third in the NBA in assists. Finding his backcourt, maybe he's finally got back Bradley Beal. And then finding his big fellow. You run the floor, he'll make you pay it. And the jump shot, 42% coming in on the season, but it's been dialed in this evening. 12 of 20 for Wall. He's got six 
boards, six assists, and four steals. Irving, nice crossover, goes at Serafin, and a foul on Serafin. And the Wizards can dribble it out. They'll improve to eight and three. Again, their best early season start in 40 years. They've got the second best record in the East. They're now five and one at home as they win going away against the Cleveland Cavs. John, you guys are 8-3 and three now. There was a lot of talk coming into the game that you guys hadn't really beaten a good team. Nobody can say that now. How big was this win? Uh, it was key. We knew this was a tough week for us. Uh, the toughest teams we played in Toronto, those guys, they beat us handily. And uh, we felt like we let one go against Dallas. And uh, we know Cleveland is going through tough times of trying to figure out what their identity is, but they're still a tough team. And uh, we're happy to come out here and get a good win at home. I talked to you before the game. You downplayed the matchup with Kyrie. Kyrie Irving, another top young point guard, but you were terrific. How big was that matchup in your mind? Oh, uh, it's big, man. Like I said, I'm, I'm known in this league as, as, as getting my team wins. So I'm just trying to become a better leader. He's a talented player, somebody I look up to, and we have a great friendship off the court. Uh, between the lines, we battle, but uh, it's Washington Wizards versus the Cleveland Cavaliers. What was really working for you tonight? You told me you weren't a scoring point guard, <laughs> but you scored a lot tonight. What was really working for you? Well, at certain times when our team need me to be aggressive and score, and uh, Paul's a great leader, and he told me to be aggressive at times. And uh, he said I was being too passive early on, so I just tried to get to the basket. Uh, my mid-range is falling. Uh, I had a great workout with my trainer that was here, and uh, it paid off tonight. You were coming off the game against Dallas. I know you didn't feel like you played well. How big was that on your mind coming into this game? Uh, it was big, man. Uh, I had a lot of stuff going on off the court. Uh, coming in shooting 6 or 17, I felt like I could let my team down. I had an opportunity to be aggressive and lead us to wins. So uh, in this league, you got other games other nights back to back. So I, I threw it off my shoulders, had a good workout the day before, and I uh, came out and had a good game today. Obviously a great start to the season for you guys. Now you have Bradley Beal back. How much of a higher level can you guys play at with him back? Oh, we can go to a high level. You know, we still can get better defensively, offensively. Uh, our efficiency is not there yet. You know, we still getting used to playing with others. And uh, we just got to learn how to not turn the ball over a lot. In the third quarter, we gave up too many easy turnovers, and even in the fourth quarter. So uh, we got a lot of room for improvement. Here comes Rodney Stuckey, the one-time Pistol. Signed a one-year deal in the offseason. Missed it inside. It was pistoled by Sean Murray. He got his hand on it, Fred. Kyrie off the box. And sticks it. Nice high pick by Double T. And Kyrie knocks it down. Donald Stone improves three-point shooter. Missed it. Snap pass down to racing Kyrie Irving. Good catch by Marion. Ball is really, oh, and no look, beauty. Inside, Irving. Kyrie and company, 18-4 on the clinic. Great pass by LeBron James. Everybody went to the corner. It's Kyrie cutting through the hoop. All right, goodness. Brooklyn missed it. Down the floor, Sean Marion. Again! That was a great pass by Kyrie. He passed, he passed that ball before he hit the floor. Kyrie talked about today with us the uh, touchdown pass. And he says, I haven't thrown one yet. That was Brian Hoyer asked. DJ Watson had the pass knocked away. Block shot though inside. Here comes Love. Killer Rajay behind the back. Kaz pulling out all the tricks here, but they turned that one over. He's 30 years of age now, but certainly has found a home with these patients. Signing with him as a free agent last year. Kyrie Rajay hits it. Looking for a tough, tough end work. Doing a good job of moving bodies and moving the ball. Deion Waiters gets it back. Again. Sizing up his former teammate C.J. Miles. Kyrie Irving for three. Kyrie Irving from Dion Waiter deep in the queue. Kyrie man is back. Weaves his way inside. Kyrie serving to Tristan Thompson. Doing a good job of keeping his head up. He finds double T and he lays it in. Kyrie, 10 foot follow the hits. We'll see if the Cavs can get a first down. Ball swing to Scola. Thompson replaying. Scola on the deck. The runner bits. Rebound to the Cavs. Indiana's done a nice job dropping back after that early barrage by the Cavs. From 25 feet. Kyrie Irving the bottom. LeBron doing a good job of finding Kyrie. Kyrie doing a good job of, of finding the open area deep in the two. Slow. Swarmed by the Kettler defense. He passed the ball straight out of bounds. LeBron off one leg. Missed it. And that's the, that's the difference. Now the Pacers are running the Cavs. Slow. Let it strip. Cavaliers with a steal. Love down the floor to 23. One man to beat Hill. Does. And he was fouled. 
carry up top to Tristan Thompson and a high hand up. Cavaliers come out of the locker room with great energy. Get away, Kyrie, cut off by Mahini. Mahini has to stay on it. Let's see if he tries to take him off the dribble. No, a three ball stance. Sends it, knocks it down. Coolly, calmly outside that three point line. Ronald Sloan showing his quickness, ducks inside now. Cavaliers a rebound. Mahini got away with some contact there. Thompson went down. And then an open floor foul drawn by Kyrie Irving sending the Cavs in the free throw line. Sloan, double clutching, out of rhythm, missed it. He's an improved his feet, worth shooting this year. Bounce toss to Sean Marion. Inside, right down Euclid. Kyrie with a nice cross court pass. And then Marion with a nice layup to the hoop. Cavaliers are on the move. Boy, when they run, they are lethal. Kyrie on the beat. Ah, he was fouled at the hour. Looking for the end one, Irving's got 21, looking for 22. He is really starting to get very good at stopping right there at the foul line and making that shot. They're gonna clear out, let Kyrie take it. Kyrie inside. Right down, you could finish it up. You could tell, you knew that was coming. You knew he couldn't stay with Kyrie, and Kyrie takes him straight to the hoop. One and go winner. 109-97. Cavs came in number 16 in the league in defensive efficiency. And they will likely move up a couple of rungs after holding these Pacers to 39% shooting tonight. For the next 12 chat lead, they did beat the Cavaliers on opening night in Cleveland, marking the return of LeBron James to Cleveland. One of their four wins on the season. Here's Irving from downtown, way off, rebounded by Marion. Gets it back to Kyrie Irving. Oh, beautiful reverse. Yeah, I'm sorry. Kyrie Irving, while a young player coach, as gifted physically as anybody at that point guard position in this league. Called her own. Trying to get it to Shumpert. And here comes LeBron. Nice pass on the bounce. And Irving with a spectacular move. That's where Irving is so special. He gets around the rim. His ability to change hands and finish just spectacular. All right, David Aldridge reporting from our... On sideline with just under five remaining in this first quarter. That will not count. A foul on the shot. It's not a matter of force feeding, but we got to, you know, we got to run stuff and we got to do things that to get him involved early and often. And, you know, when we do that, he, he gives it back to us. And a nice move by Kyrie Irving to open up this second quarter. Irving behind the back to beat Prigioni and then tied up and fouled by Stoudemire. Well, Cavalier head coach David Blatt telling us earlier he was not happy with his team's play the other day when they won against Milwaukee as Irving knocks down the jumper. Shot clock to five. Irving for three. Yes. Kyrie Irving from downtown. He has 15 points. That counts in the foul. What a move by Kyrie Irving. <laughs> First he beats you with the dribble moves, then he has an incredible knack of finishing around the rim. You think sometimes he's taking the layup from too far out. Nice move by Irving, went to the left hand as he drew the foul, it is on Larkin. Irving, oh, with the spin on Larkin, not able to hit, rebounded by Love, and he's pushed, foul call. You can see Kyrie Irving taking a look. Let's see who's guarding me. So was Shane Larkin and said, you know, I can do this. Yeah, he's pretty much said that about everybody that the Knicks have put on him tonight. Six-second differential. James met by Stoudemire. Here's Irving with a deep three attempt. Yes! What a second quarter for Kyrie Irving. Two guys that were projected to be in that starting lineup. Calderon just got back six games ago and Bargnani Andre Bargnani has yet to play, so it makes it a little more difficult as Kyrie Irving knocks down another triple. AC has scored seven of the Knicks' nine points this quarter, 14 in all. And off the, the drive by Irving, a foul call. LeBron, two for ten, eight points. Meanwhile, Kyrie Irving continues to score. 30 for Irving. Once again, Anthony. Defended by James. Make it four for 14 for Carmelo. Oh, another gorgeous move by Irving. You're enjoying this, Greg. Uh, he's he's fun, liking it. It's just fun to watch. I mean, I'll tell you what, he, and I said earlier, he really does embarrass you at times with his offensive repertoire. Here's Stoudemire on the move. He's stripped by Marajal. 
three on two for the Cavs. The finish by Irving. Two zone. time zone, two times ball comes back the other way. Two scores for Cleveland. Larkin with the runner, banks it home. And Shane Larkin rewards Derek Fisher for staying with him. I think in part, even though he commits by, I think he wants some of his quickness on Kyrie Irving here in this fourth quarter. Irving will toss it in. James with a deep three. Yes! LeBron James showing some signs here in the fourth quarter. Shot clock is down to three. The steal by Irving. James on the stuff! Club has a 20-second timeout left. Shot clock down to five. The crossover by Irving. Here's the oh. shot off glass. Kyrie Irving with 37 points. <laughs> Added to his season high. The Cavs now lead by three. Derek Fisher using his final timeout with 10 seconds remaining of the four. He turned down the screen that was being set at the top of the circle. He went to his left hand. Watch this finish. We're down to five. Anthony putting moves on James. Takes the three for the tie. That will not count. Well after the final horn. And again, a very tough loss for the Knicks. Not able to win the close games. Cavaliers pull it out, 90 to 87. Hey, Kyrie, walk me through that last play with the clear out with LeBron, gave you the left side. Uh, it was just a setup play from Coach. Did a great job of calling the play. And, um, you know, I just give all the credit to my teammates for setting great screens tonight. You know, got me in a, a great rhythm throughout the whole entire game. And, you know, we came out with this win in, in Madison Square Garden. What kind of victory is this when, when you don't play your best as a team and maybe you don't bring that defensive intensity from the jump? I mean, the only thing that matters is that we got the W. You know, obviously there's things to learn, things we got to correct that we're watching film tomorrow morning. But we got to get ready for a game, uh, you know, against the top team in the East, and that's the Toronto Raptors. But we came here and handled business. May not have been a perfect game, but we got it done. What do you think your team's identity is right now at this point in the season? We're still figuring it out. And I, I think that's the greatest thing we have going right now is just the energy we have and just trusting each other, learning to trust each other, learning how to be great teammates with one another and win games like this, close ball games. Number two in the Eastern Conference and rising daily, the Atlanta Hawks back at Phillips Arena to take on the Cleveland Cavaliers, a ball club where the expectation level was very high at the beginning of the year, but they're struggling at 18 and 12 and coming in after a big loss to Detroit. The Hawks back home with that great 22 and 8 record. Millsap, baseline oh. turn. Kristen Thompson rebounds. Kyrie gets the bump and oh. banks it in. A three-pointer and a foul on Damari Carroll. Banks in a three off balance. Carroll loads up three short. Irving on the lob to Thompson in transition. Cavaliers lead 6-5. Well, one thing Tristan Thompson will do, he will run the floor, and they look for him on those quick lobs. Kyrie down from his knees, bounce to Thompson. Hey! Irving, got oh, it! another three-point play. Another spectacular basket, and another foul coming on Damari Carroll. So two quick ones on D.C. will bring Tabo Cephalosha in the game. Inside, Kyrie goes with that strong left hand. He's got nine. Here's Deion Waiters who just checked in. Hoisting a three and hitting it. And he has not bashful. He will put it up. Kyrie Irving brings it ahead. Oh, man, Kyrie Irving with that handle. Goes over the top. Miller, wing three is good. And that's Harris. Oh, Harris, rather, excuse me, as Joe knocks it down. He's third among rookies in three-point shooting at 39 percent. Kyrie on the line to Tristan Thompson. Oh, that was set up all the way by Kyrie Irving. Irving, five seconds, four. Kyrie all the way. And it's going to be a blocking foul. The Hawks take a one-point lead into the second period. Kyrie Irving giving it out front. Here's Kevin Love for three, and he drills it. Open and, look, and he knocks down his first field goal. And that was a wide open look. He had time to measure the seams and get his feet together. <laughs> Though I, I thought I was best used helping folk out. David Blatt, hands on hips, watches his offense. As Kyrie Irving works with Kevin Love. Kyrie to the hole. 
And he's he could flat do that. He's a talent. 56-41. Kyrie. He's got 17. Cleveland don't have anybody at the rim. And so you can get all you can eat down there. But Miller has not taken a shot. And he's started the game. Della Vadova comes back to knock down his second three tonight. Kyrie with a quick move. Kyrie Irving, that's a tough shot. Mike Scott lost the dribble, tried to find Damari in the corner. Kyrie again, and it rolls in. Boy, he got some speed. He, he's one of the best in the league at changing direction to get to the basket. Kyrie going to work again and scores again. That's 12 in the oh, period cooking. at 25 for the night. Lob too tall for Mike Scott. Turnover is Atlanta's 11th. Irving. And that's a three. Oh, look at Kyrie Irving looking at the young fella. So I had to get those three back some kind of way. Teague back in. Operates. Gets waiters on his hip. Puts it up. No. Dion the other way. Kyrie nails a three. Kyrie Irving. Oh, he is on fire tonight. 31 by Kyrie Irving. Long. Thompson and a foul. Kyrie Irving misses the three. Thompson, the offensive rebound, his specialty. Corner three for Jones, and he's got it. James Jones with nine off the Cavalier bench, all on threes, two-point game. And he had all the time in the world to take that shot. Irving, good. Oh, Irving. Boy, he's had a night. Yeah, he has. And they've needed all 33 of those points so far to stay close, but they're running out of time. Irving, 35. Man, that's one of the toughest shots you're going to see against a big switching hands, finishing with off the glass. Thompson. 18 points for Tristan. The hard sounds, and Atlanta gets the win. Kyrie Irving comes to congratulate Jeff Teague on quite the battle. Kyrie with 35, but it goes for naught. For the Cavaliers in the backcourt, Kyrie Irving back after missing the last game a couple of nights ago against Philadelphia with a back injury. Della Vidova in the backcourt along with him. Miller, Kevin Love, and Tristan Thompson. A little bit undersized at center with a daunting task tonight, taking on Dwight Howard in their battle. And Kyrie Irving knocks down his first jumper. Irving averaging a little over 20 points per game. A whistle and a foul going to be called against Patrick Beverly. They repost it to Dwight Howard. There's that left-handed jump hook he likes so much off the mark that time. That's what you got to do with Dwight. Take, take away his dunks, make him make shots. Great ball movement here. Wide open corner three by Kyrie. Irving knocks down the three ball. Tremendous and ball movement there, Mark. Irving touch knocks down a tough pull-up. You know, Corey Brewer said that he was so glad to be reunited with Kevin McHale, the guy that drafted him when his career first began, seventh overall. And not only that, but he was playing on a team that, you know, was trying to win this year. And they got injuries, and what's well, Minnesota won five games this year, so he's come to a contender now, so. Tough shot again by Kyrie Irving, crossing up Papa Nicolau. Houston leading by three, nine and a half to go here in the first half. James Jones, corner three rejected. Della Vadova launching a three. Marion with the tip, and he's had some tough luck around the bucket. There we go. That time, <laughs> finally got one to go. Even Sean smiling. He's been working hard with no results. There's Ariza. Boy, that was a mismatch. We'll see they got a small lineup out there right now. There's nobody at all to protect the rim. Their big guy right now is Sean Marion. And so, you know, if you're used to and you want to take that ball to the basket every occasion, and somebody better get up on uh, Kyrie Irving. He's got the hot hand. That's three straight. He's knocked in. Starting to take over a little bit for Cleveland. Cleveland with a chance to take the lead here. Tough fadeaway, wow. and boy, Kyrie Irving really has it in gear right now. And, and he's playing against a very tough defender, Patrick Beverly. Well, the Eunice clears out the side, but they load up on Harden. Tough step back three. James Harden not off to a great start here tonight. Floater inside, good by Kyrie Irving. See, when you get defensive stops, you can get in the open court. And that's really when Cleveland is good. Now, the interesting thing is LeBron said when he returns, he will feel better physically than he has all season long. He said he's felt good for a game or two here or there, 
but really never has been comfortable physically all year. He actually said he feels better right now than he has most of the season. We know he's lacked some of the explosiveness we've seen in the past. Maybe that'll come back when he returns. Irving knocks down the long one. I love to watch him play. He's such a smooth player. Here's Irving, the step back baseline jumper. How about the footwork though? See how much space he created without even dribbling the ball? He is such a good offensive player. See, if you're David Blatt, the last thing you want to see is James Harden get an easy basket. If you can keep him off the foul line and make him work, and you've seen here three or four times he's driven to the basket, gotten contact, and not gotten a call, and Kyrie might be in for a 50-pointer tonight. We might, uh, we might be watching a career high for him. And Harden turns it over. Irving, love. Got it. So when a guy's struggling, don't give him layups. Now, Kevin Love, a tip in and a layup. Let's see all of a sudden now if his game starts falling, maybe some of those jump shots. And Houston going to lose possession here to Cleveland, although they won the tip. Five on the shot clock for Irving. Going in a rush. And a scoop shot by Kyrie Irving, who's okay. got 30. Here's Love. Shot clock expiring. And Tristan Thompson with another offensive rebound. Irving dancing through trouble. Are you serious? Wow. Oh, he's the best layup maker in the NBA. I know that sounds silly, but I mean, he huh. can finish under the rim better than anybody in the NBA. And Kyrie says, I'm going to beat this rim protection. Watch this. Dribbling through traffic, kissing the ball off the glass. Look at the English on the ball. You can tell he plays with great imagination. Irving with the brakes on, going to pull it out with 12 on the shot clock. Kyrie Irving. <laughs> wow, that isn't even fair, Doug Woo! Collins. Cleveland leading by five. Irving percolating with 34. Ariza for three. And he leaves it short, rebounded by Kevin Love. Irving on the drive, draws the foul. Harden up court against Della Vidova. Off the Howard screen into the paint. Stuck his arms out, couldn't get the foul, and here's Love on the break. And Kevin Love with the layup. Hey, Cleveland hanging around, down by just seven. Irving. Ariza guarding him. He's seen just about everybody, and that is his first bucket in the fourth quarter. This one's done. Houston winning it 105 to 93. Improving to 24 and 11 on the season. Now it's probably not going to happen, but DeAndre Jordan, when you look at his numbers, he should be in the All-Star game. And like I said, it's probably not going to happen. He's got his hands full of so many elite players at the big position and great guards in the West. Chris Paul picked up that foul. From what I understand, you, you were not broadcasting the last couple of seasons, right? Uh, I, yes, you're right. Okay. Way to figure that out. <laughs> James, James off on the three. There's the hit ahead, but it was deflected, and J.R. Smith keeps it for the Cavs. And Irving will try a three and knock it down. Kyrie Irving with a three-pointer. Barnes free for three. It's the first time we've worked together in some four seasons. No, you just didn't know. I, I'd watch, you know, football and basketball, and I was actually sit, call games along with you. You just oh, you wasn't aware, uh, aware of it. Tight space, tough catch. On the turnover, the push by Irving at Griffin. Wow, he's such a good finisher at the rim, Mark. I mean, you can make the case he's the best finisher in basketball around Ooh. that paint area. He just, I mean, he gets it as far as scoring the basketball. Lob to Moskov. Came over from Denver in the trade. But and like you said, Stan Van Gundy and that Detroit team has done a great job of you know, putting together a run. Brandon Jennings playing great basketball. Kyrie Irving checked into the timeout. He knocks down a three. So the offense there for the Cavs, they are shooting 65%. Irving couldn't finish. The Cavs crash the glass, trying to keep it alive. And Irving does to Thompson. If you don't do it to everybody, then you can't just nitpick, and it makes it tough. And you're talking about a guy that's going to make a decision whether to be a free agent and stay in Cleveland for long or not. So you've got to make sure that there's communication at all times. Clippers by one here at the two-minute mark of the half. Kyrie Irving knocks down the two, averaging 21 points a game in the stretch when LeBron was out they lost a lot of those games losing nine of the uh, last 11 they played but Irving's play continuing to stay strong using his body knowing the shot blocker was coming and draws the foul on Jordan and you got a coach telling them push it they want to play with pace that's when they're at their best 
Irving, that is so good. He knew the great shot blocker was trailing, and he got by. As Irving knocks down the three to put Cleveland back on top. There comes a time as a team, though, the mentality is, look, 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 let's get stops. Let's let's get stops. I'm not going to let you off the hook. We've right. got to find a way to stop them. This is not. We're going to face tougher teams offensively. Mm -hmm. So we got to take the challenge. The great impact he had with Wall and Austin Rivers, Doc's son, who just checked into the game, said that's one of the things he's most excited about is Irving drives and gets the basket and the chance for the three-point play. And Kyrie having a great evening with 25 here tonight. I mean, you lose sight of, when you think about LeBron's greatness, you lose sight of just how special Kyrie Irving is. Guarded by Austin Rivers, Irving. <clears throat> wow. Now Rivers trying to deal with Kyrie Irving, went under on that screen, and Irving now has 31. <laughs> and that's coming off the bench. That's coming off the bench, Cold, immediately right. catching the basketball and making a play out of pick and roll and then defending. With the takeaway chase down by Rivers. Irving tried the crazy finish on the other side of the rim. And Austin picks up the foul. Irving, a three, Kyrie, 35, his fifth three-pointer of the night. Gary in the flash, Thompson's free inside, couldn't find him. Late clock, Kyrie, Irving with 37. They beat the Lakers last night. And the Cavaliers beat the Clippers tonight by five. The Pistons kicked off their seven-game road winning streak a month ago in Cleveland with a 23-point win over LeBron James and the Cavaliers. The fight for a spot in the playoffs continues tonight here at the Palace as the Pistons again take on the Red Hot Cavs with games against the teams they are chasing looming large on the schedule. Live from the Palace, it's the Pistons and Cleveland Cavaliers. Irving to the basket, no. Miss tapped up and in by Irving. Cavs inside and Love scores. Kyrie Irving to the lane, stops and pops. And it drops, it's now 11-8. Ball flicked away. Shumpert to Irving, lobs it. And a jam for Sean Marion. Hey, that was all Kyrie Irving that time. He's the one who harassed and then of course eventually helped force that turnover before finishing at the other end. I'm impressed with the way Irving has been working on defense individually. Andre outside against Mozgov. Puts it on the deck and misses. Kevin Love with a rebound. Miss to Irving. Now the jumper. Got it. Uh, he's going to get space because he can blow by you. And that time, Spencer Dinwiddie gave him space. And Irving knocks down Cleveland's second three-point make of the game. Irving with a jumper. Got it. Man, does he have a pretty jumper? Picture perfect. Smooth. But Jakai, you got to get that up a little faster. Uh, that play was too slow in developing after the catch. With a jumper for Kyrie Irving. Irving, though, counters with a triple on the other end. He has 10 in the second, 14 so far on the night. Two triples here in the quarter. Swipe by Irving, way up to Love, lays it up, lays it in. Kyrie Irving again, folks, on the defensive end. He's motivated. I mean, he is really pumped for this challenge here of dealing with DJ Augustine, who had the 35 in the Pistons last game. Irving to the lane. Down deep to Marion for the dunk. Marion's doing a nice job in there for them. Just camping out around that basket. Hands ready, making himself available off whatever Irving and LeBron James does. Cut inside by Irving for the score on an out-of-bounds pass from LeBron. You know, that's the second time they have scored on a baseline out-of-bounds. Irving behind the line, and he buries it. He'll get you on his end. Cavalier miss, tipped out, and Smith sticks it uh -oh, from distance. 70, 58. This is creeping closer, but Irving won't let him get much closer. Another from downtown. He has four triples in six tries. He has scored 22. Inside for Andre, flips it up off glass. No, taps it up, no, taps it up, no. Taps it up again, no. 
LeBron with a rebound. Tough break. That could have got it to nine, George. Irving on the other end. Triple. Five-point swing. Spencer Dinwiddie to four court. In trouble. A swipe by Irving. LeBron with a jam. Wow. And some of his fans in here make a little noise. It's 80 to 68, Cleveland. You know, it always hurts when you have the ball and then the other team ends up scoring. The turning gun for Ron Butler is short. Jody Meeks lost it, got it back. Drives it, scoops it, no. Tap, Greg Monroe, no. Greg in a crowd, stripped by Irving. Irving down the lane. Thompson with the flush. That's at least the third time when the Pistons were threatening to get it to nine or eight, as was the case a moment ago. Irving to the rim, lays it up, lays it in. And that's what usually follows, right, George? It certainly has tonight. You get a chance to get it even closer, and the Cavaliers come back with an easy one. Oh, my goodness. Irving can't miss. Kyrie Irving brings another. He has 29. Kyrie Irving with the long gun. Got it. And again, seemingly every one of them that did not go was followed by something like that from Kyrie Irving. In the fourth quarter, Kyrie Irving scores 16, LeBron 10. And the other two for the Cavaliers, Tristan Thompson. They win the ball game. And that magic streak. Matches season high of eight. We'll find out Cavaliers and Blazers presented by AT&T Uverse as the Cavaliers locking horns with another team that has June basketball aspirations. The Portland Trail Blazers, number three in the West. Cavaliers, of course, coming off the win last night against Detroit. Sean Marion pressed back into the starting duty as he'll play at the small forward spot tonight. Why? Because no LeBron James. Let's go back to last night at the Palace took this fall as he landed basically on both wrists. It's the right one that is giving him some pain right now. So after having it examined by doctors, he is being held out of tonight's ball game. This was just a late decision you heard Jeff Phelps talk about just a few months ago on Cavaliers Live pregame. Kevin Love drinks. The Cavs come right out trying to get Love involved early because they know they're going to need the scoring from Love tonight. They come right out, two shots, he knocks the second one down. Harry's been so active especially in this win streak, piling up the steals, keeping his head on swivel. What a great defense. J.R. Smith, healthy three. Knocks it down, straight on, 5-2. Had a tough time last night, but starting out deep in the queue. Lost off with a footwork. And the left hand, the big fella. The big fella doing a good job. Hook shot on the baseline. Timo sets that screen well timed. Weak side love. Got some air on there. Nothing but the bottom. That one floated up there like it had wings deep in the queue. Three point difference. Kyrie says one of these days. Knocks it down. Got that three stroke there in the groove, and he's been shooting well of late, you know. Well, it won't take long. Kyrie is deep in the queue. During the winning streak, shooting 56% to the floor. Leonard missed it. Came in the ballgame, hitting 11 out of 24. He just gave Mozgov a shove. Kyrie. And he's fouled against Steve Blake. Cut it. If you want to know what it's like to take somebody to the basket and wait for the play, Kyrie Irving, wait, wait, lay it in. It's good. Opportunity for a three-point play. Kyrie darts into a pass. Somehow Tom it over. Back to Irving. Sends it. The bottom. Kyrie Irving on the short corner. Cavaliers by 10. Blake bodied up Irving. Short shot clock going to work. Inside. Fights it up. No. He was fouled by Leonard. Great job of using his body again. Again. He is really has control of his body going to that basket. Kyrie on a blur, and he drew that foul. Explosive step that time. Loving the pick and pop against Barton. We try to back him down. Kyrie launches. And hits. He's in a zone. Kyrie Irving again for three. If you're going to stand there and watch him, he's going to dot your eye deep in the queue. Irving switched upon by Aldridge. Sends it. Got it again. Kyrie Irving just cut it out. Moskov will screen now. Well time, carry, trying to get inside. Puts it up and out against Aldridge. Doing a good job of waiting to the last minute before he releases the ball. The defender's flat-footed, he lays it in. Kyrie Irving says, I don't care who you put on me. 
You might as well shoot everybody up. Because Kyrie is on target deep in the queue. He's got his best career first half with the 25. Kyrie steps back. Oh, seriously. You have to be kidding me. Kyrie Irving. Whoa. Like he's in the gym all by himself. 54 40. We'll have to use a little Photoshop and put Uncle Drew's face in there. They can make this for the <laughs> next uh, Pepsi Max right. commercial. Kyrie pinned to the sideline. Raises and hits it again. Kyrie Irving. Pitch and catch action. Kyrie knocks it down from Mike Miller. And the onslaught outside the arc continues. Irving inside a little. Taking his time. Backs out. Got it. Off a rubber rim. Soft touch for Kyrie. 36. Here comes Little. Good to have Shepard on your side, though. A guy who can at least give him a different look. Free try. Easy rebound to Iman. Kyrie quickly down the floor. Sends it. And the bottom. Kyrie Irving. He's got Xbox at him today. At the kill. Kyrie Irving. Irving. Goes hops to the screen, sends it, got it! He's got 41! That play, the high pick and roll, the mid-range shot, he can get that all day long. Aldridge switches out and Irving. Dancing to create space, keeps it alive, ball on screen, the left hand! Kyrie Irving! Kyrie Ridiculous is his name! Lord thought he was fouled, no, no bailout. Cavs with the ball on the lead. Irving, ball on a string, inside, finish with the left hand, right down you pretty well. Career high for Kyrie now with his 45. Irving cannot be expected to do it all himself, going to work. Hey. But he draws that foul. He says, oh yeah, play-by-play <laughs> -play announcer? Yes. Let me do what I do. Let me do what I do. Irving, got away from the tomb, fires. Got it, Kyrie again! To the rescue! Kyrie reversed his pair for that one. He reversed, went back to the left, and got it there. And it's deep in the queue. Spread floor for Kyrie Irving. He works in the shot clock. Everybody, I mean everybody, on their feet. Shot clock at seven. Kyrie sends it for three. Oh, Kyrie Irving, are you kidding me? 53 in a game for the ages. 11 triples. Timeout, Portland. Good guys by three. And look at the highest paid cheerleader <laughs> in Northeast Ohio, and he's loving it. Oh, you gotta love it. Well, because all this is gonna do, AC, is make his job easier come playing time, knowing he's got a big time running mate. Nate the Illy backs up to the corner, fires. No! Kyrie has a rebound. Who else but Kyrie Irving? He's done everything but serve popcorn tonight. 2.1 to go. Why not? Perfection of the strike. 10 for 10. Cavaliers can let him dribble out the clock. A one and go win. Uncle Drew style in downtown Cleveland. Double Nichols, maybe a new nickname for Kyrie Irving. As he hit the speed limit here tonight in one of the all-time Cavalier performances and a standing ovation as he talks to Ahmad here on Q2. Gee, guess what? Our player of the game with his 55, 11 and 19, setting a franchise record, including the game winner. You might as well put a an S on his chest because he played like Superman tonight. It's the annual visit of the Los Angeles Lakers here in Northeast Ohio to take on LeBron James and the Cleveland Cavaliers. Game two of our NBA Sunday Showcase here on ABC. 44 degree mild Sunday afternoon here in Cleveland, Ohio. Sold out the Quicken Loans Arena. And over and Clarkson. Good job as he kept Boscov at bay off his left hip and finished it. Jordan Clarkson, the rookie out of Missouri, he was second team all SEC last year, scoring 14 points a game for the Tigers. Here's a terrific point guard. Irving with the lob. Love with the finish. Ellington fires a three that's off. Black try to crash the glass. 
It ricochets to Sacre. Yeah, you got to make those. Clarkson. Oh, my. Back the other way, LeBron on the run with Kyrie Irving. Irving to the basket and one. All right, I've been around a long time. This young guy can finish, can finish on the break. The third longest win streak in franchise history. 12 games came to an end in Indianapolis on Friday to the Pacers. But still this great run that has been back in shouting distance in the East as Kyrie Irving puts one in. Well, I don't think the problem is going to be at the offensive end. They're going to score the ball. When you have James and Irving, and then you have Love, and then you have experienced guys on the bench also. Moskov on the lob, set up by Irving. Great screen and roll. The scoring, the field goal percentage, the efficiency. They're a poor yeah, defensive right. team. They struggle here as Irving gets around Lynn, gets to the basket, and as you said, he finishes with the best of us. Uh, he's, he, he's exciting to watch. And uh, he's exciting to go. Jeremy Lin, Swaggy P, Nick Young in there for the Lakers. And Irving responds with his own three to give us our 12th lead change of the opening quarter. See, he can stay behind the three. When you have a guy that can stay behind the, the screen and shoot the ball and shoot it at 41% in the three-ball game, you've got to go over the top and force him off, off the shot. Lynn got trapped there, he turned it over. James back on the floor, back on the move, and Kyrie on a roll. The all-star Kyrie Irving now has 13 points. Now this is the Lakers second unit that has been so efficient during the course of the season. This is a decent team out here. Yes, it is. We know these guys. Yeah. Irving, great move. Mozgov at the basket. And Kyrie putting on a show here in the first. Now everything is coming together here. It's nice. Lob at the out of bounds. Oh, boy. To Shumpert. Uh, right over the back of Boozer. <laughs> Boozer had no clue that that pass was going to a player coming from the distant corner. They slipped to the basket by Love. Irving with another assist. People seem to forget a lot. When they won the Olympic gold in 76 in Montreal, Dean was the coach. He also has a couple of NCAA championships. There's no one better than West because he could do it from rim to rim and, and won many a bet doing it. <laughs> Back-to-back -back James of field goals puts up a quick five points as 13 will watch a triple-double here For LeBron the rest of the afternoon two rebounds and four assists shy of that Clarkson Mike keeps showing you a little diamond in the rough here and there. He gives you some spark Unfortunately the Lakers cannot stop these guys right now the ball movement the quickness and you could see their lack of defensive effort getting up into the people Irving oh, is not a backup point guard. Kyrie hits another three. This has been a three-point shooting clinic. Irving, beautiful move with the ball. Thompson inside. And Tristan Thompson, fourth overall pick in the draft. Back some four years ago out of Texas. He's uh, given David Blatt some good minutes. Kyrie Irving takes it to the basket, 98-79. See, once he got in that circle, that little stutter, move, step, and then the big step. And he just like freezes you a second, and then he makes that big move. Young is short again on that shot. Yep. Yep. Trying to chase down Irving. Goes right at Jeremy Lin and draws the contact and the foul. Lob to Thompson. That's what they're trying to get earlier and didn't. And they do here. So the big thing right now is, is are you we know the pressure is there because of the talent level of the people who are here right but then the big thing is is as you move along in the second half of the season the injuries can you be injury free will everything still be quick that's what you worry about by the time you get to the playoffs Irving another lot for Thompson at the rim resistance is minimal Boozer from 17 well Boozer's had a quiet day Mike and we know he can score the ball but he's having a bad day there's no reason for this talent uh, and the type of team that they have of not getting into that second spot behind Atlanta as far as conference one loss records. Uh, that, that has to be a must for this organization. Irving just uh, got it all dialed in now. Five three-pointers, 28 points for Kyrie. The Cavaliers will sweep the season series from the Lakers and have won 13 in the last 14 while the Lakers have lost 13 of their last 14. Now, Jeff, we talked about LeBron James being so good during the stretch where they're 14 and 2. 
As Nene misfires. But some of the other reasons, obviously the trades really helped with Smith, Shumpert, and Mozgov as Kyrie Irving gets inside. And don't you think a lot of it's just, they just need a little time to get together. It was a new roster, a new coaching staff. I, I really, I think it's a little bit of that, Mike, but I think it was two things as Kevin Love with a great defensive play. Nice finish, Irving and James with a beautiful connection. Again, Wizards without Bradley Beal, such a key part of their team as Irving goes right to the basket. Very quick pace to start this one. Love deflects it. James again pushes. Hard charging, finds Irving, and Irving a nice finish inside. Irving already with six points. James already with three assists. Irving inside to Mozgov. Timothy Mozgov obtained from Denver. It has been just what the doctor ordered for them with the Andy Verjao injury. Irving knocks that down, but they form such a talented young backcourt. And like everybody, like we talked about with Nene earlier. Oh, Nene! Eight points here in the first quarter. Shepard, he's been shooting well since coming to Cleveland. And knocks down another three. And the Wizards are shooting 50% from the field. They find themselves down by 17. Three-point shooting has been a big difference. Irving knocks that down. Think about that, Mike. You just saw a smaller guard back in. A long athletic guard in, in John Wall and hit him with a nice fadeaway. Gortat loses it. Irving. Wall right there to defend. And one. Irving last second decides to go reverse. A beautiful move from Kyrie Irving. He's got 13 and a chance for a three-point play. You know, David Blatt said it in the after-quarter interview with Israel that they came back ready from the break. Irving draws the foul. He's getting a lot of oohs from the crowd with some of these gorgeous moves. <laughs> He's enjoying the show. Four to shoot for Kyrie Irving. Crossover, fires, and hits. 18 points here in the first half for Kyrie Irving. Irving lobs it up, and Moscow throws it down. Beautiful pass from Kyrie Irving. Just slips out of it. Great pass by Irving. Well, midway through the third, Cavaliers have had a big lead most of the night, and Irving answers back. The help defense, the team defense for the Cavaliers has been very good. And awful shooting. Smith, catch and shoot, knocks down the three-pointer. And it's back up to 21. They've hit 10 threes, and the Wizards again 0 for 12. Irving, and Thompson shot blocked by Gooden with seven to shoot. What a great performance out of the gate after the All-Star break. Irving count it and one. You see that strength of Kyrie Irving, though? Uh, he, he initiated the contact, jumped in, wasn't knocked off balance at all. Fight for the rebound. Thompson comes away. Tristan Thompson off the bench. Again, another guy who knows who he is and knows his role. Della Madova. Now is the three-pointer. They have shot so well from beyond the arc. Another timeout as the lead is up to 33. As Thompson gets it done, you want to avoid Milwaukee. Milwaukee is good. And so you want to stay out of that 3-6 matchup or 4-5. And, and that's a big-time win by Toronto. Irving gets hammered. Great road win, a complete domination by the Cleveland Cavaliers. One of those nights for the Washington Wizards. As the Cavs win going away, led by as many as 40, led by 20 plus most of the second half. LeBron James, Kyrie Irving led the way, but they had plenty of help. Kyrie, uh, tonight it's so much energy coming out of the uh, the All-Star break. What was the biggest message going into the post-All-Star schedule? Starting the first game back from All-Star break with a great sense of intensity, uh, do it on both ends and for 48 minutes. We didn't want to come out after All-Star break and have a, you know, kind of basically lay an egg. We wanted to come out and have a, have a sense of urgency on both ends, and we did that. 
there were so many plays tonight and in recent weeks where the ball movement just seems so fluid, so natural. What's been done tactically to make that uh, available for you guys? Just trusting each other and being basketball players out there. We're all pretty good at what we do, and every single night, uh, depending on game to game, all five of us can get in double figures. Uh, as we showed tonight, and we have a, a great bench that can come in and give us a lot of energy on both ends of the floor, so we just need to continue this. Can you describe the mood change from what you guys were feeling and acting like right around Christmas time to now when just it's so boisterous and so many uh, you know activities going on on the bench there? Guys maturing, uh, and we're learning how to be great teammates with one another. You know, it's going to take some time. We had a lot of high expectations from the outside, but internally in the locker room, we just had to figure things out, and I think we're starting to do that at veteran leadership have been on this run, and now we have to make the second half push. Moskov against Tim Duncan, and here we go in San Antonio, the defending champs taking on the Cleveland Cavaliers, and Tony Parker has it first. Irving and Parker. Up outside, and ties the game at two. Kyrie Irving hitting it over Tony Parker. James once again with his second dunk. That's what that post action does that Chuck is talking about. Getting. With a nice hot pair by Mozgov, who kind of backpedaled his way in to set the screen. That was nice, Mozgov setting a little screen there. Look at the moves by Irving inside. His ball handling is just ridiculous. I mean, he really has the ball on the string. You see all the kids on the internet dribbling the ball now with plastic bags over the balls because Kyrie Irving has such great handle in the midst of traffic. Irving picks up the basket right there. He's got eight. David Blatt said Tuesday in Dallas. He played a beautiful game against the Mavs. Even with the trade, even getting Rondo, and even uh, getting Stoudemire. It, it hasn't worked. Which is, which is interesting because the trade and the moves that at midseason Cleveland made have worked so well, and in Dallas with the additions of Stoudemire and, and Rondo have not. Irving tries to carve his way by Duncan and what a play. gets it to go. Here's Duncan, picked up by LeBron, outside Bonner. This is a three. LeBron has it. Rachel, you have more on Kevin Love. Yeah, we may be hoping for him to get going a little bit more tonight, but he is having a much easier time with the Cavaliers in general, guys. Remember, he was the center of so much scrutiny for months. He told me this morning that he feels now he has a much better handle on his role with the team. He's finding his spots on the court, and more importantly, he's learned to block out the noise off the court. Remember, he's never played on a high-profile team like this before. He had no idea what it was like to be at the center of that hot spotlight. Now he does things like turn off his social media, not listen to talk radio. He said he might even learn to meditate this summer. So, hey, maybe he'll kick in. You have to love the way Kyrie Irving is playing, but he's going to have to pick up his play. Before All-Star break, his numbers were a lot better than they are now, and so you see him getting his rhythm back, and he's taking shots like that, saying, well, I got my rhythm back. I'm not getting well, it back. Well, I got my rhythm back. Well, but that's kind of like LeBron and Kawhi Leonard earlier. He's taking this Tony Parker thing personally. Irving right down the middle. Fending off the defense of Green. <laughs> and no disrespect, John Calipari, we're coming for you. It would be so cool for me to call Auburn in the NCAA tournament. Someday you might do that. What There's about this year? Irving. Someday. What about this year, Kevin? How about that shot? 25 for Irving. This year? I don't know. <laughs> oh, see, oh, oh. And Kyrie's Woo. coming right back at him. Too. So that's how I guard. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> I make him guard his three. Irving has got 28. Thompson Great from pass. Irving. Yeah, it sure was. Great pass. Kyrie, now six inside for Thompson. Three assists from Irving. How about Kyrie Irving continues to score now with 30. Has anybody played more basketball than LeBron in the last five years? Nobody. You, you know, so those eight games, when you see him come off re-energized, you have to love it because you know he's sacrificing his body every night. Well, tonight he went over 42,000 minutes, and LeBron knocks it out from out. Side a 20 point performance so far with a triple right there. One of three on threes. Nice defensive play by Shumpert. The galloping Kyrie Irving all the way for two. See, they're much better, obviously, in a fast, court, fast break situation. Splitter. Shumpert. Momentum seems to be shifting just a bit here. Well, they, better get, they better get it before Tony oh. Parker comes back in. Oh, oh, what, what a, a play by Irving. He gives you a move with every part of his body. San Antonio has not shot below 58% the entire evening. That is a foul, and it's on green. It was a three. James Jones. 
Irving again to crossover into Thompson. Great pass. Oh. What did David Blatt say to you about Thompson as a fourth quarter player compared to some of the like Mars yeah, Goff and Love? Yeah, he said he loves to play him in the fourth quarter. Like we said, as we began the game, almost averaging a double double and up high with a nice catch is Thompson. Well, and he's got 10. The best player I ever played with was Andrew Tony. And we ruined his career in Philadelphia. Oh, uh, nice dive uh, inside uh, by Irving. Yeah, we ruined his career in Philadelphia trying to make him play with the same type of feet problems that Kevin Durant has. Harry Irving is an 86% free throw shoot. Perfect from the strike tonight, 7-7. Seven of seven. 40 points now for Kyrie Irving tonight. 15 of 26. 40 points in 41 minutes, 40 points in 26 shots. He's got it again. Three defending. What a three! That was terrific. That was. They kept him in the game. Parker. Another switch. Thompson defends. Tony Parker. Right. Rebound by Leonard and a big one of ours, which may seal a win for the Spurs. You know what? It seals the win, but it goes back to that same thing. All that switching. They put their guards at a disadvantage trying to keep Kawhi Leonard off the board. You took your best rebound away. Yeah. He's yeah. trying to guard Tony Parker out on the floor. And you got little Ky Kyrie Irving trying to guard Kawhi Leonard. Splitter comes in for Bellinelli. Another miss. Well, LeBron screwed up. The mouth off. <laughs> they almost got it. Oh, my God. That was Cleveland good. will have the ball. 3.1 to go. Ginobili on the ball. And Leonard. Kyrie, a three. Good! Oh he got it at the buzzer. Wow. They'll check it out. Wow. They'll review. It's a tie game at the end of regulation. Five of wow. five three-point shooting for Kyrie Irving. What a shot in 46 tonight. Chuck, you asked. You said you wanted them to foul before the hand got up. Well, they didn't do it. Look at this pick. No switch. A wonderful 46-point performance by Kyrie Irving tonight, hitting a three to beat the buzzer and send it to OT. That's just a terrific shot. Shumpert picked up by Parker. Rebound by Tristan Thompson. He's one of the great offensive rebounders in the game, as we talked about. Number one coming off the bench in that category. Number three overall. Irving with another three and 49. Yeah, Kyrie a, Irving. With this lineup, I would actually put Kevin Love at the center, take Tristan Thompson out so that I could play for a small and one hand to try to get some other moves. 51, wow. 51 for Kyrie Irving. Wow, what a show. What a show. And this is Cleveland's first lead since late in the second quarter when they led by two. Number 10 in scoring in the NBA coming in. Number two in minutes played. So he sees a lot of time on the floor, and tonight he's got 52. Green to three. <laughs> from beyond the arc has gone five of nine tonight wow. for San Antonio. One of the best NBA games I've seen in person ever. LeBron the triple, kaboom! Three point <laughs> lead for the Cleveland Cavaliers over two to play. What a play. What a, assist. What, a, what a game, America. Switch on defense, Green is on LeBron. Irving, Diaw there, another triple. Wow. Every chamber wow. is filled tonight wow. for Kyrie Irving. 55. Wow. Oh, my goodness. You look at all the things that Kyrie Irving, a.k.a. Uncle Drew, does. You know, first of all, it starts with his jump shot, so you can't space him. And then after he just keeps knocking him down because of his dribbling, now he starts to penetrate. He can finish strong. He can take contact. And then he's just been throwing in some shots like this tonight where, like Chuck said, you just got to shake his hand and say, I'm hands, a fan. Man. I'm a fan. You're better tonight. LeBron for three. Wow. What a shot. What a hit for LeBron James. And he just gives these Cleveland Cavaliers their biggest lead tonight. Here's Duncan on top the screen and Green the three. Missed it all. Out of bounds at sales. What a game. There's a foul in backcourt. It's on Diaw. They have been number one in the league since January 15th in three-point shots made. And with that free throw right there, a new career high, 56 for Kyrie Irving. Six in the first quarter, 16 in the second, eight in the third, 16 in the fourth, and now 11 in overtime. San Antonio has not lost in the month of March since 2013. 
They were 16-0 last March. They were 4-0 this, and they lose tonight in overtime. And Kyrie Irving with a historic performance with 57 points. He was a perfect 10 of 10 at the line. He was 20 of 32. And he was absolutely magnificent against the defending champs. A warm and sunny Sunday afternoon in Central Florida. And tonight inside the Amway Center, there is a buzz all around the building. The hottest team in the NBA is in town. It's the Orlando Magic and the Cleveland Cavaliers. Peyton lobs it up for Devlin too high. Irving to James and the Cavaliers on the scoreboard. Now if you can offensive rebound, you can slow them down. Everybody released on the shot. James was going the other way, Kyrie. Kyrie Irving, three-point shot for Kyrie Irving. He was seven for seven against San Antonio on Thursday night. Kyrie Irving, high off the glass. Kyrie Irving, corralled in the corner, in trouble. Great job by Dwayne Dedman helping. J.R. Smith buries a three at the buzzer. Who doesn't force a lot of turnovers, David? It's about 13 a game, but they score off of them. Very efficient. Irving shooting it so well. Averaging 24 per game since mid-January. Harry Irving down the middle. Oh, too easy. Nine for Kyrie Irving. Kyrie Irving. There was not a Magic player near the plate. <laughs> Kyrie Irving off the screen. Oh, man. Three-point shot for Irving. He is two for two tonight. Seven for seven in their last game from beyond the arc at San Antonio. Boy, is that can't miss? happen. <laughs> Victor Oladipo's game is attack, attack, get in the paint. And he hits the ground a lot. It's been wear and tear on you. What a nice setup by Kyrie Irving. Mozgov with the dunk. Oladipo getting a screen from Dedman. His floater won't go. The rebound, Tristan Thompson. Irving with 17 points tonight. His shot is blocked by Dedman, but a foul. Irving. Still perfect from beyond the three-point line. Alfred Payton made a good move, but he missed the shot. Kyrie Irving accelerates into the lane and lays it in with the left hand. No fear. <laughs> Booch back there. But again, Kyrie Irving with a head of steam. Irving. Kyrie Irving. 12 in the period. 26 in the game. Irving, the shot clock down to three. And Irving floats it in. What a tough shot. In a crowd by Kyrie Irving. Thompson with the rejection. That's better protection at the rim that time. Irving tripped up. That was a big shot. Maybe I thought Vooch may have made a poor decision. <laughs> <laughs> but Shumpert answers with their 15th three tonight. Harkless on James. LeBron. The open shooter this time is Kyrie Irving. Cavaliers will run out the clock, and David Blatt's club will go 24 and 5 since January the 15th. The best record in the NBA. And Mike, because they don't have a second defender behind Jimmy Butler that can play a LeBron James, he has to be extra careful not to be too aggressive. They can't afford to have him in foul trouble. Kyrie Irving aggressive, gorgeous move to the basket. And Irving with his first field goal. Irving for three. That's good. Rattles in that. It's a one-point game. Last time they lost here was way back on January 7th. The Houston Rockets beat them as Kyrie Irving rattles that one in for his third field goal. Pace has picked up a little bit as we're tied at 22. Tristan Thompson with the jump shot. 1.1 1 .1 left. Irving. Hits a three at the buzzer. Two defenders draped over him, and Kyrie Irving nails it. As Irving hits one, as Brooks goes under the screen. Well, the Bulls are one of the better teams defending the three. They're getting torched here in the first half. 
Cavs are 9 for 15. Irving, beautiful move. And the lead back up to 7. Well, Mike Dunleavy, his absence really hurt them when he was out those 19 games with a sprained ankle. They were 9 and 10 without Dunleavy. He knows how to play offense. He's big, and he's a smart player. Irving. Mozgov, nice turnaround shot. Irving throws it behind Mozgov. Butler able to tip it, stolen by Irving. Back to James. James, pass, Mozgov finished. Kyrie Irving setting that all up with a quick hands to come up with a steal. J.R. Smith is the only NBA player to have multiple games where he had double figures in three-point field goals made. He's got 11, 10, and 10. The NBA record for most of the game is 12, shared by Kobe Bryant and Daniel Marshall, as Kevin Love, a pretty fair three-point shooter himself, puts the Cavs up 10. Let's see if incorrectly reset. Oh! What a three-point performance here this afternoon from the Cavaliers. With two seconds to go. From beyond half court. <laughs> Kyrie Irving is four for four from downtown. The team is 14 of 29. Irving on the pull-off bank shot won't go. Irving the drive goes right at Noah blocks a shot and a foul and the home winning streak continues 18 in a row here in Cleveland for the Cavaliers LeBron James his first triple double of the season but he had plenty of help 27 from Irving eight three-pointers from J.R. Smith and the team overall with 16 threes as the Cavaliers defeat the Bulls for the third time this season day two of the NBA has the Boston Celtics against the Cleveland Cavaliers in game one of their best of seven opening round series. A sellout crowd at the Quicken Loans Arena. It's been five years since they had a Cavs playoff game here in a building that the Cavaliers have been dominant in the second half of the season. Pass inside, Irving, quick shot. And Kyrie Irving with his first career playoff points. Individually, they do a great job of, you know, understanding their assignment and taking guys out of the picture. Those are two guys that are locked down defenders in that backcourt. How about that move? But like I always said, I'll take great offense over great defense any day of the week. Oh, nice move inside. Kyrie Irving with his third field goal. Irving splits the defense and finishes. Gorgeous move from Irving, who's got eight points here in the opening period. Irving fires away. It's good. Three-pointer for Irving. He's got 11 points here in the first half. Uh, it's going to get old, but this guy is off the charts on the offensive end. He's had a tremendous impact. Roll acceptance as he bobbles the ball there about coming off the bench. Well, he started all 82 games last year. And this year, just 15. Irving knocks down the three. This is great defense by Isaiah Thomas, but not much you can do. Knockdown jumper by Uncle Drew. We see the Celtics playing a zone for the first possession. Irving once again. He's three for three from downtown. 17 first half points. Irving bang at the buzzer. What a first half in his NBA playoff debut. 20 points with an exclamation point as the second quarter comes to an end. Irving again. Three-pointer for Irving where he's five for five. And if you're Avery Bradley, you can't go under that screen, and the big probably needs to make the adjustment to come up. Bad pass stolen by Irving. Smart trying to stay in front of him, and he bumps him. And they're in the penalty, so Irving will go to the line as Smart commits his second. Irving pulls up, draws a foul, and one. Kyrie Irving with a brilliant NBA playoff debut, now with 27 points.
I mean, not much you can do here defensively. I mean, the guy is so crafty offensively. Irving drives and finishes, and that will do it. Another dominant home performance from the Cleveland Cavaliers as they take game one of this opening round series. Kyrie, now you don't have to answer questions anymore about never playing in a playoff game. How did this compare to how you thought it would be? Um, it exceeded expectations. Um, you know, go out there and compete with my brothers. You know, it's what you work hard in the summer for. You know, all season, 82 games, and we come in and, and get game one. So we got three more to go. What a play first playoff game for you. 30 points, including five three-pointers. What was your mindset coming in? Uh, just come out aggressive. Uh, whatever my team needed me to do, especially on the defensive end, I was willing to do. Offensively, it was going to take care of itself, but I just wanted to throw myself into the game and um, you know, live with the results. Isaiah Thomas, the Hall of Fame Isaiah Thomas, said to me that you were so ready for this moment. Like, how did you know that you were ready? Um, you know, big games, uh, you know, you always want to get, uh, get up for. Um, you know, it's what you prepare your whole life for. It's what you dream of as a kid. And, you know, coming as a, come in as a four, fourth year player, coming in my first playoff series, just wanted to play well and do whatever it took to win. As a team, what do you guys need to improve as you prepare for game two on Tuesday? Uh, we're going to watch film, uh, a few defensive breakdowns. Um, Isaiah Thomas got going. Obviously, he's a, he's, he's a bunch to handle. Uh, so we just got to do a better job on him, containing him in the paint. And, uh, you know, everyone else, we just got to stay home. Thanks, Kyrie. Congratulations on the win. Mike. It is off to round two of the postseason. The usual sellout crowd built to the 21,000 are making their way into the queue. Quicken Loans Arena in downtown Cleveland, where the Cavs have won 22 of their last 23 games. It is game one of this best of seven Eastern Conference semifinal series. The Chicago Bulls, the number three seed in the East, facing the number two seed, the Cleveland Cavaliers, in a much anticipated matchup. Shumpert for three, yes. You love seeing that from Shumpert in the corner. You're used to seeing J.R. Smith over there around this time in the game, but it's incumbent on Shumpert to make sure he's not just valuable defensively, but he knocks down some big shots. Cleveland Cavaliers, second worst bench in the playoffs. Nice move by Irving. Oh my goodness. Kyrie Irving, who put up 30 points in his playoff debut in game one against the Celtics. The second highest scoring game in a playoff debut, second to LeBron James. Kyrie Irving right back and the foul. A great shooter and great competitor, and noise one as well as you see Kyrie Irving go up and the foul is called. But the Cavs are showing some signs, playing with energy here in the in the second quarter and getting results as Derrick Rose is called for his second personal. Irving for three. Kyrie Irving with 11 points. Rose block. Thompson with the rejection. Here comes Irving. Challenges Noah and hits the reverse. He has scored the last 10 points for the Cavaliers. Rose got picked off. Irving gives to James. Fires and hits. That's a two. He had a foot on the line, and LeBron has picked it up. He's five for seven. He has 10 points. Irving through the foul. Shepard for three. Chased out by Thompson. Kristen Thompson hearing it from this crowd for his hustle. Irving with a series of moves and scores. Unbelievable. No way. Somebody tell him he should have shot that with his left hand. I thought it would have been easier. What a tough move. And he still has to do it after gathering himself off those crazy ball handling moves. Irving into the lane. Gets it to Moskov. And he scores. Coach Black came here, had a team that he thought he had. <laughs> then he was blessed with LeBron. He said, wait a minute, let me switch things up. He had to make adjustments. He had haters, he had injuries, he had more haters, more adjustments. He's officially not a rookie anymore in this league. Irving with a driving hook. The Chicago bench very strong, but we have not seen much of them. You're exactly right, but Casale said, wait, don't stop me yet. I'm knocking down these easy jumpers. As you see the beautiful left hand finish again by Uncle Drew, Kyrie Irving. Bulls now 9 of 13 from downtown. Irving scores. Kyrie Irving goes to the hook off glass. Bulls up 81-70. Irving is fouled by Heinrich, so he'll go to the line for two shots. 
Irving Shumpert and Della Vadova in a three-guard set with Mozgov and Thompson. Thompson setting the pick. Here's Shumpert. Yes! Another three for Shumpert. That's his fourth from downtown. Irving right back. Shumpert has a mismatch outside the paint with Gibson on it. Irving. Yes! And the foul. Noah called for the hat. Kyrie Irving will head to the line. As you see, Irving has been perfect at the free throw line. Completes a three-point play. Chicago's lead is down to three. And LeBron knocks down the left-hand layup. A convincing game one victory for the Bulls as they defeat the Cavaliers 99-92. to And Chris, this is the first time in LeBron James' 85 home playoff games that his team never led. Excitement building around Verizon Center in downtown D.C. on a chilly January night, but you can be sure it will be heated inside the joint as CSN brings you Wizards basketball. Tonight, the Wiz look to dethrone the King for the second time this season. Washington, 15 and 17 on the year, takes on LeBron James and the 23 and 9 Cleveland Cavaliers. Irving drives, contact, score the field goal, he'll go to the line. Not too different from James Harden, the way he's able to move his body around and move the ball in a different direction. Della Vadova. Nice pass, and they get an easy two. So there's an assist. And that's the first of the game for Cleveland. And what a shot. Kyrie Irving is averaging 15 points, and this is seventh game played since returning from injury. Nice move by Irving. Drives on Gortat. Wow, what a great shot. We're talking about a right-handed shooter. Taking that ball well out with the left hand shooting that hook shot. Nelly Oubre drives, gives it off to Gortat. The Wizards turn it over. Shumpert for three. Wow. Love got away with pushing Temple. What a shot. Down low. Well, it looked like he kind of lost control of that. So as he's moving in the air, Kyrie able to regain control of that ball and then just spin it up on his downward flight. The Cavaliers are second in defensive efficiency in the league. LeBron pulls the trigger on a three that's short and bounces in. Irving. Irving with a terrific move scores off the glass and he's fouled. And that's what he does so well. The stop and go herky jerky move is just so hard to keep your balance and stay in front of it. Here he is again. Irving drives, puts it up and in. What a shot by Kyrie Irving, who has 17 points in the game. Again, that's what they were missing the first two months of the season. The guy that can just create something out of nothing. Irving. Three to shoot. He's going to have to pull the trigger. He does, and he hits. Backs up again. He's fouled by Dudley, and he'll shoot. John for the open shot. It's off the front of the rim. All struggling tonight. 5 of 15 from the floor. Irving chased, puts it up, and in. Boy, he has hit so many different types of acrobatic shots uh, using that glass and using some English. Irving, some good moves, good defense on him. I like that. Randy Whitman takes time. Kyrie Irving picking up where he left off last game, which was his sixth game back tonight, his seventh. LeBron scores, that gives him 32. Last year, the Wizards won just one game in the series. It was the first game played. Held the Cavs to 78 points, won at 91-78, but then Cleveland got the final three, winning by an average of 23 points. Unbelievable. Kyrie Irving with a spectacular move 
to get the hoop. He has got 27 points. Irving again. Well, they've pretty much been just clearing out the side, and if no double team comes, allowing him to finish. Last three by Irving was his first of the game. He's got 32 points now. LeBron James with 34, Kyrie Irving with 32, and J.R. Smith with 25. And the Cavaliers improved to 24 and 9 as Washington falls to 15 and 18, 8 and 10 at home. It's an NBA Saturday primetime on ABC as we welcome you once again to Cleveland, Ohio on a warm January night. It's the Cleveland Cavaliers hosting the San Antonio Spurs. Parker drives, stripped, lost the ball. Texas right hand thought he got hit. Here comes Kyrie Irving, drives to the basket, lays it in. Mills, not that time. Iman Shumpert in the game. It's Shumpert, Irving, Jefferson, Mozgov, and Delavadova. Irving, the crossover out to Richard Jefferson. Knocks it down. Three point shooting red hot. They're five of nine from long range. And the lead back up to 10. Irving goes right at Dial. Tough shot, banks it in. I hate to hop on it, but there's people who say, well, ball movement, man movement. You have Kyrie Irving being defended by Boris Diaw. Get out of his way and let him dance. And get back to your point. I don't, I don't think you dare Kyrie Irving to shoot the basketball. I understand those numbers, but I don't think those numbers do justice to, to the type of shooter that Irving is. I like how Jonathan Simmons is trying to compete against Irving. Moscow and a perfect pass from Irving. Irving left-handed, pretty play for Kyrie Irving. Wow. Doesn't get enough credit for how good of a basketball player he is. So gifted going to the basket with a multitude of finishes. Teron Lewis said he's not really in full basketball shape yet. Not 100%. And that's why the Cavs still remain optimistic. Plus, remember last year's Parker. Beautiful play off the glass. What a big second half team they were last year. As Irving, blocking foul call. Ginobili wanted a charge, and instead he gets called for the personal. Ginobili rushed it a bit. Irving to Love. Love for three. Puts it in. 21 points, 10 rebounds, three assists, and a block shot for Kevin Love. We're able to get stops. Whenever we can get stops, we can get out and run. You know, they have a great offense, so they execute very well, so it's tough to get stops at time. When we do, we got to get out and run. LeBron James was as much of a facilitator as a scorer in the first half, but in that third quarter, he took over. What do you want from him here in the fourth quarter? Just keep attacking, keep being aggressive, attacking the basket, forcing guys to come over and have to help him rotate, and then we can kick it out to our shooter for threes. Irving. Simmons harassing it. Irving gets inside, surrounded by Spurs, and he puts it up and in. Shot clock down to seven. Irving fakes, drives, gets inside, count it, and one. Little hesitation and a chance for a three-point play. <laughs> oh, this isn't fair. This is not fair. Uncle Drew putting on a clinic in Cleveland. Demands the pick and roll, says to Mr. West, allow me to have this dance. Patty Mills comes off the screen. Can't hit. Jefferson, the rebound. Irving pushes. Irving drives. Got a knock right back in his hands. Still a Nova for three. Irving shot is good. Irving now with a left-handed hook across the lane. And he's got 19. Well, let's go back and see. Uh, no. Yeah. Well, well, don't even argue. The, like, the light yeah. didn't go off. The light the didn't light. go off. No, that's only for our our debut of our latest technology, if you've been watching tonight. Irving to the basket. Oh, what a play from Irving. Once again, he's playing horse with his left hand. That's his fourth left-handed hoop tonight. No, oh, that was an incredible move, though. And it's a joke. Fourth straight win for Cleveland. And the high-octane offense on full display here tonight at the Quick and Loans Arena where Cleveland improves to 19-3. They shoot 55% from the field. And Teron Lue now 
four and one as head coach and gets the handshake from Greg Popovich. And the best elixir, a win. And hopefully the Cavaliers will get it here tonight, less than 24 hours after that heartbreaker. New Orleans also comes in with a surly attitude because they lost at home a couple of nights ago to the Lakers. Kyrie Irving mid-range, he came into the ball game number two in the league behind Mo Williams for guys that shoot at least two mid-rangers a game. He's 54%. Irving knocks down the three, a sight for sore eyes. You know that three-point stroke is going to start to get dialed in. Very shallow. Sets the screen now. Coleman, a good job fighting through it. Good decision by Kyrie to give it up. JR, deep for three. JR swishes nine. My goodness. Irving, off a bump. Great pump fake. Cracked it himself and scores. Got a good job there of getting him a bird off the ground and lays it in. 34-27. Harry is getting away from Douglas. Mo airs out a three. The bottom. Mo Williams, welcome back. Mo, Mo, Mo. Kyrie, long three. Got it. A couple of triples for Kyrie Irving. Doing a good job of getting in a triple threat position and going up over the top for three. Kyrie changing gears, squares up. And he was fouled, fouled in midair by Douglas. Morris Cole turned the corner back out there, contested, hit a tough shot. So the one-time Dayton Dunbar football star. A lot of people thought he might go to the college football route because he was a quarterback. Irving off the glass, nice cover shot. Yep. Irving elevates and hits it. Sweet string music, he's got three more. Kyrie. Early offense, get the ball down the floor, take advantage of a lazy defense. Irving, mid elbow J. Off the rubber rim, Kyrie Irving, he's got 18 now. He likes that mid-range. 54-46, Kyrie gets to the rack this time and finishes it. So that time he picked a spot. And he stuck the screen. Kyrie spins inside and had the Shot blocked, but a foul by Holiday. Anderson called for it, running down the floor. Missed a three ball. Whoa, he has dodged one there. Amazing, they're four of 18, and they're running this ball game. Kyrie split the D, the pull up. Oh, Mark Price would be proud. Yes, he would. Split the double team. Stop on the dime, he's got there. Kyrie Irving. Trying to get in the lane, kicks it out to Jefferson, needs this one. For three! With conviction. He put a little bit of air into that one that time. He made sure he got it up in the air and not flat. Cole, high arcs, into the hands of J.R. Smith. Here comes Irving back and down. Cole goes right at him and scores! No hesitation for Kyrie, but that's early offense. Well, he was on one-on-one -on, -one on one side of the floor by himself. Cunningham had to pick up Kyrie. The pull-up. In rhythm, two more. He's been deadly tonight with that mid-range game. Timeout, Pelicans. The Cavaliers. And to earn it, a standing O. Final seconds ticking away here at the queue. 99-84. A one-and-go winner as New Orleans was shut out over the last four minutes and 20 seconds, and the Cavaliers pick up win number 36, and Ty Lue goes to 6-3 and three as the Cavaliers head coach. A much-needed victory over a gallant bunch of Pelicans. LeBron James wants to be the king of kings here tonight, which would mean a W as they get their first look at the high-powered, high-scoring Sacramento Kings from out west, a team that has struggled, especially on the defensive end of late. Here comes Gay. Good inside-outside presence as well. Blocked by LeBron James as Bellinelli thought he had two. That was great defense by LeBron coming in from behind to get the block. Harry thought about it against Gay. Now elevates. Got his legs into it for three. Yeah, did a good job of doing that, Fred. They had a nice jab step, brought it back, and then let it go deep in the queue. J.R. Smith against Bellinelli. Shoots over him. Missed it and chased it down. Cavaliers another chance. Kyrie tries the other side. Got it! Back-to-back -back trays for Uncle Drew. Kyrie coming right out. Right off the bat. LeBron rolls inside. Too easy! <laughs> That's the way to get back at him. That's right. Kyrie an open look there. Cuts inside. Again to the rack. LeBron waited to the right moment. 
soon as he saw Rondo out of position, nice pass to Kyrie. Good movement without the ball. J.R. Smith for three. J.R. Smith a little tired of, of, of Bretonelli going after him, so he says, I'm going to get back at you, young man. 24-21. Irving looking for an open teammate. Shepard cut off. And he backed it home, looking for the end one. Irving got inside. Caspi and scored it. Yeah, he knew that Cassie couldn't stay with him. Once he got his body, the shoulder passed him. He knew he had him then that time for the basket. Because it's swatted by Moscow. Good hustle by the big fella. Here comes Irving going downhill all the way to the rim. Right down to Euclid left. Timeout, Sacramento. 45-36. Irving switched to the left hand and tapped Benson home. He really fooled Rondo that time. Rondo thought he was going to do something else. The, uh, Kyrie did a good job of coming back to the left hand. Rondo with a pass that was wide, results in a turnover. Yeah, spread the floor. Irving, Euro stepping to the hole for two. Irving. I guess the double team. Kevin Love flared out. Buried it. Yes, just a matter of time. Kyrie draws two guys. Love moves to the open area. And knocks it down deep in the queue. Kyrie mid-ranging and heading. Came into the ball game as a mid-range shooter, 55%. Well, that's his shot. He and Mo both. Off the miss. Kevin Love slow to get up. He's okay. JR backs out. Rims it up. Back tap by LeBron James. He'll get a credit for a rebound. Kyrie Irving cashed it in. LeBron James. With the hustle, 50-50 ball. Cavaliers, Kyrie knocks it down. Rondo backs out for three. Guided that one. Here comes 23. Sacramento did a good job dropping back. Ball swing to JR. Sends it. The bottom for three. 1,600 triples in the career of one JR Smith. The three. And I like it. Because he didn't hesitate, he took the shot that was there and knocked it down. So Kevin Love with 11, Gay cut off by Jefferson, who picked his pocket. Good solid defense, had to move your feet to make that happen. Here comes Shumpert, really attacking the oh, 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 He oh. rattled the iron with the left hand. Irving drops it off at the feet of Jefferson for three. So. Standing and waiting, Fred. That's why it's so important that move bodies in the ball because your spot shooters get a chance to shine. Irving sends it, hand in the face, and he was fouled. He got some gravity to help him. He'll look for an and one the hard way. Allison getting it going now. Back the other way, Kyrie Irving. The new style Cavaliers. You make one, we make one just as quickly. Inside, Jefferson on the possible. Good passing on the ball. Cavaliers now have the defense totally on their heels. Kyrie squares up and hits it beautifully. Got air under that shot. Squared up in midair. He's got 29. Jefferson tees it up for three. RJ again. Looping feed to JR. Right back to Irving for three. Got it. Moving the ball from side to side. The defense can move faster than the ball. Cavaliers a de decisive offensive performance. And a win and go winner. Nice round numbers. 120 to 100 on a triple-double night here at the Q. It's the Lakers and the Cavaliers as we welcome you to NBA Wednesday presented by State Farm. Snowy Cleveland, Ohio as Kobe Bryant will play in the Quicken Loans Arena for the final time. Kyrie Irving's the first shot of the night goes in. I'm just glad that they're defending each other. This is, this is a matchup where they're taking the challenge and looking to defend each other. Krista Thompson, one of the best offensive rebounders in the game. Irving gets some oohs and ahs and the finish. Sweet move from Kyrie Irving. Now Kyrie right here says to the young fellow, allow me to have this dance. And then uses the rim as a shield, finishes with the scoop shot. Beautiful move by Kyrie Irving. Irving, he pulls up from the elbow. Kyrie Irving with eight points. A lot of heavy hearts throughout the NBA tonight as we just recently learned that earlier today, Ingrid Williams, the wife of Monty Williams, a former NBA player, head coach, and now current Oklahoma City assistant coach, passed away from injuries 
that occurred in a car accident yesterday. Ingrid Williams, just 44 years old. She's the mother of their five children. And so many people, their hearts hurting right now and extend their, their love and heartfelt condolences to Monty Williams. Shot clock down to six. Irving gets past World, plays it up and in. Irving steps into a three, gets it a go. He's been struggling from three-point range since he came back, but starting to get a bit of a feel again. Hearing Kobe, Kobe chance in all these arenas where for many years he was hated. Respected but hated as Kyrie Irving knocks it down. Well, whether you're a Laker fan, and there are Laker fans throughout the country or not, and just the charisma and the dynamic way he played night in and night out. Even this year, as bad as the Lakers are, they're on, on the national TV schedule 19 times, and this was before he announced he was retiring. As Varejao hits the jumper. Well, if, you, if you're the Cavs, what you can't do is allow the Lakers to lull you to sleep when you lose your competitive spirit. you got to win the game all over again. Irving drills the three-pointer, his second of the night. Irving last year shot a career-high 41% from downtown. As that three-pointer is good, Lou said that for several weeks after that, Kobe Bryant would punish him in practice just to let him know that was a one-shot deal. Irving with the steal. Irving sidestep. Looks like he took an extra one, but still lays it up and in. And it's right back to 17. 25 points in 22 minutes for Kyrie Irving. Beautiful feed. Varajal can't finish. Thompson with yet another rebound. He's 11. And a gorgeous pass. Irving with a finish. Tristan Thompson showing some skill. And a lead back to 20. You see the Lakers staying in that zone. You got to make multiple efforts. It's not about giving them open shots. You got to look to contest. Mozgov his first field goal attempt back up to 21 Richard Jefferson that's the 11th three-pointer of the night for the Cavaliers and right back up to 16 because if you're Tyron Lue your team is winning but we're not playing to face the Los Angeles Lakers and Lou and beat them just barely or in a sloppy game we're playing to be the champ and this type of energy effort and passion won't win you the championship Nice slam from Mozgov. Yeah, it, it has been a roller coaster ride in terms of the intensity. Irving slips, slides, pulls up, and knocks it down. Wow. Stops on a dime after that little slide. He's got 29. Irving again, another pull up. Got it. Kyrie Irving, second straight game, 30 plus. He had a season high 32 on Monday. He's got 31 tonight. And the Cavs go back up by 13. Oh, Irving with the left hand, high off the glass. Russell fires away, and that'll do it. Another emotional night. Another tribute night for Kobe Bryant and his former teammate, Teron Liu. A three-game homestand as the fans come in a sleep train arena to see LeBron James, the Cleveland Cavaliers, open up this Homestead Kings trying to bounce back from a tough loss against New Orleans. Irving. Kyrie Irving with a fancy move to set up the wide open three. Boy, that was a, another beautiful spin. So we've seen James and Irving already uh, just leaving defenders. And there's Irving breaking down the defense, and he's got five. Yeah, his quickness is going to be a real problem for Rondo, no question about it. He's been able to get spots on the floor that he likes. Here's that three-pointer you were just talking about. That's what he's out there for, to stretch the floor. And uh, Channing fry has been doing that for years. Does not have a post game, even though he's uh, got a lot of length. Kyrie Irving fouled by Willie Cauley-Stein. How about the English on that to get that to fall? That's an incredible shot by Kyrie Irving. That's definitely Kyrie taking it right into the traffic here. Willie Blockenstein tries to get to it. Uh, and uh, just the amazing little spin in English off the glass. That's amazing. amazing. That is remarkable. Second foul on Cauley Stein. And how about Karan Butler? His first shot is a good one. Karan says, hey, if I play every two months, I'm still ready. And uh, That's called a professional. That's called a major professional, as he's always been. And that's a major professional. Oh, my goodness gracious. Did you just see Kyrie Irving? Wow. 
Kyrie Irving with two great back-to-back -back plays and a chance for a three-point play. Yeah, a little shake, a little bake, and oh yes, a take with the left hand. Kyrie Irving, former number one pick out of Duke, putting on a show, and uh, man, hard to guard that kind of stuff. James all the way on the other side of the floor. Delivered over the three-pointer. Boy, that's great ball movement. That is a superior ball movement. I mean, the floor is spaced. They got the shooter, the open look they wanted. That's Della Vadova, the best three-point shooter on this team. Kyrie Irving. Oh, oh, wow. He has had some amazing shots in this game. He is a, a spectacular talent, no question about it. The up and under, we've seen just about everything from him. Rondo. Blocked by Kevin Love. Uh-oh, here's James. He's ahead of the field, makes the catch, and the Cavaliers lead 81-76, and now George Carl needs a timeout. What a change of events we've had. This is a 15-point swing. Irving, oh, my goodness, that's just too easy. He threw his head down and uh, beat two defenders right to the rim. They double Kevin Love. And Kyrie Irving with a deep three ball, and it's a four-point lead for the Cavaliers. Rondo had been looking at the Cleveland bench to try to anticipate the play that's being called. And the play is a three by Irving. And, well, sometimes you just got to tip your hat. Kerr, oh, my goodness, Kyrie Irving. Jerry, I mean, is there anything that he can't do? I mean, we have seen it all tonight. <laughs> I think we have. I hope we've seen it all. I'm afraid there's more. 91-88, here comes Kyrie, and he's fouled. And he shoots it anyway, and he scores. You want to talk about a guy that is on fire? That is Kyrie Irving. It doesn't count, but he's like, hey, I'm going to shoot it anyway from about 40 feet. <laughs> Irving, he's fouled, and the basket counts. How do you not call that foul at the other end? And that's a technical foul they just called on Darren Collison. Kyrie has an opening. He attacks. Boy, what body control by Kyrie Irving. He, he's just a magician, isn't he? He really uh, so creative. He's been the best player on the floor. He really has. He's been the, the game changer. Well, guess what? <laughs> I was wrong. He finally made a big shot. Because, Jerry, you know, he's been struggling all game. Oh, he has. No, he's had great shots all night long. And, uh, obviously, he's... Finally hit the uh, long ball there. You see a Kyrie Irving uh, definitely going to get it to him that time. He got the nice arch on the shot. Yep. He's been shooting so flat the whole game. So LeBron James will hold on, and he will say goodbye to Sleep Train Arena with a victory of 120 to 111. And he walks off this floor for the very last time of his career as we move into the Golden One Center next season. The playoffs less than a week away. Game 81 tonight. The Cavs tried to sweep the Atlanta Hawks. Irving, open look. Got air under that and stuck it. Kyrie taking his time. Get down the floor and hit quick. Kyrie jumps and hits. Good looking stroke again. Yes, quick hitting plays for Kyrie. Kyrie floating, gets it back. Well, Kyrie, that's the one where you fight another offensive player. You make him play defense. Irving squares up for three. Kyrie's got nine in the quarter. And I like it because it's all quick hitting. Yep, Kyrie, as the defender fell down. Got the hop off a of rubber rim. <laughs> Back to Irving, going to work again. Inside on the step through Irving. Kyrie, and, and you see I like the way Kyrie is playing tonight. He's being more, more deliberate. Irving fights off the pass to Love. Contested three, got it! Love is in the air early in the first half here against the Hawks. Irving turned the corner. LeBron James sets his feet, knocks it down. What are you seeing from this three-point shot these two games? What I see right now, LeBron James is just in a great, comfortable position. Up top, Thompson in the high hand off. That was a great play that time. They set that up perfectly. Irving getting the screen from Thompson. Got to beat Horford. Flips oh. it up. It is. He bounced it home. Yeah, once he gets you going like that, you're not going to stop him. Then, he, then the only thing you can do is wait and see if he makes or miss the shot. Kyrie Irving crossing over. Drains it for three. Kyrie Irving, quick, a quick hitter. As long as he's quick hitter, he can make quick decisions. The defense has to make fast decisions also. So he's outscored team 1917. Kyrie <laughs> stepping back, reusing the screen. Now elevates and hits beautifully. The whole defense trying to stop him. Irving bodied up by Millsap, so he backs out and hits it. Kyrie Irving with 24. 
stiff tee against a double team. Got in midair. Yeah, and what happened? Uh, yes, and, 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 and double team did a good job of helping out. Irving. Right off the glass with a soft touch. Early offense, getting down the floor. Back comes baseball. Crossing over. Bennett. Oh, oh. top by Channing oh, Fry, oh, oh, oh. who shut his light off. Get that weak stuff out of here. Irving jumps. The bottom for three. Horford now switches out on Irving on a clear floor. They try to take him. The pull up. Beautifully done again. See, isolation, you're not going to stop Kyrie that way. And the second unit is doing a lot better tonight than they did in Chicago of holding their own against the, uh, the Hawks tonight. Knocked away by the Cavaliers. And he took the blame. Invert is clinically engineered to increase landing absorption up to eight times your own body weight. The more force you can sustain upon landing, the higher you will jump. Sold out Oracle Arena as we're set for the tip of the starting lineup. Some changes. Kevin Love back in the starting lineup after coming off the bench in game four. And because of Draymond Green's suspension, Andre Iguodala, his second start of the playoffs. The first one was game seven in OKC. Well, they say closeout games are the toughest ones to win for Golden State. Made a little tougher without their all-star green. James to Irving, three-pointer. And Kyrie Irving knocks it down. Steve Kerr talking about Draymond Green as Iguodala throws up an air ball. Said, we're not going to second-guess his actions. Nothing we can say or do. Just move forward. But he says it's hurt us, and he knows that. But the team would love nothing more than the clinch without him here tonight. And Cho as Irving makes a dandy move inside. And you know why it's hard? Because he's better than the guy who starts ahead of him. And so to wi willingly come off the bench for someone that you're better than is very difficult. But it was what was in their best interest, not what was in his best interest. I give him great credit for that. Kyrie Irving gets inside, kicks it out to J.R. Smith. His corner three is good. Thompson drives, kicks it out, Barbosa. Barbosa sets, can't hit the three. Jefferson chips it to Irving. When we saw Steve Kerr take out Andre Iguodala, he did, I agree with it because he's matching his minutes as Kyrie Irving knocks down the jump shot with LeBron James minutes. Kyrie Irving's jump shot is good. Irving has back-to-back 30-point -back games. 30 in game three, 34 in game four. And he's already five for six and steals it from Livingston. Irving, crossover, pull up, got it. They've got to do a better job defending the small, small pick and roll. They're having problems. We saw it, we saw it in the open. they got to communicate and understand who they're defending. Here's Irving. Steps back. Kyrie Irving. Beautiful jumper from Irving. What a first half he's had. He's now 7 of 8 from the field, 16 points. Irving to Love. Love's jumper. That's good. Love's first field goal, first points of the night. Irving pokes it away and comes up with a steal on the lazy pass. And Kyrie Irving banks it in. Steve Kerr not happy. That's the 10th turnover for Golden State. And Cleveland back up by four. Irving gets free, banks it in, and a foul. Bogut picks up yet another. And Kyrie Irving continues his sensational game five that's why you don't get caught up in five assists this is the right play this is a high pick and roll you're putting bogut in the action that coach talked about Kyrie Irving's going to come off with either a drive or a jump shot that's great offense Irving the floater banks it in Kyrie Irving putting on a clinic 10 of 12 from the field Curry finds a spot can't connect James grabs another Irving steps into a three, knocks it down. Kyrie Irving from downtown. And it's an eight-point lead for the Cavaliers. Steve Kerr telling his team continue to move without the basketball. Irving again from downtown. He's four for five from that distance. He's got 29. Irving drives past Curry, pull up shot. He banks it in. What a sparkling performance tonight from Kyrie Irving. He's got 31. Third straight game in these finals, he's hit 30 or more. Irving drives on Barnes, keeps his dribble. Inside, Shepard for the dunk. Great setup from Kyrie Irving. Irving slides inside, Thompson right with him. Irving, bank shot is good, and a foul. Kyrie Irving does it again. He's got 33, and Cleveland back up by nine.
Just offensive brilliance right here. Irving on the drive, bank shot is good. Kyrie Irving again. Kyrie says to Steph Curry, allow me to have this dance. Look, it uses the size, the strength, little push off with the shoulders. From about seven years ago, my son was playing high school basketball with a loaded team. We were playing in a Christmas tournament up at halftime. They got drilled in the second half. Called my wife and kid and said, what happened? As I was calling an NBA game. They said this guy named Kyrie Irving on the other team put on a clinic. I know how you feel, son. It's okay. Irving, just 24 years old, said it over and over again when he's healthy. A sensational offensive talent. Nearly falls, drives now, spins back, tough fall away, shot, it's good! Kyrie Irving! Another brilliant shot, it's a 10-point lead. He's got 38. Curry steps back, Curry off the mark. James, another rebound, his 14th. Irving from three, bang! Kyrie Irving from way downtown. 41 points for Irving. As Cleveland forces a game six, what a road victory for the Cleveland Cavaliers as the NBA Finals will return to Cleveland on Thursday night. Kyrie, your third straight game where you get at least 30 points, including two in wins, and regardless of who's checking you, you're getting to your game. What have you found in this matchup? Uh, just continue to stay aggressive and get out in transition and uh, use this big fella next to me to get easy shots. And when we're playing one three pick and roll, and they're getting the switches. I mean, we're just attacking matchups, and we just have to have consistency going into game six. Jeff Van Gundy said that this was one of the greatest individual performances in a finals game he had ever seen. And Mark Jackson said what you did tonight was Isaiah-like. With two men of that stature saying that, your reaction is what? I'm, I'm thankful, but at the same time, we wouldn't be in any position without both of us putting on a performance like this and our guys coming in and just trusting our leadership and just doing it for four quarters. That's what it's about, just staying as a team, staying resolved, and sticking to the game plan. To a man, the players will tell you it's just game two of 82, but the capacity crowd at the ACC is going to have none of that. The opener was Wednesday, but this feels like the official start of that journey for the Toronto Raptors. It's BMO Raptors basketball on Sportsnet, and what a way to kick it off on a Friday night with the Cleveland Cavaliers in town. I think in my mind in the league, they've got every weapon that you could look for. The best player in the world, one of the best rosters put together in the world. So it's a good test for us. Tonight. And what do, the, what do the Raptors have? Oh, tough start. Kyrie uh, Irving knocking one down. The Raptors have a almost 100% Demari Demar Carroll, which is something they didn't have playing against LeBron James last year. J.R. Smith, the deep three. You know, one of the things we've seen with J.R. Smith, don't let him get a rhythm going early. Kyrie drills it. That's Man. what makes this guy so tough. That jump shot. He can get by anybody almost any time he wants. And when he gets hot, he's an absolute nightmare to try to deal with defensively. LeBron James, corner three, and it's good. James had 19 points, 11 rebounds, and 14 assists on the banner-raising night. Health is the key. Yeah, that's that's for him. A good one. Irving knocks on down the three, and it's 31-23. Tremendous body control by LeBron James as he lays it off of the window and a six-point lead, and a nice job by Irving on the cut. And a difficult angle with Lowry draped all over him. There is a great article on ESPN.com about Tyler Johnson and how after he received the offer sheet from the Brooklyn Nets as Kyrie knocks it down uh, that he actually got sick he couldn't keep he was just so he I'd just be sick believe, I'd be crying you'd he, have to he, pick me up off the floor Are you kidding yeah, me he, he, he vomited he was just like I can't believe this is happening to me and then it gets matched by Miami which is great it's great that you, you, you see everything that has transpired in this league, and it just continues to to get better and better and better. As Kyrie Irving knocks it healthy. down, eight point advantage for the Cavaliers. Raptors shooting 39 percent, Cleveland 46. Irving showing his handles. 
whips it over to Love, back over to Kyrie with the up fake, to Love to three. You can tell they trust each other. Absolutely, a lot of patience right there. No rush, get the shot you want. Tremendous work ethic, the money will not change that as Irving drills the two. Well, Kyle Lowry just shook his head. He, Kyle's working, he's getting up, he's contesting a lot of these shots by Irving, and Irving's just showing his ability to make tough, tough shots. Valanciunas has a double-double. His first of the season, he led the Toronto Raptors in double-doubles a season ago. And with 22, and the three is good. And Kyrie, if he becomes a consistent three-point shooter, somebody that's going to shoot 37, 38% from three, that's going to be trouble for teams. Dunleavy can't lays it up and in. You just can't sleep on this guy. One point game once again. Irving the three, got it. 5.30 left. Well, Corey Joseph just working his tail off. James with a slam dunk. Nice find by Kyrie Irving. He had nowhere to go, but he was able to find his teammate. A minute left, and Lowry driving, attacking off the window. JV trying to keep it alive. Gets hammered. 50 seconds left. James Irving open prey. Go! 94 91. So here looking for Lowry. And he gathers it, fires. No. That's going to do it. 94 91. Cleveland takes the first of four meetings between these two teams. We live in the land of Believe Land. What a night in Northeast Ohio as the Cavaliers start to double dip in Gateway Plaza, taking on the Houston Rockets. Sean Wright, Kevin Cutler, and Courtney Kirkland are officials for tonight. Glad you're aboard here on Fox Sports Ohio and NBA TV. JR, great escape through. We'll square it up and hit. Well, JR has been practicing that same move while I was watching him before the game where he's coming from the baseline out to take that shot. Backdoor cut, pass knocked away by Harden, reclaimed by Tristan Thompson. Kyrie split the knee! <laughs> Throw it down, Kyrie! Throw it down! 7-4, Juan and Golden. Kevin Love on the catch. And the jump hook. That is a really catching his team. <laughs> One step too slow. Good pass, quick, sharp passing. Irving trying to get to the rack. Stays with it and finished it. Doing a good job of taking their time. In the half court, they're not good defenders. Iman Shepard off the bench and drains it for three. He gets his legs under him. He shoots a much better shot. When he has those legs on him, he can use that squat to give him elevation. That's Bobby Brown. Very athletic with the ball. Attacking. Couldn't finish it off, though. Cavaliers trying to continue this pace here. Dunleavy finds Kyrie Irving. Beautiful basketball. The bottom for three. Time up. Mike D'Antoni. The world champs are on fire. Irving against Brown. Great footwork, just a shot to got the rebound, stayed after. Going in Harden, says, I'm going to score this, and he does. He's got a second chance. Carey launches for three. Give him a 16-point first half. Woo. A pirouette in midair. Deep in the queue. Thompson stuck that screen. Irving dances inside. Finish the left hand. Kyrie, very good at getting into your body and making the proper spin off the board. Kyrie steps into a three. Got it again! Kyrie Irving with 21 in the first half! Kyrie doing a good job of keeping the Cavaliers within striking distance with a four point lead. Love squares up for three. And hits! Love is in the air at the queue and the Cavaliers lead 78 73. Yes, Love was feeling it that time. He did not hesitate one time. Gotta get number two going here against Gordon. Right at himself. Kyrie spins! Put him in a blender! Kyrie Irving off the glass, 94-92! Woo-wee! <laughs> Here comes Kyrie, changing gears, gets the rack! He is so clever at catching you flat-footed. He caught Nene flat-footed that time, straight up for the layup. 20,562 rises one. Long launch. Oh! Good night, Houston! Good night, sweetheart! Whoa! Time to go and watch the tribe. 125 116. A wine and gold winner for the world champs as they're 4 0 for the first time in 16 years. And now we need the tribe to do their part.
for the ultimate celebration downtown. Yeah, 128, 120 the final score. The Central Division champs, the world champs, taking on the champs of the Atlantic Division a year ago. And oh yeah, by the way, that Eastern Conference Finals rematch. Kyrie driven and for two. Kyrie, of course, adept at the mid-range as well. 7-4. Inside, Tristan Thompson. Returning the favor, the Cavaliers do a good job of running through the plays more than one option. Here comes Kyrie directing traffic for the two-man game. And the footwork came up short. Got the miss and scored as Tristan Thompson had Valentinus locked up. LeBron James, no, Kevin Love offensive board. Got it back. Finding Kyrie Irving. Dancing with it. Flips it up, no. Ooze and Oz, but a miss. Kyrie, another offensive board! He's gone! Tristan Thompson on him, two putbacks. Ross sends a three. Easy rebound for Kevin Love. We're tied at LeBron James on the scoreboard, 23-23. Dunleavy came to it. And hit it a sight for sore eyes. Mike Dunleavy, nothing but court. Yes, Kyrie did a good job of staying in the air long enough to let Dunleavy get into the proper position, and he's deep in the queue. Irving. In traffic, spins it up and in. And the game has changed, Fred. They are slowing the game down now. Seems like both teams are willing to play half court. Alan Chutes, you know the jump hook's coming. Sweeper, and he scored so long and big. And Jonas Valanciunas has eight. But when he puts it on the floor like that, you got to go at it. Make him a passer. Because he's going so strong, he's not going to be able to stop his number. Tristan Thompson on a finish. Doing a good job of getting the open man. Too easy that time for DeRozan. He missed it. Wow. I don't know if he's expecting a foul. He's arguing with Tom Washington. Five on four as a result. Gary flips and scores. Doing a good job of, they ran him off the three-point line, but he kept his pace and he kept his balance to make the shot. Irving is his Team USA teammate, Tom Thompson. Throws it with left hand. Nice little move that time to go with the left hand, and he had his legs under him, able to get up high enough to lay it in. Kyrie Irving weaving and bobbing, and hitting, indefensible. Backs out, Kyrie Irving, run off the spot. Inside, scores! As he put Norman Powell on rollerblades what? on the closeout. The Cavaliers on their heels. Jefferson back out there. Still on dribble. Kyrie Irving from 25. Perfect for three, Kyrie Irving. My goodness. <laughs> Cavaliers trying to fight back. Kyrie inside, double clutch, he spins it out. 112, 110, Cavaliers inch within two. The Rosen jumps. Uh uh. Rebound. Valanciunas long rounds. Couldn't control. LeBron knocked it away. Now a chance to tie or take the lead. Corner. Kyrie for the lead. The batter. He rubber rimmed it. Kyrie Irving time out. Toronto 113. 112. Josh Cribb says I love it. And that'll do it. A one and go winner. Playoff type intensity. Heck of a ball game here at the queue. As the Cavaliers had to dig down and earn it, you see the long-time friends Lowry and Ty Lu exchanging pleasantries as the Cavaliers outscore them down the stretch, 18 to seven. As they win this ball game, 121 to 117. Well, after a gorgeous day of playoff-type weather, Cavaliers with a regular season meeting against the Detroit Pistons. And of course, last spring we know what happened. Cavaliers beat them in four, but it was a tough series. Game one, the big three at 81 and a five point win. Game two, JR won video game on him, had seven trays and a 17 point wipeout. Game three at the Palace, Kevin Love delivered another double double, and Andre Drummond delivered some elbows. No technical foul there, but the Cavs won by 10. And then Kyrie Irving from half court in game four, he also made the critical stop at the end of the ball game and a two-point win against Reggie Jackson and company and the Cavaliers danced off into the second round. Tobias Harris waltzes inside with power. He's really a hybrid 3-4. Plays both positions for these guys. Carry off his screen. Inside on a spoon feed. High hand off to Tristan Thompson. Now that's knowing your teammate there because Double T wasn't in position until he made the pass and he throws the hammer down. Inside Thompson with will and power. He got fouled that time, but no call. But he went up strong and got it in the hoop. Kyrie rises and string music for three. 
15-11, good guys. Inside, back to a cut too easy, LeBron James. They are really executing the offense at a high level. Hey, Smith inside, missed it. Ball off the shoulder, Dunlady, cleaned up by Drummond. No! Missed the jump hook. Frustrated as he heads down the floor. Cavaliers pushing every chance. No look inside, LeBron James and a cute dish by Kyrie Irving, who's got five dimes already. Here comes Kyrie, spinning! Oh, he put him in a blender! You see me, and now you don't. 26 17 Cavaliers. It's like Kevin Love on a seal off. Well, Kyrie is really seeing well this evening. Right before the ball has anything to do with the play, he hits Love for easy layup. Oh, well, Pope again on Kyrie. Kyrie giving room, and he says, I've got to take it. Thank well, you very much. Well, he knows that Pope is afraid to go at him. So Pope has kind of in a in that La La Land, and Kyrie knew that, and he just went up over the top for two. Kyrie spun away from trouble. And it. Kyrie oh, Pope still looking for it. <laughs> Kyrie got him leading to the right too far. Spin move for two. Here comes Kyrie. Oh, off the footwork. It went right at Drummond. Drummond was preparing to jump. Kyrie said, "I'm gonna just put it up softly on the top of the board." Drummond stayed on the floor. Kyrie gets two. Goes Kyrie, giving the right hand. Pocket pass to Thompson. Wheels it in and scores. Two. Good catch. That time, a little bit low for him, but he was able to hold on to it and lay it in. Kyrie stopping a dime and scores as he drifted in. Good job of using the head fake. Once he stopped and, and, and made the defender stop, easy layup for Kyrie. Kyrie jumps and hits. In his own, he's got 15. Good job of stopping on a dime, backing up, and knocking it down. 64-41, the lead balloons to 23. It's Smith, wide open shots. Boy, kind of a double clutcher. Got his own miss. Blocked by Tristan Thompson. Man, he's going to have 10 blocks to keep this up. This needs to dish because he's not scoring right now. <laughs> right. <laughs> Kyrie oh. from 30. Got it from Geauga County. Timeout Detroit. <laughs> Kyrie Irving stopped almost at half court. And he is too, too deep in the queue. LeBron James knocks it down. Well, personally, I just think when Jackson comes back, they all feel better oh, about yeah. themselves, and 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 they will be a much different team when we when they when Jackson comes back. LeBron James sets it, hits him two in a row. LeBron James is spot shooting him, just like in practice. Same spot, same place, same result. Irving crossed over and hit it again. Kyrie is just. On point. And now he started the game out assisting. Now he's starting to knock the points down. Morris pulled the trigger. Rims out to Baines, who lost the ball because of the collision with Shumper. Lure has the unenviable task to try to stay in front of Kyrie. Oh, he doesn't matter. And he actually defended it pretty well. Kyrie is just saying, okay, I don't care how many guys guard me. I'm going to just let it go. They have a chance to go two for one. Looks like, though, they're going to just work for a good shot. Kyrie sends it. <laughs> and gets it, just like I said. Work for a good shot. A three from Kyrie. That was a good shot. <laughs> deep, deep, deep in the queue. <laughs> a winning goal winner. One-sided. Almost wire to wire. Everybody had a hand in it, including LeBron James, Kyrie Irving, Kevin Love. And the Pistons will try to recoup and try to solve their road issues as they're now a miserable one and seven away from the Palace. And the Cavaliers now seven and one here at home and go to 10 and two, regaining the uh, top spot in the East by a game over the Atlanta Hawks. It's a hockey hoops doubleheader. We got basketball presented by AT&T as the Cavaliers take on the Sixers. Tonight it's the Flyers and Flames in the Wells Fargo Center. As the Cavs try to go 2-0 against these guys this season. Kyrie Irving against Okafor, ducks inside, scores! Kyrie remembers that Jaleel Okafor, when he was going to Duke, said, you're my favorite player in the NBA. Well, <laughs> Kyrie reminds him why. <laughs> Kyrie elevates. And cashed it in for three. Well, he's always confident. <laughs> Kyrie Kyrie's sets up and knocks it down. Kyrie rhythm dribble. And he hit it for two. Guys, the other night after Dallas, LeBron mentioned how pleased he was with the team and their defensive Jim effort. From the effort standpoint to the attention to detail to communication, he loved it. 
right now not that way. He called the guys together in that last huddle. He pointed to his head and he said, that thing that we talk a lot about, KYP, know your personnel. He says, guys, it's all about attention to detail right now. All right, let's see if they can pick up that end of the floor as Kyrie with the three ball, 41-33. Thompson on the run. MB can't block everything. Set a menacing screen. Irving against Embiid had to sneak it up. Oh, how in the world did he make that shot? Kerry didn't care if he was 7-2. I'm taking you straight to the hoop for two. I got to see that replay. That was impossible. Kerry against Ilyasova, the pull-up. Stopped at a dime. Kerry is wearing him out. He's got 17. Came into the ball game number six in mid-range shooting at 48%. So enough with 20 assists already. Cam's only with eight, which is not like them. Back-to-back -back games of 30 assists against Portland and Dallas. Possible one there. Gary Irving drains it for three. LeBron James doing a good job of keeping his head up. He forced everybody to guard him in the paint. And Kyrie doing a good job of knocking it down. Kyrie off the two-man game. Kevin Love handed the face three. And he hit it. Great concentration by Kayla. Yeah, and Kyrie did a good job of finding him because he almost had he had the shot himself. Kyrie elevates. And hits it for three. Cavaliers now down one. But we can always get Kyrie going at any time. Choice of screens. Kyrie gets one from Tristan Thompson. Kyrie inside. Spins it up and yeah! <laughs> Joel Embiid couldn't get there. Good guys lead by one. Kyrie did a good job of getting his body in front of Embiid to force Embiid to back off. Great move on Kyrie to give the Cavs their first lead. Yeah, he is a little mouthy. That's the only one thing. <laughs> Kyrie Irving on the back down, sends it, and hits a tough but shot. Cold-blooded. I guess it's time for Kyrie to hit one of those shots. <laughs> wow. With the ball off the leg of Richard Jefferson, who's not kicked, so the Cavaliers can keep coming. Kyrie Irving dancing inside, taking over. He's unstoppable right now. What are you going to do with Kyrie? Just let him go. <laughs> Fast ball, Kyrie Irving. The bottom, Kyrie for three. LeBron James orchestrating to the T. How to run a drive and a pass to the corner. And Kyrie is deep in the Wells Fargo Center. Rodriguez, ball comes on the floor to Kyrie Irving. Down the floor, one on two. He doesn't care. <laughs> Kyrie Irving. <laughs> Bruising ankles and he goes as he scores again. He's got 35, 15 in the quarter. LeBron's got his triple double with a 10 rebound. Kyrie <laughs> right the hole, adding to the onslaught. <laughs> they don't know what to do with Kyrie. <laughs> so Kyrie with 39. Embiid now sends the three and hits. I tell you, he's pretty good from the three point line, Fred. Yeah. I don't know why he didn't take the one in the corner, but he, I haven't seen him miss since we've been here, but maybe one in time. He's. He's so, missed one or twice. He's missed a shot. So a one and go winner. Cavaliers had to persevere, riding the shoulders of one Kyrie Irving as he came up with a 19 point fourth quarter. And the Cavs with a victory now go to 13 and 2, 4 and 1 on the road, as we'll uh, hear the conversation in the locker room after this one. The second night of a home and home, this time in the land presented by AT&T Cavaliers and the Milwaukee Bucks went overtime last night in a heck of a ball game we can say the same thing here tonight here comes Kyrie Irving against Snell it's good size against him and seven for two Delavado up in the chest of Kyrie Irving Kyrie a bump through a double team keeps it alive inside Lincoln stripped it in <laughs> Moving without the basketball. Delavan over using his length. Irving goes right after him. He with the footwork and he got the ball at home. Kyrie doing a great job, Fred, with that Euro step. When he gets you going to the left, he can go back to the right just as quickly. Kyrie, well timed with Thompson. Behind the back. To escape. And what's way to go? Kyrie swerving. 17 9. Now you see me, and now you don't. To the hoop. Kyrie Irving. Here comes Vaughn at the middle score. They were called his rookie year. Last year had a very good preseason game here. Lamont taking his time. Irving against Henson. Gave it up. Jefferson fires. And hit it. Jefferson doing a good job of making himself available that time. Uncle Brogdon checks in the rookie from Virginia. Has a real solid pace to his game and some strength as he showed there. Yeah, he, he will be. A starter, uh, or, or get a, he's going to get a lot of minutes with this team. His nickname is the President. We'll tell you about that in a moment. Kyrie, three plays and scores. Kyrie's making his life miserable, though. Kyrie split the D. Which way did it go? Spits it up and in. I don't know where he is. 
Look to the right. He's not there. Look to the left. I don't know. Two points good for Kyrie. Good to have those anti-lock breaks <laughs> out of the Kuma using his length against Irvin. Look at the lead feed to McCray. Attacking. Gave it right back. Shepard will fire. For three! Cavaliers are the highlight maker. Moving the ball all the way around. Inside, outside. Shepard hits deep in the queue. 31-19, good guy. Still up and over. Afterthought, Jay missed it. Rebound to the Cavs. Yeah, he just thought he'd take the shot then. That's what it looked like. Here comes Kyrie right back on the floor. And he drew the foul. Kyrie attacking the basket while the defense is retreating. Kyrie awaiting the screen from Thompson. Those guys so good together. Kyrie inside, gave it up. LeBron James tees it up. The bottom. Penetrating by Kyrie. LeBron James is deep in the queue. LeBron steps in another. He's in three in a row. Going video game out of LeBron James. Got a hurry. Shot clock was not reset. Kyrie over in the nick of time. With the left hand. Kyrie dances through the bus for two. Irving launches and hits for three. He has had a great ball game here tonight. Kyrie Irving. Delavidova said it. No, short. Chipped away from Henson by Thompson. Cavaliers are making it clutter. It's cluttering up the, 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 the way to get there. Irving dancing and scoring. Cavalier dead. He went for Rishnikov on him. Lincoln. Likes that right hey. corner. Hits it again. So DeAndre Liggins, not known as a three-point shooter, although in the D-League last year was over 40%, but he is now 7 of 11 in three-ball shooting. Kyrie, a bump, and a bucket as he drifted in. Nice and smooth. Little spin off the board. Kyrie to the hoop for two. Parker finally missed one. Cavaliers pushing. Spread floor. Irving a gap. Finds Jefferson. Sends it. The bottom. Richard Jefferson. That was a good. Pass by Kyrie. How much set shot did he have? Yeah, he missed it. Almost like a push shot. But he has an NBA body. LeBron Lee fires. That hits for three. LBJ. And all of a sudden, things are starting to light up from outside in the queue. LeBron James on a rim record. All the Bucks turned around. You watch Kyrie. LeBron slides in behind him to throw the hammer. Now, Kyrie spinning, throws it out! Rosing ankles and he goes Kyrie out! The Kyrie dance to the hoop for two. Give him 28. But the conundrum, what to do with Uncle Drew? He's getting ready to go to the Kyrie dance. Here we go, final seconds of the quarter. Irving stops on a dime, the follow away. Irving, finding Fry, they left him open. That's a mistake for three. <laughs> Shepard ran into Jefferson. Here comes Kyrie. LBJ just like they drew it up. <laughs> Cavaliers virtually wire to wire. A one and go winner. Final score here at the Quicken Loans Arena. Cavaliers 113. The Milwaukee Bucks 102. They take a 2-1 series lead. Go to 21 and 6. The Bucks fall a game under the 500 mark at 13 and 14. We welcome you to our NBA Christmas special. Presented by State Farm. It's the Cleveland Cavaliers and the Golden State Warriors on a beautiful, brisk. December afternoon on Christmas Day. A rematch of last year's NBA Finals and the 2015 NBA Finals. The two best teams in the NBA squaring off for the first time this season. Cleveland, as we mentioned at the top, uh, they've been the best home team in the league so far, 15-2. and two. Irving out to Love. Love sets, fires, and hits. That's just such a difficult action to defend. Bad pass stolen by Liggins. One man to beat. Struggles with his dribble. Durant right there to stop him. Irving fakes. Got it. Oh, Kyrie Irving. How sweet was that? My goodness. Oh. Hey, this guy continues to amaze with his ability to dribble the basketball. Clark in his fourth year in the NBA getting some valuable time as Channing Fry nails the three-pointer. Fry sixth in the NBA in three-point percentage. Irving gets past Green, finds Channing Fry for an easy land.
Three assists for Kyrie Irving. Three-point lead for Golden State. Irving banks in a beauty. Irving fakes, drives on Draymond Green, comes up short, and tipped up and in. Kyrie Irving, the second effort. Ball poked away by Irving. Trying to save it, still alive. Players diving on the floor. James has it, finds Jefferson. Irving steps back, finds Kevin Love. Quick release on a three, rattles home. His second three-pointer. And Love has 12 points to lead the Cavaliers. Iguodala spots up. He can't hit the three. Thompson, another rebound. Six overall. James, down a lane, kicks it out to Love. Irving dances. Feed inside to James. Layup is good, and they've tied the game. Ten straight points now by the Cavaliers as we approach a minute remaining. Irving guarded by Clay Thompson. Thompson, such a good defensive player. James, well beyond the arc, drills the three-pointer. He's been shooting the three pretty well this season at 37%. Irving, penetration back to Thompson. What a sweet pass from Kyrie Irving, his seventh assist. And it forces Steve Kerr to call timeout. Thompson sets the screen on Clay Thompson. Irving drives. Oh, off the glass with some English. Irving kicks it out to James. Corner three. That's good. Three three-pointers here in the third for James. Four overall. And it's back to two. Poor pass from Green. Irving, one man to beat. It's Curry. Sidestep. Strip. Ball right back to Irving. James. His shot won't go. Second effort is good. Uh, Golden State has started off the fourth quarter with a run. The lead by 14. Richard Jefferson drives into the paint and throws it down. There's a flashback for Jefferson. And a technical foul. It's going to be a taunting foul. Liggins back in the game. Up top, Irving. Three-pointer. Right side is good. That makes it an eight-point game. Thompson creates some space. Irving, the crossover, and the banking. 16 for Irving. It's down to six. Irving cans a three. Kyrie Irving with another big three-pointer. Thompson pass inside, stolen again. Kevin Love posting up against Clay Thompson. Finds Jefferson inside. He's out. Oh, he throws it down again. Talk to everybody, Richard. You're 36. We still have 345 remaining. And what has been a special regular season game between these two NBA champions. Nice pass, Irving to James. That's the 10th assist to Kyrie Irving. 13 rebounds for Durant to go with the 36 points. Finds Draymond Green. Pass stolen by Irving. Irving to James. Shepard back to Irving. Fakes drives on Durant. Left-handed throws it up and it rolls in. Tie game. That's a tough shot. That's great defense by Kevin Durant. But better offense by Irving. Curry on Irving. Irving the drive. Back to James. Cavaliers lead and a foul. They run this play every time. Pass inside to Green. And they got that against Detroit to break the tie the other night at 110. We're tied again. Inside goes to Irving. Thompson may have gotten a piece of it as Durant comes the other way. To Curry. Curry for three. Bang! Steph Curry from downtown. His first three-pointer. Check that as second three of the game. And Golden State leads by three with 114 remaining. Irving, the crossover, lost the ball. Curry dives on it. James on him. They do not have timeouts. Cleveland is out of timeouts as Jefferson has a shot clock winding down. James back to Jefferson. Gets off the three. Won't go. Rebound tipped and taken by Iguodala. Ahead now, but Irving steals it back from Durant. Irving gets in the paint, scoop layup, he banks it in. One point game. There's about a 13 second difference between shot clock and game clock. Remember, Cleveland out of timeouts. Five to shoot. Iguodala to Green. Green the drive, back out Iguodala. They won't get it off in time. Shot's good, but they wave it off, a 24 second violation.
Here comes Irving. Drives on Thompson. Irving spins. Puts up the shot. It's good! Kyrie Irving with 3.4 remaining. And the Warriors call timeout. Irving does it again to the Warriors. You cannot play better defense than Klay Thompson just played against Kyrie Irving. But give me great offense over great defense any day of the week. Look at the patience. He wants to get to his spot. Not rushing. Great defense. Uncle Drew does it again. 14 of his 25 have come here in the fourth quarter. Throw in 10 assists. And Quicken Loans Arena erupts as the Cavs go up by one. Iguodala to inbound. They throw it into Durant. Durant stumbles, falls down, throws it up. It's over. Cleveland wins. What a comeback from the Cavaliers. Down 14 here in the fourth quarter. Come back and beat the Warriors 109 to 108. Christmas. I mean, if anyone wants to see a Christmas game, going against a great team like the Warriors, the emotions are high, a lot of great players on the floor at once. It's just great competition in NBA basketball. But you guys always say it's just one game of 82, but yet this felt like a playoff game. Did it feel that way? Uh, it was up there. It's nothing like the playoffs, though, but I mean, the intensity was up there. This is what you want to be a part of as a professional. Take me through the game-winning layup that you just made. Take me through that play. I just wanted to take my time, get to the spot, raise up, make sure I had my legs under me. I knew that Clay's a great defender. He had some length, so I just tried to fade away, get enough arc on the shot, and thankfully it went in. With three and a half seconds left, though, that was a lot of time for them. Yeah. What was the mindset? Just one stop, one stop, one stop in. We can go home winners. But this is a great Christmas Day game. Merry Christmas to everybody at home. Uh, it's a great competitive game, though. Now, you guys were down 14 oh, in yeah. the fourth quarter. What changed for you guys? What kicked in? Just the hustle. Um, raising our level of play. Understand that we've been in this position before. It's a great team down there, so we just got to get stops consistently. We'll be fine. Thank you very much, and Merry Christmas to you, Kyrie. That should get your old heart right up. Cavaliers and Celtics, presented by AT&T. The guys in green always get our focus, don't they? As they are number three in the East, behind the Cavaliers and Toronto. Irving thought about it. Driving kick to a wide open LeBron James. Stops it home for three. That time he caught Crowder trying to help on the weak side. He came back to the strong side. He knocks it down in the key. Love launches. That hits for three. Cavaliers do a good job of moving the ball. Kyrie attracts the attention in love. Docks the eye in the queue. So it's 11 8. Irving behind the back. Oh, it's in the air at the kill. 14 13. What a notice. Long watch Bradley Short contested by LBJ. Runs the floor. Irving in the open floor. Inside. Justin Thompson rumbling down the floor. Cavs running the floor. Kyrie Irving with it against Crowder. Inside flip to Love. Down deep, too deep. Kyrie doing a good job of keeping the head up. Love doing a good job of being physical around the basket. Kyrie steps it away. Short. Thompson on another offensive board. Always. He's got three already. Kyrie in the cut. Draws a bump. Puts it down. Off the rubber around the foul. As Kyrie finishes off that and one. So give him his first three points. And the Cavs lead by one. Oh, stolen by Kyrie Irving. Off Rodney Mott. And cruises in for two. The it's referee is part of the game. Yeah, part of the floor. <laughs> it's a good thing because it probably would have gone out of bounds. It was going out of bounds. But hit the referee. Kyrie scoops it up and lays it in. Kyrie. A bump and a bucket. Well, the way they are defending the Cavs, the Cavs are going to have to move the ball well because this team is really getting up into the Cavaliers' faces on defense. Irving sends it. And gets that three back. They're going to sit back and wait. Kyrie will make you pay. Irving picked up on a switch by Crowder. Dances on him inside for two. Kyrie Irving put him on roller blades. Bradley. Miss on the follow up as Kevin Love initially at the point of contact without fouling. LeBron got it back. Love off the pitch. From Irving for three, just like they drew it up. Move the ball around. <laughs> ball swing love. For three more, Kevin Love. And Kyrie Irving 
another dime. He's got nine assists. Who are you supposed to guard? You can't double LeBron. You can't double Kyrie. You can't double Love. So what do you do? You let him have the shot. Inside, Tristan Thompson feathers at home. That's he. He had Love. He had Liggins in the corner. And, and big and double T in the middle. And you can't stop that play because he has three people to pass it to. Kyrie splits the D. And Saunters in for two. So give Kyrie now 17. Kyrie Irving ducks inside. Tough angle still finished it. My goodness, that Kyrie, that time he had to stay over. He tried to go underhand. He had to go over the top of the ball that time to make the layup, and he made a good one. Irving. And he knocks it down for three. Kyrie Irving getting 22. And that is the young man's jump shot. Boston has cut into some runs, but not once in this game. My observation has been standing outside the huddle. Has Ty had to get on his guys about anything offensively or defensively? It's a lot of self-policing because inside these huddles, players are communicating so much with one another. Irving back down and hits. Needed that one. Got to get that momentum back for about another two or three minutes to get this game back under control. Here's steal by LeBron. He'll get it from Kyrie Irving for an easy one. Yes. Good anticipation by LeBron. He causes a deflection. Kyrie flips it back over his head. And LeBron James throws time. And a back. Buck and a half left here at the queue. Bradley ball hunting. Timely screen. Tristan Thompson, one man to beat. Irving inside. With a tag against Al Horford. Big tag. Bucket by Uncle Drew. Got to hustle back. Irving got the right angle. Gets to the rack. Scores. He put Marcus Smart in cement boots. Timeout. 119, 116. Good guy. Kyrie didn't have to dance that time. But he just took it straight to the basket for two. He's rubbing his hamstring there. Hopefully that move when he exploded in there. He's rubbing that hamstring. Yep. Quick burst. Will be attended to as he tries to stretch it out with head athletic trainer Steven Spiro. Final seconds tick away. A rainbow winner. The Securitas win as the Cavaliers hold off the Celtics. And a six-point win to go to 24-7. and seven. And hopefully some treatment will get Kyrie back to normal. Cavaliers begin the longest road trip of the season presented by AT&T. And just like you travelers sometimes, Cavaliers had to have a change of planes with a layover in Brooklyn as they take on the Nets. Their only visit to the Barclays Center this season. If you sleep on this team, Fred, they'll, they'll give you a tough time. Recently, the Golden State here by 16 at the half and caved in. Kyrie Irving fouled, cut the bucket. Just a matter of time for Kyrie to get his feet under him. As Kyrie completes the and one. Side Tyler Johnson, Alec Crabb, the offseason offer sheets. As Kyrie Irving drains the two, and both those guys were retained by their teams. Tristan Thompson looks at Bogdanovich, bring it at me. And Bogdanovich missed the three <laughs> ball. I love it. Tristan's face. Kyrie dancing inside as he scores 34-33. His patented Euro oh, step. Oh, that oh, last oh. little step gave him the angle to make the shot. Kyrie left wide open. Sends it for two. He had a toe in line. One man you cannot leave open is Kyrie Irving. Irving backs out for three. That's all it takes for Kyrie to get a good look. Just let him get his feet under him. He can knock it down. Shot clock at five. Kyrie spins away. Which way did he go? Give it up. Liggins with time. Measures and hits for three. That's using the 24-second clock to the fullest. Irving elevates. That hits it for two. Kyrie says, okay, if you're going to come out here by yourself, you're in trouble. Irving sends it again. The bottom for three. Uh -huh. Kyrie Irving. That's one guy that you don't want to shoot on the move. <laughs> Whitehead off that screen, open look. Uh -uh. Rebound to Tristan Thompson. Kyrie feeling it right now, sends it. Oh, he didn't do that, did he? Light him up, Kyrie. Kyrie with three more, timeout. As he reminds everybody, I'm not from New York City. I'm from West Orange, New Jersey. <laughs> and don't forget it. Lopez. Short. Good job of Kevin Love to step right in his path. Here comes Irving, feeling it. High hopping, dribble. Oh, that is sick. Kyrie Irving, 
two. The carry dance to the hoop. Pass by LeBron. Two Kyrie Irving on the cuts. That was a great pass by LeBron. Really, the defender had no chance. And the Nets will tip their hat to the Cavaliers. The world champs come to Brooklyn. Their only trip of the season. And the Cavalier fans here rise in mass. Final seconds ticking away. For a one go winner, 116, 108 the final counts as the Cavaliers led most of the night, leading by as many as 24 as the Pesky Nets made a game of it. But the Gans put away to run their record to 27 and 8. The Nets fall to 8 and 27. Cavaliers come down to the bayou, presented by AT&T as we're not very far from the famous French Quarter. And the Cavaliers are trying to leave this place with a win finally. They've lost five in a row at the Smoothie King Center. In fact, the last time they beat a team from New Orleans in their gym, James Posey was playing for them. Thompson on the cut, gathers, and scores with a soft touch. Good shot inside, good pass by Kyrie into the middle. A spinning shumper. A long launch is down for Kyrie Irving. That's a good pass by Shum. Draw the defense to you, give the ball up, and let things happen. Kyrie giving Holiday some of his own medicine. Kyrie with a little dance to the hoop for two. And a frozen 31 21. Galloway off the bench, missed a three. Well, he shot that before he had the ball. Nice and Galloway didn't even get a beat of sweat up. <laughs> let it fly. Kyrie Irving for three. Kyrie Irving. 31 24. Kyrie Irving backs out, elevates for three. Well, the Cavs pull closer. Cavs have to find some resolve here. Kyrie spinning, tough shot, defended, and he willed it home. Give him 14. Kyrie Irving sending it. Long Ranger knocks it down. So give Kyrie 16. Shoot the ball well tonight. 6 of 11. Irving gets it back, though. Kyrie he is known as a three-point shooter. Well, he's starting to light up now off of that pick and roll with the mid-range game. Down the floor, Buddy Heald. His first shot. Partially blocked by Irving. Good defense. Kyrie backing it out. Ball on a string against Cunningham. Oh, behind the back! He didn't! He was fouled hard. Boy, he's got hit on him. He hit his head on the floor, look like. Kyrie with a Kyrie dance to the hoop. But he gets hammered. Jones with a hip check. Wow. Didn't mean to catch him on the head. But boy, he got it from front and back. Makes them both. Dusting himself off. He's got 21. Irving gets Holiday, a good defender. Kyrie with a big time burst. Pays the price again. He put it down. Kyrie ridiculous. Looking for the end one. The Kyrie dance to the hoop. Well, he's got himself a 12-point quarter, 84-74. Holiday spinning, late help, too late. Holiday continues to wear him out with 29. Shepard thought about it. Irving steps into one. The bottom for three. Tyreek Evans. Gonna make him a jump shooter, which he does. Yep, he didn't want to do that either. He has the time. Kyrie says, give me the ball. <laughs> Going to work again there in the penalty. Kyrie goes inside, swoops, and the scores! Kyrie Irving in takeover mode! The Kyrie dance to the hoop for two! LeBron against Holiday again. Pass deflected by Holiday. Here come the penalty, gets stolen by Kyrie, who's bumped no whistle. Puts it up and in! Kyrie Irving again! My goodness, he got fouled twice! Are you serious? He still made the basket. That's crazy. Kyrie floating. Got it to go! Showing the entire arsenal. But now they're taking their time and getting what the defense gives them. Kyrie launches for three! Three's better than two. Cavaliers cut it now to 115 106. Cutting him again. Rims it out. Whoa, what Cavaliers a lucky break. Catch a break. What a lucky break that time. Down nine. Kyrie feeling it. Going video game on him. Kyrie Irving. Well, well, well. Put him on the cover of NBA 2K17, 115-109. Irving steps back for a tough three. He was fouled. Three free throws coming for Uncle Drew and a chance to shave the gap in half. Trifecta for Kyrie. He's got 45. Irving. Has to go to work quickly. Tough step back. That he got! Are you serious? Kyrie Irving. Irving to love for three. Point nine left. 124-122, and that'll do it.
a very, very bitter pill to swallow for the world champs as they come in here and are totally upset by the Anthony Davis list. New Orleans Pelicans, 124-122. Well, after nine straight, we finally get back to the East. Tonight, presented by AT&T. As we're downtown, Cavaliers really start three and four nights now, taking on the Brooklyn Nets at the bottom of the heap right now. Totally re a reclamation project, if you will. Steal by Shepard, laying the weeds down there is LeBron James. But it's Kyrie up top to Tristan Thompson on the high hand up. Cavaliers on the break. Long pass to double team. Irving, open look. And he catches it. The high pick and roll with the pull up jump shot. That's Kyrie's sitting, one of his signature plays. Irving sends it. Oh, Kyrie with four. That's Whitehead, the rookie. And he missed it. Challenged beautifully. Isaiah Whitehead tried to get it there. Here comes Kyrie Irving, ball straight. Corbett at the horn. No. And that will finish the opening 12 minutes here. As Kyrie Irving sticks it. Jordan McCray off the Kevlar bench now. Love, scoring his shoulders. And drained it for three. Good looking shot for Kay Love. Doing a good job, that was a nice play there. Love came back the opposite way than what he normally goes to his right. Came back to his left to knock it down. Irving sends it and hits it. 55-49. An interesting thread how the NBA is now. You won nine ball games, you still rest players. I don't understand that mentality. Kyrie's got 11, 58-49. Irving from 16, perfect. Almost a free throw for Kyrie there. He's got 13. Irving up top to Thompson. Beautifully done. So he's had two alley oops from Kyrie Irving here in the first half, or first uh, in the ball game tonight. LeBron inside on the easy one. He had two mouse. <laughs> he had double mouse in the house that time. 77-60, or mice if you prefer. Yes. <laughs> <laughs> Hollis Jefferson sends it. Rebound alone. Changing gears early. Off the square, looking for the end one. It's a roller coaster ride, you know. Yeah. Um, it's it's kind of hard. It's, it's kind of hard because, you know, teams going through slumps like this, that were at quarter front end, you think you over at one time and uh, you'll be in last year, and then you got to go through it again this year, especially when you're trying to defend the championship. It's, it's one of the hardest things to do ever. I mean, I've never, I mean, for one, I've never won the championship until last year. That was the hardest thing I had to do. Now, to come back off an injury and, and repeat is, I mean, it's not going to be easy. So, the last thing we need to do is start shooting ourselves in the foot. I got you. I got you. Don't get me wrong. This great to, That kid is amazing. You like that shot? I, I love it. <laughs> <laughs> I thought he was going to pull up two steps back. <laughs> he having fun now. Look, he having fun. Yeah, he <laughs> <up>. Oh! <laughs> That kid is amazing. That's a, that kid is amazing. <laughs> the Kyrie stands too. So the final seconds ticking away. A wangle winner. Final score here at the Q. Cavaliers prevail 124 to 116. As I mentioned, go to 20 and 5 here at home, shooting a very tidy 61% from the floor in the second half, led mostly by Kyrie Irving and LeBron James. Two of the most indomitable forces in the league on the court today, Russell Westbrook and LeBron James in Cleveland as we welcome you to NBA Sunday Showcase on ABC presented by Verizon Go 90. From Quicken Loans Arena, it's OKC against the Cavaliers. Inside to Victor Oladipo, who's having a career year shooting from the field. Off the mark that time. Yeah, what you like to see is a little bit more consistency. He's going to have an opportunity now without Cantor, who's out, you know, anywhere from six to eight weeks, to get more shots. Well, Kyrie Irving has averaged over 30 points per game. He'll be in the last five. He has been on a tear for Cleveland. Sabonis on the attack. And almost had himself a nice move and layup there. Here's Kyrie Irving. Well, he's got to he's got to show tonight that he can score the basketball against Love. And a good sign for Tristan Thompson, who's been in a little bit of a slump offensively. Uh, Kyrie Irving with the floater on the baseline knocks it down. I just want to get in the sack right now. Both teams are 0 for 7 in the three ball, all right? 
Now, come on. When have we seen a game start out where we're 0 for 14? Yeah. They'll keep shooting them, though. And, uh, <laughs> Tristan Thompson inside for Cleveland. Kyrie Irving knocks down the 15-foot jump shot. Yeah, he's in a groove right now. He, he, he's feeling good about himself. His total game has been upside in regards to the offensive end of the floor. Cleveland leading by two. James changing that in a hurry. Soaring high for the layup. Irving out to Shumpert for three. Yes! Well, this is the big improvement in Shumpert's game, is, is the three-point shooting. Irving staring down Westbrook. Oh, what a great what move. A move. What a oh, move. he put Westbrook in the blender oh. and got the bucket. Now that was a great move. He's terrific with the lead step and then coming back and then making his move. Watch. See, there it is right there. He gets the defender to lean back and then come forward, and he's got you because you now you're frozen. Interestingly enough, Kyrie Irving, a much more uh, willing passer this year. His assist numbers are up this season. But uh, Tyron Lue, their head coach, wants him to, as always, stay aggressive offensively. Irving running the offense out to Shumpert from downtown. Yes. Ron Shumpert, a 40% three-point shooter this year. Really yeah. improved. Now that's, that's up. That's up ever since he's been in the league. He's Irving. got some motor. They've, they've had this matchup a number of times boy. but that's how good Irving is he's shooting up over a guy who's 6'10 who has quick feet and you could see he played them well now at least three times but Irving is a master at adjusting the shot a lob up high and Thompson converts well, I like the fact that they're giving Jimmy Johnson a run here right now yeah people talk about LeBron James going to six consecutive finals as Irving knocks down the three James Jones has been right there with him going to six straight finals as well. Four in Miami in the last two here in Cleveland. Of course, the NBA, a very inclusive basketball universe. And one, Tristan Thompson off the dime from Kyrie Irving. Off the lob, Adams couldn't get to it. Ah, uh, Thompson was in the way that time. Got a little deflection. Irving with the nasty Euro step on Ibrinas. How about the soft touch? The soft touch on the line. Irving stares down at Brinas and gave it to him. The ankle taker took a couple there. Oh, it's time to boogie oh, for Kyrie. Oh, oh, oh. Got the layup. He'll take two that, scoops. Uh, that, that was beautiful to watch. Textbook. And that's his trade. He makes it look so easy. And Cleveland blowing this open. And Westbrook with a quick three off the mark. Irving checked back into the game for the Cavaliers, and he's still hot. Well, he got the switch. He got the switch that he wanted, the big man, the burn, and then all of a sudden, bam, 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 and he's by you into his favorite spot. Irving guarded by Westbrook off the Thompson screen. They try to corral Irving. It didn't matter. He got around both of them. Got around both, and then how about how easily he slinks in there, and that that soft shot is so high on the glass. Thompson inside with an easy one. Nice pass. Once again, Irving now very quietly with the assist. Adams keeping it alive, and Thompson finally clears for the Cavs. James. Oh, this is a mismatch. Irving goes quick and knocks down the three. On the kick out to Grant. And yeah, the backcourt just 13 of 44. James with the punch to put a exclamation point. A strong third quarter by the ankle taker, Kyrie Irving, who finishes with 29 points and eight assists. Kyrie, after a tough stretch that saw you guys lose six of eight, you've now put together back-to-back -to -back wins. So what has gone into those? Uh, just a lot of patience. Um, you know, me just taking this leadership role and just pushing our guys every single day. We understand that in order to be that next level championship team, we got to bring it every single night. Teams are not taking any nights off against us, and we got to realize that. And it starts with our practice habits, guys coming in and, and really dedicating themselves to the game. Over your last six, over 30 points per game, well over 50% shooting, and extraordinary from three. Why do you have it going so well right now? Uh, I'm just trying to lead these guys as best I know how. Um, you know, just growing every single day. Putting it, put everything into this game every single day I wake up and you know when you get a chance to, to do it what you love I mean you enjoy it that much more so I'm just thankful. Nice to see a smile on your face as well. Thank you.
Bobby's 49 degree night in Oklahoma City. It is the usual sellout crowd, better than 18,000 are here at Chesapeake Energy Arena. Always an extremely enthusiastic fan base as we welcome you to the NBA on TNT, presented by State Farm, the right combination for tonight's NBA coverage. The defending NBA champion Cleveland Cavaliers taking on the Oklahoma City Thunder in game one of our Thursday night doubleheader. People in Memphis were very upset that uh, LeBron and Kyrie Irving and Kevin Love were not on the floor, even though the Grizzlies did win the game. Nice move there by Kyrie. And here comes Westbrook. Westbrook all the way. Played well by Irving. And it's uh, deflected out uh, by Kyrie Irving. Three-pointer for Irving. That's his spot on the floor. He loves dribbling right down, right side, right hand. Irving with the shot. And that's a three-pointer. Irving with the step. Nice move on Robertson. It's not fair. Not only does he have the handles, but the foot speed and the creativity to finish at the rim. Take a look at first half analysis as Irving is able to get to the rim. So he has 12, and let's see uh, Kyrie and LeBron oh, saying, just saying, you know, I'm glad we're playing. Westbrook fires for three. Half minute remaining first half. Love able to get ahead of the field. So Kevin Love with his third field goal. He has nine points. Tristan Thompson opens up the scoring for the Cavaliers. Cavaliers outscored the Thunder by 10 in the second quarter. Irving able to get to the rim. 36-26 advantage. I think it could have been handled differently by all parties, but I, I just I just don't like the way that it, that it happened. And uh, hopefully, like you said, we'll find out what happened. But to go over there with 10 security guards, it's just it's an uncomfortable feeling for any man to be put in that position. And that was also a bad statement by Horrible Madison Square Garden. Oh, come on. Uh, publicity ending with, we hope he gets the help that he needs. You're insane. I mean, that's incredible. Uh, Irving putting on a dazzling exhibition and scores. <laughs> this is crazy, man. He's made about three or four moves tonight, and this is off the dribble handle, splitting guys, and still being able to finish in traffic. Kyrie Irving with 21 points. Clover picks it off. Here comes LeBron behind the back. Irving for three. Yes! Five quick points for Kyrie Irving. Starting to do it all here in the fourth quarter. Irving putting moves on Robertson. Continues to go to his right and scores another sensational play by Kyrie Irving. Reggie basically says, can I have his dance? <laughs> can I have his dance? Because I'm going to take it to the paint with these hands. Irving back again gets to the rim. Anything you can do, Russell, I can do better. The Thunder going to 31 and 23. They've won three of their last four after losing three straight. So they're in the number seven spot of the West for the moment. What's up, guys? Good one in Boston tonight as the defending champion Cavaliers get ready to take on the current two seed in the East, the Boston Celtics. Thomas coming off a four for 21 performance on Monday. Snapped a string of 43 straight games with at least 20 points as Irving was able to alter that delivery from Bradley. Here's Irving trying to get the angle and somehow flips it off the window and in. That's what I call layup king. My man Jalen Rose back in the studio. We've heard that many a time. Irving trying to do the same to Thomas floats it up and in. The master, master of the layup. Irving. What handles through the D, barely bouncing it off the floor to get in for two. Wow. Irving <laughs> somehow spun it in there. Uh, you got to feel for where you are. You know, you, you, when you drive like that and you're not a dunker, you, you got to feel the defender, keep him on your back. You see Isaiah Thomas do that, and then use the glass to protect yourself. Irving with space, connects. Now that's the difference between the NBA when I played and the NBA now. 
When I played, you tried to run for layups. Now you pull up and knock down threes. Boy, Avery Bradley is in a wrestling match with us. Kyrie Irving. I do not know how he got open, but we had a, just an ISO cam on him on that play. Avery Bradley did everything right, and Kyrie finally busted loose for the layup. And Irving now has seven in the quarter. He had six at the half. Irving, a bomb from three. Don't let him get started. He's one of those guys gets in fuego. He'll throw up 30 points in a quarter. Irving, the Euro step, uh -oh. spins it in, plus the foul. How about Kyrie goes, hey, you know what? There's more than one undersized point guard here in this game. I mean, Isaiah Thomas has been brilliant. It looked like he actually got fouled on that play. Amir Johnson caught him around the neck. Watch this here. He now has 19 on the night. Smart likes it on the block. Gets stripped by Irving, controlled by Thompson. Irving flips it up, banks it in, plus the foul. Irving completes it. He has 24 points. Irving with Bradley hounding him. Irving trying to shake him. Bradley all over him, flips it up, and a whistle. Avery Bradley called for the personal. Crowd on its feet. Irving working on Thomas. Gets around him, up, under, and in. Oh, what a move for Kyrie Irving to tie it at 99. Off the glass. Look at his concentration. Horford comes over. Wow, it's like a ballet dancer. Possible two for one here. Do you look for it? It's probably too late now. Probably is with 29 to go. Thomas into the lane. Can't bank it in, but gets the whistle and will shoot two. Thomas connects. Two-point Boston lead. Cavs have one timeout remaining. They will not use it here. Now you've got to put yourself in a position if you don't score here to foul and, and then get to the moving the ball. Irving hooked by Bradley. Still working on him. Forces it up and off. Thompson keeps it alive. James will fire to an open Williams. Off out of three. Rebound Boston. And Crowder is fouled with 4.2 to go. James has to get it in. Bounces it. Irving collects it. Will heave it. Can't hit. Thompson the tip. No, and that'll do it as Boston outlasts Cleveland in a thriller here at TD Garden. Middle game of a three-game roadie presented by AT&T as the Cavaliers come to Atlanta. Haven't seen these guys since November. Three more meetings against their playoff rivals. And, of course, the Cavs had won 11 straight over them, including the postseason until the November meeting at the Q. Kyrie turned the corner, wide open look, and he sticks it. <laughs> Kyrie coming off the pick and roll. That time he stopped and knocked it down. Howard, on his like that spin move, got the left hand, missed it. A little bit further out that time. Yeah, then that's the key. Push him away from that spot at least a yard or two. Irving squares up for three. Well, I don't care how far you push him. You're going to have trouble with him. Kyrie knocks it down. Kyrie on a two-man game. Short that time. Back tap by Jenny Fry. Another chance for the line of Golders. Fry pulls the trigger. And he hits it for three. So he started it and finished it. Yes, moving the ball well. Irving. Some wizardry. Drawing Howard on him. And scores Kyrie Irving. Doing his thing. 17-9. Kyrie Irving. For two. Irving. With a quick dribble. Double clutches and oh. scores. That was tasty. Now that was understanding what you need to do at the right time. Kyrie with that little hesitation. Put him back in position to make the shot. As Kyrie from the foul line knocks it down. One-legged stop. Well, Kyrie is giving him a headache right now. Man. Knocked away by Corver. Kyle says I'm on the other team now. He shoved him. Kyrie Walsing inside. Spins it up and in. Right down Euclid he went. 34-23. Kyrie Irving all the way to the hoop. Kicking him all the way and knocking it in. Jump shooting is not an easy thing if you don't have the right technique. These will all be in the basketball my way out eventually, someday. That's where it'll be. There'll be a man on Mars before that happens. <laughs> Comes to fruition. <laughs> Inside, how about that? It's Kyrie Irving with Tristan Thompson on him. Well, you got D. Williams leading the break, and you got LeBron on one side and Kyrie on the other.
pick your poison. LeBron gets to the rack inside, just wearing them out inside the paint. Boy, they, they set that up well. LeBron thinking about it. Downstairs to Kyrie, ball swing. Hot potato around the horn. Everybody touching it. But David Griffin, here comes LeBron. <laughs> Corbin, look at this thing. Kyrie, oh, the audacity <laughs> of the wine and golders. <laughs> my goodness, my head is spinning. The boy Trying to keep up. 69 <laughs> 52 timeout Atlanta. <laughs> Who has the ball? I, I have don't know. no idea. <laughs> there are fingerprints all over that ball. They're going to have to wipe it off. Baseball, hit his pocket pick. Kyrie Irving with a lightning quick hand. Now the one a set, which is a Kyrie Irving. Three! Who needs a set? <laughs> Kyrie's got 18. Oh, he's showing the handles tonight, hasn't he? Jefferson drains the three ball. We're well, feeling it tonight, Fred. You can just see his legs under him. He's letting it go at the right point and knocking it down. Kyrie knows the clock. Got on side with a left hand. He's toying with him, Kyrie Irving. Kyrie. He's got 23. LeBron thought about that three. Deflected feet into the hands of Shepard. Cross court touch. Here we go again. Look at the ball dancing. And Jenny Fry knocks down the three. <laughs> well, I'll tell you, the Hawks. You get a stiff neck trying to watch that. <laughs> Kyrie Irving. Oh, it doesn't matter. <laughs> Over and through the hand of Schroeder. Fry hits the mid ranger. Right back the second time. LeBron's man had to stay with him so he couldn't come over to Channing and he knocks it down. So he'll give Fry eight on three of six from the floor. Irving swings it out. Channing sends it, knocks it down. Fry another three ball. Yeah, and Kyrie with a great pass. And Channing knock it, knocks it down deep in the Phillips Arena. As Irving, that is his shot for and sure. That, that is his shot for sure. You're right. <laughs> He's got 28. Kyrie came in as a 49% mid range shooter, number three in the league. Derek Williams drains it for three. Another one. Cavaliers with 20 triples. Yes. Kyrie from deep. Oh Sends it, knocks it down from Roswell. <laughs> Google map it. You'll see how far it is. 106.84. He was feeling it. Inside. Defended by the Hawks. Crowd getting into it. As we get a foul on Atlanta. So Kyrie dusting himself off for a pair. Give him 35 as he and LeBron continue to mirror each other in the scoring column. Baseball wants to get to the rack. Does missed it. Rebound LeBron James. Whoa, that was a big miss there. Baysmore, the hero the first time out at the cube, but this time missed it. Kyrie, working time, gets inside for two. Always keeping his dribble. Uncle Drew says, let's get out of here. Irving gets to the rack and drips it in. And he was fouled. And that's going to do it. A wine and gold winner the circuitous way. As the Cavaliers led by 25 on a historic three ball night and have to hang on to beat the gallant Atlanta Hawks in an absolute shootout, 135 to 130. As Atlanta wound up with 42 in the fourth, but on a night when Kyrie Irving gets his ninth game of 40 or better, they needed all of them, along with LeBron's points of 38. Yeah, you're right. As they combined for 71. Second night of a back-to-back -back in the City of Angels. Last night, the Clippers. Tonight, the Lakers here on Fox Sports Ohio, presented by AT&T. As the Cavs try to sweep the season series, the ratings will go up tonight in uh, Summit County because of the Nance family certainly watching. First shot goes. The Cavaliers want to come out, Fred, and really start to get into a rhythm as far as how they run their plays, how they rotate on defense. Russell's only played one game against the Cavs in his career. 24 in that meeting. And Kyrie Irving on the knockdown. The high pick and roll with the mid-range jump shot, always a good one for Kyrie Sam. Right to the hole Kyrie. Right there. Kyrie with a dance to the hoop. Nwaba again against Kyrie. Kyrie launches off the screen, he hit it. There's nothing they can do. If they're going to continue to back up off of the pick and roll when Kyrie has the ball, they're in trouble. You've got to come up on it. If you don't, Kyrie will make you pay. Wamba, oh, a strong move. Tapped up by Randall goes awry. Ball squirts loose into the hands of Kyrie. Look at it push. In a blur. Ducks inside. Spins it up and in! You can't stop it! My goodness. He had a full court dance to the hoop that time. Zubats back out there. Irving. Drops it to Kevin Love for three. 
No doubt about that one. And Kyrie in love with a nice little give and go, and love is deep in the Staples Center. Seven point game, Kyrie. So foul line change and he sticks. Kyrie. Very easy for Kyrie. Shepard sends it off the mark. Back tap by Thompson. They'll get credit for the offensive rebound. Irving, long launch three. The bottom, Kyrie Irving. Kyrie Irving. Irving. He's got 18. Randall set the screen for Russell. Flips it. Has an easy shot release. Well, he has, he's a good shooting motion. Again, he's going to be the two guard. Kyrie, again. He's got a pristine shooting motion. Uncle Drew back at him with the pose. 56-55. Same spot, same result. Up top to Tristan Thompson on the high handle. Yep, they can't guard everything because LeBron had went to the corner to draw the defense over there. They were aware of that. And the nice little over the top, double T throws it down. Irving turned the corner. After he lays it in, are you serious? My right, goodness. Look away layup for Kyrie. LeBron backs him down. Pass deflected in the hands of Kyrie Irving. Launches for three. Give him 27 now on the deep ball, 81 77. Irving sets it. He's feeling it right now with three. Kyrie's going to have to be the savior then, but if they don't stop, I don't care how many baskets Kyrie makes, they got to get some stops. Irving against Nawaba. Through some contact and drifted in. <laughs> A one man show. Kyrie Irving. 89 82, seven point gap. Long launch for three. Kyrie Irving, deadly, deadly from deep in the Staples Center. Out for the lead, Kyrie. Got oh, it for three! Goodness. Kyrie, where to path out on the left side of the floor, 109 106. Shoot him out of the Staples Center, Kyrie. Irving switched upon by Randall. Straight line drive. Puts it up and in! Says, You can't stop me, but nice try. Kyrie with a dance to the hoop. He's got 44, 12 in the quarter, 119, 112. Clarkson, live dribble, and score. Very athletic, isn't he, Jordan Clarkson? And they forced a foul now, and ball on the hands of the right guy, Kyrie Irving. Kyrie Irving will dribble out the clock. A win and goal winner, Hollywood style, the hard way. With the Good ending, shall we say. 125, 120 to this movie. And the Cavaliers will head to Denver now with a record of 46 and 23. But 101 points, the best since the big three came together in their third year. Most points they have scored combined. One of the reasons why the Pepsi Center will be jam-packed here tonight. Cavaliers and Nuggets presented by AT&T. As the Cavs make their only regular season visit, of course, to the Mile High City, taking on a team that's desperately trying to hang on to the final playoff spot in the West. Jokic on the pass. That time he tried to force it. You heard Tristan talk about that. He takes chances with his passes. And he averages almost five assists a game. Love a deep three. Got it! That was from Lakewood. Colorado, that is. 6-2. Cavaliers with the early four-point lead. Doing a good job of coming out of the locker room, ready to play. Plumlee against Kyrie Irving. And he dotted his eye with a three ball. Doing a good job of moving it around. You take it. No, you take it. You take it. No, I'll take it. Knocking it down. Kyrie Irving. Kyrie on a spin move to Thompson. Missed it. Back up. And Kyrie. To fire and hits. He started it. He finished it. Yep. Cavaliers doing a good job of staying after it. Fred didn't give up on the play. Double T back to Kyrie for two. Martin had 12 with the Q in the prior meeting. Before that, the prior two games, 27 and 29, but cast it two back. And see, that's what the pressure is on you. You have to continue to score if you're going to play, give up this these type of uh, points on defense. Denver will allow a lot of points. Kyrie Irving fought it up and in. Hey, little spin move by Kyrie in the lane. 61-49. Irving on the long three. They'll review it at the uh, next stoppage of play, but right now it's ruled a three. Two more, though, for Kyrie Irving along the baseline. Rolling his plumbly in traffic distance. Good defense at the point of attack. There's a Khaled right there. Kyrie racing inside, spins it up short. But he got it off the loose ball. JR, boy, he could use one. And guess one. JR Smith <laughs> looks up <laughs> to the stars at the say, finally. Plumley missed it. He has a better position that time. Kyrie steps from the three. The bottom. Kyrie Irving. So he's got 22 now. 
82-69, Cavs back within 13. Gary Irving. Says up trade three for two all night long. And that's what Coach Coach Borland was talking about. You gotta make them feel you. Harry again, feeling it. Knocks it down! Cavaliers within 10. Irving with 27 now, eight in the quarter. Harry Irving doing his thing. Three missed it. You want him shooting jump shots. He's around the rim, he's deadly. Thompson. And at the top, but the soft touch against Plumlee. Coming down, Cavaliers in transition. Good finish by Double T. Barton looks at the clock, does the math. Says, I'll take it. Shorts. Here comes Carrier. Inside Barton. Got to the rim and finished it off. Yeah, when Kyrie's coming at you full speed, just like LeBron, there's not much you can do but wait for him to do what he needs to do. Final score here tonight, 126 to 113 as the Nuggets have seven players in double figures. We've uh, chronicled their nights all evening long. Final regular season meeting between these two ball clubs, Cavaliers and Hawks presented by AT&T. Last two springs, they've had playoff sweeps. Here today, trying to make it a split of the season series as the Hawks have won both at the queue. Cavs trying to do the same thing in their gym. Kevin Love against Howard. They're going to try to draw Howard out. Kyrie Irving for three. Cavs come right out. Nice move. They got the mismatch. They got the switch. Kyrie knocks it down. Shot clock continues to twirl. J.R. Smith elevates. And knocks it down for three. Cavaliers, two of two from deep. Come right out, moving the basketball and getting second chance opportunities. Kyrie flips it up. And in with a soft touch. LeBron and Kyrie. <laughs> that was a great give and go. Pass by LeBron and Kyrie with a good layup to the basket. Kevin Love, weak side pitch. For three, Cavaliers can't miss out there. And see, that is going to be key. Fry and, and Love have to hit that shot when, when Howard is guarding him because that discourages him from going outside. On the run, Kyrie knocks it down for three. Good pace for the Cavaliers. Coming out, Fred, running off of turnovers, running off of missed shots. That's a good sign for the Cavaliers early in the game. Kyrie launches. The bottom for three, so he's got 11 in the quarter. Three triples, 24-15. Elias Silva switches out of Kyrie. The fallback, and he got it to go. What a first quarter he's had with 13. Now goes to Calderon from the sky. He has with it. Kyrie continues to push. Kyle Corbin, the trailer. Three more! Cavaliers banging triples. They have seven in the quarter. Cavaliers come out ready to play, and you can see every one of them, every Cavalier on that floor has a focus that's really geared and locked in. Jenny Fry! That's how they roll again. Yep. Bullet feed to JR. Plenty of room, and he hit it for three. JR Smith waiting in the corner, deep in the corner that time. Run to a crowd. Oh, a drop off to Kyrie Irving. That's not Smooth. fair. Let me tell you what. <laughs> you have to know everybody on the floor and what yep. they're doing at all times to make a pass like that. Because it looked like he was going to go to the corner. Yep. The defense went to the corner, dropped pass to Kyrie for a layup. What he sees is just crazy. Inside, they let it go as Kyrie Irving scores. Schroeder thought he had drawn an offensive foul. He sure did, but he, he kind of flopped a little bit on that. But you can see he... He was not in position, and he kind of just fell. Right on cue, Kyrie, for three. Cavaliers do a good job of executing. A nice couple of back picks between Kyrie and Love, and finally get Kyrie open for three. Kyrie Irving for three. Again, well, you, Howard. Get, you got Howard away from the basket. He is not going to defend away from the basket. That's a known fact. Kyrie again. Like a layup. It's going to be spot shooting time. He's got 28. Because Howard did not come out again. He stayed back. Kyrie dotted the eye. LeBron, Wash Schroeder, and the miss. Kyrie on that uh, misfire. Stayed after. Look at Irving battle. Gets a floorboard, keeps it alive for Kevin Love. Oh, that's hustle to hustle. And a punching in the fist of Kyrie Irving because it netted two. Dunleavy. Lots of luck against Kyrie. A bump and a bucket. He put Dunleavy on rollerblades and then it went, work, went to work downstairs. Kyrie Irving with a strong dance to the hoop. Come on. Kept at bay by Delaney. Threw it away almost. Kyrie rescued it. And scored it with persistence. Boy, oh boy. We talk about coming to the rescue. That was a turnover waiting to happen, and Kyrie stepped in at the right time for the layup. Ball well, knocked away. Kyrie had to rescue it. In trouble in the corner. A jump ball! Oh my goodness! 111 109. Plenty of time for the Hawks here. Kyrie got up! Ball rescued by Millsap. Turns, fires, got it! At the horn! Unbelievable! We've got overtime! Kyrie. 
squeaks inside with the left hand and he finishes. Kyrie doing a good job of dancing to the hoop with the left hand. So give Kyrie 39 now. Single shot clock. Kyrie in a hard cut. Takes a big time bump. Boy, he went in there with some uh, guts, didn't he? So Kyrie splits the pair. 114, 111. I just never thought going in the fourth quarter with a 26 point lead, it would be like this. Here comes Irving now against Baseball, their best perimeter defender. Corver sends it. Off the wall and the money. Signature. Knockdown triple in the time of need. Cavaliers lead by one. Here comes Hardaway crossing over. Gives it up. Mascala hit it for three. Maybe one of the biggest buckets of his NBA life. Here comes Irving. Gets to the rim, they give it to him. I don't have to either try to make a steal or foul. Finalist three as it turns out. Off the board, unless they adjust the clock, I don't think they will. And the Cavaliers with back-to-back -back absolute gut, gut-wrenching losses to the Atlanta Hawks. With lots of whams of the right hand, Joe, presented by AT&T. As the Cavaliers come ready again to defend the land on the shores of Lake Erie, taking on Indiana in game two, the opening round of the Eastern Conference playoffs, right here, right now, on Fox Sports Ohio. Kyrie, tough angle, short off the glass, got it back off Thompson's hand. Kevin off the bottom for three. Cavaliers come right out. Kyrie attacking the basket, gets his own rebound, and Love is deep in the queue. The trailer is yours. Finally missed one from three-point line. 11-7, Cavs down four. Got to get number two goal. Send it. And leads it hits. Right on time, partner. Got to get number two going. And he's deep in the queue. George switches. Kyrie with the knockdown jumper. We're doing a good job of isolating that time. Irving sizes up T. He got the angle on him. Tough little shot as Young was converging. Boy, I don't know how he made that one because I thought Young was going to be there to defend the shot. Kyrie spin around him. And he went off a rubber rim. Kyrie's got 10. Nice little spin move in the middle. Soft touch for Kyrie. Knocks it down. 60 51. Uncle Drew goes to work. School of those young blokes. Kyrie with the dance to the hoop. Kyrie called for it against T. Gets to the glass. It starts with left hand. Kyrie Irving from the side to the hoop. Inside, two more for Kyrie. Kyrie with a long dance to the hoop. Kyrie Irving against T. Great space and hit a tough three. What concentration he showed there. My goodness, Kyrie Irving. Kyrie lost it. Final seconds, final shot, presumably, of this third quarter. Kyrie feeling it, sends it. Oh, it for Kyrie Irving. And a couple of words for Lance. Kyrie Irving back out there. He's been marvelous tonight with 26. 10 of 17 from the floor. Teague returns, so apparently the wrist is okay. It's just his ego taking battering right now by Kyrie Irving. Well, it's a shooting dollars for Kyrie Irving right now. Because he comes off that pick and they are backing up on him. And he just stops for the mid-range game. 104-91. Kyrie goes to the left hand. Why not? And living at its best. 106-91. Kyrie Irving to the hoop with the left hand. Now they force the switch. Irving. Oh, he's feeling it. Kyrie Irving again for three. Give him 33. Inside. They forgot about somebody. Kyrie Irving went through the back door. LeBron James up the floor, and the white flag will be raised. Yep, that's it. Cavaliers take a 2 nothing lead. A white and gold postseason winner. And in NBA history, when a team takes a 2-0 lead, they're successful 94% of the time. The Cleveland Cavaliers are looking for a bounce-back game from LeBron James, who comes off an uncharacteristic subpar performance on Sunday night while it was... Avery Bradley hit the game winner as the Celtics came back from a 21-point deficit sparked by Marcus Smart.
who had a career night, 27 points, including seven three-pointers with Marcus starting for the injured Isaiah Thomas. The Eastern Conference Finals are being presented by the Samsung Gear S3. It is on to game four here at the queue in Cleveland. The Cavs up two games to one with the Celtics in a stunner, turning it from that 44-point blowout loss in game number two. Here is Love with a deep three. He opened up in game three, hitting six threes and finished with seven for the night. Irving, it's down to two, down to one. And it's a 24-second, is it? Apparently a foul call. Bradley is off on that three. Here's the pitch out for Irving ahead of the field for the reverse as he is fouled. Mark, one of the things that Tyler stressed is that he was focused on game four with his team, not game three. He did, though, say that the problem in game three is we didn't play with the same pace offensively. And then on the defensive end, we were too far off their bodies. We didn't make it difficult enough physically. We weren't in attack mode. He said specifically, we're at our best when LeBron James is in attack mode as we see Kyrie Irving knock it down from the elbow. Tyler just echoed that thought in the huddle in the first quarter. He said we've got to be more physical, show toughness, and set the pace here, Marv. An 8-0 run from Boston. Irving oh. with a deep three. They needed that answer. And if I'm Olympic, that's exactly what I'll give up every single time. A tough reverse step back three. Good defense, just better. Oh. And here comes Irving. Olympic went flying. Irving to the rim. So Kyrie Irving looking to lead his team back. Bradley not able to hit it. Here's J.R. Smith who just Check back in. Irving over Bradley. He's feeling it. Hits the three. Kyrie Irving with 14 points. Shot clock to four. Here's Irving on the drive. It's been all Kyrie Irving for the Cavaliers. 13 points for Bradley. And Bradley called for the foul as uh, Irving got the shot off with time running down here in the first half. Irving, who has been the offense for Cleveland. Kyrie Irving led the Cavaliers back in the second quarter after the departure of James. He now has 20. He's 6 for 11 from the field. Olenek strip. James for Irving. Back to James. Smart play by Kyrie Irving. Understanding LeBron James with those four fouls really has not found a rhythm not in game three, and not really tonight. Here's the finish by James. That's a three-point attack by Crowder. Crowder was just tripped up, and he's, he's shaking up. Here's Irving. Crowder came up hotly. Maybe a wet spot on the floor over here, Marvin. Yeah. I think that's why Crowder went down almost in a split move. Kyrie Irving again. He has been the story offensively for the Cavs. 25 points for Irving. You see a beautiful move by Kyrie Irving. He now has 27 points. That's a 10 of Griselda. Picked off by James. On the hop for Irving, who scores. What a spectacular move. Meanwhile, Irving is down. Looked like his ankle. He came down on the foot as he was going up, and he's had foot problems before. Yeah, he missed the entire preseason a year ago, recovering from a fractured kneecap. But he's trying to walk it off. Oh, he's he, getting this crowd into it. He's hyped. He's in the zone. He needs adrenaline. He needs yeah. this crowd right now. It's about all, you're exactly right, Chris, that adrenaline. Irving, score off the lead from King. Here's Irving on the drive. He scores! And a foul! You said it, Reg. I mean, he reminds me of a guy I played with, Rod Strickland. You just looked at him and like, how did you finish this shot? Taking it up, moving so much, and getting the contact. So good a finisher. 33 points, 12 of 18 from the field. 26 have been scored in the last 16 minutes. And he's also scored 13 of the Cavs' last 15 points. Three-point play for Kyrie Irving at a six-point Cavalier lead. Irving played by Rozier. 
Irving on the drive. Man, stop it. Stop it, Kyrie. Are you kidding me? Apparently that ankle is just fine. Final seconds of the quarter. Irving checking the clock. Here's the step back three. Yes! A classic third quarter performance by Kyrie Irving. Kyrie Irving with 39 points. 9 for 10 from the field in the third quarter. His playoff career high is 41. That came against Golden State in game five on the finals of, of last season. And this is his high playoff game for this year. Smart on the foul, and Irving will shoot two. Standing ovation from this crowd. Oh, no. Irving going behind the back. <laughs> he has a career playoff high of 42 points. What a performance by Kyrie Irving, who twisted his ankle earlier. Wolford misses, and he can put one this this one in the books. Cavaliers bounce back from the shocking loss at home, blowing that 21-point lead as they take a three games to one edge. And the best of seven, it wasn't easy. Boston got off to the good start. LeBron James picked up four fouls in the first half. And now the Cavs look to close it out in Boston Thursday night. And here on TNT, the Celtics, of course, with other ideas, are they looking to extend to a game six back here in Cleveland? They just said it, a playoff career high for you. You were unstoppable in that third quarter. Where did the momentum shift and what allowed you to be so effective? Our why, the reason why we do it, and that's to get back to the finals. And we understand the goal at hand. We want to accomplish something bigger than ourselves. And it's going to take a full 48 minute game. Coming out of halftime, just wanted to be aggressive, leave my guys and leave it all out there on the floor. And it didn't come without adversity. You overcome a 16 point deficit. We see an ankle scare for you in the third. How are you feeling now? And what was the difference in those final minutes? I'm great. This is the only thing that matters right now. From moment to moment, I'm living in it. I'm dreaming of it and I, I can't wait. This is just such an unbelievable effort for my teammates, and we need to hit adversity in order to grow. You're now one win away from yet another trip to the NBA Finals. What becomes the message to this team as you head back to Boston? Goal at hand. That's it. Our why. Only, reason that, only thing that matters is getting a win up in Boston. Whatever we got to do, sacrifice everything in order to attain our goal, and that's to get back to the Finals. Congrats, Kyrie. Welcome to Cleveland, Ohio, home of the defending champion, Cleveland Cavaliers who find themselves in familiar territory down 0-2 to Golden State in an NBA Finals hoping the return home can turn this series around as Irving drives and gets the first bucket of the game now Thompson defending Kyrie Irving stays with him tough shot banks it home what a play from Irving Thompson was draped all over him Kyrie Irving shake and bake banks it home Irving spins, drives, layup, oh, sensational move from Kyrie Irving. Irving with five to shoot, poked away from behind, Irving gets it back, left-handed, banks it in, is offhand. Irving gets in the paint, drives, adjusts and banks it home. Corvers come back in, Irving spins, Irving drive, gets inside, throws it up, and banks it home! As the buzzer sounds, brilliance by Kyrie Irving. Kyrie Irving with an answer. Eight of 14 from the field. Irving slides inside and banks it home. Timeout, Golden State. 21 for Kyrie Irving, and it's a one-point game. Curry, two-point jumper. JaVale McGee has come on for Pachulia. Here comes James. Kyrie Irving picks it out. J.R. Smith, three-pointer. In and out and in again. J.R. Smith has found his jumper. He's got 12. Here's Kyrie Irving, flips it up off the glass and gets it to go. Found the perfect angle. It's just high percentage offense. Put the ball in Kyrie or LeBron's hands and let him play pick and roll and make plays. Irving fakes, spins, gets inside, falling away. 
back again. It falls in. Hanging on the rim. Kyrie Irving cuts, and James finds him. 27 now for Kyrie Irving. He's got 10 here in the third. Shot clock at six. Good ball denial from Livingston. Oh, what a pass, and another beauty, and James throws it down. Two terrific passes, and Cleveland goes up by three. Livingston back out, McCaw. The rookie on the drive, the floater is no good. James whips it out in the corner. Kyrie Irving cuts layup. It's good. Kyrie Irving does it again. Here comes Irving. Irving to the basket. Layup. Puts it in. A dazzling display from Kyrie Irving. And this is the largest lead of the finals for the Cavaliers. Irving finds James. James open for three. Got it. 35 for James. Irving finds a room. Nails it. 35 for Irving. Durant, quick catch and shoot. Not that time. Kevin Love with his 12th rebound. Love, by the way, has six steals in the game as well. Had a huge impact to Spike shooting poorly. Irving and one. Oh, Kyrie Irving putting on a show. Four fouls on Clay Thompson. Irving completes a three-point play. He's got 38 coming up on a minute remaining. Cavs have just one timeout left now. James with eight to shoot. James pulls back, drives again, kicks it out, Corver, corner three. Can't get it to fall, rebound Durant. Incredible opportunity. Durant for three. It's good, Kevin Durant from downtown, and Golden State takes the lead. And they should get a two for one here. Irving guarded by Clay Thompson. One on one. Irving pulls back, steps back, three-pointer, off the rim, won't go, rebound by Steph Curry. There's only about a second and a half difference between shot clock and game clock. You got to double and force him to get rid of the basketball and then foul. They got to foul Green. Durant has it. Corver all over him, and there's the foul. Kevin Durant, a great free throw shooter, and suddenly this building's stunned by a quick turn of events. Durant, 13 points in the quarter. Now 31 for the game. Nine straight points from Golden State. And with 12.9 remaining, they lead by three. Love to inbound. Finds James. James blocked by Iguodala. Ball loose. Touched out of bounds by James. And it's Golden State ball with 10.4 remaining. Smith poked away, picked up by Durant. Cotton back. Wild shot. And that will do it. With 1.5 remaining, all Golden State has to do is inbound. What a stunning turnaround in the final couple of minutes. Cleveland had a seven-point lead here in the fourth, but Golden State stays perfect. A crushing loss for the Cavs as the Warriors take a 3-0 lead in these finals. It's the Golden State Warriors and the Cleveland Cavaliers for the NBA championship. Back here at Quicken Loans Arena, where the Warriors clinched their title back in 2015, and now a different team with a special new player as Kevin Durant already with three 30-point games in these finals and a chance to do something no team has ever done in the 71-year history of the NBA. But in their path, LeBron James and the Cavaliers wanting to make sure there'll be no celebration on their home floor tonight. Golden State, meanwhile, has been superb in closeout games. Kyrie Irving knocks down a three, and it's six nothing in less than a minute. Kyrie Irving, two for two, coming off his 38 point game in game three. Kyrie Irving, one dribble, bank shots good. Livingston on Irving, puts up the three, shots good. Kyrie Irving from downtown. His second three pointer has not shot well from three point range in these finals, but he's got 11 points here on the first. Irving, a little shake and bake. Again, scoop layup off the glass. He is a master at that move. Irving for three. His third three-pointer of the first half. 
Irving finds James, wide open for three. That's good. They've had a lot of success with that play with Kyrie Irving and LeBron James coming off to their right hand, getting to the cup. That time, the right decision by Kyrie finding a wide open LeBron James. Irving stops on a dime and drills the jumper. Irving, three-pointer straight on is good. Kyrie Irving lighting it up from downtown. His fourth three-pointer, and he's got 21. Irving the drive, scoop layup on the other side. Right now, they have no answers to stop this team and to stop Kyrie Irving. 25 points in the first half with four minutes to go. Iguodala is on Kyrie Irving. Irving gets to the foul line. Back to James. Fakes a three. One dribble. Sets it up. Hits another. Twelve three-pointers in the first half for the Cavaliers. Kyrie Irving drives again. Scores again. And a foul. Another sensational move. And Irving has 27. Irving doesn't take a back seat to anyone at his position. You understand the history of the team that you're facing. The Warriors, outstanding third quarter team. They score back-to-back -back hoops. Let's talk about it in the timeout. They come out, Kyrie Irving steps into a rhythm three. And a well-timed timeout by T. Luke. Irving, contested jumper, knocks it down. 34 for Kyrie Irving. Irving drives on Thompson, left-handed, throws it up and gets the bounce. Well, celebrating starting here at Quick Malone's Arena. Irving for three. He's a scoring machine. Kyrie Irving, one on one, gets to his spot, elevates, and knocks it down. Then looks at Dwayne Wade and said, I told you so. Mama, there goes those men. And now the Cavs will dribble it out. Cleveland is still alive as Golden State's quest for playoff perfection comes to an end tonight. Well, I've got both LeBron James and Kyrie Irving. Kyrie, I'll start with you. Whether it was five, six, and seven in last year's finals or tonight, what is it about elimination games that brings out the best in you? I mean, it's do or die. We understand that. Um, you know, us leading the charge on both ends of the floor. Um, you know, you got to demand a lot out of yourself, and when you got a running partner like this, and as well as great veterans that we have in our locker room, it makes the job a lot easier. But obviously, the job is still far from over. I mean, we're still in the hole, and we still are in do and die every game that we play from now. But this is a good start. What was so different about this group's disposition tonight? Just the way we came out. Um, you know, obviously, we heard their comments saying that it would be satisfying to celebrate on our home floor. And honestly, we were ready to get on this 2 p.m. flight tomorrow back to San Fran and get ready to play for game five. Kyrie, thank you. Won an NBA championship in 1971 with a young center named Lou Alcindor, later known as Kareem Abdul-Jabbar, and the great Oscar Robertson. When the Bucks began, the roster included names like John McLaughlin, Flynn Robinson, and Wayne Embry. 50 years later, their roster now includes names like Antetokounmpo, Brogdon, and Middleton. Welcome to the NBA on TNT, presented by State Farm. The Boston Celtics with new starters and a bitter memory from a week ago. The Bucks are picking up where they left off in last season's playoff run. Here comes Irving around the Horford screen. Different lineups, the mid-range shot won't go. Horford tries to claim it and does. And Irving again. Kyrie Irving puts it down. He's averaging 20 points a game for Boston. Two straight losses to begin the season for Boston. Cleveland and against these Milwaukee Bucks. That drive by Irving inside with a foul as he was reaching in. The bump inside here. Middle oh, what a block shot there by Kyrie. Terrific block by Irving. Middleton will drive inside on Tatum. It's picked up. Irving with a three. Kyrie Irving puts up a triple. He's only shooting 32% from three-point territory. Nice ball rotation up to Kumbo. And Kyrie drives right by him with a beautiful spinning drive. Just beyond the seven-minute mark of the second quarter. Shot clock is down to three. Kyrie Irving doing it in on the defensive line. And it out to get three. Put that shot up and down. Oh, Kyrie masterful inside. Oh, I was getting ready to say great defense, which it was by Malcolm Brogdon. How did Kyrie get out of that double team? Pump fake by Kyrie and a Stop it. 
gets inside for oh. two, and he's got 13. He averages 20, and last year averaged 25 a game. More importantly, five of seven from the field. After the kill, has got seven, and now he's got nine with a difficult shot. And it's a one-point game. I mean, no one's going to block his shot, and he can get to his spots and fade away like he just did on that play right there. It's going to make it very difficult for teams to really guard or double team him as Kyrie knocks down another three. Kyrie Irving, the four-time All-Star, the former Rookie of the Year, and a first overall pick by Cleveland, who played uh, six years with the Cavaliers. <laughs> Horford with a three, and it's down the hatch for the Boston Celtics. are out there with Tice, who starts at the center tonight. Brown, who is 0 of 8 shooting. Well, I, I always thought that they were going to have issues scoring the basketball with Gordon for a while until that chemistry happened between Kyrie and Gordon. They say that the Lakers are a little bit longer, but man, this is a long team as well. Kyrie with a pretty shot with Delavidova defending. Yep, the second tallest team in the NBA is this Milwaukee team. Delavidova open three. Horford is there with the rebound. Now playing well with his 19 points and seven rebounds. Horford is averaging 13 a game. Oh, oh what a crossover by Irving. Another open triple. Got it! Al <laughs> Horford. Shooting practice from outside. Two consecutive three-point shots. Irving for Horford. And got What an assist. And Al Horford comes up big. Five and a half to go, and the shot clock is at six. Kyrie with the dance. Oh, and a spin. Finds himself in the double, out to Horford, one to fire, the three, good! Oh, they're money from outside in this second half. Eight of 13 in the second half, three-point shooting for the Celtics. Irving on top. He and out to the field goal. They've been paired against each other at great deal tonight. Shot clock is at four. Irving, the scoop, and the juice! How about the freeze move on Giannis up top to get that extra step? to get by the seven-footer. Irving's got 22 and a turnover by Milwaukee. Look at this move here, Kevin. The freeze move and just goes right by him. There was no way that Giannis was going to be able to catch up. What a beautiful move by Kyrie. Horford and Henson. Grinding, feeding, and Irving scoring inside. Give the assist to Al Horford. That is a terrific win for the Boston Celtics on the road against a team that beat them in game two of the season by eight on their home floor. And the Celtics return the favor tonight. Game four, the Heat's six-game homestand brings the Celtics to Miami. Boston now has Kyrie Irving and two of the best young players in the game. The Heat still without a sound white side and still searching for their defensive identity. Irving from downtown. That's why he's so hard to guard, Eric. He uses the screen so well, and if you push up on him, he's got those great ball handling skills to go around it. 11 threes this year for the seventh year man, Kyrie Irving, who's averaging 21 points a game for Boston. Irving looking long, has Al Horford. James Johnson's back. Horford with great patience to draw the foul on Adebayo, go to the line for a three-point play. Five on the shot clock, Irving back at the throttle. Nice back shot by Kyrie Irving. Switched hands in the air. Put up, put it up with the left hand. If he put it up with the right, Olenek would have blocked it. And he's been outscored now, 22 to eight in the quarter. Easy lay-in from Kyrie Irving, who now has seven points. After that timeout, Steve, Coach Stevens went to Marcus Smart as the point guard and used Kyrie Irving in the offense, and he wound up with the layup. Irving to Baines. That's good. Ten seconds left in the half. Johnson. And the rebound down to Smart, looking long for Irving. Touchdown. Yeah, J.J. had to make a decision there. Do I hold it out for the last shot? Will they take my man in? Well, it didn't work out. Kyrie Irving, 4 out of 13, makes a difficult runner. On two players, both guards, starting guards for the Heat. 11 for Kyrie. Good defense by Dragic. Got over the screen once, does it twice. Irving makes the shot anyway. Tough shot. 13 for Kyrie. Deion Waiters drives in. Ball knocked away from behind by Kyrie Irving. Irving off balance, but on target. He's got 15 points. Irving whips it back to Baines. 
That's great work by Kyrie Irving, rewarding the man whose effort gave Boston another chance. Irving hits the runner. That's a silencer. His first point of the fourth quarter. Irving. Pretty play by Kyrie Irving. He has Boston's last two scores. And when the game's on the line, you go to your best player. Gotta have a stop. If you want to get a win. Four on the shot clock. Irving for three. Oh my, the last seven points. Dragic for three, in and out. And that'll do it. The Celtics will win their fourth game in a row this season and their eighth in a row against Miami. Welcome you to Oklahoma City the night before Bedlam in many of these parts and a great early season matchup between the Thunder and the Celtics. Another sellout crowd arriving here at Chesapeake Energy Arena. We welcome you to NBA Friday presented by State Farm. Kyrie missing on the triple and now Russell Westbrook against Irving out on that right wing. Got the drop step on him into Baines. He got hit. Oh, Adams with the loose change in the jam. I tell you, I'm, I'm happy for Adams. Because we all know he's one of the real workers that you have in his slip. Lob to oh. Robinson. Well, that would have brought the house down if he finished The idea was great, but it was a little too high. Irving in transition. Bags a three. One of the, one of the first good opportune shots. Now right here, Boston comes out of the timeout for a Marcus Morris play right off the uh, draw board. Well, mainly because Anthony was looking to trap if... The ball went into the paint. Nice. You got to get it now. You got to get a layup here. Tyree, no look. Nice. Morris oh, on the oh, other oh. end. He Tumbled right. and looks all right. Tip. Boston comes away with it. Marcus Smart felt he was getting a little oh. too much body down there. Can Irving make it back there to back? He go. can for Boston. Very good. Now, what are they doing? They're doing a better job defensively. Holding Oklahoma to with the one shot, and they're scoring the majority of time. Baines contested shot, didn't touch the rim, and here comes OKC. Oh, you got to get back. Robertson finished the dunk on a two on three. Can't do that. You can't do that. You can't let that wing guy run by you. And that time, Irving finishing on a tough shot. Oh, they, he's needed that. He's needed that for his confidence to get him rolling. Al Horford on the isolation. Now the double comes. There it is. Extra pass. Irving saw Grant coming. There you go. He take the double, get re ball reversal, get it to the opposite side. That corner, nine out of ten times is open. Kyrie late shot nice. clock flips it in. How about that? Uh, if, you're, if you're a Boston fan, you're happy because he's moving now. He's made some key baskets in the third quarter and he, in this quarter. Al Horford from Irving, all net. Four on the clock, Horford for the lead. Nice. Bang! Nice. See, that time they did, they ran the pick and roll, the pick and pop. And when he came into the middle, Horford opens up right in that corner. Thunder down by one. Oh! oh. And one, and one. Chance at a four point play. They'll review it to see where his feet were right on that three point line. Kyrie Irving, Hubie, opened one for 11. He's made his last six field goals, just missed a huge free throw. Oh, make it seven straight. Oh, that's, that's good. Oklahoma City led 79 74 with 6.45 to play. Now, your best defender is on Irving, but there was, uh, there's the trap, a good rotation. Irving cut off by Adams, late uh, shot clock. Horford just got it oh! off, and he hits. Everything in green is coming up roses now. Let me tell you. Oh, look out. Irving oh, goes oh, to the left oh. hand to hit. How about the fade? You get down inside. The big man is going to block your shot. You fade, and you finish with your left hand. Two possession game and lead. Irving got the jump on Robertson. again. Thought about another three-point oh, attempt instead that? inside the line. Hits another perimeter, Jay. See, because of the penetration on the left side of the circle, getting into the paint, they continue to run and leave that corner open. And then the pass is right on the money. About well, 13 seconds difference here. I see he got, the, he got the, what he wanted here now. Irving on Adams. Somebody's going to have to double. Whoa, he got all the way to the oh, rim yeah. and scored uh, again. Uh, that's that's Irving at his best. Just don't foul now, Boston. Long three. Mello is halfway down. And a rebound for the Celtics with 7.2 seconds to go. An impressive 
second half and fourth quarter here in Oklahoma City. Well, just think of what Kyrie Irving has done here once he got rolling. Just look at this. Now, here he is. He gets down inside in between three guys. Once he had Adams, you know they were going to have to double team, but they didn't come in double team like they did in the first half. Paul George at the horn, no good. Second half comeback, and for the first time ever in NBA history, a team has won seven straight. There it is. After starting 0-2, led by Kyrie Irving, 25 points, 22 of which came in the second half, and Al Horford right there, 17 of his 20 coming in the second half as the Celtics go to 7-2. and two. Take a look at these lineups brought to you by your local Toyota dealer. Our old pal Al Horford with Jason Tatum, Aaron Baines, Jalen Brown, and the newcomer for us is Kyrie Irving. We'll talk more about his leaving Cleveland and joining Boston as the evening goes on. Dorian Prince, Luke Babbitt, Dwayne Dedman up front for the Hawks. Babbitt, terrific yesterday. Bays with that big game that Andre referenced, 14 points, 7 assists, 9 boards, and 2 blocks in Cleveland. And Dennis Schroeder spectacular with his 28 and a third quarter that he owned the Cavaliers. Kyrie plays it back. Al lines up the three ball and hits it. Al Horford, his 18th three-point of this season. That's third on the Celtics, but the percentage, 51-5 from outside the arc. Horford again. Bayes swipes at it. Al drives and puts it in. Oh, nice heads-up move by Al Horford. He was going to take the three, but defense closed on him. Nice drive to the basket. Kyrie moves in, oh, scores. Oh, man. I mean, he had no room on the baseline, finished him with the left hand off the glass. And when you go off the wrong foot, a lot of defenses don't expect that. Here yeah. is Kyrie for three. That's good. Irving leads the Celtics in three-pointers made. That's his 23rd. Kyrie. Well, you got to get to Kyrie. Kyrie is a flat-out scorer. And he can score anywhere inside of that half-court line. Kyrie. You think they're going to miss him in Cleveland, my uh, boy? Well, I think they're going to miss him just a tad. <laughs> free throws for Kyrie. Two free throws for Kyrie. And the Hawks lead by a deuce. Kyrie, what a move. Goes in and backs oh, it in. my goodness. Just incredible. Marco Bellinelli, the up fake. Fires a two. Got it. Good to get this big guy back on track. He was red hot to start the season. Then the three-game slump. Now he looks like he's back on the beam. Tonight. But you still got to know where Bellinelli is at all times because he can get hot at any time. Yes, indeed. And that's part of the adjustments that I'm talking about mentally that the Hawks have had to make because Boston is playing such a solid game on both ends. The defense is good. They were getting over top of screens. They had to adjust on the pick and roll, but the Hawks have really answered the, the good defensive play. Where the pick and roll has been so good for the Hawks. As Kyrie Irving knocked down that corner, Jay, he's an unstoppable guy. He's one of those guys that's unguardable. One-on-one, -on -one, he's as good as anybody in the league. Baines tees up Jalen Brown. And it's Dennis, but couldn't wrestle it away from Al. Kyrie will drive and drop it in. He is so good. He makes it look so easy going to the basket. Finishing with either hand around the basket is pretty amazing. Al moves in on Dedman. Needs help, finds it in Kyrie. A magnificent score. Jalen Brown poked away. Kyrie saves it. Smart has it and fires. Hits a three. My goodness. Well, that was an unbelievable save by Kyrie Irving. And a near steal by Taylor. From the corner, here's Smart. Back up to Kyrie. Moves in. Gets it up to Tatum, and he hits a three in the corner. Timeout Atlanta. Well, Bob, thanks a lot. When we think about what we've seen from Dennis Schroeder all the last 48 hours, you would think that his confidence was already at an unbelievable level, but he said to get up to play against a guy like Kyrie, it gets me fired up even more, and I have to be even better than I was up there in Cleveland. And I found that very interesting because in Cleveland, as we saw, he's about as good as you can be. Now Horford with an emphatic game. Pushes his point total to 15. And the Celtics lead by three. Strong move by Al Horford. Finishing at the rim with authority. Kyrie, shooting roll, three-pointer. Third three for Irving. 23 points. Celtics' biggest lead at six. Kyrie splits the defenders. 
And a beautiful assist to set up Jason Tatum. Well, Kyrie, you can't keep him in that pick, pick and roll, trap. And the thing is, when you trap him, you got to trap hard so he can't split it. Kyrie Irving, bump, bank, hits. And that's why you wonder why Kyrie Irving doesn't have the ball in his hand. Kyrie with a pull up, money. 27 for Kyrie Irving, 97 96. Horford underneath the Kyrie for a lay in. Boston by one. Kyrie with 29. Two seconds, one Irving. Three pointer. He's got 32 in the Celtics. Go up 104 to 103. What a wonderful score. Unbelievable. Shot clock at five. Kyrie into the paint. Floater. Man, oh man. Man, oh man. You know what's coming and you can't stop it. No, you can't. He's, he's a great one-on-one. -on -one. Probably one in the top two or three in this league. Four seconds. Back to Smart. And that's a ball game. Celtics behind Kyrie Irving. Win it in Atlanta. Al Horford congratulates. Some of his former teammates, there aren't many left. Uh, <laughs> many. They all, all of them gone. Says hi to the coaching staff and Kyrie and Bay's embrace. We welcome you to Phillips Arena in downtown Atlanta. Will this be the venue where the Boston Celtics 14 game winning streak comes to an end? That's what these Hawks fans have in mind as we get set for Hawks basketball on Fox Sports Southeast tonight as Atlanta gets ready to hit the Phillips Arena hardwood, taking on the Boston Celtics. Kyrie Irving, nothing but net. He has been simply amazing. His teammate, Aaron Baines, hit him in the face and broke a bone. That's why Kyrie's wearing the mask. Now he got rid of it in the second quarter as Dennis floats one home. He got rid of that mask in the second quarter against Golden State on Thursday night, but obviously has it back tonight. Gets inside, and it's rejected by Dedman, but a goaltend as that ball hit the glass When first. Kyrie Irving with that tricky dribble, hesitation move to free himself up, and when he gets in the lane, he can finish so many different ways. And look at Kyrie Irving. Stretch across to block that shot. Kyrie with a spin move and lay in. Oh, that's a beautiful turn and finish at the rim with the left. Kyrie, again, so many ways he can score. Delaney. Hawks are now 5 of 11 on threes. And a long bomb is good. Kyrie Irving. Yeah, Delaney got a busted lip. Isaiah Taylor took one in the eye. There's a three for Jalen three. Brown. He's got ten. That's his second three-pointer of this game. With a 50-44 count. Well, the main thing, he's doing a nice job of shooting the long ball, but he can't make free throws. Kyrie runs it down in the corner. Clock under ten now for Boston. Irving flips it to Al Horford. Jumper is good. That's a three for Al Horford. Just his second basket of this game and first three-pointer. That's the ninth Boston three. They had 14 here two weeks ago. Kyrie dials in the three-pointer. It's his third tonight, and he's got 14. Here's Kyrie. Moves in and scores. 16 points for Irving in a one-point game. Kyrie, magician with that basketball. Brown from the corner. Torian Prince taken away by Tatum. Al's got the loose ball. Now to Kyrie. Halfway through the third quarter. Brown sets his feet. And Boston takes a three-point lead. Celtics by one. Marcus Morris rises up on loop. Misses. Back tap. It's going to be saved by Horford. What a save there by Morris. Bounce pass to Kyrie. 18 points for Irving. 70 to 67. Luke in the corner. Uh, Horford Luke the rebound. Gone. He's gone cold. Kyrie gets it to the middle. Kyrie will drive it. Grab of the jersey. We haven't seen Tatum. He's played well in that third quarter. Horford switches everywhere. Kyrie being guarded by Detman. And that's kind of drops in. That's Kyrie Irving work. now with 23 points. You can't switch a big on Irving. It's just not going to work. Plays to Kyrie. Seven on the shot clock. Oh, Bay 
Dennis in his shirt. And he hit it. There's no defense for that kind of play. Horford giving it right back to him. Eight, seven. The fake and fire. Now that's three shots. Oh, they may call two. Jason Tatum, third quarter explosion. Marcus Morris in the second. Kyrie flips it in. <laughs> He's got 30. 110 99. What a player he is. Celtics will dribble, uh, the uh, Hawks rather, will dribble out the final seconds. And the Boston Celtics run their winning streak to 15 in a row. Brad Stevens goes to 2 0 against Coach Bud and the Hawks in this building this year. Boston now 15 and 2 overall and 8 and 1 on the road. Dallas, Texas is the latest stop for the Celtics on this three game road trip as they put the NBA's longest win streak on the line. Coach Brad Stevens has the guys ready to go. A couple more games before they get home for Thanksgiving. Jason Tatum and company looking to extend the streak against Dirk Nowitzki next. Kyrie gets in the paint. Little floater for two. Matthews misses the three. That was very all-star game like. That was. That was. <laughs> Speaking of all-star game like, there's two more for Kyrie. Kyrie's in such good control when he's going full speed to the basket, changing up his pace for that layup. Kyrie knocks it down and will get to the line. Rick Carlisle claiming Kyrie shot his right leg out. Kyrie, a deep three. What, what a read by Kyrie, going to the flare and then pulling up from about 27 feet out. Hasn't missed. He's got 10 points on four or four shooting. Smith with three on the clock, hangs in the air. Everything but the shot. Kyrie. Jalen, corner for three. Hard push by Kyrie. And nice job by Jalen Brown getting all the way flat to the corner. That's the shot you're going to get if people take away and focus in on Kyrie Irving. Perea gets picked off, and Kyrie drills the jump shot. Man. Forget about the best backcourt in the East. Yes, I know. I'm thinking the same thing. Kyrie. Hesitation. Throws it out for Smart. Gets it back in the corner. Takes it. Makes it. <laughs> what? What was the problem with the offense? 27th in, uh, in offensive rating? Where'd that go? Kyrie in the paint. Yeah, design play to get the ball moving side to side and get Kyrie on the run, getting to his right hand. He's so good at that floating shot. Seven for seven in the half. Al will take it, make it. Yeah, Al just pretty much teed that one up. Yeah. Misery's not going to come all the way out. He knows Al can drive the close out. That's his first field goal attempt. Irving. <laughs> eight for eight now in the game. Incredible. 22 first half points. Back down by Horford. Kyrie, pull up three. Oh, my goodness. 53-47, <laughs> 25 for Kyrie on nine for nine shooting. Marcus, nice pass. Smart play by Kyrie. You know, da Dallas has been setting up in that 2-3 zone. On the dribble penetration, Kyrie didn't space. He cut, got an easy backdoor layup. Kyrie loops it inside to Brown. Gets an easy two. Good recognition by Kyrie with the mismatch. Jalen Brown sealing J.J. Barea for the easy deuce. Kyrie hangs in the air. Doesn't get the bucket, does get the foul. Man, Kyrie did a really good job of using his body against the smaller Farrell. Barnes spins, leans, can't bank it home. Loose ball. Kyrie's got it. Gets it ahead. Jason to the basket for two. 89-84, five-point game, quick timeout taken by Dallas. Barnes, Celtics need to stop here. Barnes, step back, short. Kyrie, Tatum running the floor, makes the catch. And the save, smart with the hustle play. Saves it again. Kyrie, for three. Who else to make those plays besides Marcus Smart? Coming up with the two. Big, loose balls, kicks it out to Kyrie for the top of the key three. 92-89. Matthews can't get the shot off.
Kyrie with the miss. Irving the other way, keeps going with the dribble, keeps it alive, spins back, banks it home. 92-91, timeout, Dallas. Dirk spins in the lane, lost the ball, out of the pack comes Kyrie. Boston's got numbers on the break, throwing it up, Tatum. Tie game. Six on the clock, Barnes. Barnes, step away. No, rebound, timeout, four tenths of a second. Thrown up towards the basket. The tip does not go. We're going to overtime. Kyrie. Off the dribble. Through a crowd to the basket. Once again, pushing that ball through. Two defenders getting himself right to the rim. Kyrie. Little stop and go move again. Tie game at 100. Hesitation dribble. Goes wrong foot. Right hand layup. Kisses it off the glass. 41 and counting for Kyrie. Irving again. Pull up jumper. Nails it. Davitsky. Nope. Rebound to Smart. Celtics for the first time in the overtime here. Chance to take the lead. Brown. Step back. Got it. Timeout Dallas. 139 on the clock. Perea. Crossover move. Oh, it was tipped by Kyrie. Picked off by Brown. Correa wants to foul on that play. Kyrie spins. Takes it in the paint. Backing his way down. Off the finger roll. Kyrie Irving showing why it's his world. Look at the back down. Taking his time. Spins. There goes Matthews. Doesn't matter. Right hand on the left side. Kisses it high. Off the glass. Going to the line to make it a three-point play. That man right there. I mean, came to the rescue late in the game on the offensive end. When nothing was going well for the Celtics offensively, Kyrie made play after play after play. 16 of 22. 5 of 7 shooting threes. I think the most impressive thing is he gives what the game needs. Doesn't go out there and try to get his. It is, I need to do, I need these buckets to win the game. 9 of 10 now at the free throw line. Still another game, Scal, that looked lost. Yeah, I, I, it was tough today. For two and a half quarters, they did not play well. Matthews misses a three. Rebound to Brown. That's going to do it. And the Celtics extend their winning streak in overtime. The streak is now at 16. Boston is 16-2 and two on the season. Fourth longest winning streak in franchise history. They head to Miami. The streak is over. Kyrie Irving and company ready to start another one here tonight as the Celtics have six of the next seven at home. Jason Tatum continues to shine. Can Marcus lead the bench? We'll find out next against the Magic. Kyrie for three. Nope, a deep two, they call it. Check that. Fournier. Nope. Both it the other way. Celtics trying to extend a one-point lead here early. And they do. Well, hits a pass. Alertness. I love it. Morris. For three. Uh, he's going to be the unknown quantity people's minds, but he could be a very, very important player. Back to Kyrie. Nice move along the baseline. He'll get to the line for two. Hey, that's the type of shot that just defies imagination. Right. Kyrie, back to Horford. Gets it back, gets the dribble back. That Vucevic in a switch. Goes by him to two. Yeah, and Gordon was... Uh, Gordon was reluctant to cut that off. Kyrie is fouled by Vucevic. Yep. Sounds have Kyrie, Tatum, Morris, Rozier, and Al Hofford on the court. Tell you, the Celtic bench in this half. Whoa! Poignant just stopped. Whoa. Celtics now with 19 assists in the game on 24 hoops. Come up with a loose ball. That's a tally point for Brown. Rozier again. Well, they had their turkey. Yet.
yesterday. And no question about it. And Cranberry sauce to boot. Kyrie to the basket. I mean, he had Peyton wondering which direction he was going in. Kyrie all the way. Yes. That'll teach you. Press me in the backcourt. You're going to pay. 72 points for Boston here in the first half. On 58% shooting, better than 50% on threes. Makes his free throw. Kyrie. Watch out, he's coming. 22 now in the game. Kyrie just keeps that dribble on. Starts going back in that direction again. I mean, I that's like the, the cobra and the, what do you call him? The Hindu guy, yeah. the, the flute. <laughs> He's got all the answers. Well, Augustine's not going to bother him, so I mean, uh, bigger guys don't uh, bother him when he's taking the jumpers. Kyrie. And he's going to get three at the line. He's 10 to 10 at the free throw line, and that'll be the ball game. So the Celtics entertain this post-Thanksgiving crowd. Frank Vogel and Coach Stevens meet at half court. They're good friends. Now hopefully with much to smile about. And the Celtics have a solid win here at home against the Magic. Some of the NBA's best young talent on display here tonight at the TD Garden. That's Ben Simmons. He is the real deal. We know about Jason Tatum and Jalen Brown. Should be a good battle here tonight. The Celtics try to make it seven straight wins over Philly. Next. Celtics look like they're trying to pick on Redick a little bit here. They clear it out for Tatum on the baseline. Down to seven on the shot clock. Loses the handle momentarily. Now Kyrie will have to make something out of this. How about the layup? Well, when a big guy switches out on him, it's sayonara. Saric pulls up for a three and drains it. Well, Saric could hit that shot. Redick, Covington, Kyrie, pull up three. Well, I'll tell you, he had Covington leading almost to Cambridge. Inside Horford for two. Well, that's a heads-up play by Kyrie. Got in the paint and had that entire defense scrambling. Kyrie, pull up. Yes, and a foul. Well, Horford continues to send some devastating picks. And Kyrie, with his great dribbling ability, gets him wide open off that pick. Kyrie for two. I got to tell you, they're letting him play. <laughs> a lot of banging going on there on the drives. Kyrie. Shot clock to clear aside for Kyrie. He takes the jumper and drains it. <laughs> oh, um, oh, that was a oh, um, shot. Irving. Floater. Count it. And a foul. He finds a way where there doesn't appear to be a way. Another rebound to Horford. Kyrie pull up three. Got it. Boy, when you let him get to the line and you're down, anticipating he's going to make a move to the basket, you are done. Kyrie to the basket. Oh. They had a big man on him trying to really take away the dribble and the uh, layup type of shot. Didn't work. Kyrie. Oh, nice pass. Sharich for three. Mario Sarich for three. Offered along the baseline. Kyrie, good look. Got it. Good swing of the ball, and they left the big score a wide open. 27 now for Kyrie in the game. Morris looking for Kyrie. Little handoff. He comes up shoot. Just drains the three right off the bench. Comes off the bench. Right ready to fire away. He's got 30. Boston's up 11. Kyrie goes the other way, kicks it back out. Horford for three. That was a tantalizing possession. 
as Kyrie read that they're going to stop me if they can. But guess what? They couldn't. Kyrie. He's going to get to the free throw line. He finds an angle, even one that doesn't appear to be one. That came from beyond the backboard. The other thing that I notice watching him that I've never seen other players do, when he first comes out to warm up, he gets about 10 feet from the basket on either side of the lane and puts balls off the backboard with either hand. And he does that for about 10 minutes. And yeah. all around so that he has perfected Kissing the ball off the glass and all these driving moves. Kyrie appeared to lose it and got it back. And Whoa! Hit a floater. Whoa! He let it go and then sidestepped it. Tatum for three. Frosting on a cake. Celtics take the turnover. Philly will inbound and that'll do it. Kyrie Irving has put up some monster numbers during this homestand. He'll need all of them, and the Celtics will tonight because the Bucks have gone from good to very good with Eric Bledsoe now at the point, and of course the Greek Freak. Should be fun. Celtics and Bucks. Uh, next. Kyrie in the paint. Kyrie. Two. Little uh, reverse. Nice pass from Hawford. Giannis, a little fall away in the lane. Rebound to Bain. Yeah, they took away the basket. That's what they want to do is... Don't let him get to the rim. Like that. Kyrie's two for two. Irving again kicks it back out. Hold for plenty of time. I tell you, Irving, uh, they're prepared to double him every time he puts the ball on the floor. And Irving is going to become the prime ball handler and passer, assist guy. Nice pass. Left. so in the dust on the back door cut. He did. Six on the shot clock. Kyrie with his own tip. That's the way to hang in there. Are you kidding me? Kyrie. He would have to have been a magician to find a way to get that ball up on the rim. Kyrie back to Horford. Deflected by Giannis, but picked off by Morris. Gets it to the corner. Kyrie for three. Nice play by Morris. Celtics at 9 of 16. Shoot threes. 56%. 61% overall. Giannis kicks it back out. Middleton. Kyrie wins the race for the ball. Throws it off the glass. Jacumpo into the paint. Back rims to jump. Horford comes away with it. Did you see him hook the man with his elbow? Celtics have a 27 to 15 rebound advantage in this game. As Kyrie drills the jumper. Well, he works his way free. Gets a shooting hand. A clean look. I mean, they're jamming him on every possession practically. Kyrie to the basket. Before anybody got back to really stop the penetration. Irving with 17 on the night, 7 of 12 from the field. MVP chance begin. Celtics are 10 of 12 at the free throw line. Shooting 57% overall for the game. Kyrie. That was nicely done by both Tatum and Horford. It's called Kyrie. Go to the basket. <laughs> 169. He just put up uh, 11 fingers. Kyrie, yes, and a foul. Kyrie hangs. Are you two. kidding me? How about the foul there? Irving. Step back three. Got it. Oh! Takes the mask off. He was ready to say, I'm done. Uh, I'm done. Kyrie Irving putting up some monster numbers during this homestand, averaging 29 a game. Looks like he brought lunch, too, for everybody there. <laughs> Al Horford getting ready in the locker room, coming off a great game. And speaking of great games, how many has this guy had in his Hall of Fame career? Celts and Mavs are next. Kyrie. 
the two off the glass. Yeah, those little ten footers softly off the glass becoming a staple of his game. Yeah, little hand off to Kyrie. Top of the key. Bam. Sounds with the first lead at 7-6. Kyrie. Boy, they anticipate him going to the middle, and he faked him that way and got some distance for the shot. Checks the clock, eight. Keeps going, takes the jumper, gets the roll. Yeah, and that's a little experience working on Yogi. Kyrie and Tatum. Oh, what a move. What a move. Yeah, I don't know what Smith was thinking, but Smith right now is not going to make the all-defensive team. Now we'll take it. Really good defense. Oh, God. Nice play by Smart, who's getting fouled by Cleaver at the time. Kyrie to the basket. Kyrie kicks it to the corner. Corfoot knocks down a three. Kyrie, the two. that more difficult than it needed to be. Kyrie spins it. Oh. oh, wow, what a shot that was. Kyrie. Yes, and foul. I tell you, this guy is the goods, baby. Pete Chant, as always, in the end of games, goes up for Kyrie. He's got 20 tonight, 9 of 16, averaging 29 during his homestand. Three possession game. Kyrie trying to get free. Does. Gets Harrison a switch. Wants to take him off the dribble. Knocked away. Comes back up with it. And banked it home. I can tell you, all loads. Ten-minute drills, before, you know, around the basket. Yeah. That was where it paid off. Dirk again is going to take it. Unable to hit down the stretch. Kyrie in the right spot. Gets it ahead. Rozier for two. And Terry will get to the line. And this is hustle play. What a pass, too. That. Yep, that's a power move, and there's Dirk flailing at him. And again, Celtics doing what they have to do at home, winning games, getting a little practice time. Mark Cuban is leaving the arena. From the Alamo City, San Antonio, Texas, home of the five-time NBA champs. But tonight, the top team in the NBA comes to town, the Boston Celtics. With a 22-4 record, taking on the five-time champs, the San Antonio Spurs, Kyrie Irving, ready to spin tonight on a roll all season long. Brown, wearing those goggles, kicks it out to Irving, who's wearing a mask. And the Phantom of the Parquet, as they call him back in Boston, with the game's first bucket. Irving off the screen from Baines, and it's a 9-0 game for Boston. Pump fake on the three, got a better look. And a rare miss by Tatum. Back out to Irving, who steps into the three and drills it. Horford with a beautiful offensive rebound and then the touch pass as Irving hits another three. Kyrie Irving, stare down three. Nothing but net. Patty Mills trying to stick Irving here. 
Kyrie is in his bag, folks. He's in his bag. 17 points in the first quarter for the guy with the mask. Aldridge crept in the line for another possession and turned over. This will be room service for Irving. 19 points for him and his first bucket of the second quarter. Kyrie Irving and one almost. That one just coming out. Parker with the screen from Aldridge. And Tony Parker knocks down the pull-up. We talked about Tony Parker wanting to play another three years. He also has aspirations as Irving hits the jump shot. Parker has aspirations of being a NBA general manager, Jeff. Brown steps into the long ball, rims out. Irving says, look what I found. And Kyrie Irving now with 23 and 25 in the game. Kyrie lets it fly and drills the three. So is that. That's rare, too. That's just such incredible individual skill. Irving with the hesitation. Put it on a platter and one. Look at this finish. Picks it up off the dribble. Scoops it high off the glass. And takes the bump. Uh, Rick Carlisle recently said of Kyrie Irving said, He's the best ball handler I've ever seen, and I've played with Nate Archibald and some guys. And pretty high praise. Bryn Forbes on Irving, who calls for the Morris screen. Hesitates and finishes again. 33 for the guy with the mask. Approaching clutch time with five minutes to go. Gay losing the handle. Great hustle by Brown. Kept it alive. And the Celtics control. Irving kicks it out to Brown for three. A much improved three-point shooter. Brown this year. Shooting 40% from downtown. And it's a one-point game. Jason Tatum as far as again. At leading to winning. He doesn't have to take a back seat. He's got 20 points tonight. He's been a reliable fourth quarter sidekick for Irving, who takes out his do it yourself kid and does it himself. 10 on the shot clock for Ginobili. Aldridge with the screen. He resets it. Ginobili for the lead. Yes! Manu! Here we go, five seconds to go. Tatum gets it in. A look for Kyrie Irving. Rims out. Halfway down and out. And the Spurs escape. Well, the Celtics hope to be hot, as a matter of fact, after a cold night in Chicago. But they got Kyrie back. They take on the Nuggets next. Chandler will come out and defend. Tatum rolling to Rupi. Baines for a quick two off the feed from Irving. Yeah. Smart finds Kyrie. Kyrie to the basket. Well, he left Murray in the dust. Look at Denver playing six games in six nights. He, not even as crazy as the NBA schedule can be. Not even. The Nuggets have six games in six nights as Kyrie knocks down a three. But it is the sixth game of a six game road trip for them. Baines going to the basket for two. Pick and roll. They have nobody got the rim. Brown to the basket. And Mike Malone's going to call a timeout at the other end. Boston taking their first lead of the game. Kyrie rounds home with three. That's what the Celtics didn't have the other night in Chicago. Celtics play here on Friday, Memphis on Saturday, Indianapolis on Monday, as Baines gets to Baines. 13 now. For well, Baines has taken over where Hoffman has been playing. Irving takes it. Makes it. Boy, the man was down, put his hand down, and that opened up the window for the shot. Kyrie for two. Somehow he recovered that. It dribbled off his sneaker and he went down and got it. Kyrie. 
Baines will hand off, gets it to Kyrie, gets the open jumper, and knocks it down. It's that easy for him. But they just moved the ball, moved themselves. Kyrie got Murray on him this time, blows by him. Takes a little fall away baseline and rattles it home. That's just silly. I mean, it's like, it's like a varsity player playing with the JV. Irving for two. And Murray took one in the chops. Murray with four. Murray got it back. No. 24 second violation. Well, that's great defense that time. Irving on the cut for two. Uh, good heads up play by Irving and Marcus. Kyrie. Denver has 19 offensive rebounds in the game. Plumlee. Saved by Shane. Kyrie. I sit here and watch it. I don't know how he does it. I don't know how the shot doesn't get thrown back at him. It never does. Kyrie. Baines. And a foul. Uh, saying he's okay. Celtics. 124-118 win. Gary Harris, a heck of a night. 36 points on 16 of 25 shooting. Indianapolis, Indiana, the scene for the Celtics tonight as they play their third game in four nights, trying to make it two straight on the road, but two-time conference player of the week, Victor Oladipo, standing in the way. Kyrie is ready. All of Australia is ready. Celtics and Pacers are next. Orford. Again, the playmaker. Kyrie comes up shooting. Both of the assist. Kyrie with a quick look at Baines and still just elevates right over Collison, knocks down the two. As Kyrie takes a long three and gets a four point play opportunity. Seven straight shots hit by the Celtics. Baines is open. Wow. It's a shooting play. At that time, Kyrie draw two. Just gave, got rid of the ball up and over the defense. Baines steps right into it. Bogdanovich. Wrong with the three. Irving. He's going to take it. This is something. Yeah, it's a clinic right now. Yeah. Smart. Looking for a cutter. Finds Kyrie. Kicks it to the corner. Ojale for three. I think Kyrie was underneath the basket when he finally got that catch. And Ojale, right off the jump, knocks down the big corner three. Smart again. Trying to spin away from Stevenson. Gets it back, top of the key. He's going to take it. Make it. Smart likes his gym as well. Kyrie. Pull up. Two. Four for five shooting for Kyrie. He's got nine. Kyrie, 12 in the shot clock. Pull up, Kyrie. Nailed it. Ooh. Kyrie can do some special things with the basketball. Yeah, Oladipo, what was he scout? Second or third pick of the draft? Second. Yeah. And he was good in Orlando. They just gave up on him way too early. Smart knocks down a three. Kyrie with a fake. And two. Yeah, Pacers bailed out of that coverage, and Kyrie just so smooth at getting the ball to the basket makes him pay. The two. Like that ball goes inside. One foot outside the paint. You have Jalen Brown in the post. Little split game action. Kyrie with the easy jumper. Kyrie rises up and drains the three. And that's what Kyrie wants to do. Get a little bit of space. Get some cushion. Rise up. Stick it right in your face. Back to Horford. On a cut. Kyrie. Difficult shot. And it goes and it gets to the line. Show off the touch, Kyrie. Kyrie. Dips the shoulder. Gets the roll. Wow. Soft touch by Kyrie. Attacking Sabonis. No space for him to shoot. So he makes space. Get it to Kyrie. Sabonis has him in a switch. Kyrie shoots over. Knocks down a three. Quickly the ball is into Smart. Smart. Head of steam. Takes it to the basket. Floater. Goes. 
Boston quickly to the defensive end, and Nate McMillan quickly to the timeout. Two possession game. Smart. They get it to Kyrie. He comes up shooting. Knocks it down. Wow. Wow. That's such a big shot. Bogdanovich looking. Able to get it into Joseph. Back to Bogdanovich. Uh oh. Stolen by Rozier. He's got time. He's got a bucket. 1.6 on the clock. Celtics with a one point lead. Bogdanovich looking, looking. Gets it in. Half court shot. Ooh, hit the rim. And Boston escapes. 112 to 111. Doubleheader on a 38-degree mild evening. We are at Madison Square Garden in New York. Merry Christmas, happy Hanukkah, and happy holiday. The expected sellout crowd ahead of the 19,000 still making their way in. The NBA on TNT is being presented by State Farm. It's the Boston Celtics facing the New York Knicks as we take a look at the Eastern Conference race. Boston is on top, record of 26 and 8. The Knicks vying for a playoff spot, and they are 16 and 14, and they have Detroit at Detroit coming up tomorrow night. That last foul was called on uh, Lance Thomas. Interesting. Uh, Porzingis says the best Nick team he's played on. We take a look at the last two. It was <laughs> knocked out of a three. Horford, guarded by Porzingis. Beautiful pass to the cutting Irving. You can run your entire offense through El Horford in that low post. He's a great passer. Leads all centers and assists, but forwards and centers and assists, power forward that is. And just does a great job of finding the open man. Not clocked out of one. And Irving able to fill it. That's his specialty, late in the clock. Kyrie Irving takes his time and gets the shot he wants. A little fadeaway over there on the right baseline. Bailed out the Celtics after, again, the Knicks played very good defense. Here is Cantor. Final minute of the play in the first. Irving working hard for this one. <laughs> Kyrie Irving has nine points. Here's another guy who played much. Ron Baker, who was inactive for 18 straight games, and he has worked his way back into the lineup. Played well last season as a rookie out of Wichita State. Kyrie Irving. Irving looking to put a move on Jack. Irving for three. Yes. Kyrie Irving from downtown, and it's a two-point net lead. Irving, nice handoff. Tice, who suffered a broken nose a couple of games back and playing with that protective mask. Did he borrow Kyrie Irving's mask? <laughs> Kyrie Irving now with 17 points. I spoke with Celtics head coach Brad Stevens. The Celtics haven't been shooting well, but he's patient with his team. He said actually in that second quarter they settled down a bit. And Kevin, you talked about the purpose in the Celtics offense. Actually, Brad is pretty comfortable with it in the second quarter and going into the second half. He said we had more purpose, more movement. We got good looks. We just missed it. And it's a simple game. Sometimes you miss. So he said the effort is there. Yes, as we see once again, beautiful fast break. Irving finding Hawford. Boston with their first lead of the game. They extend it to three. Nice pass on the Hoffman Cannon with the finish. Yeah, Tatum is playing through that dislocated finger. Actually a pinky. And uh, just has not been able to get going. Oh, Irving ooh, on fire. Kyrie Irving with his third consecutive three. 23 points, five three-pointers in all. Here's Tice. Well, he's has found some confidence. Yeah. Daniel Tice, 25-year-old rookie. That's a three-pointer by Abdel Nader. Irving from straight away. Kyrie Irving. Get ready to watch a lot of Kyrie Irving here going in this last 4:30 because. When they get down, Kyrie takes it over, and he's a, when he gets on fire, he is something to watch with that ball in his hand. Here is Irving with a runner, goes glass. Here's Beasley. Good play by Irving, got a piece of it from behind, and Marcus Smart. 
Gives it up to uh, Kyrie. Irving down the lane. Kicks it out. Horford. Back the other way. Irving for three. Yes. Kyrie Irving with 30. Irving to the basket and draws the foul. It's on McDermott. So the Knicks able to turn it from the blowout loss at Charlotte. They go to 17 and 14. Tied with Detroit and Washington for the number six spot. And the Knicks play the Pistons at Detroit tomorrow night. Knicks have had big problems on the road, losing 9 of 11, but different story at home where they are now 15 and 5, while the Celtics coming off the home loss last night to Miami have dropped two in a row. They go to 26 and 9. They are still on top in the Eastern Conference. Tonight in Boston, the Bulls try to start a new winning streak. They face the Celtics, a team they dispatched at the United Center two weeks ago. It's the Bulls and the Boston Celtics. Holiday off that high screen by Lopez. Back to Robin. That's taken away. Kyrie Irving on the drive. Left hand lay. That's good. And you can see Dunn kind of back away and I think that's a smart play. He knew Irving had a Kyrie Irving loose. And then the feed to Baines and he goes up and down. That's where he hurts you. Is he's able. He's got some of the sickest handles in the NBA, yes, he and he does. gets it. He gets it to the basket with those handles. Irving down the lane, runs it up and scores. And that hesitation, and it, it's going to take a team to slow him down. It's just not Chris Dunn. The Bulls, despite not shooting well in the early going, have the lead. Irving fires and scores. That they would typically, that is, he hit a little pull arc in it. They switch onto him. This is the jumper and the ball loose and picked up by Tatum. Looked ahead to Brown. Brown back inside and whipped out to Kyrie Irving and he scores. Oh, you didn't miss too many wide open jumpers like that. And a timeout, Fred Hoiberg. So the Bulls want to talk it over. Morford to Kyrie. Firing that score. Gotta get that back, back to back. Ties the game at 49. Horford knocked down and the layup good. I'd say Curry loves to get contact as he goes to the basket. He's constantly putting his shoulder into you to draw contact. Kyrie back outside. Brown fires. Nothing but that. He's trying to hit some threes down. He'll mark it. A bully drive and missed it. Contact tapped out of there. And Kyrie, and now it's five against four. Horford to Irving. To Brown, a wide open three, teed up and knocked in. And another timeout by Fred Hoiberg. Firing, three, score. That's a three by Kyrie. Well, he lost Holiday. He, he faked going over that screen and crossed over, whoop, and then crossed back over. And Holiday just gets a little bit off balance. And Irving with the three, a little bit or a lot. One of yeah, the two on skates. He kind of lunged back into the play, but. Kyrie knocked it down. Irving at the top. Oh, and a stop and go dribble. Then he finds Baines who goes up and scores. Yeah, he's just he's playing with the Bulls guards. He's doing whatever he wants to out there. He's, he's creating. He's putting pressure on them. Tatum on the move. Tatum feeds Kyrie. Nothing but net. Wow. That's another three. New transition. 85-68. Tatum, corner three, Porter down, he shoots 50%. Never shot the ball particularly well tonight. Irving on load, that's good. That's a three. He dribbled right into the, right off the screen, he dribbled right into the three-point line. Nawaba, stripped away and stolen by Kyrie Irving. Ahead to Rozier, Rozier runs in, shot good. Wow, tough shot, too. Tough shot by Terry Rozier. Timeout, Fred Hoiberg. 5.33 left, 107 to 84. In terms of bigs in the NBA, there's no better twosome than that guy right there, Anthony Davis, and that guy, Cousins, defeating the two of them, 53 points and 10 rebounds. They got Rajon Rondo on this team. This should be fun. Kyrie and company looking for eight in a row next. You know, we're, we're, we're talking about the schedule as Kyrie double dribbles and gets away with it. Knocks down a three, and then you get one game in 10 days.
face. It's going to throw you off a little bit. Big time play by Kyrie Irving as he turns the corner. I think he shook off their wrist, rust in the first half. Cousins for three. Kyrie comes away with it. Pull up three by Irving. There's the rust all knocked off at halftime. Kyrie's been hot in this third quarter. Kyrie open. Drills it. That's a good read by Kyrie. Rajon Rondo shot the gap. Kyrie went to the corner wide open. Kyrie suddenly with 14 in the game. Horford. Tatum. Clean look. Buries it. Good ball movement once again. Kyrie Irving coming off strong. And Celtics moving the ball to get open threes. That's the way you beat this Pelican defense. Holiday right back at him with the three. But you got to come back and match up. It's, just, it's not that hard just to communicate and find your man. Celtics respond. Kyrie has no rust on him at all right now. Davis right there on the baseline is going to be whistled for the foul. Tice looking inside for Horford. Defended by Davis. Back to Kyrie. Long rebound finds Tice. Back to Kyrie. He'll try again. Got it. Boston lead. Right place, right time, and nice play over to Kyrie, who is still hot from that hot third quarter. Smart. Kyrie open now. Kicks it back. Tice. Yeah! Eighteen threes made by Boston in the game. And lead by five. Thrown away. Kyrie, no, follow, no, but a foul is going to put Kyrie at the line. Makes the second. Holiday. Davis. No basket. Foul is going to be on Smart. Pelicans by one. Davis back-to-back 40-plus games for the second time in his career. Holiday. Nearly threw it away. Davis comes up with it. And wow. Wow. And not so much the call. The official who made the call was the furthest one away from it. Makes the second. Boston calls the timeout. 20.2 on the clock. 104-102. Pelican. Brown to inbound. Gets it into Horford. Gets it back. Into the hands of Kyrie. Defended by Davis. Kyrie takes it to him. Throws it up off the glass. The two. We're tied with 11 eight to go. Good use. Good use of the body by Kyrie on Anthony Davis. Not an easy task as he seals and gets the layup. Rondo looking. Looking. Gets it in. Cousins for the game. Overtime. Kyrie pull up two. Got it. 27 for Kyrie. Holiday. Pulls up, banks it home. Right down, look easy. Yeah, Holiday. Holiday just using his body to create space against Kyrie. Rondo leaps it in. Time. And time runs out before Davis can throw it down. And the Pelicans come to Boston and snap the seven game Boston win streak. Celts got a two-game home losing streak, but that guy should help him snap it here this afternoon. Kyrie Irving is back. Aaron Gordon and a magicless Orlando team standing in the way. Jalen Brown, he's got some stuff going on in that second game. We'll tell you about that in a minute. Celtics and Orlando are next. Again, the Magic have really struggled. They've had a couple of nine-game losing streaks. Nice little floater on the baseline for Kyrie. Kyrie, the pull-up. Banks it home. Kyrie. Kyrie. Keeping the Celtics in it. He has seven of Boston's 11. Kyrie having no problem at all. Drills the three. Mosley got picked off. Pate with some daylight. Comes up and under. Has it blocked by Baines. Loose ball. That's why Osley's out there going after that loose ball. Kyrie through a crowd for two. And once again, Fournier. Let him go. 
Celtics have opened up a six-point lead. The largest of the quarter, Kyrie, 13 of the 21. Gordon, same spot, misses again. Rebound to Brown. Irving. For two. Boy, he just knows just how much space he needs to get a layup off against the bigger player. Kyrie, fall away, two. Kyrie gets it back, comes up shooting. Kyrie is 8 for 11 in the game. He's got 21 first half points. How good is this game? 58 57. He's got 24 in the half. On 9 for 12 shooting, 3 for 3, long distance. Tatum gets the screen. Takes a step to the basket, has it deflected. Horford comes away with it. Five on the shot clock. Kyrie realized it missed a three. Rebound finds Kyrie, takes another, buries that one. Hustle play by Tatum to keep it alive. 27 and counting for Kyrie. Kyrie continues to be lights out. He's five of six now shooting threes. Kyrie is just the man here, 32. Kyrie, the two. But they are in need of a turn up, a, a timeout, this Orlando team. Peyton staying with Kyrie, now he gets the ball. Passes up the three, Tatum does not. Single-digit game, down by nine. Up on their toes. Kyrie, eight on the shot clock. Kyrie takes it. And this time, got the whistle. Well, they're doing all the things you have to do to come up with a win on the road. Horford will take a three, make a three. Ninety-eight, Keeps going to the basket and gets two. And no whistle once again as Mack uh, nudged him off the shot. Seven-point game. Lucky he had uh, made that. Horford gets two on the beat. Tyree. Kyrie able to draw the foul from back who felt he get run over. Yeah, he, you have a situation where Kyrie gets 40 in the game and you lose to Orlando. Boston has a three-game home losing streak. The Boston Celtics versus the Golden State Warriors as we welcome you to NBA Saturday Prime Time. And it's presented by YouTube TV. A uh, beautiful afternoon at Oracle Arena in Oakland, California, home of the defending champion Golden State Warriors, who once again have the best record in the NBA at 39 and 10. And this afternoon, facing off against the team with the best record in the Eastern Conference. By the way, Jalen Brown had a big game the first time these two teams played. As Clay Thompson misses, Brown the rebound. He had 22 points. That was the game back in November 16th. Boston won at 92-88. As Al Horford nails the three-pointer, and the Celtics quickly lead 5-0. Kyrie Irving goes right at green, spins, gets inside, left-handed off the glass. That's a pretty move. That's some finish right there. Kyrie Irving made a basket on Draymond Green, started talking after that last shot. Green responds with some words for Kyrie. Irving is fouled. Steve Kerr thought Baines pushed the defender into him, but it's going to be Celtic ball. How come they don't use that same logic when Draymond Green is averaging 10 or 11 and 7? If you're an all-star for what you do for your team, you're an all-star. If you're going to disregard the numbers, then disregard the numbers and give it to guys that deserve it. Well, again, we keep saying it over and over again. They need to expand the rosters to the all-star team. I don't agree with that. I just think we need to do a better job and be consistent with the thought process for selecting people. Oh, that was a sweet move from Kyrie Irving. And one of the problems with sagging off the bigs of Golden State is they have clear passing lanes to Curry. Everybody knocking down shots right now. 
Irving way downtown. That's good. Kyrie Irving, five for five. He's got 14 points in nine minutes. Irving goes right at the rand. Scoop layup is good. He's now six for six from the field. Irving fires away. Kyrie Irving, seven for seven from the field. 19 points in 11 minutes. And the lead back up to eight. They can live with him running to the three-point line. You can't get great players everything. Got to take away layup. Horford comes back and knocks down the three. Al Horford, like so many bigs in recent years, starting to shoot the three. He's seventh in the NBA in three-point percentage. Curry thought about a three. Now steps back, fires, and Baines the rebound. Irving, long distance. That's good. Kyrie Irving, four for four from downtown. And the Celtics regain the lead. Kyrie Irving draws the foul. Shot's good and one. Irving answers after Curry knocked down his fifth three-pointer. And the Celtics back within five. Irving against Durant. Finds room. Back out Horford. Open baseline jumpers. Good. And despite a couple of big Warrior runs, it's a four-point game. Timeout call by Steve Kerr. Six to shoot for Kyrie Irving. Launches a three. Rattles it home. Kyrie Irving. Five for five from downtown. He's 10 of 12, 28 points. A three-point game. Under five to play. They lob it in. Durant can't quite get it. Well defended there by Marcus Morris. Irving, burst of speed to the basket and draws the foul. Irving hits a pair. Back to one. Irving drives, stops, left-handed, banks it home. 32 for Irving, using his offhand. He's 11 of 13 from the field. Morris picks up Curry on the switch. Curry one-on-one, -on -one, drives, fakes, left-handed scoop, knocked out of bounds. One official called it out, but Derek Stafford says yes, a foul. He's got the last seven points for the Warriors. Livingston to inbound. They get it to Curry again, and Curry quickly fouled by Al Horford with 6.9 remaining, and obviously if Curry, even if he hits both, Celtics with a chance to tie it, but they are out of timeouts. Season high, 47 for Curry. Clutch at the line. No timeouts for Boston. Clay Thompson on Irving. Green tries to knock it away, and there's the whistle and the foul before the shot attempt. So Irving will shoot two free throws with 2.9 remaining. So Irving expect to try and miss it. Celtics now two. Barely hits the rim. I think it just hit up by... But he violated it. Oh, it hit the it rim. It hit the rim. It hit the rim, but, hit the rim. But Irving did violate, too. So but they that's could, not the call, though. I know. Come on, sir. <laughs> I agree, but... <laughs> Inbound to Curry. And Rogier fouls with 1.6 remaining. Curry can hit these two free throws, and it's all over. Curry... If he hits this one, it's over. If not, Celtics still with a last chance with 1.6 remaining. And that'll do it. 49 points for Steph Curry. Uh, what a matchup between the best in the West against the best in the East. Golden State survives. And they defeat the Celtics 109-105. A brilliant performance from Steph Curry. 49 points. Eight three-pointers. The New York Knicks are presented by Chase, and tonight they face a team they've been playing since 1946. The New York Knicks and the Boston Celtics. Actually, the shooting Clyde. Celtics 3 for 14. Knicks are 4 of 12 to start. And that's Horford's shot from up top when he gets free. Yeah, good creativity by Irving to find Horford, who's a 50% shooter from the field. Irving sizing up Boudier. Gets by him and kicks. Open look, Jalen Brown hits another corner three. Previously in front of the Nick Pitts. This time a long celebrity roar in the corner. Cantor, fall away. Easily fighting for it. Brown collects. Both teams are good rebounding team. They average 44 rebounds. Knicks average 10 offenses. Celtics 9. And Kyrie Irving off the bounce, his first basket. Timeout, Jeff Hornacek. 8-0 run for the Celtics, and their lead is 8. Five and change to go first quarter. This guy, oh, he's tough to defend. No competition for Irving's spot. Chance at three. Brilliant play to the rim. Back comes Irving, and he sticks the three for Boston. And previously, he missed that shot. This time, a few feet closer, able to get it down. Kyrie's been erratic with his shooting. Make one, miss one. Beasley struggled against multiple guys defensively. Irving carves him up. 
Irving against Burke. Help comes. Fires and hits. Well, that was excellent defense by Burke, folks. He did their thing. He stayed on his feet and now smart with his field. Slams it down after the turnover and a momentum play late in the second quarter. Celtics lead by six. Irving against the double now. Inside Brown, good recognition to find the open man. Remember, Brown was hot the first quarter at 10 points. Horford from straight on, pointing to the passer, buries the three. Irving strokes the three. Irving now with 17 to lead the Celtics. Irving had 18 the previous game against the Pistons. Now we played that soundbite from Jeff Hornacek talking about the competition he expects fly between Moutier, Neely Kina, and Burke. One thing you're guaranteed from Moutier is the athleticism, no doubt. Yep, and the hustle. He's, got a, he's learning to improve his defense. See right there, the guy's caught on the screen. Irving making him pay. Stagger frees him up for his third three, and Irving now with 20. And a steal. What kind of pass was that? Moody gave it up. Irving scores again. Timeout, Jeff Hornacek, with under six to go in the third as the Celtics extend the lead to six. Irving lets it fly. Hits again. Moutier and Neely Kina were both there, and Irving found a little seam to score. The body control, but came up short. That's a problem for Moutier, folks. He can't finish once he makes that move. Irving recognizes he's been hot. Largest lead right now for the Celtics, up by 10, and Irving with 28 tonight. Moutier with driving room. And throws it away. Ten turnovers now in the Knicks. Tatum has Morris, takes it himself, and the rookie converts. Moody in his third season, but make uh, high school missed passes. Those type of passes where you're going away and throwing back across your body. Not playing with prudence. Irving gets free, leans into a three, and hits. Shrugs and says, why not? Hardaway for three. And Horford grabs the board. Horford, their leading rebounder, so after seven bounds. Irving sets up Horford, and it's an all-star connection. Al Horford knocks it down. Irving up top, Brown slams it down. And that's what Brown can do for you. Excite the crowd with his leaping ability. Burke slings it out, Hardaway saves. Celtics get it. Irving, Brown, big throwdown. And the Celtics lead by nine. Timeout, Jeff Hornacek with under two minutes to play here at the Garden. Now some cheering on the Celtics rise here at the Garden. Knicks were close, but they fall short here against Boston. 121-112 tonight. Kyrie Irving scoring 31 for the visitors. Triumphant return home for Kyrie as he was the catalyst propelling the Celtics to the victory. Here's a sight every Celtic fan loves. Gordon Haywood in uniform here today, but it was only for the team pitcher taken here this afternoon. Everybody looking pretty good. Hopefully they'll feel that way a couple of hours from now. Standing in the way, Kemba Walker, Dwight Howard, and the Hornets. They're next. Howard a little embarrassed losing to all of Australia on the tip. <laughs> John Washington, Ron Garrett, and JT Orr, the officials for tonight's game. And it is a flush to start the game. Yeah, what a way to start the game. Kyrie coming off aggressive, draw two, and hit Baines for the flying one-handed jam. He said something I thought was interesting over dinner. He has wonderful stats the first 13 years in the league. How a double-double as Kyrie knocks down a three. Yet you don't feel he affects winning. Not, not since Orlando. See, but you're going to have big as you shoot like that. that that's going to be the evolution of the big. you got to be able to shoot or dive like a Daniel Tice or a DeAndre Jordan type that can, you can throw the ball up. Kyrie with the long two on the step back. Kyrie continues to be hot three for four to open the game, seven points. Howard goes to the basket, gets two more. You know, Baines has done... Fantastic job on Howard in previous games, but Howard seems to have found out about that stat. I was just going to say, I think he read that stat. The tomb got the block. 
Is Kyrie behind the backboard on that shot? He gave a little extra arch to get that ball up. We'll have to take a look. Smart off the bench will make the inbounds pass. Does so to Horford. Sounds had a fresh 24 seconds off that. Looking for and finding Kyrie. Takes a three. Makes a three. His ability to recognize how much space he needs to get a shot off, it doesn't matter. Perfect defensive position by Howard, high hand. Kyrie knows, I can get this shot off, and he's going to shoot it with confidence. He's got 12 points, half the Celtics total. He's done it in eight minutes. Kyrie again, one-on-one -on -one with Howard. Step back this time, nails that one. I can watch him every day. <laughs> every gives, day. Gives Howard a little pat as he goes by. 13-game yeah. <laughs> yeah. win streak right now for Houston. Were you telling Paul Pierce to hit somebody? No, I, was, I must have been saying, like, Garnett hit somebody. <laughs> <laughs> then he just headbutted me right there. I should have flopped. Got a fine from him. I just can't, can't flop if your own teammate hits you. Kyrie, the two. So smooth. Recognized the switch. Just drifted a little bit to get the space over Kaminsky. That's a bit nylon. Kaminsky. Interesting finish. Very Olenic like. <laughs> <laughs> Good call. Kyrie gets two more. 61 55 with two minutes to go in the first half. Oh. He's got 24 in the first half. Yeah, these decisions are in a split second, and it's like. He has no preconceived ideas of what he wants to do out there. He just finds a way to get a shot off. Up for Baines, makes the catch, gets two with the left hand. Good patience by Kyrie Irving. Coming off the screen, engaging Howard, a good roll by Baines. Baines hasn't missed a shot either. Kyrie, wow. Yeah, that's just Dwight Howard not following the game plan, not coming out. And you give... Kyrie, this type of shot, Mike, look at that. He is wide open. Are you kidding? He hasn't been that wide open in three weeks. Sounds it down to seven on the shot clock to get it to Kyrie. Oh! Oh! Get out of here! The two. Lamb. Looking away before he caught it. Now he's trying to catch up with uh, who he's supposed to be covering. And that's Kyrie by himself. There are levels to this game, and Kyrie, since the break, has taken his game to a whole new level. Can Kyrie get to 40? And he's going to get two at the line. Thirty-four points on 13 of 18 from the field, four of six from deep, four for four at the line for Kyrie. Two angry, frustrated teams will take the floor tonight with one feeling a little better about themselves when the final horn sounds. Who will seize the moment? It's the Phoenix Suns and Boston Celtics here on Fox Sports Arizona. We were, of course, coming off of that horrific ankle injury last year as he fires out to Irving. And not a surprise there, you were out here before the game tonight doing the radio show or earlier today, and you said he was lighting it up. Ariza gets another clean look. He goes down. Irving. You made a great point, though, EJ. This, this is also part of growing up, which is learning how to play with that lead, yep. not celebrating, not enjoying it. No, because the Celtics are going to make them work. Yeah, they think if the Suns think they're going to prove to victory now, they can forget it. Yeah, because that guy right there, number 11, the only Celtics starter who has still scored 13 points, will ensure that they come out with a different mindset in the second half. Warren up inside of the runner. He goes down hard. No foul. Here comes Irving. Morris gets the lay-in. So four quick points right there. Irving able to get loose. Yeah, that's two possessions for the Celtics where they've gotten point-blank layups, and that's something they did not get in the first half. They're going to make it back-to-back -back threes. And Horford beating Holmes to the loose ball. Out to Irving with a three-point hit. Boy, those are the 50-50 balls you've got to find your way to. Anderson looking to get off the snide. Did not score against Brooklyn. Irving feeling it.
As close as they have been since early in the second. Sun's biggest lead has been 22. Home four foul heads to the bench as Morris knocks down the three. We well, talked about his three-point shooting streak. Stroke much improved this season at 49%. Irving on the drive, able to get inside. He's got 23. The Celtics team that got a visit from the great former quarterback Peyton Manning for their game against the Nuggets the other night. Put together an inspired three quarters of basketball, but it was not enough to get them the victory there in the Mile High City. 12 point game. Biggest lead for the Suns has been 22. Irving raising up and puts it over the outstretched hands of Ayton. And it's a nine point game, just under three to go. He won't have the chance, he'll be fouled before he's able to do so. Is Marcus Smart and Marcus Morris at the scorer's table. How about that one from Kyrie Irving? That's unbelievable. He <laughs> did that on a 7-2 guy, and he hesitated and hung in the air and threw it in with his left hand off the glass. Wow. Irving's got it. He's got a high of 30 for the Celtics. Get the screen and the switch. Looking for the three. He'll get it. Hey, look, he made that shot. As I, I said, I watched the guy take 50 shots yeah. today. And I saw him make about 20 in a row. Yeah, hey, look, if they get a stop, they're going to get a chance to tie this game. So what a work of effort and endurance they have put in. Booker scored the last 10 for the Suns. On the drive, gets tied up with a steal by Irving. Irving on the drive. Drops it off to Brown. Brown has it blocked, but then on the follow. And a timeout by the Suns. A one-point Phoenix lead. Make a miss. you got to make sure that you just retreat back because Brad Stevens is really slick in these situations. Both teams in the penalty as Stevens will take his final timeout. Kyrie's in the backcourt, but you got to believe he's going to run into the play. Tatum will inbound. Morris gets it. Irving with a double clutch. Out to Morris. Sets up, fires, and hits. Three-tenths of a second remaining. Suns with no timeout. They got to take the ball out. Brooker lets it fly. We're going to play a little overtime. Irving with the steal. And that is the first Celtic lead since the first shot of the night, which ironically came from Kerry Irving. The Suns are going to have to earn this when Booker slips inside. Well, Booker's going to have to earn it, and he has to be the one that stays aggressive here. Here's a guy going Uncle Drew on the drive. I'm telling you, he's putting on the show. And again, I, I saw this guy before the game. I'm telling you, I just felt that he was going to be sick tonight. Just our fourth tie of the night. Irving trying to quickly break it, and he does. You got to know he's going to take over, and he has. Booker. Working against Morris with the left hand. Yes! He's cold-blooded, too. So we, we got two cold, cold bloods going at one another right now. Horford. You know it. You just know it. Booker trying to match. And he does. Swing it around to Brown. My. Goodness. Booker able to turn the corner, gets the drive. Irving with his head down. Morris with it to the rim and in. Five point Boston lead. Irving with the block. As you look back at tape, and they'll see in that fourth quarter with about four and a half minutes left. They kind of start, stop playing, and they're thinking that the clock is going to run down. And this is what becomes of it. The Toronto Raptors, the Boston Celtics. What a way to kick off our NBA Friday presented by State Farm. A sold-out TD Garden. Two powerhouses from the East meeting for the second time this season. Tatum goes right at Green, who's... 
one of the better defenders in his position. Jalen Brown connects on a three. Now that's what you want to get him going early. Irvin tries again. This time, oh. connects. Holford back out. Brown trying to get on track from three-point range, shooting just 29% from there. Irvin fires again and hits. Kyrie Irving, his second three-pointer. Well, ever since uh, he got rid of the hair, uh, he's putting up numbers that are staggering. Green gets up into Irving. Irving on a drive, pull-up shot. You talked about Leonard is unguardable when he does that. So is Irving. Now Morris one-on-one -on -one against Leonard. Leonard misses that. Marcus Morris, the rebound. Morris has played well for the Celtics this season. Mike, he's the leading rebounder on the team off the bench. Horford. Well, they're both. We have two excellent passing teams here. Very unselfish. Leonard, oh, and Anobi oh. goes down hard. Oh, boy, oh, boy. It looked like there was plenty of contact. Irving drives the other way, spins it in off the glass, and Anobi just gets up at the other end. Irving, little shake and bake, and drills the jumper. Now, see, he, look, he, he, it was difficult for Irving. If he, he, he has a little guy on him. Morris inside, yeah. takes some contact. Irving stops on a dime and drills the jumper. He's got 14. Uh, he's, he's looking sweet tonight also. Horford for three. There's six of ten from downtown. Passes nice. by Irving. Nice. Irving backs uh, home. Uh, how about that? Off the glass from that angle. You know how tough that is? Irving gets into the paint. Left hand and slips it up and in. 18 first half points for Kyrie Irving. Rogier trying to hound Green, well defended. Rogier pulls back Green, misses. Boy, that's excellent defense from Rogier. Well, Rogier's got a ton of talent. He proved it last year in the playoffs. Irving, hand in his face, rattles that one home. He's got 20. There's Irving falling away. Shot is good. Kyrie Irving with 22. He's 10 for 15 from the floor. Irving to Tatum. Tatum sets three pointer, puts it in. You notice, Mike, no rush there. Oh, nice nice back door. Irving with the left hand is fouled. Beautiful move. Not only when Irving makes the pass back, but he makes the pass and then he fakes coming over the top. Irving for three. Kyrie Irving from way downtown and the game is tied. He's now three for four in the three ball and he has 25 points. Danny Green looks to answer. Tatum tips it. Irving comes up with it. Great play. Watch out here. Irving to the rim. Bank shot. Got it. Celtics lead. How about the kiss there? Delon Wright, who's a good young defender, having his hands full right now. Irving trying to spin. Makes him take a tough shot. He still knocks it down. 31. He loves that spin move, though. As Irving drives again. Won't go, but a foul. One on one, he is unstoppable. Irving gets in the paint. Double team, rattles it home. He's got 35. Now he's, he's putting on some show here tonight. All right, like the matchup. They have Leonard on them, but then you got to watch for the switch. Irving to the rim. Left handed, banks it home. One point game. Now look, he's back two off the one at the other end on the right side, and this one on the left side. Irving to the rim, off the glass, does it again. Now this guy right at 6'5", can, cannot stop him. Morris on Leonard, four to shoot. Leonard the drive, puts up the shot, won't go. Rebound, Harper, overtime. Well, give, give Morris a ton of credit. Hayward's got the line right on him, turns and hits. Gordon Hayward hitting some big buckets for the Boston Celtics. Siakam in the paint, short. Rebound taken by Tatum. Uh, good defense. Played, played him well and challenged the shot. Ne nearly stolen. Irving shaking back to the rim. Packs it home again. Great defense. Great defense at that end. And then uh, once they had that possession, they went right and made a beautiful move. Irving isolated with Van Fleet. Off the dribble. Pull up jumper. Puts it in, Kyrie Irving, the masterpiece tonight. The Horford baseline, got it. 
We're watching excellent team play under pressure by the Celtics, making the correct pass. Now he should wait. Yeah. Irving scoots inside, throws it up. Harford comes down and throws it down. And that'll do it with 18.9 remaining. Well, they ran the clock. That was perfectly. And then a beautiful move out of the corner. Over the past week, the Cavaliers, of course, have been into a, quite of a buzzsaw. And tonight, they come to Boston on the first of a back-to-back -back as they take on the Celtics tonight. Disappointing here, 11 and 10. They're in seventh place in the Eastern Conference. Jenny Osman on the foot. Here comes Irving. Averaging 22 points a game. The pull-up gets it to go. That's the one thing you can't do is let that young man get started. We we all know what happens when he gets going. One and three this Boston getaway. Irving a foot. He's not forced much at all with the uh, Celtics. Trying to get others involved, and his assists are up a little bit. Six and a half a game. Irving sends it and hits it for three. He's a 38% shooter outside the arc this season. Hood straight on three shorts. Controlled by Boston. My goodness. Irving steps in a long one. Wow. Give him 10. That was Steph Curry right there. 21-13. Tice. Good look inside to Irving. That's good basketball there. Yeah. They, they, they catch you watching the ball and they backdoor. That's, a, that's a, a staple of this team. They like to do that if you catch you ball watching. Irving attacking. And he scored it. So Kyrie Irving with 15 now. Well, Tristan with 12 and 8 in the half. Whoa. And three goes for Kyrie Irving. He's got it dialed in here tonight with 18 points. On second in the miss, Thompson a, a tip attempt. Back in the Celtics, Cavs have to be careful here, yeah. closing this half. You're right, this is when they have a tendency. Go oh, inside, Baines. As Irving had the ball in the string. Loudest roar of the night, 56-48 all of a sudden. Snyder was always very high on him, and the fact that he could uh, alter games coming off the bench, much like uh, Jordan Clarkson, with that ability to, to get points in bunches. Here comes Irving, oh boy. trying to beat the clock, kicks it out to Morris for three. Yep. Marcus Morris was ready and waiting. It's almost like he read that play from Irving. We have to sustain 100% contact at all times to take away his momentum and rhythm. All right, thanks, Coach. Back to you, Fred. All right, Angel, thanks, Coach, as uh, they start the second half with a Baines lob from Irving, so he's got eight. Austin began the game 11-3 and then closed that second quarter 15-5 as Irving a deep three again. Well, he ran right into that shot. Deflected by Sexton. Irving thought it should have been a foul. Morris, a three ball. He's really shot it well from deep this season. A career best 43% for him. Smart pocket pass to Baines. Man, it's a top by Tristan Thompson. Who sent it back like a piece of overcooked salmon. But yeah. then Irving knocks down the three. How good has he been from deep tonight? Yeah, that was, Kyrie has been the one that's really on target for this team. Oh, now 5 to 15 shooting. Irving and a dash. Well, the one thing you can't do with Kyrie is do what Sexton did that time. Once you commit, try to force him to one side, that's when he has you dead call. Oh, no. Irving tapped it in. Doing it all tonight, he's got 31. My goodness. Kyrie Irving. Kyrie coming to the ball, takes the handoff, dribbles through a crowd, nice. gets to the rim, and gets two. That is so difficult that he makes it look so easy. Morris. Nope. Two minutes. Kyrie is going to play the whole first quarter here. He drills the three. Drill the three from Capitol Hill. Oh, there we go. There's a reference. <laughs> Under five to go in the half. Kyrie gets two back. Yeah, that's a big time shot. They, you know, they've been shooting a lot of threes. The offense, Kyrie said, let me get a solid 15 footer just so everyone could see it. Irving. 
dribbles through a crowd, throws it up off the glass. Once again, the pitter-patter dribble as he splits and dices the Washington Wizard defense. Green will take it. Rebound to Tatum. Gets it in the hands of Kyrie. Trying to go on Sadoransky. Kicks it back out. Baines is going to try a three. Knock it down. We haven't seen one of those in a while. But that's the type of three that Aaron Baines should be taking. Kyrie drawing two, kicks it out. He can set his feet, let it fly. Loose ball, good hustle by Baines. Kyrie along the baseline, spins it home. And that's how you do it, Mike. Washington came out with the edge. The Celtics took it back, making hustle plays after hustle play. The Celtics come up with a turnover. Smart gets it ahead. Morris, open court, two. Morris wants a foul. Wall, Beal rather, takes it hard to the basket. 65-64, Kyrie skips his way down and gets two. I thought Kyrie was going to pull that ball back out. So did the Wizards. A little hesitation. <laughs> He's so good at putting that ball up on the glass. Tice kicks it out. Morris, plenty of time, sticks a three. That's a big time play by Tice. Going to the basket and a steal by Rozier. Can they capitalize? Yes, they can. And a quick timeout taken by Washington as the Celtics suddenly down 11 a short time ago are up by seven. Kyrie. Able to turn the corner, throws it up, and Williams throws it down. The bench is just loving young Mr. Williams. Kyrie once again, all the way to the basket this time. Rebound. Ultimately, Kyrie in the corner hits a three. Good job by Robert Williams, keeping that ball yep. alive. Yep. Kyrie to Williams, who just kind of hanging around. It's a big time take by Kyrie, yeah, putting the sure. ball going where he wants to go. Rozier looking for Kyrie, gets it to him. Kyrie sees an opening, takes it all the way to the basket. Good solid screen by Smart. To create a little bit of confusion with the Wizards defense, and Kyrie does what he does. Get all the way to the basket and makes it look easy. Kyrie, pull up three. Tipped up and in. What a song. Marcus Morris. What a tip. Wall again for two. Wall, Wall getting that full head of steam. You cannot allow that late in the game. Kyrie, six on the clock. Foul is going against Washington. It's going against Beal. Kyrie makes them both. Wall. Again to the basket. Again for two. Crying for a foul. Irving able to blow by on the sidelines. Kyrie. Oh, what a pass! No pullback for Kyrie. What a pass! Was it trouble getting it in? Finally, do and a quick foul is immediately given. I don't think the Wizards were expecting that. No, I don't think they were either. Kyle and Sherrod is standing by. Post game live coming up next. Brought to you by the New England Ford dealers. Oh my goodness. My game. How does that happen? Kyrie. Makes a move. Kyrie takes it to the basket. No. Overtime. Irving to the basket. Boston opens up a six-point lead with under three to play in overtime. Oubre for three. Oh. Oubre has been something off the bench. He's got 20. Seven-nothing run here by Washington after Boston got up six. Minute 23 left to go. Irving. Bumped on the way to the basket. 
Kyrie makes the free throw. Boston goes back up one, 122 to 121. 10 on the clock, Beal. Put back up and in by Morris. Washington goes up one, Morris hitting the glass hard. Irving. Defended by Wall. Kyrie in the paint, kicks it. Rozier, seven on the shot clock. Irving. No space, high arcing, three, Celtics up two. Wall to the bucket, tie game. Deep three, yeah! No timeout for... Scott Brooks, he's just going to say, let's just go. Beal for three. No, rebound loose. Trap down. Wall. Boston ball. Kyrie with two daggers. John Wall came back and answered. Kyrie said, I got something for you, Mr. Wall. I'm just going to pull it from deep. Once again, nothing but the bottom of the net. Dead on, dead in. Three point two left on the clock. There are the numbers for Kyrie on 12 of 28 shooting. And it comes to Irving and he gets fouled. Foul on Chief Morris. And there it is. Kyrie delivers late. Two big threes. And he hears it. MVP from the crowd in Washington. Makes them both. The Celtics, 25 of 25 from the free throw line. And Boston in overtime. Takes down Washington 130 to 125. The winning streak continues. It is now at seven. Game three of a four-game homestand about to come down. Kyrie Irving hoping the Celtics can turn things around a little bit. And maybe they can with Al Horford back in the starting lineup. That is definitely going to be a help. But then this Kemba Walker, he's had some big nights against Boston. The Celtics and the Hornets are next. Al Horford's going to jump it up against Kobe Zeller. Gets the tip. Fresh legs. <laughs> yeah, he doesn't win many of those, right? <laughs> maybe it's Cody Zeller. <laughs> There you go, Kyrie right off the bat, drains a jump shot. And that's an assist for Al Horford, playing through Al and guys playing off of him. That's what the Celtics need. Batum keeps it moving, Williams. Kyrie. Kyrie up the floor, probing. Good little brush screen by Al Horford, and he already looks locked in. Celtics 3 for 3 to open the game. Charlotte 0 for 4. Into the hands of Kyrie. Pull up 3. I thought that might get a timeout. Not yet, though. 9 nothing to Boston lead. Tatum gives it up. Kyrie gets an open look at a 3. 10 points already for Kyrie. Confusion on the Hornets. Side defensively, that's not the guy you want to leave wide open. It's his side that's rejected out of bounds. And watch Kyrie. You gotta continue to pursue the ball. Get that shot out of here. That's team defense. Kyrie. Oh. Great example of superstar. Yeah, superstar player with the clock running down. All the way by Walker doesn't work. Taken down by Haywood. Kyrie is five for five, three for three from deep. Thirteen points overall. Make it fifteen. And Boston opens up a five-point lead. That was a great seal by Tice.
Let's check in with Abigail. Yeah, guys, inside the huddle, the focus was on this zone defense the Hornets are running. Both Al Horford and then Brad Stevens, when he sat down, told his guys, you got to get it in the middle. We can't just keep moving it around the perimeter. Smart from the corner. Knocking down the three. Nice play by Kyrie. 20-point half for Kyrie. More importantly, the Celtics up 17. Irving will take it. Make it. Kyrie having himself a half. He's got 23. Boston's got 64 on the board with two minutes still to play. Smart. Oh, good ball movement there. Morris takes the free throw jumper and knocks it down. Yeah, it was great ball movement inside out. Not forcing any layups. And then you end up getting a wide open 15 footer. Offered for two. Right now they're just going through skeleton offense. They're yeah. getting whatever they want, hard cuts. Guys are spacing, taking the right shots. Irving accelerates to the basket, count it in the foul. 25 and counting for Kyrie. Here's the layup. And let's take a look. Kyrie's just on fire today. The city of Boston of glow at night and welcome everyone to TD Garden for the Sixers and the Celtics. Those two teams conjure up images and names of some of the great rivalries ever to play in the NBA. Russell, Chamberlain, Irving, Bird, and a lot of anticipation here today on Christmas night as the Celtics take on the 76ers. Welcome to an NBA Christmas special presented by State Farm continuing tonight from Boston. Philadelphia leading by four just underway here on Christmas night here in Boston. Second meeting of the season between these two teams. Nice. Kyrie Irving over Reddick. A couple of Duke guys going head to head. Yeah, I like that. Because you think that he, this guy's got the total package. <laughs> He's got the three game, the mid range game, lefty, righty, you name it. Simmons pushing the tempo. And a quiet first few minutes for Jimmy Butler. And he misfires on that mid range jump shot. Well, you have to get back here now. Well, they caught him napping. He hit the snooze button. The one guy you have to worry about on a missed shot is Tatum. He gets out quick. And it's amazing how many times they'll hit him and there'll be no defender in the sight. Tatum back the other way for the Boston Celtics. A stare down three is short. Going to try it again. Irving got look the rebound. Look Great this. hustle by Kyrie Irving. Now, right now. You're, you're upset if you're coaching Philadelphia you're upset why because your player who was guarding Tatum left him and started on the fast break but you didn't get the rebound yet it cost you a second chance opportunity Butler on Irving this should be a nice matchup to watch Irving with the left-handed scoop got it to go he was in his bag this guy plays the glass I say it every time we do a game it's better <laughs> than anyone in this league. Left hand, right hand. Once he gets down below that foul line, you're in trouble. Celtics with their first lead of the ball game, 16-15. Irving, without hesitating, drills it. Butter. That was an outstanding staggered screen on the left side of the floor. And Riddick got caught on the second screen. Here's Butler. Mid-range jumper way off. Butler trying to find his rhythm 0 for 4 right now. Yeah, he's getting good looks. Irving, uh, got it! Uh, it doesn't matter. You can be a big guy and you can be a shot blocker, but even you think you're going to get him, he'll find a way to play the glass. Irving, yes. Easy. Just effortless. As soon as he comes off that screen, if you're nowhere there, he's pulling up. If you ride up and try to play him, he'll try to go baseline on you. Here's Jalen Brown, perhaps the guy that's been impacted more than anybody with everybody returning to full health. Irving. Man, he's got it stuck on automatic here in the first quarter. Well, did you like the fake? Come on, a little <laughs> fake there and just fade back on it. That's one of the toughest shots in basketball, the mid-range shot from the basket to the sideline. Irving, still hot. Eight. 
Tice at seven feet. Cut him off, but the fade. Fade over the top. Five on the clock for Chandler. Eyes the three. And Tice clears. Here's Smart. Tice wasn't waiting for it. They didn't draw it up that way, but they'll take it anyway. Why not? Well, we tell you that early on, he's shooting at 41% in the three ball. Having a great game. Irving oh, nice. kept Reddick on his back. Yeah. Boy, that was a clinic. Well, that's what the great ones can do. They come off the screen, and if they, know, they know that they have a half a step on the man. They cut in front of him to keep him on the back. And then if you double team, they hit the free guy underneath. Otherwise, they got the floater. Oh, and they still can't get a handle on Kyrie Irving. He read that great. See, when he comes off that screen, anytime that he gets a, a help with a screener, he'll read after that first bounce whether he goes all the way or a, a short pickup. Simmons inside. Uh, now, who knocked the ball away? Irving. Mm. Irving on the double team. And the 11th turnover for Philadelphia. Irving up hot. Nice. And up top to Horford. Yeah, good timeout. Excellent defensive plays. Up. Wow. Kyrie's back. He was one for five since halftime. They got to get him going. Pins the man on his back, plays the blast. Beautiful play. Muscala from mid-range. So he's, he's really having a tough night. Right now, he's one for eight in the game. Rozier for three. Yes. What a shot in the arm he's been. Brett Brown calls timeout. Oh, and Kyrie got open underneath uh, and made them pay. Not only that, but he shoots it over a six foot eight guy. Mm. As he makes the catch below his waist, he was quick enough to get the fade off. They screen Butler. Irving got into the lane. Uh, Butler seemed so to get a piece of it. Now the hesitation. The hesitation got the step. And that's when he hesitated, Butler was coming, and then he made that big step, caught him. Butler out to Embiid, thought about the three, two on the clock. Rebound, Chandler blocked by Tatum. Wow, what a play. Irving off a couple of screens. Into the paint again. They forced the miss. I played him well. That was a tough shot. Butler in transition, back to Chandler, in rhythm, why not? Oh, oh, Wilson man. Chandler, not Butler, not Embiid, not Simmons, but Chandler with the big bucket. Butler with dogged defense on Irving. Kyrie kept his dribble alive, tough shot. Uh, Uncle Drew uh, with another one. Let me tell you, that was a raindrop. What a tough shot, Butler was right on top of him. The Sixers can get the last one. Tied at 108. Simmons out front. Guarded by Morris. Reddick for the lead. And we're going to go to overtime. Nice. Tatum inside. Beautiful. But the ball reversal by Harvard at the top of the circle, and then Morris not forcing anything. He allowed that to open up and then made the pass. And Bede, slick pass inside. Simmons blocked. Got it back and out to Chandler. Tatum with the board. That was a bad missed opportunity. The lob, Hayward, and the finish. In this league, you miss an eat opportunity at a layup. The team scores in three to four seconds. Why? I have no idea. <laughs> but it happens all the time. Hayward left it short on the rim. He had good, good movement, though. Good shot. He showed a lot of explosiveness on that previous play. Foul on Tatum. That's all right. You say that's a wrap-up. Force him to make the foul shots. Irving for three. Yes. And the lead. I really like that. The way they set that up by getting Tatum on the right-hand side of the floor. Irving then had the screen by Horford. He could have done a number of things. Butler, one on the clock, they gotta shoot it. Reddick forced to throw one up. Good rebound, good luck out here. Irving for three. Wow! Oh, wow. Uncle Drew strikes again! Simmons with a head of steam. Mr. Wild one. Oh, that, that didn't even touch him. 
There it Tatum. Is. Up and down they go. Frantic. Remember, remember what I said? You missed the layup at one end of the floor. Now that would have been a hard yeah. driving layup. Within three to four seconds, there they are on the line. Tatum knocks down both. The Boston Celtics win their second in a row. Defeating the 76ers to remain perfect in overtime this year. All right, thanks a lot, Michelle, and welcome to a very frigid and freezing night here in Boston in a showdown between a couple of Eastern Conference powers that hope to be playing when things warm up in April and even May, perhaps even into June. The Celtic Nation in turmoil a little bit right now after a three-game road trip and Kyrie Irving, the team's leader, having a few things to get off of his chest, and he let it be known. Welcome, everyone, to NBA Courtside, presented by McDonald's. Tonight, the third meeting of the season between the Toronto Raptors and the Boston Celtics. Kawhi Leonard's Raptors with the NBA's best road record. He's coming off a 41-point night three nights ago. Meanwhile, Kyrie Irving, good news for the Boston Celtics. He's back in action after missing their previous run a couple of nights ago against the Brooklyn Nets. Here's Lowry looking quick on the drive. Couldn't finish with the left hand. And back comes Marcus Smart, who's also back in the lineup. He missed the previous game due to illness. Horford with an easy one at the rim. And Leonard hits nothing but net. A career year scoring-wise and shooting 37% from downtown. He's got five already. Irving trying to counter, and he does. A little get back. Look at Nick Nurse, the first-year head coach of the Toronto Raptors, former player at the University of Northern Iowa. Coached overseas in Britain for over a decade and got his start in the G League before making his way on to Dwayne Casey's bench as an assistant. Irving with another three. Great way to come out of a timeout, Jeff. Orford from deep on the pick and pop. Well, that time they were in sync. Inside, Tatum off the inbound, got an easy one. Beautiful out of bounds cut by Jason Tatum to get an early one and an easy one. Horford with the offensive board. Hayward with the pull up, got it. He says, I'm still not as confident as I should or I want to be, but I will be by the end of the year. Irving got it on the baseline. And Irving's good in the low post. Now he's got a game down there. Feels comfortable. Good bucket by him. Irving off the Bain screen with the left. Oh, he gave them the left hand. Oh, that should be illegal right there. The handle and then the left hand shot from 12 feet. Kyrie on the baseline. Irving with 12 after that field goal. Tatum for three. And another possession for Boston. Inside, Hayward, look what I found. And Irving with another dime. Kyrie Irving already has six assists. Irving guarded by Powell. Good ball fake by Hayward, and that's where he wants to be able to finish better, at the rim. And a good sign for Gordon Hayward. Kyrie inside. This is a finishing clinic tonight wow. by Irving. Well, Kyrie always wants that last shot, gives it up to Hayward. Funny how things change. That wasn't the story a couple of games ago in Orlando. When that was the storyline, when Kyrie upset, he didn't get the ball. I was just talking to Nick Nurse, and I said, what what changed a 22-point turnaround in that, in that first half? He said, well, the big deal was our second unit kind of played tentatively. Uh, you know, they just didn't guard well. Look at the, the bench scoring for, for the Celtics. And he said, offensively, our second unit just didn't play with any pace. The key to this third quarter, he said, we got to get some flow to our offense. He said, we started out really great and then just started standing around. 
Well, the Celtics get the first bucket of the second half. Al Horford doing the honors. Horford on the pick and pop three. Seven on the shot clock for Toronto. Danny Green for three. Well, they got a great look. They just haven't shot the three well at all tonight. So it's another good play by Serge Ibaka off the short roll. And now three of 17 from deep. Kyrie going full Uncle Drew on Toronto. Just a great, great score. The ability to stop, step back, hit a little fade. Mm. Pretty much unstoppable once he gets going. Irving with 16 of the ball game. His ninth double-double of the season. To go along with 10 assists now. Here's Rozier. Ibaka switches on to him. Horford inside again. Fouled and won! Kyrie calls for it against Van Vliet. Ten on the shot clock. Tough pump fake. Wow! How did that fall? Kyrie inside and one. On the pick and pop, Horford with an answer. Lowry with the three ball. Not a fan of that shot at this point in the game. Tatum at the other end, and one! Lowry didn't bound for Toronto. Two on the shot clock, he's got to go quick. Got it off over Morris. Fortunate to draw iron. Tatum for three. Celtics with the lead. Irving got the switch, Ibaka guarding him. Seven on the shot clock. Starting to dance with it. Slammed on the brakes. Money. Butter. Kyrie, a bomb! Oh! Straight fire! Big time shot maker. Great contest by Leonard. You're just looking at an elite offensive player. Celtics with possession up five. Trying to close this one out. Irving inside, Horford with the finish. Leonard from deep, short. Boston in control here. The lob. Ha! Horford on a high handoff. Green with another contested three. And that might just do it. Little sugar from Tatum. So the Boston Celtics going on an 11 to nothing run when the game was tied at 106. And they'll go up 2 to 1 in the season series against the Toronto Raptors. Boston the number 5 seed in the Eastern Conference. And appropriately, fittingly Irving with the ball in his hands as time expires. Grizz with the tip, and Conley will bring it up. Irving keeping the dribble alive. Now looking for a cutter, can't find one. Gets the dribble back. Got Gasol on him. Takes him to the basket, throws it up off the glass, and gets two. And Will, he can score. 
And it's by Temple behind the back pass, finds Smart in the corner, and he knocks down the tree. Kyrie, his passing is it's continuing on from his magical display we saw the other night against Toronto. Holiday looking inside, Gasol wants to pass it. Nowhere to go. Still got time, six on the shot clock, comes across the lane. Good job by Horford. And then reaching by Morris, coming up with the steal. Smart. Morris kicks it out. Trailer. Kyrie. Smart. No three. Love, love the ball movement. Love the attack by this team. Inside out game is on point right now. Hayward. Gasby will pick him up. Irving in the lane. Oh, count at the foul. Six the difference on the scoreboard. Boston the ball in the league. Splitting the defense, kicking it to the corner, getting an assist, and Brown gets a three. It all started with Kyrie Irving split two. 37-43. Yeah. It's a four-point game. Horford off the catch. Knocks down a two. I love the volume of those two playing two-man game right now. Horford. A couple of fakes. Gets two. Yeah, this is a big concern for Brad Stevens, just the inconsistency of this team playing at front. But that is what you need to do when like, offense starts going sideways. Just run Kyrie Alhor for two-man game. Good things will happen. Irving. Oh. Not sure how he did that. Kyrie goes to the bucket for two. This is the 12th time in the last 15 games the Celtics have allowed a 35-point or more quarter. Coach, about the intensity level in the first half, he said we had it in spurts. Consistency and shot selection we can be better at. Kyrie is going to get a chance for a three-point play here. Gasol will take a three. Nope. Tatum with it. Irving in stride. Buries it. And a quick timeout is taken by Memphis. Irving. Jackson trying to defend him right now. That's a really good job. Horford, though, buries a three from the corner. Bail the Celtics out. Tied at 68. Irving. Leans, count it, foul. Kyrie Ky Irving has been aggressive and dominant. Irving answers on the other end. So, hops for the fall away. A little wild with that rebound. Baines gets it quickly into Kyrie's hand. Seven rebounds in the game for Baines off the bench. Kyrie for three. Kyrie has 13 points in the quarter here with five still to play. Dick Life was the updated numbers. <laughs> five of six shooting threes. Aka Smart is. The man is on fire. Casby, no. Rebound control by. Kyrie pushing it hard up the court. Keeps on going. Kicks it to the corner. Rozier knocks it down. We talk about Gasol and Conley. Those two have a big impact so far. Irving for three. Noah rejected by Baines. Picked off by Brown. Ahead to Kyrie. To the basket. For two. That was sweet, Mike. Went up strong last minute. Flipped it to the left hand on the right side. That was unbelievable. Is Kyrie going to score 30 to 40 for the Celtics to win games? Not all the time. He definitely had an aggressive mindset in that third. But he can also have, you know, someone else could have stepped up. It's just that Kyrie had that mindset. I don't think he has to be like that every night. Nor do I think that he's out there getting his and, and not trying to get other people involved. No, I'm not saying he's that. Yeah. Horford from the top of the key. That's a big three. Kyrie. Oh, 360. Man. Oh, man. <laughs> Most players would get dizzy if they did this. He, he, he spun him like a top, Mike. By the way, the last two games, Kyrie has 59 points and 28 assists. Yes, 59 and 28 in the last two. Irving. Now he's got Conley in the switch. Back and forth with the dribble. Drives, pulls up. Two. They go up there so soft. Smart. Knocks it down. Irving comes up 
shooting a three. He got it. Wow. 38 for Kyrie. Let's time run out, and Boston continues their home winning streak. We welcome you to Atlanta and State Farm Arena for our showcase night featuring the Hawks' John Collins. And what a night to feature him. Guess who's in town? It's none other than the Boston Celtics. For the second time this year and the third time in the season series, the Celts and the Hawks go head to head. Alex Lent has checked in for Dubman. Pick and roll, and it's Trey finding a way to get that bounce pass. Then Alex got turned around, found it, and dunked it. 22 13. Well, the Hawks are doing a good job of exposing the interior defense of the Celtics. Morris. And this is what keeps the Celtics in games when they're struggling and, of course, puts teams away late. That's their three-point shooting. They are number three in the league in makes and attempts and sixth in three-point percentage. Kyrie, one hands it up and in. And, of course, last week we saw in the news you surprised a couple of students with Super Bowl tickets. Were they excited to get the tickets or were they just excited to meet you? Oh, they were more excited. You know, they were, they were excited for both, but I think they were more excited for the Super Bowl tickets. That's a once-in-a-lifetime experience. Yes, meet Ludacris is cool. Kyrie moving in. Oh, count the basket off the window and a bump from Prince. And he started out the three-point play. He started out slow in this quarter, but now he's starting to pick it up. Stripped by Prince, picked up by Kyrie, back to Tice. End of the shot clock, three is good. Jeremy Lin works that pick and roll with Deadman. And again, good look, but no points. It remains 11. Kyrie for three. Oh, this guy here. His second three-pointer of the night gives him 11. And the Celtics have cut it back to eight. Rougier flips it ahead to Kyrie Irving. Takes Trey right to the baseline. Man, there's nothing you can do about that. If you don't double him in that situation, he's going to kill you every time. DeAndre off the glass. Now clearing. Kyrie in transition. Oh, Flips man. it up and oh, in. Man. You just don't know how he's going to get the shot off, but he finds a way. Well, again, there's just no defense for that kind of shot. Kyrie. Automatic. A 20-point first half. Kevin to Trey. The long one is good. Trey's first three-pointer of the night. He's now one of four from distance. Hawks again by 10. Kyrie taking a deep one. And drills it. You think you can shoot it long, Trey? How about this one? <laughs> oh, oh. That's, that's ridiculous. Smart back to Kyrie. He was perfect five for five in the second quarter. And hits the three-pointer here for 26. Kyrie comes down with it. Drives, lays it up. Tatum puts it in. Almost missed that. Jason Tatum with 13, 76 71. Here's Trey getting in the paint, keeps it away from Kyrie and lays it up. Nice drive by Trey Young, 89 78. Bounce ahead to Ojale. And Collins fouls him and turns it into a three point play. And that will be foul number four on John. Tough foul there by John Collins. Jeffrey's pass is picked off by Rogier. Nine Rogier. points for Rogier. Quick hands there. Gets the steal. Brown for the lead. Three pointer. Timeout Atlanta. Jalen Brown with 10. And the Celtics have the lead for the first time since it was 3-2. to two. Here comes Kyrie, and he sneaks it in under the arm of Collins. He's good off the dribble. There's no defense for that. That's just good, crafty basketball. Quick move there by Kyrie Irving. Kyrie Irving wants to go one-on-one -on -one here. Dembry. Right, Kyrie slips, recovers, throws it up and in. Oh, man, come on. That's ridiculous. <laughs> oh, wow. 32 for Kyrie. It's a beautiful Saturday night in downtown Boston as we have one of the marquee matchups of the NBA's entire regular season. 
A sold out crowd at the TD Garden as the two time defending champion Golden State Warriors make their lone regular season visit and they're coming in playing great basketball as they face off against the Boston Celtics. Steph Curry always on the road a mob scene they come to watch the warm ups. This is the usual picture for Curry before a road game and tonight he's up against one of the premier players in the NBA, Kyrie Irving, who has been just spectacular recently for the surging Boston Celtics. Curry back door, left hand, can't go. The Irving Curry matchup, as good as it gets at the point guard position. Al Horford. But that's the tough cover for a traditional center as people play five out more and more. Cousins instinct is to come to penetration and Horford spotting up behind the three-point line. Marcus Smart with a beautiful finish over contested hands. The glue guys in Draymond Green and Al Hoffett both struggled at times with put pressure on it on the team when they began to play their best basketball was when both guys got in better shape and got healthy. Irving from way downtown knocks down the three for his first bucket. He has been on some tear of the last four games, shooting 60% and averaging just under 31 a game. Irving takes a step back off the one foot. Al Horford the rebound, back out to Irving. He's gonna try again, hits a three. Nice feed inside, Horford. Sweet pass from Kyrie Irving. And Steve Kerr wants an early timeout. Horford left open. Thompson triple team knocked out of his hands. Irving for three. Spectacular finish by Kyrie. All right, we got to stop with this. He's play, He's been there three games. They played three injured teams. <laughs> Curry can, can gets we inside. Stop giving him credit for everything. Like he's played okay so far. Irving pull up jumper. Got it. Fifteen for Irving. Irving way downtown. Horford the rebound. Back out, another three. Ball tipped up and in by Kyrie Irving. Irving on the drive. Going to have to force it up. Gets it off in time and knocks it down. 19 points for Kyrie Irving. Irving shoves it over to Tatum. Tatum for three. Horford bringing it up the floor. Finds Marcus Smart, who just couldn't quite get a handle. Irving gets it back into Horford. Boy, a broken play turns into a wide open dunk for the Celtics. Irving, left handed, too strong, gets his rebound. Falling away, rolls in. To me, if you're the Celtics right now with this Warrior lineup on the floor, when I have the basketball, you're going to see a steady diet of high screening roll with Kyrie Irving putting DeMarcus Cousins in the action. Thompson. Stolen by Hayward. Irving back for Horford. Puts up a three. Knocks it down. The lead cut to one. Got to convert back with the same energy on defense as that you're playing with on offense. Well, he comes back this in. Count it and the foul and a chance to tie the game. Chance of MVP for Kyrie Irving. He has been on a sensational tear recently. Irving for three. Kyrie Irving dribbles the three-pointer. And Steve Kerr immediately calls timeout. It's back to a two-point game. Irving drives inside left-handed. Banks it home. And the foul. Tie game and a free throw coming up. Durant against Morris in the lane. Foul. Irving. Inside to Horford. Horford layup is good. Beautiful pass for Irving from his 10th his assist. Durant fouled on the three-point attempt. The crowd doesn't like it, but Horford nodded his head. Iguodala guarding Irving. Drives inside. Scoop shot. Banks it home. Oh, what a shot from Irving. A magician with the ball. Durant in and out. Irving lost it. Got a little too fancy that time. And Iguodala picks it up. Back to Clay Thompson for three. Puts it in. Clay Thompson, a big three pointer. And Golden State goes up by three. Seven to shoot. Morris, double team. Back out smart. Three pointer. Bang! Mark 
Make a start from downtown to tie the game. Thompson on the drive. Layup. No good, but a foul. If you, if you don't call that, that's like New Orleans and the Rams pass interference, letting that go. Morris for three. Green the rebound. And they've got to foul him right away with 8.6 remaining. Morris with a great look. Misses them both. And Green gets the rebound. Back out to Curry. And they foul Steph Curry. They lob it into Smart. Smart back out Kyrie Irving. Launches a three. Hits the rim. Shot won't go. Iguodala the rebound. And that'll do it. The Warriors win their 10th in a row. All right, thanks a lot, Michelle. You know, there's something about that first Sunday in February with the Boston Celtics hosting a game at home and the New England Patriots playing for another Super Bowl championship that just feels and seems kind of normal here in the New England area. And that's the scene set once again. A lot of TB12 jerseys and Gronkowski jerseys on hand today as the Celtic host, the hottest team in the NBA right now, OKC. And we are underway. Now, I'm watching both teams steal. here today. We have two of the best teams at forcing turnover. Oklahoma City number one, and then Boston in the top five. Al Horford with the mid-range jumper along two. Well, you know you have to close him down because he'll take that jump shot every single time. Horford on the pick and pop. Back out to Kyrie Irving. Yes. Kyrie Irving shooting this year is just fantastic. He's right at 50% from the field with 18 shot attempts a game. He's shooting over 41% and then 85 on the line. Irving went around the world. Oh, what a shot! Well, we showed you coming in up at the top of the show. This guy is a master of offensive moves. He can play with his back to the basket, going to the rim, foul line dying, lefty or righty, shoots the three. He has all kinds of offensive plays. Kyrie in his bag. Well, that's the story with him. If you're going to trap him, trap him. You just can't go at him and allow him to split you. Boston has numbers off the shooter miss. Tice. Had the whole freeway down the lane. Well, that's because Noel was down the floor and he picked up Irving, who was out in front. And naturally, his man was the open man. Kyrie's got out, numbers. Out. Tatum on the break. When he's in the game, Tatum's in the game. Anytime there's a missed shot or a forced turnover, he will be the first guy out across half court. He'll do he does it night in and night out. Brown left alone. And he oh, makes boy. the Thunder pay with the three. Talk about confidence. Last wow. time, we think about it. Christmas time and that, struggling yeah. in that. All of a sudden, a month later, he's got it all together. Yeah, he's a different guy, Coach. A little two-man game with Horford and Tatum. Great cut by Kyrie oh, for the layup. Wow, off glass. Now, how about that off glass? Now, come on. Everyone says, oh, you're always talking about him in off glass. Well, that, that was a spectacular shot. Unfortunately, we missed it at the other end. <laughs> Terrence Ferguson says, hey, watch me. Hey, Ferguson, we told you now, very, very improved three-point shoot. Nine points, and Kyrie adding two more to his total. Under four minutes to go. Ah, oh, nice spin. Couldn't get it, and look who's there. Kyrie Irving yeah. had his teammates back. And Kyrie Irving did that in between two blue shirts. All right. Irving with look a nice that. jump stop. Goes glass again. 18 you, I, points. I just enjoy watching him play. Seven point lead. Smart inside for uh, Irving. Now there was a great pass. See, Mark, uh, Smart doesn't get a lot of credit, but he is their like second best assist guy. Okay, when you look at it, he can he can get the in traffic. He can make the play. Westbrook at the half was two for nine. Now he must get more involved in the points. But most of all, I want to see them play better defense. And if you're going to trap. Will you please pick up the roll, man, and then make the next rotation? Well, they didn't make it out to Horford in time, Coach, and he made it hurt. Irving with the mid-range pull-up on the baseline. Yeah, this is Oklahoma City, the number three defensive-rated team in the NBA, and uh, they gave up 59% from the field in that first half, so they're going to have to do better at the defensive end here in the second half. Grant on cue, stripped by Irving. Nice, nice, nice play. Well, he's good size. He's a whippet, the way he's built. And the fact that he can guard, and now that he can make a high percentage in threes. 
A big addition for them. Horford with the jump hook inside. The lead is up to nine. An 11 nothing run. The hook is never going to leave basketball, okay? <laughs> Irving against Schroeder off the screen. Snakes by Adams. The whole package on display for Uncle Drew. When you play him, it's so difficult because he can stop on the dime, like you just said, and then he can do that fade away and hit the shot, no matter what the angle. Getting in the stance there, too, and teeing up Schroeder. Almost got the steal. Schroeder out front with 10 on the shot clock now. Come on, come on. You. On the drive-by and got the layup. You know, he said, shh, shh, shh. <laughs> He went just like that because he heard it. He said, I know exactly what I'm going to do. I'm going to blow by this big guy. Really finding his way here in Oklahoma City. Playing the first four years of his career in Atlanta. Tice from deep. Why not? The reigning threes. Remember now, Boston is third in makes and third in attempts on offensive foul. Rozier from the elbow. Off glass. And that was such a beautiful play to watch because of Irving looking for him and making the pass. Kyrie against Schroeder. Pocket pass to Horford. All right. Now, you see what happened there? He got the switch, and then they got Adams up to double team. And once he double teamed, that opened up the big man. It was great. Smart, guarded by George. Bullet pass yeah. inside for the layup. Boy, Kyrie Irving doing damage in the paint on layups here today. Irving against Schroeder. Going to work with it. The step back. Got it. That's clutch time. We yeah. showed you the clutch time numbers. Now, yeah, see the spin move? That yeah, forearm went out and got a piece of Schroeder and moved it back and got the fade away. Oh, wow. Now, Tatum got loose underneath. Yeah, loose. Look, it could have been a foul, you know, with the ball out of bounds uh, because that was almost a wrestling match trying <laughs> for him to get open. Ferguson switches on to Kyrie, dancing with it. Good double team, and yeah. Russell Westbrook gets oh, the steal on, you got, to you two on one. George for three. Westbrook kept it alive. And it's going to be a loose ball foul underneath against Moore senior Russell Westbrook apparently shot out of a cannon when high and that foul actually going to go against the Celtics Kyrie Irving Westbrook makes it a two-point nice. contest 45.9 to go neither team with a foul to give both teams with a two timeouts remain Horford back good to Kyrie good recovery by Adams five to go oh. on the drive by got all the way to the paint and the lefty falls. Oh. Now, he took, now that that was incredible. Big thing here right now is your philosophy. You go for a three. You go for a two. You score quickly, and then you score quickly. You get into the defense and force them to call timeout. Oh, they're going Up for the, the three. three ball. Brent, yes, nice. and it's a one point contest. Don't assume they're going to call timeout now. They're not calling timeout. They've got get two your left. Man. It's a one-point game here. Full-court pressure. They trap Tatum, okay. and Tatum fouled on the play. Tatum misses the second loose ball. OKC can tie with a two or win it with a three. Westbrook lost the handle a little bit too fast, and he turned it over with 7.4 to go. A cataclysmic turnover for Westbrook. Down by four with 7.4 to go. Grant gets it. They go for a quick two and a foul called, stopping the clock with 5.2 to go, sending Westbrook to the line. Now, you remember, you must hit the rim. You must hit the rim. And he didn't. And he did not. Do you believe it? We see it happen so many times, Hubie Brown. So many times players forget that they have to hit the rim or else it's a side out. Well, I'm glad that we brought that up. Okay. <laughs> hey, uh, you, you hate to see it. It doesn't happen often, but the ball must hit the rim. Now tonight at the United Center, the Bulls go for three in a row. They come off a scintillating win in Orlando last night. And a big part of that was Otto Porter Jr. Tonight, the test, one of the East best, the 37 and 22 Boston Celtics. Horford 
Jumper splash. Now, I still think Al Horford is the key for this team. He's the stabilitator. He just stabilizes this team. And there's Horford again. And that's a tough cover for Robin. Kyrie Irving races in with a left hand and scores Kyrie underneath the Chris. He can score with either hand effectively. Otto Porter off the dribble. Kyrie rate the rebound in. Irving. That's oh, good. That's a three. He just caught that in one motion shot. It. Well, he pitched the ball ahead in the backcourt and then came off a of fist side action. Little side screen by Horford. Kyrie Irving against Lopez. A little fake and he can handle and scores. Yeah, he's one of the better one on one players in the league. Maybe and the best. <laughs> he can get buckets in a hurry. Irving into the traffic, shoveled to Tice and he dumped the ball. A nice pass by Irving. One time he kind of got lost in traffic. Kyrie Irving back out there. Whips one Tatum. Oh, a two-hand flush. And he's, he's back cutting guys right now. You've got to keep him in front of you. Kyrie Irving, nowhere to go. Morris, up and good. Marcus oh, Morris. Right there. Marcus Morris. Back is seven for ten. Three for four. Ooh. As Irving drives, scores, and draws a foul. Let's talk about a shot maker. Kyrie with another floating drive. I'll tell you, he's fun to watch. Here's Kyrie wow. splashes in a three, trying to keep his team within shouting distance. Got it down deep. Kyrie with a tough shot. He made it. He's going to come in here in the second half and impose his will on whoever guards him. And now, and now, Neil, with the Bulls with this lead, you can't take your foot off the gas pedal. You've got to continue to do the things that got you this lead. Horford three. And that's what Stacy talked about early in the game, his versatility. 31 for Levine with 6.43 left in the fourth. Kyrie Irving slithers inside. Levine in attack mode. Stops, pops, in and out. No good. Well. That went way down in and jumped up. Tice puts one in. And Jim Boylan gets a timeout. Tice underneath goes up scores. Tice got good hands. Irving. Long three and knocked it in. Ooh. 94 86. Took Levine into the post. They couldn't get it to him. Now they do. He runs in, shot up and good. That kind of gamble went for that steal. Didn't come up with it. Here's Horford, and that won't fall. Batted around and picked up by Kyrie. And 111-98 with 433 left. Irving now with 24. Make that 26 points. Irving driving. And a whistle on a foul. Maybe on Zach. Marketing with 33. Irving to answer. Irving now has reached 30. I mean, so, no, and well, you think you want Marketing, and here's Kyrie running in. How did he get that Irving shot off? Off shots. Over a seven footer. And he's driving oh, yeah. a score by Irving, and he'll get to the free throw line. I mean, if he really, really wants to take over games, I mean, there's oh, not anybody goodness. to stop it. There's Kyrie knocked to the deck by Lopez. And slow to get up. Good win for the Bulls. Morris pokes in a three. And that's going to do it, Neil. They can drive home safe in Chicago. Beep, beep. Bulls get it in. Game over. And the Bulls up in the Celtics. 126 to 116. Kyrie Irving set to lead the Celtics in the first of three straight home games coming up for Boston. Marcus Smart fighting a flu bug, but he's going to give it a go tonight. He better be ready because that's De'Aaron Fox and Buddy Heel coming in behind him. This is an explosive Sacramento team, and they'll take on the Celtics next. Tatum knocks down a jump shot. Well, they show them must be okay. Yeah, let's hope so. Kyrie's got healed now defensively. Works him off the dribble and buries the shot. And turns the corner. Kyrie with his first two of the night. Neil trying to work on Morris. Kyrie with the
the hustle play. Boy, he kept ending up with the biggest player on the floor. Tatum for two. Made a nice move like he was going to run to the three-point line. Then ducked back into the baseline and gets two. Double-digit lead. Kyrie has it blocked from behind, but Heald's going to be called for a foul. Between the legs, into the paint. Irving buries the jumper. Well, there's the guy that's going to get us back in the game in the half-court offense. Kyrie for two. I'll tell you, this guy is some player, boy. Kyrie comes back the other way and spins it home. And going at Fox. And going at Hill. Irving for two. Fox looking to penetrate. Can't bank at home. Loose ball picked off the floor by Kyrie in overdrive. First for two. What a beautiful play by Kyrie. They're going to score it. Go Goaltending the call. Kyrie, great hands. Oh, wow. Just terrific hands in catching that ball. He moved with the crossover. Missed the basket. Kyrie ahead to Tatum for two. It's a one point game. Isaiah just back from that hip injury, off season hip surgery. He had his moments in a few games playing for the Nuggets, but with the Nuggets going into the playoff stretch, Mike Malone has said Isaiah is out of the rotation. Isaiah and the Nuggets are here at the TD Garden on Monday. They sure are. They're a very good basketball team that nobody talks about too much. Collie Stein. Gets it to Barnes. Barnes misses the layup. Baines for two on the other end. Hustle play by Baines to get out in front of their defense. Bagley misses. Kyrie the other way. Well, they got Horford on Bagley, so uh, that's good. Haywood looking for a little room. Gives it up instead to Kyrie. Knocks it down. Irving now with 24. So, that makes it 106-103. Uh-oh, Irving got free and now Fox recovers. One eleven, one oh three. 103 Yalitza had it slapped away. He thought he was fouled. He doesn't get the whistle. Now it's Irving. We've seen that before. Well, this is what makes the Celtics team so tough. If, if they play teams really tough. Well, right now, Kyrie Irving with 30 points. They try to, as you said, get the ball out of his hands. Make someone else beat you. And Morris hits the big three, Doug. Yeah. And the Kings had an 80-67 to 67 lead with seven and a half remaining in the third quarter. And since then, it's 49 to 25 Boston. Make that 51 to 25. Welcome to Philadelphia. Three weeks to go in the NBA's regular season. And we're at the Wells Fargo Center tonight to kick off a terrific doubleheader. This evening it starts with the 76ers and the Boston Celtics. The Wells Fargo Center will be packed because they love their Sixers and they hate their opponent tonight, the Boston Celtics. And both teams still with plenty to play for with 11 games to go in the NBA's regular season. You mentioned the starting five for Philadelphia. It's the single most productive five-man unit. They just haven't played all that many minutes together, but this is a brilliant starting five that Brett Brown is working with. Sixers did play last night. They won in Charlotte as Irving tries again and knocks down another. He only had 40 in the last time. Well, he's going to read what the defense gives him, and Joel Embiid had switched on to him. To be honest with you, 
Joel was giving him a cushion. I still thought he might attack off the bounce, but instead he gives him a nice good look from the perimeter. Embiid goes right at Horford again, falls down. Harris right there, can't get it to fall, gets his own rebound, blocked by Tatum. Ahead now to Horford. Horford runs into Reddick. And they let him play on. Reddick took a shot and is slow to get up. I think one thing to watch tonight for, for Philadelphia, and you just saw it on the last possession as Morris gets into his mid-range. Blocking foul called on Reddick. The basket will count at one. Irving, a little floater goes up. Soft touch from Kyrie Irving. He's got 10 points already, and Brett Brown wants to talk it over, Doris. How good is Kyrie Irving? Put such pressure. They're up six. He's off to a tremendous start. Irving setting up perfectly to Aaron Baines. Boy, Kyrie Irving has his fingerprints all over this basketball game. Out of the gate, scoring it, and that time making it easy on Aaron Baines. Irving. Falls away, 12 points already for Irving. We still have four minutes to go in the first. You, you talk about elusiveness, why the why Kyrie Irving doesn't live at the free throw line. That little fadeaway he does, Mike, he, he just is so elusive to the contact. Horford steps out. What what nice rhythm and two-man game these two guys have. They just, there's such great chemistry between Al and Kyrie. Irving gets inside, banks it off the glass. Shot clock at six. Irving was sensational in that first quarter. Goes right at Embiid, falling down, throws it up and draws the foul. Brett Brown and about 20,000 here, very upset, as is Embiid. And I, I believe we've got a technical foul call on Brett Brown as well. Let's check in with Cassidy. Yeah, Mike, and I also asked him about the seamless transition. It says, you know, I've been traded a lot before, so I kind of know the type of energy you have to go into a new situation with and also just understanding the personnel. And he also said that he had a vision about how he was going to affect this group in the right way uh, before coming over here. Like Nostradamus vision? <laughs> Meanwhile, Irving with the block shot. Irving again isolated with Embiid on the perimeter. Drives, gets inside, layup, banks at home. Sensational move from Irving. Come on now, how are you gonna guard that? Irving goes back door, tried to draw a foul, and a late whistle and a call. Jimmy Butler. Butler just one for eight tonight, and 0 for four from downtown. Kyrie Irving stops on a dime, jumper's good, and lead back to 10, timeout Philly. Simmons on Kyrie Irving. Irving, nice pass, Horford wide open, can't get it to go, Irving right there. Irving's been on a nice rebounding stretch. That's his eighth rebound of the game to go with 27 points. Celtics haven't scored in four minutes. Irving, and here's the end of that drought. Boston back up one. Simmons guarding Irving, Kyrie Irving falling away. That's good, tough shot. If he has a signature shot, it's probably that right there, that little fade. Irving spins inside. And a foul call on Embiid. That's going to be his fourth. Irving, that's a three. Kyrie Irving answers back. He's got 36. Butler on the drive, gets inside, lays it up and in. Great play by Jimmy Butler. No Marcus Smart. No Bulldog defensive player to make the stops. Irving back to Horford. Horford for three. Ties the game. Al Horford comes right back, and we're even as we approach two minutes remaining. Butler inside to Harris for the slam. Jimmy Butler making play after play. They put the ball in his hands late, might almost, almost exclusively. Tatum off the dribble, gets inside, layup is good. Oh, sweet move from Tatum, and the game is tied again. Simmons, foul, count it, and one. Ben Simmons with a chance for a three-point play. Perfect free throw there. Timeout, Boston. Irving on the drive, gets past him inside, blocked by Embiid. Morris the rebound, puts it up, shot short, Embiid the rebound. They don't have to foul, there's about a, three seconds, a little over three seconds difference, shot clock and game clock. Butler backing in, backing in against Irving, five to shoot. Lost the ball, picks it back up, jump shot, it's good! Butler drills it with 4.7 remaining. They're the 
Sixers go up by five. It is Authentic Fan Friday here at the TD Garden, and Aaron Baines is the poster child for tonight. <laughs> He's also in the starting lineup along with Al Horford as the Celtics get ready their biggest game of the season against the Pacers is next. Kyrie knocks down a three. Baines open, misses the shot, rebound controlled by Horford. Celtics get a second opportunity. Over the top, they find Kyrie. Nice pass, good look by Horford. Turner misses the jumper, pulled down by Tatum. To Kyrie along the baseline, goes behind the back, the fall away. Oh. Well, they got the right guy. He's a remarkable talent, that kid. Morris for two. That was a terrific shot. Irving doesn't miss a three. Bogdanovich uses the screen. Rebound to Baines. Boy, they're setting those screens and they're getting within 15 feet shooting jumpers. Horford with his head down. Count it the foul. Kyrie to the basket for two. Well, we want to see a whole bunch more of that type of situation. Take it to the rim. Collis in the crossover. Lays it down. Boston comes up with it. Irving, pull up. Two. Go to it, my man. Collison misses a three. Irving was up the floor in a hurry. Smart finds him, and he knocks down a three. Boston by six. 17 in the game now for Kyrie. Comes up, shoot, and it's going to get three. Collison the foul. Young keeps on going to the basket, can't score. Picked off by Smart. Leaves it for Kyrie. Oh, what a pass! Beautifully done. That was just terrific. Baines going to the basket. What a thunder dunk! 11 and 9, the numbers for Baines. Looking at a double double here tonight. Kyrie. Oh. That's not fair. Kyrie kicks it back. Horford will try again. Knocks that one down. Tied at 87. Kyrie. Irving. To the basket. Guy grabbed his shape from behind and everything. Irving. Fall away. And Nate McMillan is really unhappy with that call. Yeah, well, they, they fouled him about uh, three times before he took the shot. Irving. Goes by Collison. Gets two. Wow. Just a remarkable that he can do that whenever he feels like it. Brown. Right up on Bogdanovich. Kyrie got a hand in there, gets the loose ball to Smart. You gotta call a foul! Underneath Young, yes! 1-12 apiece. Into Horford, he's got plenty of running room. Looking to make a deal to somebody else, namely Kyrie. Irving. Irving to the basket, Irving got it! Five tenths of a second to go! Pick and roll. They try to double Kyrie. He worked his way out of it. Once he gets going, you ain't stopping him. Oh, there's a nice fake there. It took Young out of the play. And Kyrie gets a layup. I'll tell you, I, this guy is some competitor. Evans looking, looking, looking. Gets it over. McDermott did not get the shot off in time, and Boston wins the basketball game. Good evening, everyone from Boston, and welcome to game two in this best of seven first round series in the Eastern Conference. It's the fifth seeded Indiana Pacers and the fourth seeded Boston Celtics. The Celtics have one game to none.
The East has the number two in three seeds tied at one in their respective series. The top seed Milwaukee Bucks try to go to 2-0 on NBA TV tonight against Detroit. As do the Celtics here against the Pacers in the Garden. Kyrie Irving. Good shot. Had the room in game one. Kyrie had 20 points, five rebounds, and seven assists for the seed. The try inside by Bogdanovich. It was tapped. Some good defense in there by Boston. James with the block shot on Bogdanovich. Outside Tatum aligns for three. These are just transition fast break buckets that Nate McMillan did a good job in the first half. Only two fast break points in game one. 22 fast break points in the second half for the Seas. Outside Baines, who's three. Good! Aaron Baines puts in a triple. And the regular season saw him shooting 34% from outside. Irving a three. That is good. What a start to this one. And he got the switch he wanted with Thaddeus Young on that drag screen and roll action. Collison is tailed there, knocked away by Kyrie Irving. The other way they go on a three on two into Brown. Irving gets the assist, got the steal, and Brown will finish it well. Irving came up with the steal and created that fast break. We saw a lot of this in that third quarter for the Celtics. Brown was very fortunate to get that ball back from Kyrie. Bad pass from Brown to Kyrie. Kyrie did a good job of saving it, get the ball back to Brown for the lay-in. Now they got uh, a little bit of a mismatch here. Irving smells it, goes into the taller, less quick Sabonis, and got the two. Good. Pretty read and a good shot by Kyrie Irving. Good D by Sabonis. Just greater offense by Kyrie Irving. Turner, three. Hayward. Irving. Kyrie takes it the other way. He's got seven. Here's a three. Tatum puts in another one. Jason Tatum with a great stroke right there. Give him two threes. He's got six. Morris. And Rozier with a disappointing season after the great starring role he played last year in the playoffs. Tyree. Got it. Pretty shot by. Kyrie Irving. He's in double figures now with 10. Shot clock at nine. Fade away. Good. Oh, that was a sweet move by Kyrie Irving. Layoff Kyrie has shown up here in these first two ball games. Stripped of the ball, keeps it alive. Young, Bogdanovich, Joseph free to fire from three. With the rebound taken by Terry Rozier and out to Kyrie Irving. He'll accelerate and stop on a dime. Or not many guys can do that, but he can hit the brakes and hits the deuce. Did you see how fast he was going wow. and able to stop <laughs> instantly? He hit the brakes. <laughs> wow. Here's the switch. You gotta keep Kyrie in front. Boy, stops and stops and stops and oh, stops. Man. Jab steps and puts it up and in. All you can do is shake the man's hand because the bigs are doing what they're supposed to do. And they're staying in front of Kyrie. Yep. He is just making a very difficult shot. Look at the footwork here by Kyrie. Look at him. And the handles. I mean, look at uh, Thaddeus Young. You can't play him any better than that. Game clock and shot clock one winding down the first half. Bogdanovich will defend. Irving is in. The drive, the floater. Cut it. Good shot by Kyrie Irving. Irving will take it with a nice slashing move for two. Give him 20. Collison now feeling himself tonight with his offense. Something he did not have early on. It's Tatum getting it from Irving. Nice two on two. And a timeout taken by the Pacers. Kyrie dancing. Matthews there. Aggressive defense. But look at the try. The guy The speed of Kyrie Irving. He is so low to the floor with those handles. I mean, you try to reach, he teaches, and then he's quick enough to get around anyone and get all the way to the cup. Approaching two to play in the third. I think this is going to be all Kyrie the rest of this game out for the Celtics. Over McDermott, he got it, and you got it with a good call. You felt it, Kyrie with a little wink at Reg. Kyrie's got 25. Knocked away with the charging Rozier doing the splits. Evans, three on two, the middle step inside. Knocked away with some great Boston defense. Ahead it goes. Down to Rozier from Horford. Irving, three. Good! Wow! What a stroke! All Kyrie here from here on out. Thaddeus Young. 
15 points in the crowd. Battling here, grinding and turning and not scoring. Pacers this quarter, three points in over five minutes. That's it. Would that be considered the leprechaun on the rim as we've heard so many times? Would be Irving. One point game on the triple by Kyrie. 31. The score rotation to Matthews. The pump and the drop. Both of the rebound. Irving for the lead of three. The last six for the Celtics. Matthews defends. Irving is a machine. 36 points. I mean, he is willing the Celtics right now. No answer defensively here for Indiana on Kyrie. Kyrie Irving with a turn and away, but there was a foul before it was launched. Two point game here. Irving has the last nine points for Boston. But down to the choking triple. Big shot. Lead for the Pacers. Mi floppy action, misdirection to find Bogdanovich a wide open three. And now the Pacers back-to-back -back threes have recaptured the lead here. Here comes Hayward. Step back, Bogdanovich. Again. That's a great shot by Hayward. It's a two, but it puts Boston back on top by one. Shot clock at four. Bogdanovich three. It's good! Another three! And the Pacers by two. Crossover, Bogdanovich. Great play by Horford. He knocked the ball away. Here comes Brown. Foot race with Collison. Outside it goes. Tatum three. Good. Creating offense from your defense for the Celtics. Young back to Matthews. Off the glass. No rebound by and you don't need to foul here. About a six second difference, game clock and shot clock. Irving quickly double. Tatum again. Underneath, wide open is Hayward. Boston by three with 12 seconds to play in regulation. Oh, turnover. Now it's a, turn, uh, a timeout here by Brad Stevens. Don't e you don't even get a look at the basket here. Welcome to Brooklyn, opening night. And there is legitimate buzz in this borough. Who doesn't like a free t-shirt? Nighttime, it's prime time. And the Nets opening up their season tonight against the Minnesota Timberwolves. Brooklyn Nets basketball is back on yes. Time the Nets are opening against a Western Conference team since 09, and it was Minnesota. Lavert, bottom, a three. Good way to get things started. And that's a big aspect to his game. I know for Carl Anthony Towns to take that next step, it's going to have to be some post play. It rims in for Kyrie Irving. Brown, big shot, no. Cleared by Prince. If he would have made that, I would have said something about what he started. <laughs> Kyrie Irving, pull up, jump. Bottom for three. And you're going to have to be up on Kyrie at all points in time. Any pick and roll, that's what he does best. He gets into that pick and roll and is able to stop and pop him pretty much anywhere. Irving, attack mode for two. There is nothing that that young man cannot do in transition. When he sees one or even two players back there, he feels like he has the advantage. Irving from Avenue K. Irving off the hesitation, squeezes inside for the impressive deuce. Irving off the spin, ball fake, big shot is good. Kyrie Irving on cue. Minnesota had made eight straight. Irving! Sizzling! Irving with a bullet feed. Levert trying to get involved. Gets the roll! The Nets have not been getting those kind of bounces so far tonight.
Irving. Nice move, slicing to the rim as he took it right into the chest of Carl Anthony Towns. 56-39, Minnesota. Irving breaks free. Oh! The spin master! Plus one! Kyrie Irving makes it look so easy, but it's the balance, it's the composure, and it's the strength. And he always has his eye on the rim, but that takes a whole lot of core strength to be able to contort his body the way he does on so many of these finishes. Bounce off, guys, take some contact, and still come away with the bucket. Carl Anthony Towns. Back door, Lavert hangs, and gets the roll. Karras Lavert, the athleticism. Right out of the gate. Prince gets his first bucket for Brooklyn, and the steal. Prince inside, he's fouled. So the Nets looking for some sort of catalyst here. Teague crosses over on Allen, and a step in by Laverta Steele. Harris right now is one on two, waiting for his teammates. Kyrie Irving, deep three, <laughs> got it! Kyrie from way downtown. 28 for Irving. Wiggins wants to set it up for Carl Anthony Towns. One on one with Allen. A follow, does it go? Covington, not to the outside. Here's Kyrie Irving. Leaves it for Harris. A three. Oh, yeah! The Nets have the lead. Joe Harris. Nets trying to go in front. Irving handles. Fade away. Got it! Kyrie Irving, the highest scoring game in a Nets debut. And a major highlight to do it. Irving, off the hesitation, goes to the left hand. Kyrie Irving, the magic man. Levert, the drive, the cutter. Kyrie Irving scores on the interior. Allen sets a screen for Irving. Teague sticks with him. Irving, the baseline drive. Behind the back, Jared Allen. Left hand, he gets the roll. 108 106. Allen with six points, six rebounds. That's with a chance to tie or take the lead. Irving for the lead. Oh, yeah! Splash Kyrie Irving! 37 points. Shot clock winding down. Wiggins, no. Graham grabs it. Rejected by Harris. Wiggins fills the lane, and he fills the bucket. 110 to 109, Minnesota. 142 to play. Irving throws it up. In and out. It almost went down. And Kyrie Irving will get three free throws. A chance to crack 40. Kyrie Irving, the first net to score 40 points in a season opener. Wiggins drives and scores. We're tied at 112. 127 left. Irving on a switch. He's got Grant. Irving. Oh, no. Oh, yes! The handles and the range for Kyrie Irving. He is putting on a show. Carl Anthony Towns lets it fly. It's a three. We are tied at 115. Fans on their feet at Barkley Center. <laughs> Tied at 115. Irving. Defended by T. Irving gets into it. The roll. Allen. No. Allen recovers and a foul. Basket won't count with 5.7 left. Rims out. Rebounded by Prince. He's blocked. And Minnesota has taken a timeout. Timberwolves looking for a win. Wiggins at the horn, off the mark, and we're going to overtime. Bonus basketball on opening night in Brooklyn. Irving, the blow by Kyrie Irving. 45 points in his Nets debut. Irving a three. He knew he missed it. Prince guides the ball back for Irving. Kyrie Irving buries it. Short memories. Prince, shot clock's winding down. Harris has to let it fly. Oh, Joe Harris got it. 
Wiggins, he gets the step to the rim. Nice touch. Andrew Wiggins puts the Timberwolves up by one. Wiggins using the screen. The cross and the bucket. Andrew Wiggins has put Minnesota up by three with 49 seconds to go in overtime. Nets have nothing going in this half-court set. Irvin trying to do it himself. He's fouled. A dazzling debut. Kyrie Irving has become the seventh net to score 50 points in a game in franchise history. Late game drama in Brooklyn in the season opener. Oh, we're going to go hero ball. Six seconds left in overtime. The Nets down by one. Irving lost his footing, regathers, <laughs> fires off the mark at the horn, and the Timberwolves win it in overtime. For New Orleans, Josh Hart, Brandon Ingram is in there, suffered a head injury in New Orleans, has lost Oklahoma City on Saturday night. Former net, Jaleel Okafor in the middle, Drew Holiday, and Lonzo Ball in the backcourt. For the Nets, Joe Harris, Torian Prince, Jared Allen gets the start in the middle. So that means that DeAndre Jordan will come off the bench. Allen making his fourth start of the season. Karis LeVert and Kyrie Irving. Here's Irving. The fadeaway, Kyrie Irving. Legitimate highlight from Kyrie. He's going against a two-time all-defensive player in Drew Holiday, and he makes it just look so easy. Takes his time, the step back, and just the fadeaway, and it just looks so effortless. Oh, no look. Harris on a backdoor feed from Kyrie Irving. Excellent five-out set there for the Nets, allowing that room to operate and cut back door. They expand it to Irving. Ball fake and pull up. Pure. Body up the floor, whips it to the outside. A oh, nice step in. Kyrie Irving the steal. Triggers it ahead. Lover turns the corner, spins it home, and a foul. Frank Jackson, yet another juke product on this New Orleans team, has checked in. Ball movement. Temple the rainbow three. Here's Irving, one on one with Holiday. 10 to shoot. Still 4.22 to play in the opening quarter. Irving forces his way in for the fade. Underrated part of Kyrie Irving's game, if there is one, his strength. Going again to the Detroit game, 15-point lead in the second half, and then whatever you want to call it, taking your foot off the gas, lethargic play, relaxing as Joe Harris gets the layup there. They open the window for Detroit to get back into the game. So Coach Atkinson, after that game and then earlier today, said he wants his team to play more competitively for longer stretches. Too many lapses during these games. Irving lines it up, buries it. Textbook form from Kyrie Irving. After a made basket, they waste no time, and Ingram too strong on a three. Tracked down by Ball. He thought Okafor would be underneath the basket, and instead, Allen was there. Irving speeds up. Corner pop, shooting practice. Lovehurt got a three. What a laser light pass. Great job by Karrison for getting deep in that corner, so it's hard to defend both. Irving, ball fake, uses the window perfectly. Kyrie Irving adds to the Brooklyn lead. Ingram side rim. And here come the Nets the other way with Irving leading it. Irving, jab, fade, money. <laughs> Kyrie Irving creating new moves. Hart fires, short on a three. Look out, Irving ahead. Dinwiddie will go upstairs for the two-handed jam. Irving, head to shoulder fake, penetration. Oh, Kyrie Irving to the rim. Tend to shoot for Levert. Again, he beats Holiday off the dribble. Irving. Oh, a deep three, Kyrie Irving. Levert steps into it. Off the rim, track down by Irving. Joe Harris off the slick feed, got it! Kyrie Irving keeps it alive, and Harris nails it from the outside. They've got their largest lead. Avert shovels it, Kyrie Irving elevating for two. And it's 84-72 Brooklyn. They have shaved eight points off the largest lead for the Nets. Get a quick deuce, and Kyrie Irving has 29 points. Kyrie Irving! The step back, Jay. 31 for Irving. Irving splits defenders and finishes at the rim. Kyrie Irving, another beautiful move. Irving, fancy dribbling, fade, book it. You want to know who's not human? 
That young individual right there. Irving comes to the ball. Off the stutter. Irving, fake, kick. Shot clock winding down. Lumford, bullseye for three. Irving on a bounce, sets up Allen. It's good and a foul. Irving, stutter step. Nice find. The throw flush. And a setup from Kyrie Irving. Crossover. Irving. Left hand. That's sweet. Irving. Oh, he's a sorcerer. Kyrie Irving with a triple. Let's have Kyrie Irving, Karis LeVert, DeAndre Jordan, Wilson Chandler, Rodion Skouros. Irving the pull up. Oh, looking smooth. Irving isolation with Hunter. Irving. Oh! How does he do it? Kyrie Irving. The ball handling skills are unmatched. And that's all with the offhand. Theo Pence is a... It's mind-blowing. Irving fakes out Goodwin. And a teardrop for Kyrie Irving. Irving. Kyrie Irving, the touch. High off the window. Irving, he's so decisive. Kyrie Irving, the fadeaway. Irving again. Kyrie Irving is a machine. Irving handles it. Picked up by Goodwin. Pull up jumper. Irving can't miss. What a way to end it. Do not go in there. Kyrie Irving in a hurry to forecourt. Seku Dubuya guarding him. Kyrie wide of the lane. That leaning high glass gun goes. But George, one of his favorite shots. Kyrie Irving lost the handle. Shot clock still with enough on it. And the long gun goes. Go ahead, Kyrie. Do your thing. We won't pass judgment. We'll just wait. Thank you. The way he's playing right now is far too much for Allen to handle. I hope Andre continues to be aggressive as an offensive player looking to score. Kyrie from the paint now has nine. Allen with a screen. Kyrie Irving with a triple. Pistons by 13, four seconds, three seconds till halftime. Harris hits from behind the long line with eight tenths of a second to play in the half. Starting the second half, Kyrie Irving scores for Brooklyn. The lead is now eight. Allen with a screen, Kyrie with a drive. Flipped up a prayer and it was answered. My goodness. He, he flipped it up trying to draw a foul. No shot for Kyrie Irving despite his protest. Now he fires from the wing and fills it. Look out, he's dangerous now. Kyrie Irving launches and connects. You're right, Gregory. Kyrie Irving with a shot from distance, drains it. He feels like he's going to make them all. So far, he has. Kyrie Irving whips it inside, and Nicholas Claxton able to slam it, his first scratch. Fans are starting to anticipate with speed. I mean, they were rising almost in unison until that shot missed. Kyrie steps back and guns it down. Inwoody and Kyrie Irving to the backcourt for Brooklyn. Kyrie Irving gets to the basket and lays it in. He lost everybody. Kyrie Irving against Langston Galloway. Kyrie Irving with that quick dribble. He rises and guns and it goes, rattle it home. Not much you can do about that. Lob deep in the paint for Irving, and he's able to score, and Brooklyn has taken the lead. He has 41, they lead 101 to 100. That should have been. Kyrie Irving goes to Jarrett Allen for a jam. That's a tough call, here's Kyrie Irving for three. Derek Rose with a rebound. Derek on the run, Langston Galloway lays it up. Swatted by Chandler, and this time they will call a goal tip. Look at six. Myers topside, it won't fall. Neither will the tap. Brooklyn leads by two. The basket by Wilson Chandler. Derek to the lane. Lost the ball. Kyrie Irving misses from distance. Rebound. Comes to Derek Rose. Derek to the basket. Lays it up. Lays it in with 1.9 to go in the game. Kyrie Irving for the win. No good. And we'll go to overtime in Detroit. Kyrie Irving to the basket. We're getting an Andre foul here at 17 in the third and 12 in the fourth. And now the first two points of overtime. 
Urban from the baseline. No, but a foul. Knocks the first free throw down. He has 44, and now 45. Bob inside for Jared Allen. It got there, and he jammed it. Shot clock at four. Allen with a jam. Kyrie Irving gets the scoring started with a three ball. Give and go. Perfection. Shot clock is winding down. He needs some help. Down to three. Down to two. Irving makes his move. And Irving finishes on a great cut to the rim. Irving on target. A three. Irving takes him on the baseline and banks it home. What a pretty play from Kyrie Irving. Intercepted by Levert. Levert, the strides, gives it up. Irving finishes. It is stuck on automatic for Kyrie Irving. Irving lines it up. Oh, he can't miss! Plus the foul. Kyrie Irving is a machine. He's not even hitting rim. Kyrie Irving, Harrison, all the way, he missed it. Whips it down the floor, and Kyrie Irving on a touchdown from Torian Prince. Irving is 9 of 9, a steal. Irving at the horn. Oh, Kyrie! He is not human. Irving lob. Allen jam, and the foul. The full throw extension. Kyrie Irving is scorching hot. Kyrie Irving, he is dominating. Irving, ball fake. Irving, money. Irving, one on one with Sadoransky. Irving, jumper, splash. White gets the step. Oh! It's the throw with the full palm. Oh, Kyrie! Irving, got it! Kyrie Irving is a one man wrecking crew. Is this for real? He's 17 of 18 from the field. Like a video game. Irving has 47. Irving. Oh, this is insane. It's the Kyrie Irving show. He's got 50. Lunging attempt will send Irving to the free throw line on the contact. Irving now with 52 points, and here a chance of MVP here at Barkley Center. Irving on the move. Irving the fade, gets the roll. Kyrie Irving has 54 points. And a strong offensive performance from the Brooklyn Nets. And welcome everyone to NBA Christmas Day, presented by State Farm from Boston. An unusually balmy day is what we usually expect. Very wet outside, a little bit of precipitation, but inside a great matchup. Brooklyn taking on Boston, a couple of contenders this year in the Eastern Conference. There's a great story she told me about KC. Tight game, big time moment. Larry said, goes to the bench. Casey's coach. He says, Larry just says, get me the ball and get out of the way. <laughs> and Casey says, sit down, Larry. And he says, now listen, guys, get the ball to Larry and get the heck out of the way. <laughs> <laughs> that's that's intelligence yes. and touch by the great yes. Casey Jones. True champion, twelve-time champ, Casey Jones. Thoughts and prayers go out to him and his family for God's cover. And Serenity. Pete Nash, uh, first time head coach there on the bench. He had a pre existing relationship with Kyrie Irving that he was telling us about a little bit earlier. Kyrie might not have called bank, but he knows the rims here. But Nash said that about six years ago, 
when Kyrie Irving was in New York City and Nash was living there, the two of them got together a few times and had some good workouts, and Kyrie picked his brain about basketball, so it gave Nash a nice head start on the job here. How about Kevin Durant? You know, we talk about his reach when he goes to release the shot as unguardable. Well, watch him close the space and get the challenge on Jason Tatum. Tremendous job defensively. Doris, we were talking about MVP candidates at the top of the before we came on air. And I'm shocked that he's not in the top three, even though he's in that next group. How many of those other three guys can guard like that that are above him? Well, I think, you know, he might have been higher if he weren't coming off an Achilles tear. Okay. Tear. And Luca, I think, is the odds-on favorite for those betting folks out there. Kevin Durant averaging 30 points a game, actually, in nine Christmas Day contests. And looking to add to that total, and does. Boy, they look lethal offensively, Mark. Harry Irving up court. Harry, one of four from the field, three points in the ball game. A little two-man game with DeAndre Jordan now matched up against Marcus Smart. Pull-up jumper got to his spot and made it look easy. I'm not sure who can stay in front of Kyrie Irving in a one-on-one -on -one situation. I feel like he can create his own whenever he wants. DeAndre Jordan bringing some smoke. Wow. Well, how about Trey Young getting out of the gates with 37 points on 10 or 12 field yeah. goals? Not a bad start to your season. And Jean Morant, 44. Yes. The young stars doing some work. Irving with the stare down three, putter. Ojale from the corner. Williams battling inside, couldn't come up with it. Here's Dinwiddie. Brooklyn on the move, a deep three. Kyrie in the house. Jalen Brown at times was electric in that first half. Joe Harris should start. For him, he's got eight. See, the first quarter, after after the Brooklyn Nets erupted in their opener in transition, Celtics, that was a priority for Brad Stevens. But that one, early offense, like find one of the most efficient, lethal shooters in the NBA and Joe Harris. Be there on the catch. He burns him right away. This is Durant with the mid-range jumper pure again. Tatum from deep. And one and done. Back comes Kyrie Irving. Hits another gear and finishes with the left. Starting to get loose in transition or early offenses. This Brooklyn Nets team. Harris Levert. Stare down three over Tice, no good. Allen with great hustle for the offensive board. Kyrie from deep. Got it. And Brooklyn up by eight. Durant. He's the medicine man. He makes the hurt go away. <laughs> Come on, that's just a relentless attack of an excellent defensive player. You're trying to get a rest for Jalen Brown, but one of your dynamic scorers are off. So now Kevin Durant's going, well, I got to guard this guy. I got to make this as tough as I can. 7 nothing run for Brooklyn. Tatum trying to keep it alive. And here's Irving and Durant and LaVert on the break. Kyrie off glass. Good. You got to get a timeout here. It's getting away, and Brad Stevens is going to use one. They're relentless. They're mm. playing on both ends right now, the Brooklyn Nets. Plus 12. Irving with a nice step through off glass and a feathery touch. I think this is a major challenge for the Celtics in the absence of Kemba Walker. And I know it's a short sample size, but with Tatum off the floor in the two preseason games, their offense plus minus plummeted. Mm. Irving from deep hits the three. And Kyrie Irving also having a big second half here. Up to 29 for the game. Durant with 25. Kyrie got all the way to the cup again. And he's with the rookie. Switches out onto Kyrie. School time. Ring the bell. School's in for Irving. Shot it over the top of the rookie. Good defense by Joe Harris. Trying to blow that dribble handoff up. And Brown with the miss. Irving in a rush. The dime drop to Dinwiddie. And another easy bucket in transition for Brooklyn. George, I was talking about a good moment inside that Brooklyn locker room after they beat Golden State. Kyrie Irving, who launches another three here and connects another three. He presented the game ball after they beat Golden State opening night to his head coach, Steve Nash. And it was a really nice moment in that it symbolized that he really is the voice of that team. And he is, in many ways, the leader of this team and they will follow him. Uh, you mentioned that Kevin Durant, as talented as he is, 
he is more of the understated half of that duo. And whatever it is they're doing chemistry-wise, I know it's a small sample, it's working for the Brooklyn Nets at the moment. As this one is done from TD Garden, Brooklyn wins it. 123 to 95. And Kyrie, congratulations on another phenomenal win and for making history tonight. You know, you. expectations were so high for this team going into this season. And after two games, I'm wondering, have you already exceeded your own expectations? No, nah. no, nah, we can't exceed our own expectations. We know this is a long journey ahead. And that's just another sparring session for us. Uh, I'm grateful to be able to come here, um, especially during the holidays. I don't, I don't necessarily celebrate Christmas, but I wish happy holidays to everybody at home. And I'm glad that we could put on a performance for everybody. And um, it's just important about keeping the, the synergy good here for our team. And we're definitely going to continue to progress every day. You appear to be having a blast out there. It's obvious that you're smiling. You're in a good spot. Do you recall the last time you were having this much fun on the court? This much fun on the court. I mean, every time I step foot on here, I'm, I'm blessed. I'm grateful uh, to be able to strap on my shoes, be able to do what I do. Um, and, it, and it takes a lot of hard work, a lot of unseen hours, um, you know, a lot of team chemistry things that we got to work on um, when no one's watching. And, and we do it to be able to put on a, a good performance here. And we just want to continue to do so through uh, just staying consistent. It is a beautiful thing to watch you and KD out there. What impresses you most now that you're his teammate? Uh, I think. The, the biggest thing that I'm, I'm most excited about is just growing continuously and then enjoying playing with another great player. But like I said the other night, it's not just about us two. You know, we introduced the world to 7-Eleven, but it's not just about us. It's a great team over here. We have a great collection of individuals where every single day we're pushing each other to be better. And that's the way you want to come in. And I'm not going to take any day for granted when we have this great of a team. And I'm just grateful for, to be on the journey with these guys. And finally, this, of course, your first game back in Boston, regular season game, getting a win here tonight. Any extra special for you? No, no. I'm like I said the other night. We, I went to war with those guys. You know, those those young guys down there. Like I said, I don't even want to. I got to stop calling them young guys. They're they're growing um, so beautifully, and I want them to continue to get better. And we're going to continue to lean on each other as brothers off the floor, but on the floor, we're going to continue to compete. Again, thank you very much, Curry. You made New Jersey and Brooklyn proud tonight. Peace. Oh, by the way, Basquiat jerseys. Go cop them. We live, baby. Guys, back to you. <laughs> got to get that merch. Got to get that merch. I know that his dad, Dredrick. Really proud and grateful, not just for the basketball player, but for the man that he has become. Here in Brooklyn, let's check out the starting lineups for Utah. Bogdanovich, O'Neal, Gobert, Mitchell, and Conley. That is a group with a lot of chemistry. The Nets, a completely new look. Prince, Green, Allen, Brown, and Kyrie Irving. Irving with a head of steam. Fend off, push shot, good. Kyrie Irving gets the scoring started. The drive by Conley, Gobert leans in, and the rebound to Irving. Help and recovery from Jared Allen. Oh, attack mode. Bruce Brown takes it to the hole. Conley, high screen, puts it up, knocked away by Allen. Into the hands of Irving, thought about it, he's got a mismatch. Irving, soft touch, it goes for three. He put it over the stifled tower. Irving turns the corner and lays it in. Kyrie Irving with that special gear. Irving gets the step. Allen, the spin, he goes at Gobert with the left hand. Irving, oh, it goes! Kyrie Irving has been perfect from the field. The block by Prince, he got Bogdanovich. Irving turns on the Jets for two. And the Nets have come out smoking hot. Bogdanovich, no. The Nets are eight of 10 from the field. Irving on a bounce. Brown to the hoop. The energy has been evident. And Utah takes a timeout. The Nets are blitzing the Jazz. Kyrie Irving, oh, he can't miss! Kyrie Irving, bottom from downtown. He is six of six from the field and on a mission. Irving, another! Kyrie Irving is locked in! Kyrie Irving, it's stuck on automatic for Kyrie Irving. Irving, splits defenders for two! Kyrie Irving is putting on a show. There's a three and a half second different shot clock to game clock. 
Getting into the face of Kyrie. Behind the back. Oh! Big finish! Jared Allen on a razzle-dazzle feed from Kyrie Irving. What a tasty dish! Just over a minute gone by here in the third quarter. The starting five got out of the gate so quickly and set the tone. Irving, yes. Kyrie Irving inside the arc. Kyrie Irving off the penetration. Irving lines it up. Oh, he is hot diggity. A three for Kyrie Irving. And we welcome you back to downtown Cleveland where the Cavs and Nets get set to uh, kick off a pair of games. Cavaliers enter action with a mark of six and seven. The Nets at nine and six and set to display their uh, big three for the first time this season. Irving now in the corner is guarded by Osmond. Irving spins, fires at the baseline and cans it. Kyrie Irving gets the Nets on the board. Kyrie Irving, there was a tribute on the video board during that timeout, he just pointed to the ring finger, meaning, yeah, that's in my heart. Also in Richard Jefferson's heart, as he was part of that championship group. Kevin Durant, he knows a little something about rings, and the Nets have not missed from the field. They are a perfect four for four. Irving straight away from three. Hard with a clean steal back from the Nets. Three on two. Irving hesitates around Sexton, glides to the hole. And the Nets lead by eight. Well, it's so dangerous in open floor. It's so dangerous when you catch him one-on-one -on -one like that. Kyrie Irving back in the ball game. Zigzags into an 18-footer. We mentioned Kyrie had played only one game previously in this building since his departure from the Cavs. The first game of that 18-19 season as a member of the Boston Celtics. Meanwhile, here's Irving. A 15-footer is good as Kyrie is 5 of 7 from the field. He has a team-high 11 points. Irving goes to work off a of Jordan screen. Does not need much room. Kyrie has 13. Irving at the foul line. Twist fires and scores. See, the Cavs have to understand either one of those three guys, you can't let him have freedom in the middle of that floor. Well, you know one thing? All three of these guys, John, will have to good, good move inside by Dotson. But all three of these guys will have to give up something to their game to make this work for this team. Everybody's not going to be able to score 30 a night. Dotson with a gorgeous move. He got Harden leaning the wrong way. Irving to the bucket. Irving had a good first half. Finds a teammate in the corner is Jeff Green, and his efficiency continues as Green now is three of five from deep. Well, he is going to have a field day with these guys because just get to the right spot and knock it down. Irving dribbling, baseline, scores. He got around Drummond, was able to elude Nance at the rim. Kyrie Irving's back on the floor. He has a team high 20 points. He goes to work. Durant from three. He has an answer. Oh, my. <laughs> I'll tell you, this is going to be a shootout to the end. Irving now works on Drummond. Right to the basket. Missed the shot. Harris poked at it. That almost went in. Harris going to get it back. He works it off to Green. Now Harden. Harden toward Osmond. Feeds a wide open Irving. <laughs> Kyrie Irving has 28, and the Cavalier lead is two. There's Allen in the paint, couldn't hang on, saves it, loops it high toward the Raptors, grabbed by Nance off to Sexton. Six to shoot, Sexton in a phone booth, deals to Okoro, back to Osmond, now it's Nance for three, got it! Oh my! Now you talk about making it work, keeping everybody in play, and then knock the shot down, Larry Nance Jr. deep in the rock. Hard into the bucket, tried to draw a foul, didn't get it, but does get the basket and cuts the Cavs lead to 110-107. Osmond off to Allen. Allen stops, floats, and scores. Patience, patience, patience. Durant winds into a mid-range jumper. Durant now has 30. <laughs> he makes it easy 30, doesn't he? Harden, meanwhile, to the bucket, gets fouled by Okoro with a buck 49 remaining. 100 seconds remain. Cavaliers 112, Nets 111. A foul is called as Harris was jockeying for position along with Larry Nance, and Harris gets whistled for the personal. Oh, all right, got to have some defense now. Harden bounces to Harris. Harris 
Off the sideline to the bucket, lays it up, missed the shot. Put back is good. Irving got his hands on it. He's tied this game at 113. Nance takes a three. Nets ball. Shot clock down to six. He's going to try to back you up to shoot the three. He yep. does. Rebounded by Allen. Now the Cavs go into motion. Sexton with five to shoot. Works on Irving lost the ball. Mm, he had Kyrie too. Irving on Sexton. We have an offensive foul called on Irving. Whoa. Oh my, what a big call made by official Suyash Mehta. Led with a forearm. Right in the mouth. The call is overturned. The clock stays at 1.5. The ball will be put at center circle. And frankly, if no foul was called, the Cavs are fortunate that this is a jump ball at center court instead of the alternative. The right. foul would have been called on Sexton, so Allen Wisely is going to poke it into Brooklyn Real Estate, and we're headed to overtime. Irving off a screen. Sexton got hung up, and Irving doesn't hesitate. He has 33, and he's given the Nets a 116-113 edge. Coro, guarded by Irving. Zips one into Allen in the paint. Allen spin, puts it up, blocked by Durant. Sexton got it back. That's blocked by Irving. Harden now on the run to the bucket. Back toward Durant. Durant accelerates, floats, scores, gets fouled, and Kevin Durant has a chance for three. Harden now off a green screen. Down the lane, blocked by Allen. Wow, good block. Sexton between the circles is picked up by Harden. Gets inside Harden, floats and scores. That's his shot, the mid-range shot. Green now, guarded by Allen. Hands off to Irving, who tried to draw a foul. And it's an offensive foul on Irving. Here is Colin, picked up by Harden on the switch. Shot clock down to six. See, they're not moving the ball like they have been. They're doing too much the dribbling in, uh, individually. They got to trust who they are and not get caught up in one-on-one -on -one play. Harden finds Durant. What a catch and what a finish. He's given the Nets a 120-115 lead. Sexton got inside Harden to Allen for an 18-footer. Big shot right there as Allen knocks it down and cuts the Nets lead back to three. Back to Irving. Irving's got to hurry here. Kyrie with one of the shot clock. Missed it. Rebounded by Osmond. Opportunity's there. Allen comes and gets it. Gives it back to Sexton once again. Colin on Irving to the bucket. Blocked by Kyrie. Sexton got it back. Nance for the tie. He knocks it down. Arden guarded by Okoro. Off to Green. He'll take it. Got it. Four second difference between overtime clock and shot clock. The ball goes into Osman. Osman toward the bucket. Cavs will take a two here. Osman converts quickly and trims the Nets lead to one. Jared Allen back in for defensive purposes as Harden ran into Osman. Cavs are looking for a challenge here. They want a travel call. The foul on the floor is whistled on Osman. Oh, man. He took a step without putting the ball down. You could not review a traveling violation or a would-be traveling violation. JV clearly was inquiring about it. He continues to bark at official Aaron Smith. Harden makes both free throws. Once again, as a three-point game, now with 18 seconds to go. Here's Osmond. Wow, long-distance shot. Missed it. Sexton grabs it and puts it in. Wow. It's a one-point game. 13 seconds to go. Nance commits the quick foul. Durant tonight has 35 points. Now 36. Cavs need a three. Sexton works on Irving, trying to get loose. He'll fire. He knocks it down. Colin Sexton, with one second remaining in overtime, has tied this game at 127. Irving wants Durant, gets it there. Durant for the win. Short, defended by Nance. On to the second overtime we go. Now Sexton, pressure by Irving. Sexton leans in, he draws a foul. Sexton splits the pair of the Cavaliers' own a 128-127 edge. Irving's guarded by Jetty Osmond. That's good help by Nance. Got turned back the first time. Irving trying to get loose. Difficult shot. Missed it. Rebounded by Allen. Sexton now. Sexton for three. Sexton has 31. Nance with a deflection. The NBA leader in deflections gets another one, and the Cavs have possession and a four-point lead. Nance. 3.05 to go. Gives the ball to Sexton. Long distance three. He's got another. Colin Sexton has 34, and the Cavaliers have taken a seven-point lead. Burton has a triple-double tonight. Finds Durant. Durant down the lane. Had to take a circus shot. Gets it back and gets fouled. 
Cavaliers 134, Nets 129. Yep, you had the advantage, you're going downhill now. Sexton works on Irving, fires, he's got it. Colin Sexton has the Cavs last 14 points, and it's a seven point game once again. Irving stops on a dime, he connects. Kyrie has 35. Sexton now, now he's guarded by the lengthy Durant. Five to shoot, Colin Will. He's got another! Oh, mercy! Light him up, Colin! 39 for Colin Sexton. Harden guarded by Allen, step back three, left it short. Harris appeared to push off, and he gets called for the foul. Oh, my. Colin Sexton has the Cavs' last 17 points. Looking for 20! Oh! Misfires, long rebound. Guess who? 42 points for Colin Sexton. Pressured by Harris. Goes to work again. This time it's Prince for three. Yes! <laughs> this is what Kevin Durant, James Harden, and Kyrie Irving are accustomed to doing on two other teams throughout their careers. Irving at the bucket with the finish. The Cavaliers lead by a dozen. Harden. Goes baseline and scores. Harden has 21 points. 17 seconds to go. The Brooklyn Nets tonight. See Kevin Durant, Kyrie Irving, and James Harden together on the floor for the first time. And the Cavaliers are going to beat them by 12 in double overtime. Your final in a beauty from Rocket Mortgage Fieldhouse. Cavaliers 147, Nets 135. Moments away from the opening tip, the Nets and the Cavaliers. Starters, Harris Harden, Jordan Brown, and Irving for Cleveland. It's Jetty Osman, Larry Nance Jr., Andre Drummond, Isaac Okoro, and Colin Sexton. Darius Garland is available, not in the starting lineup. Recovering from a sprained right shoulder, he comes in averaging just over 17 points and six assists per game. They went with Jared Allen. A great deal against his former team. That pass intended for Drummond, and it comes the other way for Brooklyn. Irving lets it fly. Bottom. Kyrie Irving opens the scoring. Harden out front. He's got a screen from Jordan. Loop it for Irving. Shot clock down to seven. Irving fires. It's good, and a foul. Chance at a four-point play. <laughs> Kyrie Irving makes it look effortless. Prince doesn't take the three. Check it out for Sexton. He fires. Long rebound. Harris steps in and comes away with a loose ball. Harden between the legs. Irving lunging layup and a highlight for Brooklyn set up by the beard. 25-24. Cavs. Now uh, Garland, he will lull you to sleep on that hesitation dribble. Yeah, so smooth, so clean with the way he handles it in pick and roll. Speaking of smooth and clean, Kyrie Irving from the perimeter. Bounce it in. What a look. Irving to Harris for two. A lot of times the guards, they teach the guards that you have to wait on the big. If you start to move before the big gets set, even though they call the foul on the big, it's really the guards' fault. Kyrie Irving drains it from long range. I really want to see if, if the Brooklyn Nets are going to start using a little bit more zone defense. Keep the bigs around the basket. Allow them to gang rebound. Landry Shamit has taken the collar tonight. He's 0 for 4. Nets were fortunate. Drummond missed it on the inside. Euro, leave it for Jordan. Big finish for Brooklyn. That's a pretty impressive dump by DeAndre Jordan. I don't know if it was a goaltend, Bird. I think it was really close either way. You know, they could have called it, and, and both teams would have been upset either way. Kyrie Irving, the pull-up jump, silky smooth. Osman can hit the three. Shamit. Rises up for the rebound. 10 second difference. Shot clock to game clock. Lob and the lay in. Bruce Brown, Kyrie Irving with the vision. They're going to score whether you run man or zone. The zone is only there to just switch it up so that they don't get comfortable. Speaking of comfortable, you see Kyrie Irving knocking down his pull up jumper. 
that pull-up jumper is just, it, it's impossible to guard because if you have to give him space and then you have to make sure that you're close enough to contest, he just stops on a dime. Irving turns the corner and finishes on the interior. And J.B. Bickerstaff will take a timeout. This is a 10-0 run bridging the second and third quarters. That's what we have been discussing. That's going to be the narrative all year long. Can the Nets limit their turnovers, and can they rebound and guard bigs? We know that they're going to be able to do that, Kyrie Irving, with another pull-up. That's a money shot. Irving lets it fly. He's got it. A three. Irving banks it home and the foul. You knew Kyrie was going to take the challenge, taking his time at the top of the key. Cannot be guarded by anybody one on one. Good defense by Saxon, just better offense by Kyrie Irving. Irving, the bounce green rolls to the rim. Beautifully done by Brooklyn. Well, JB Bickerstaff is a great coach. You almost want to say young head coach, but you know, because he's only 41, I believe, but he's been in this league pretty much since he was born. His dad, Bernie Bickerstaff, was a coach for Seattle, Denver, uh, you know, coach for the Bobcats when they first entered into the league. So, you know, he's been around this league his entire life. And a lot of times when they were talking about Steve Nash and understanding players on a different level, that's something that J.D. Bickerstaff has the ability to do is to connect with this young group of players that are trying to achieve so much. Lob it up, Jordan. Uh, you know, I, I, don't, I don't know at all. <laughs> Nets are down by 12. Irving, a little giddy up in his step, and he banks it in. Irving cruises ahead, denied, and a foul on Nance. Irving so gifted with the basketball on that high dribble, he's going to shoot a pair. 116-102, Irving pull-up jump is pure. 38 points for Kyrie Irving. The Nets take an offer in Cleveland. They lose both ends of this two-game series to the Cavaliers. It's the Miami Vice theme. Remember, the original Miami Vice jerseys, I mean, they really pop. These are a, a, a little bit too smudged. Irving pedals through traffic and lays it home. Strong start for Brooklyn in 11-2 beginning. A oh, quick move by Irving and then the feathery floater. Time out, Miami. What touch from Kyrie Irving. Harris again from three. His fourth of the first quarter. None denied. Perry and Irving both there. Great collapse on the inside. Irving finds Durant galloping in. Oh, the long strides and the finish. Man, what do you do? What do you do against that? I mean, he covers so much ground. He does it in a smooth way. Irving gets it to drop. Beautifully executed two for one for Brooklyn. Irving, three of eight from the floor in this game. Durant, good look from the wing. He got it. Irving bounces, Harris on the attack. Harden out, Bruce Brown in, Irving hits the jumper. Each team playing the second half of the back-to-back. -back. Irving finds the cutter in Brown who forces it in. You know, these unorthodox flips, they work for Bruce Brown. Harris gets some space. Truth on a three. Seventh of the night for Joey Buckets. None denied by Irving. Got it back, and it's going the other way. 13-0 to start the fourth for Miami. Irving hits the three, a big one for Brooklyn. Irving accelerates the fake, the flip, the touch. Out of bio. I mean, he, he must miss. have paid off that rim. He cannot miss. It's unbelievable the rolls over there. And Adebayo just having an incredible night, 38 points. Irving with an answer. Flexing in this fourth. Harden giving it up. Durant, pull-up jumper is good. Kevin Durant with 28 points. Smooth. Irving accelerates, fades, and hits. Ten big points in the quarter for Irving, who has 20 for the night. None 
Finds the cutter, Dragic, using the window. One-point game. Irving. Pulls. And hits! Kyrie Irving is feeling it. Looking to close. 125 to go. Double comes. Pass off of Iguodala. Out of bounds. Brooklyn ball. Irving gives it up. Durant pull up. He is good. He can get it done too in crunch time. Robinson gets free from the corner and Nets lucky to escape there. Robinson normally automatic when unguarded. Catch from a deep. break. That's the last guy you want to leave with an open look from the corner. Irving given a lot of space and finishes. Kyrie Irving, 15 in the fourth, 25 for the night, a 9-2 Brooklyn run, looking to shut things down at Barclays. As Dragic lays it in. Miami trapping, Harden evades, and finishes. Eight-point Brooklyn lead. Dragic leans in, banks it in, plus the foul. Dragic completes the three-point play. Harris looking to get it in, doesn't have anything going on, finds Durant. Durant is fouled, and Durant hobbles away for a moment. Robinson heaves it and hits. It is a three-point game, and Brooklyn got close to a foul again from deep. That could have been a four-point play. DLC's got to get it in bounds, gets it to Irving, and Irving is fouled. Irving hits them both. Five-point game, 17 in the fourth for Irving. Adebayo gets it back to Robinson. A three, and he's fouled by Irving. Hits all three. It's a two-point game. Harris bounces into Irving, and Irving is fouled. Irving misses. Rebound Iguodala. Miami's going to run. They don't take a timeout, and Harden fouls Adebayo incredibly wise of James Harden. What a heads-up play. Adebayo makes it. It's a two-point Brooklyn lead. 3.3 to go. Nets do have two timeouts if Harris has trouble inbounding. Harris gets it into Harden. Harden is smacked. He got it. Dragic takes the three, and that will do it. Brooklyn escapes. 128-124 the final as the Nets take down Miami at Barclays Center. A winter storm rocked the New York area on Monday. Today, the city had to dig out of it. And tonight, in Brooklyn, there is major star power. Kawhi Leonard and the Clippers are in town to face Kevin Durant and the Nets. It is L.A. versus Brooklyn from Barclays Center. Jackson, who's played well, stepping in for Patrick Beverly. Ball gets knocked around, and the Nets have it. Oh, crisp pass. Joe Harris with the left hand, and it's the setup by the beer, James Harden. Nets are the number one scoring team in the NBA, 122.2 points per game. Having a catch, Harden and Irving. That's a three. I'll tell you what, Leonard is 5% more efficient this year than last year, and he, I think he's having the best season of his career. Just tremendous as Irving knocks down a jump shot. So Kyrie Irving from the outside. DeAndre Jordan has checked in for Brooklyn, so has Bruce Brown. Both have been a part of the starting lineup at different points of the season. Kyrie Irving, the answer, his toe was on the line. It's a long two-pointer. Kyrie, one of the best one-on-one -on -one players. Yeah, toe on the line right there on that three-point line, but going against Leonard, gets him a little misdirection, raises up. Hey. What school did he go to, Bird? He went to. Uh, I don't. I didn't come up in my research. It's so weird. <laughs> okay, I thought you did your homework. I'm sorry. Yeah, no, nah, I missed that one. He's a dookie. Nice looking stroke from Kyrie Irving. 32-22. Five seconds left. Irving to Jordan for the jam. 1.3 on the clock. Irving on high stepping it for two. Reggie Jackson missed it on the reverse. Harden on a lead feed. Irving gets to the rim. Oh, beautiful English from Kyrie Irving. <laughs> Are you serious? 
I mean, that layup right there is just as typical Kyrie Irving. Ten to shoot. Baby hook? No. Ibaka the miss. The Nets can hold for one with 14 seconds left. Irving. Lane was wide open for Kyrie Irving. And he gets the deuce to cut it to one. Irving, first lead of the night for Brooklyn. Kyrie Irving, the baseline delivery. Oh, Kyrie Irving, bullseye for three. Spin, step back. Oh, that's nice. Kyrie Irving, ridiculous talent. 67-63 Nets. George, the drive. Help defense, Kyrie Irving, the block. Ibaka off the rim. Well, and they'll need Zubats in, in the playoffs, particularly against guys like Jokic and centers if they're trying to win a championship. But you're oh. right, Ibaka and Irvin. <laughs> Just explosive. Irving. Selfishness. Answers with a triple. It rattles home for Kyrie Irving, and the Nets lead by two. from downtown. I, mean, I guess when you need a bucket, just give it to him. But two, stutter and jumper. Rebound to Kyrie Irving. Irving, pep in his step. Oh, the corkscrew off the Euro. Kyrie Irving is locked in. Leonard, short on a three, rebounded by Harris. Next 7-0 run. James Harden got a three. <laughs> and what I love about the Nets, Irving's been on fire, and he's in the corner on that play. You <laughs> give the ball to, to Harden this time, and he's able to finish and convert. But The George Jam ends a 13-0 Nets run. Kyrie Irving is one point away from his season high, which is 38. Here's Leonard. Makes his move on the inside. Pump fake. Strength of Leonard, a chance at a three-point play. Now Durant wants to get in on the end. Durant's jumper is good. 112-106, Brooklyn. Harden. A foul called on Morris, and free throws coming for James Harden. Leonard shows the ball. Backs in. Could not bank it home, but he is going to the free throw line. Leonard has 31 to lead L.A. Under two minutes to play. Durant wants to dance with Batum. A three. Kevin Durant, a downtown hit. All you can say is what? Wow. Batum answers with a triple. Durant makes his move. Kick out, intercepted by Jackson. He was trying to get it to Irving. Jackson waits. We are under a minute left. Morris wants to take it over Irving for two and a foul. Now 16 for Morris. Harden one-on-one -on -one with Morris. Harden, step back, Jay. Offensive foul on James Harden. Batum, the trigger man, gets it in for Leonard. The drive, the floater, air ball, and it's knocked out of bounds. Last touch by Durant. Irving backs off. Jackson gets it in. George a three. It's good. Paul George on target. It's a one-point game. They get it in cleanly. Harden gives it up. Durant drives in, and he is fouled with nine seconds left. Two out of two. Three-point right lead for the Nets. A, a two doesn't hurt you if you're in Brooklyn. And the Nets decide to foul. Leonard's second attempt. It's a one-point game. Nets find themselves in another potentially hairy situation. Harden goes long. Green ball fake. Layup is good and a foul with 5.5. Harden throws the touchdown pass to Jeff Green. He missed it. Missed one the other night as well. It's open here for L.A. A foul is called. No good. Batum. Gets the bounce on the second attempt. And Harden will toss it in. 
Looking. Bounces for Irving. Foul given with 1.9. Nets up by two. Nets up by three. 124 to 120. The battle in Brooklyn belongs to the Nets. They outlast the Clippers 124 to 120. Hey, how's everybody going at home? Peace and blessings. I'm Heya from Lakota Standing Rock Sioux Tribe, also Pine Ridge Reservation. On behalf of my teammates, Brooklyn, of course, Indiana, and the whole entire NBA, we want to wish a happy Chinese New Year, happy year, the Ox. Peace and blessings to you and our relatives in China. Thanks. Here's Irving with eight to shoot. They back off the double team. Irving, the back in. The fade gets the mound to the Nets are on the board first. Lamb to Turner. There's that three ball and missed it on a rainbow delivery. Irving turns the corner, floats it in. He was looking for a foul call. Kyrie Irving gets the bucket. Harris forced to give it up. Cutter, Harris hangs and hits. The ball is popping from Kyrie Irving. Okay, nice look there. Lob it up. Jordan Chechen slammed on a special delivery from Kyrie Irving. Sabonis one on one with Jordan. Sabonis gets good position, misses though on the baby hook. Jordan ahead. Kyrie Irving gives it up. Dazzling feed and a finish by Brown. Irving made that decision in midair. Harden sizing him up. Cross, step back J. Off the mark. Rebound. How did he get there? Tippin doesn't go and a foul. Kyrie Irving. Of all the players on the floor to come away with that offensive board and stick back, it was Kyrie Irving. Irving creates some space, fades away. Bank shot, what an angle from Kyrie Irving. Holiday to Sabonis. Over Jordan, short, and Jordan the box out. Quick leak out by Irving, off to the races. Irving, kick, sham at a three, he's got it. Transition bucket with Landry Shamit firing from long range. The way Shamit is carrying himself is different. His body language, how he's moving, how he's releasing the basketball, you could see it. Lob it up. Oh, Jordan! A grown man's jam! Off the feed from Kyrie Irving. 55 to 30. The lowest number of points the Nets have given up in any half this season is 40. Pacers are at 30. Deep one. Harden. Book it. A bomb for three from the pier. And the Nets want more. No look. Kyrie Irving cruises to the rim. And he's fouled. The Nets running hard. Roll to the rim. Kick. Irving fakes out Holiday. Oh, no. Foul is called. Kyrie Irving just put a couple of Pacers on skates. Joe Harris put it on the board. It's a three. Clear it for Irving. Mismatch. Irving against a bonus. Think he wants to take him off the dribble? No. Jump shot. Bottom. Kyrie Irving. A three ball. Oh, Kyrie Irving. The fake on the outside and then the take to the rim. Irving. Oh, the acceleration. Oh, what a finish. Kyrie Irving. Off the penetration and deuce. Harden. Cross. And Brockton picks his pocket. Brockton streaking to the rim, stripped to the ball. Last touch by Irving, out of bounds. Johnson, pretty fake, fakes again. Johnson comes away with a rebound. Irving to Green. Money, a three. Jeff Green can't hit it. Tapped out by Lawawu Cabarro. Irving launches, connects. A three. Irving, the ball handling skills. Green the drive, but he missed it at the rim. Sabonis loses it. Irving takes it away. Now it's a race, and Kyrie Irving will win it with a left-handed layup. The Nets end the losing streak with a big effort against Indiana.
Strong showing. 104-94 victory for Brooklyn. Nets are in Sacramento. Let's check out the starting lineups. The Nets going with their 19th different starting five this season. Most in the NBA. The change, Jeff Green. Manning the middle. Heel, Barnes. Bagley is back. Joseph and De'Aaron Fox for the Kings. Kyrie Irving opens up the scoring with a straightaway three. Will he score again? Yes, he will. Back-to-back -back trays for Kyrie Irving. He is the two guard, and James Harden is the point guard. Healed one-on-one -on -one over Harris. Book it, a three. And that's where Buddy Hill can be so dangerous. He has such a quick trigger. He also has a very offensive mindset. So he's one of those guys that you have to be on guard with him at all times. Off-balance delivery for Kyrie Irving. That ends a 7-0 run. Irving has eight early. Pull up. Splash! Kyrie Irving from downtown. Discard and deuce for Barnes. Harrison Barnes has been such a steady force for this Sacramento Kings team. It's crazy that he's a veteran now. He's been in the league nine years. I had him as a rookie. It's just, that's just hard to believe for me. Kyrie Irving has it stuck on automatic. High screen. Irving. Pull up. He can't miss. Kyrie Irving for two. Here's Fox. Pull up. Tried to use the window. Rebound secured by Lawawu Cabarro. Irving gives it up. Lawawu Cabarro with a tray. Whiteside tried to give it up, and it bounces out front. Irving turns the corner and finishes with the offhand. Kyrie Irving has that extra gear. Kyrie Irving, the pull-up pop. And the jump shot goes... Beautiful from Kyrie Irving. Irving. Five to shoot. Irving makes his move. Baseline. What a find to Joe Harris on a corner three. De'Aaron Fox, the ability to square up. Off the dribble. Speedy point guard. And the Nets answer. Kyrie Irving, pure from the outside. Harden using the Jordan screen. Harden, jab, jumper. Tapped out volleyball style, and the Nets will control it. Irving off balance, cans it from long range. The setup by Joe Harris. Everything is going down for Brooklyn. Irving, fade away, rims in. The run Man, is now 14. Side dribble. Oh, the side dribble for Kyrie Irving gives him 31. Push shot, short, from Whiteside. Irving, head of steam. Irving over Halliburton. Oh, yeah! Kyrie Irving from long range. He is locked in. Kyrie Irving, a downtown hit. And Luke Walton is ticked. <laughs> The Nets are 21 of 33 from three-point territory. Irving. Oh, wow! It's Jordan wow. on the finish, and Kyrie Irving with the perfect dish. We know what happened a couple of years ago when the Nets made the furious comeback. Irving, a silencer. A three, and he's put up a 40-burger. A new franchise record, 27 threes for the Nets. And they win this one by double figures over Sacramento. Namaste for Brooklyn, 136 to 125. Three straight wins for the Nets. Here are the starters, Sarah, for Boston, Tatum, Tice, Thompson, Brown, and Walker smart off the bench. The Nets going with Brown, Harris, Jordan, Irving, and Hart. Out of the timeout. Irving, drive, attack mode for Kyrie Irving. Jordan has it stripped. Stumbling ahead. Brown loses it. Irving gets a piece clean. Out of bounds. 
It is an 8-0 run for Boston. That's just seeking some rhythm here at Kyrie Irving. That'll help. Getting to the bucket for the teardrop. Shamit. Another Landry Shamit long-range bomb. Ball is moving. Drop step. Tatum off balance. No. Good rebound by Shamit. Let's have a two-for-one here. Irving using the screen. Puts on the brakes. Curls. Connects. Kyrie. A thing of beauty. Nine to shoot. Kyrie Irving. Irving. Cuts. Fades. Connects. Kyrie. Getting to his spots. Irving. The low dribble. Oh, he's stealth. Gets to the rim and a chance at a three-point play. The Nets have their largest lead, three. They are nine of nine at the free throw line. Kyrie is getting hot in a hurry. And the numbers are building. Meanwhile, Tice takes it in and can't finish it. Irving on the move, right down the middle. Brown denied by Smart. Johnson is open, and he cans a three. Irving, no look. On a swing for Johnson. Cut. Irving. Oh, he's got it. Kyrie Irving gets to the paint and finishes. That's her yet to score, though, in this second half. Kyrie Irving puts an end to that. Once again, out of a timeout. Irving rises up and puts it off the glass. Drop step. Brown lost it. Got it back. Doesn't get it to go. Rebounded by Harden. Set by Brown, swing, Irving, open look, book it, a three. Oh, the hands were up early. And a shock that you leave Kyrie Irving that wide open from the wing, but everyone cutting and slashing to the basket drew in the defense. Wide open look. And a possible opening here for Irving. Takes it all the way, oh, off the window! With the perfect amount of English. Irving, one-on-one -on -one with Williams. Irving, the ball handling skills, leads to a Harris three. A major highlight for Brooklyn. Side rim, right back to Harris. Ball fake, takes it in. Kick. Irving, the penetration, the spin. Little Uncle Drew action for Kyrie Irving. Poise remains in control. Finding his areas on the floor to be a threat. Irving, got a three. Kyrie Irving with 30 points. Irving, ball fake, handles. Oh, he's in another dimension. Fourteen in the third quarter for Kyrie Irving. Tice, short, popped up in the air, and claimed by Shamit with 3.20 on the clock. Irving, a three. Yes, sir! Kyrie Irving with a bomb here in Brooklyn. Tatum, taken away by Joe Harris. He digs down low to get it. Harden. Trailer, Kyrie, count it! A three! What a performance! Walker can't hit the three. Rebounded by Irving with a minute 45 to play. Irving, motors ahead. Irving trying to get it up cleanly. Tice is there defensively, and a foul is called. MVP chant from the fans in attendance, just to hear a chant at all. It's incredible. He has put up a 40 spot. The Nets open the second half, much like the way they ended the first half of the season. Another win for Brooklyn. They beat Boston 121 to 109. Getting ready for the start of action between the Nets and the Magic. Taking a look at the starting lineups tonight. Kyrie Irving back in there after missing one game. 
And you see the starting lineup for the Magic. They once again have to go with Chasen Randall at the point. Michael Carter-Williams is out once again due to a non-COVID illness. Nets played the Magic in Harden's debut back in January as Irving goes to the reverse, finishes, plus the foul after he left Gordon in the dust. Irving fading away. That is a difficult look made easy by Kyrie Irving. Irving wide open corner three is good. Gordon will fire short. Rebound lands in the lap of Harris. Irving, what a spin. Kyrie Irving breaking down defenses. Put him in the cycle. Irving hops, dishes, Jordan flushes. Beautiful delivery from Irving finding Jordan for the dunk. Irving and Jordan, the starters who remain on the floor. Nice setup there for Shaman, who hits the three. A 7-0 Brooklyn run as Irving finds Joe Harris. Fournier had it poked by Irving. Three on two developing. Harris flanks. Couldn't quite get his feet right, but that's okay. Nick Claxton rocking to the rim. Irving with the gorgeous counter step and flip. Jordan got his paws on it. Ended up with Irving. Irving through the legs. Harris, you bet. You got to hit the shot after a pass like that. Irving fading away. That is a difficult look made easy by Kyrie Irving. Kyrie Irving with two more points. He's got 15. Irving doing everything he can to just keep the Nets in it as they're ex exchanging buckets. Irving hops to the rim. 22 points in this first half for Kyrie Irving. Two for one opportunity for Brooklyn. Irving on Gordon. Crossover two is good. Kyrie is cooking. Well, they get up one on their first possession, and Irving picks up right where he left off at the end of the second. He has the last 16 Nets points, and this is the Nets' first lead since it was an 11-10 game. Irving hits the jumper after he shed Fournier. Irving around the Claxton screen. Irving into the lane, cups it in. Beautiful finish, 31 points for Kyrie Irving. Irving from two, yes. And really, Kyrie Irving, the only guy that has been able to get going on the offensive side for Brooklyn. Oh, Kyrie Irving, a sensational navigation to the rim. Uh, he keeps having defenders back on their heels. A nice job. Doesn't use the screen because he crosses through Aaron Gordon, gets past two other Orlando defenders. His finishes around the rim continue to be sensational. 36 points now for Irving. The Nets need stops, though. Down 14. Irving buries the J. It's a four-point game with seven-plus minutes of real estate. And with that layup, Kyrie Irving and James Harden become the first teammates in Nets history to score 40 in back-to-back -back games. As Irving adds a three, the Magic are going to snap their nine-game losing streak against the hottest team in the NBA. Harris, a wing three won't go, emblematic of what's happened down the stretch of the fourth. Nets after trailing by 19 after the third, got the stops they wanted, cut it to four, and then went cold as Brooklyn's six-game winning streak is snapped. Tonight in Orlando, the final, 121-113. For Houston, no John Wall tonight. Wall is dealing with a knee issue, but Christian Wood returns to the starting five, having a big season, 21 and a half points, 9.8 rebounds per game. The Nets going with Brown, Harris, Jordan, Irving, and Harden. Harden for Irving. He thought about it from deep. 
The handles, the jumper, it's pure. The Rockets can't miss. They are eight of nine from the field. Irving, the push shot, rattles home. Irving, bottom from downtown. Kyrie Irving taking advantage. Griffin sets the screen, bounce it, hot hand. Yes, Kyrie Irving. Hot shooting from deep. Irving, ball fake. Oh, the hesitation dribble. That is special. Irving to the corner. Harris, yes. A three for Joe Harris. Irving, oh, that is nifty. Kyrie Irving. The pretty fake, and that low dribble makes him so dangerous. Harden on the bench, Irving, pull up, splash. Irving for Green. Set the screen for Kyrie, the bounce, pinpoint accuracy. Jeff Green lays it in. Beautiful setup. Harden racing to the rim on a kick. Irving, pocket pass, Claxton! Down. Kyrie Irving. What a dish. Harden to Irving. <clears throat> Harris gets it off and hits the three. Joe E. Buckets. First year as a head coach, 19 years as an assistant. Charlotte, New Orleans, Cleveland, Golden State, Dallas. His dad, Paul, former net assistant coach and a former head coach, of course, in the NBA with San Diego, Charlotte, New Orleans, and Cleveland. Book it. Kyrie Irving, a deep shot. Irving against Brown. Kyrie Irving makes his move. Irving, he is a walking, breathing bucket. Irving, free throw line jumper is good. Irving, look to make it happen. Left hand, Kyrie Irving, attack mode. What a finish. And Houston trying to extend their defense, getting up on the point of attack, but it gave Kyrie Irving more real estate to operate. Back for Griffin. Layup. Good, and a foul. Blake Griffin with a chance at a three-point play. Kyrie Irving has got a ridiculous sense. Jump shot doesn't go for Bradley. Irving, early. Joe Harris got a three. Irving the cross. Brown fills and scores. Claxton climbs the ladder for the flush. Claxton hands it off. Irving, cutter, Claxton, got it. Nicholas Claxton, the instincts cutting to the rim, and Irving finds him in perfect stride. Here's Bradley on the outside. Drives in on Griffin, blocked by Claxton. Nets come the other way with Irving. High steps, kick, Harris, a three. Joseph Edward Buckets from downtown. Irving turns the corner and gets the bucket. Kyrie Irving, a blur. Now to a minute 40 to play. Hand it to Irving. Griffin lets it fly. Yes! Blake Griffin! Big tray! 10 to shoot. Ball fake. Harris. Oh, yeah. A dagger three. Good night in Brooklyn. Uh, the Nets with a double-digit lead, 52 seconds left. Harris, another! Hot cup of Joe! Joe Harris has gone for 28 points on 7 of 12 from three-point territory. For the first time since April of 2003, the Nets have sole possession of first place in the Eastern Conference. What a turnaround tonight in Brooklyn. Welcome back to New York Knicks basketball. Knicks and the Nets from Brooklyn. And the usual starting five for Tom Thibodeau, 
and the Knicks. Meanwhile, LaMarcus Aldridge getting his third start for Brooklyn since signing with them as a free agent. Peyton guarding Kyrie Irving. Irving with that handle again is virtually unguardable. Drives inside, draws the foul. Chance for a three-point play. When you're guarding Irving, folks, you have to go back to basic defense that you learned in grade school. Stay down. Keep the guy in front of you. Don't reach. But right there, just overwhelming. Peyton hell-bent to get to the hoop, and he's ambidextrous, so he's shooting one as well. Gibson, he is. He's the oldest player on the roster. He also plays harder than anybody else. And it's a nice dish from Harris and Kyrie Irving with his first three-pointer. Kyrie had 24 points last night. We mentioned the 15 assists. Career high. Kyrie very creative this time. Good defense, but he's still scoring. <laughs> that is that. Well, Reggie Bullock could not have played better defense there, Clyde. Right, Mike. And it's just the ingenuity of this guy. The spontaneity with the left hand. Irving's got that phenomenal handle. Step back, jump shot. It's good. Maestro virtuoso. Is Irving, so he's hot now, folks. Shake it and bake it. As Irving gets free and finishes, Irving 12 points already, and we haven't even played seven minutes. Slicing and dicing in that time. Irving fakes the three. Now on the drive, kicks it inside. Alizé Johnson lays it up and in. Mitchell Irving averages five assists. Good job that time to Johnson. Clyde just got the word. James Harden, who missed those two games with the right hamstring, the hamstring tightened up, so he will not return. And you're going to see Kyrie Irving go for a big night tonight. Knocks down the three-pointer. He already has 17 points. Marcus Aldridge back in. Irving goes back to our feet inside. Alizé Johnson. Irving played 39 minutes last night. So you're going to need another Yeoman's night out of him again with Hart going down. Quickly, the floater. Too strong. Aldridge to rebound. Here's Johnson. Goes inside. Layup is good. He's guarding that man. Nobody at the moment. <laughs> really? Irving. Scoop layup is good. Kyrie Irving with 19 here in the first half. Even Randall in his wake that time with the shaking peak. Bullock on an island against Irving. There's the spin. Turns fall away. And he banks it in. Kyrie Irving. Just dynamite with the basketball. Ingenuity, spontaneity by Irving. He's got 21. Harris to Irving. Irving inside. Left handed. Oh. Is there anything he can't do with the ball? And he's feeling a little pain there as he swooped inside. Back out to Payton, finds Nerlens Noel. He's stripped. Brown throws it ahead and an easy two for Kyrie Irving. And the lead cut to nine. R.J. Barrett tried to shuffle it in. Another turnover. All of a sudden, the Knicks turning it over. Brown will sidestep. Back to Jeff Green. The transition D by the Knicks. Irving back into Green. Green fakes. Layup is good. And Tom Thibodeau needs a timeout. The 13-point lead has been cut to seven. Step back three. Kyrie Irving from downtown. His third three-pointer. He's got 30. Kyrie Irving, speaking of sensational. Well, a couple of players individually putting on just dynamic shows here at the Barclays Center. Kyrie reports me in motion. Randall trying to guard Irving. Irving. Shaking the bacon, fires it up. Back shot is good. Kyrie Irving, spectacular once again. And the Nick Lee cut the seven. But this wear and tear on him, folks. So it's going to show some fatigue here in the fourth quarter. Irving looking. Harris was open. Randall has been on his case, but to no avail. He eluded him. Step back three. It's good. Kyrie Irving dazzling once again. And the lead is sixth largest of the game for Brooklyn. Tantalizing, mesmerizing them again from behind the arc. 37 now for Kyrie Irving. I mentioned the windows. The other big two are not there. He averages 38 a game. Close to that now. Jeff Green inside. Noel goes for the fake. Count it and one. And this could turn into a three-point play. Payton says, leave me on him. Irving now drives, pulls back, puts up the three. Shots good. Kyrie Irving with another clutch bucket. And Brooklyn goes up by five with 59 seconds remaining. You mentioned this team number one in ISO wing. He's got 40. They've got Hart. They've got Durant. All guys that can create off the dribble. So they have been doubling Irving, putting the onus on Green. Previously, Irving was one-on-one. -on -one. He misfired off the glass. Now another ISO. Peyton on his case. 
a belated attempt to deny him with the Swiss. His third 40 point game of the season. And his fifth three pointer. He's now 5 of 12, 15 of 28. Jubilation, the devastation now by Irving. Randall against Kyrie Irving. Drives, stripped by Irving, but a foul. Randall, 18, 12 assists, 15 down. Two clutch free throws there. Back to three. Brooklyn has 14 left on the shot clock. There's the double to get it out of Irving's hands. Joe Harris back to Irving. Double team. Throws it away, and the double team works again. Knicks get it back with 37.9 remaining. Burks takes it back. Now pulls up. Three-pointer. Puts it in. Alec Burks from downtown. He ties the game with 25.5 remaining. Kyrie's game to win or lose. Again, he relishes these moments. Ball poked away. Now back into the hands of Irving. Double team. Irving double team. Up top to Harris. Harris on the drive. Two-pointer puts it up. Shot no good. Rebound fought for. Green has it, and he's fouled. Green is fouled with 3.7 remaining. All right, that makes it a one-point game. Two clutch free throws there from Jeff Green. Tom Thibodeau uses his final timeout. Burks finds Randall. Randall drives, pulls up, two-point shot. Shot won't go, and the Knicks lose another heartbreaker to the Nets. Julius Randall had a good look. It wouldn't fall, and Brooklyn emerges thanks to 40 points from Kyrie Irving. And the Knicks fall short once again to their local rival. For the Brooklyn Nets, Kyrie Irving, Jeff Green, and there's the surprise, folks. Bruce Brown starting tonight in place of Kevin Durant, who we were told was scheduled maybe to start tonight. Harris and Aldridge filling out the starting five. Ball, Bledsoe, Johnson, Zion Williamson, the team's leading scorer, and Steven Adams in the front court for the Pelicans. Well, think of what they're missing. Josh Hart, who was their best defensive rebounder, a guard who could guard multiple positions. Um, you know, Kyra Lewis, a guy who was starting to, to gain traction in a legit pure point guard. I mean, they've just been crushed. Yeah. Boy, speaking of crushing it, Jeff Green has been outstanding for the Brooklyn Nets over the last several games. In the month of April, he's averaging 22 per. Kyrie kicks it back out. Aldridge from downtown, and he drills that three-pointer. Different dynamic with LaMarcus Aldridge, right? You see Nicholas Claxton, you see Blake Griffin over there, some of the other front court guys. LaMarcus can make that face-up game. Nice duck it inside. Adams with the jump hook. You can see how consistently they are now putting the ball in Lonzo's hands. Let him bring it up, initiate offense, recognizing a good post up by his counterpart and puts the ball where it needs to be. Irving with another shot. And Brooklyn back up by one. Kyrie with four points in the ball game so far. As you see the Nets yeah. get out the transition mark. Irving spins on the baseline, elevates, and caught one underneath. Wow. Oh, this guy is so special. He averaged 30 points per game over the entire month of March. Long stretches of games where he individually can command and, and control an offense and keep you single-handedly in the game. The guy is brilliant. Bledsoe gives it to Hernan Gomez. The mismatch against Kyrie, but he got good defensive help. Pull up three by Irving. Butter. Well, that's what you love to see if you're Steve Nash, right? Playing with pace off a block from Claxton, getting your transition game fueled with your defense. Nice cut from the weak side. Blake Griffin got that bounce still. Don't believe the hype. Blake Griffin rising and crushing it. Oh. This is a guy who used to jump over cars. Nice cut through the lane, opportunistic, and leaves no doubt Mr. Griffin in the house. Irving on the wing. Deep three. Got it. Kevin Durant checked in just a few minutes ago here in the second quarter for the first time in 23 games. Kyrie Irving not skipping a beat without him. Kyrie with that jumper now up to 15 for the night. Bledsoe turns on the Jets, had it blocked by Harris. Good defense by Joe Harris. Jeff Green off the nice dime inside. The lead is up to 18 with 2.20 to go. James Harden approves back after this.
wide open three. Nobody in the same area code as Kyrie Irving, who knocks down another long ball. Well, coaching challenge a moment ago by Stan Van Gundy and the Pelicans. It was initially called a charge against Zion Williamson. After the review, it's ruled a block on Durant prior to the gather. Durant doesn't seem to be taking it too hard, Malika Andrews, to you. No, he it does not appear to be. <laughs> I spoke with Pelicans assistant coach Fred Vinson during the break, uh, and he said that Kevin Durant just adds another scorer to their arsenal, and he is a real matchup problem for them. But overall, he said we need to just start with playing with more intensity and aggression on defense, period. Kyrie Irving, that's not even fair. In his that's bag right. like the fries were at the bottom. Wow, Kyrie. Pulled the defender in, then pulled back. Just watch the handle, folks. Just enjoy it, because he's going to make Steven Adams jump. <laughs> he's still got command of the basketball. Watch Steven Adams react. Gets off his feet. That is ridiculous. First of all, this guy's ability to shoot off the dribble at 49%. The guy's 49% off the dribble mark. It's ridiculous. Incredible. Just incredible spellbinding skill by... Kyrie Irving and so is that guy Durant at a career high 43 percent from downtown and this is starting to look like a drill right now for the Brooklyn Nets the Brooklyn Nets will improve to 9 and 0 at home since the beginning of March and 19 and 9 overall this season against sub 500 teams mom approves Kevin Durant's return to the court successful on all fronts. On a rainy Wednesday night in Philadelphia, inside the Wells Fargo Center. Home of the 76ers as we take a look at tonight's starting lineups delivered by Taco Bell. And for Brooklyn, this is their 29th different starting lineup as Kyrie Irving returns, but no Durant, no Harden. So Landry Shamet, the former Sixer, Joe Harris, Jeff Green, and DeAndre Jordan back playing the last couple of games because of the unavailability of LaMarcus Aldridge. Meanwhile, for Philadelphia, they haven't had a lot of games this year where their predicted starting five will be intact, but this is it for Doc Rivers, and he's thrilled to have them. Again, a team that's 20 and five on their home floor this season. There's Jeff Green, shot clock winding down. Embiid goes out to guard him, and Green knocks down a two-pointer. That's a tough shot. Joel Embiid is an outstanding defensive player. Irving gets the soft touch bounce. Here goes DeAndre Jordan. Perfect connection from Kyrie Irving. Irving from the elbow. His second field goal, two for two Kyrie Irving. Five-point Philly lead. Irving shaking bake against Thibel, and he banks it home. There he is. That is so sweet. That's ridiculous. Like, Thibel is elite on the defensive end, and he just left him in his wake. Yeah, quick bucket down the other end. Lob it in, and Jordan throws it down. Another perfect pass from Kyrie Irving, and the Nets have tied it at 20. Irving on the pull-up, knocks oh. it down. He, he, the game comes easy, and it doesn't matter where Kyrie is getting to. In any of the three levels of scoring, he's so good. Well, there's Thibault and Irving going at it. Left hand, and he flips it up and in. Oh, my goodness. I mean, Thibault does not a good job. He pokes it loose. Shot clock is dwindling. The challenge is exceptional, but the left hand of Kyrie Irving is better. Stop it, Kyrie. My goodness. He's going to get a rest 10 points, 4 assists. Oh, stripped by Irving. Good hands. Back up top. Jake Milton left wide open and connects on another three. Seven three-pointer already for Philly. And this is the largest lead of the first half. And, Mike, when I think of Philly, I, I don't necessarily think of them as a young team. Kyrie with a tough shot. Like, I think Joel and Ben have been around so long. Irving fouled. And He'll shoot his first free throws. In certain spots, young by experience. And Whoop. Kyrie Appreciate looks it. like he's all right. Irving fakes. Simmons with the long arm out in front of him. Now Irving penetrates. Side step, flips it up. And Kyrie Irving dazzling again. And think about it. 
in the games Joel has played, if he played in every game, they'd be on a 63-win pace with their defense. That's not going to make Doc happy. That's the horrible transition defense that rears its ugly head on occasion. As Jeff Green gets now with eight points. Irving. Simmons right up into him. Irving gets past him. Lefty layup is good off the glass. They've sent two tremendous defensive players, Thibel and Simmons, at, at Kyrie. Neither has had much for him. Irving and Jordan connect again. By the way, for Dwight Howard, it's the first game he's missed all year. Jeff Green releases down the other end, and there's that transition defense that has Doc Rivers frustrated. Jake Milton stolen by Kyrie Irving, and then a foul on Shake Milton. That could not have gone any worse for Philadelphia. Again, the quick hands from Kyrie Irving. Irving penetrates, nice feet inside. Another gorgeous pass, eight assists for Kyrie Irving. Kyrie Irving gets that one to go. He missed his first three shots, shots to start the third. And he's got 25. As Kyrie Irving puts it up and in. Bob Kravitz had an unbelievable article in The Athletic today. Give yourself a, a couple of minutes to read it and learn about one of the special people uh, in the game of basketball. Kyrie, another tough bucket. Thought he got fouled as well. These two pulling out a show. 33 for Irving, 34 for Embiid. We've got an eight-point game. There's under two to play here in the third. Nice little push shot from Bruce Brown, who looks over at the, the sixer bench. Apparently somebody said something. This time, Irving uses his body to shield the defender and then uses the left hand. Brooklyn decides to let it go. But Kevin Durant and the stars of Brooklyn have to be proud a little bit of the role players for the Nets. Meanwhile, another win here at home for Philadelphia. They now have the best record in the Eastern Conference all by themselves. Joel Embiid, 39 points, 13 rebounds. And the 76ers are 38 and 17 overall and 21 and 5 here at home. And they win the tiebreaker against the Nets, winning two of the three games in the regular season. The current one seed in the East takes on the current two seed in the West. It's the Phoenix Suns and the Brooklyn Nets. We welcome you to NBA Sunday, presented by State Farm. It should be a terrific matchup. We've got a two-time All-Star in Devin Booker. He has led the Suns to the NBA's best record over their last 43 games, and he has been tremendous. The Nets, they're just trying to get whole, and perhaps the biggest step forward that they will take in that effort today is getting Kevin Durant back on the floor. That happens this afternoon. Although he will not be in the starting lineup, it will be great to see KD back on the floor. Kyrie Irving along two, and that breaks the ice and gets the Nets on the board. It's a just a gifted score. He's coming off one of his toughest shooting performances in a win, but he affected winning with his passing and with his defense. A defensive breakdown for the Nets as Landry Shamit got caught under the basket, and he was no match for DeAndre Ayton. Back the other way, though, Irving now, two for two. Yeah, just simple back-to-back pick-and-roll plays where Kyrie's the ball handler. Efficient use of the screen right into his jump shot. Just so pretty. Gliding to the goal, another bucket for Kyrie Irving off the shake-and-bake dribble. Come on now, Bob Mishusen. How good is this guy? Three touches, three buckets. Kyrie Irving is fouled, does not get the roll, but he will go back to the free-throw line. Speaking of which, Kyrie Irving with a chance for a three-point play. As Kyrie Irving has 14 of the Nets, 18 already here in the first quarter. Kaminsky, that's a brick. Kyrie Irving for three. Got it. Five quick ones by Brooklyn. The lead down to seven, and Monty Williams wants a timeout. <laughs> Kyrie Irving knocks down threes from three feet outside the arc. They are an impossible team to defend, and certainly even more impossible when Kevin Durant and James Harden are out there. And Durant hands it off to Kyrie. 
Coming up on a minute to go in the first half. Irving got caught along the baseline, but oh finds Jeff Green under the basket at the last moment. Down to the last 40 of the first half. Here's Durant in the mid-range, off the window, and perfect. Just playing at his own pace, never rushed. Kevin Durant, four for seven, nine points in seven minutes. Welcome back. As Kyrie Irving stays red hot. Irving does it again. Irving weaving in the lane with the left hand off the glass. Irving back outside, sets up Shamit for three. I cannot remember the number of lineups you said that they've started. 32 or 30 something, whatever it is. 32 different starting lineups, 27 different players. 27 different players. So, so unusual rotations as Kyrie just keeps cooking. Like communication. To me, on the defensive end of the floor, you can't over communicate. Uh, you know, say it loudly, say it long, say it early, just continue to talk. It's an underrated skill on the defensive end, it's communication. Irving to the corner. Tyler Johnson hits one right in front of the Nets bench. Could be a really good last nine minutes. Here's Kyrie Irving. Facing up on the defensive specialist, Javon Carter. Takes him in the lane and puts it down. There isn't a weapon that Kyrie doesn't have in his offensive arsenal. This Kyrie Irving gets under the bucket. Sets up Durant. Yes. Two of the big three that are in the lineup today, they have been the offensive story as Griffin lays one in off the bounce pass from Kyrie Irving as Irving continues to add to his eighth double-double of the season as that is his 11th assist to go along with 34 points. I think all things being equal and the Nets healthy, you know, when asked, I, I basically said I think Brooklyn can do it. Uh, three incredible late-game finishers as Joe Harris gets out in transition. I talked about it. Kevin Durant prides himself on that end of the floor. And then the finish on the other end. So Durant returns. He combines for 33 with the 34 of Kyrie Irving. And it is a win going away for Brooklyn. From Pfizer Forum, downtown Milwaukee, the Brooklyn Nets and the Milwaukee Bucks. And this is the third matchup of the year. The winner of this game wins the season series. So you got the Sixers leading the East. They've won five straight games. The Bucks right now, two back in the loss column, but a win tonight. Milwaukee will creep one back with the tiebreaker. Things getting very interesting in the Eastern Conference. And these two teams have played two tight games. Sluggish shooting to start this game for both teams. Only one made basket thus far as Irving gets it to go. Uh, I mean, you would expect a little bit of that because of the intensity that was played in that game a couple nights ago. Another finish by Kyrie Irving. Correct. Quick release on the three over Giannis. Three pointer down for KD. Holiday gives it to Giannis, who finds Tucker. That's his spot in the corner. Three pointers are falling for either of these teams thus far. The Bucks are one of seven from behind the arc. And now the Nets are two of five as Kyrie Irving delivers one. Drew Holiday working on Shamit. Got it to go. Drew Holiday is such an important new piece to the Bucks. He's been terrific all year. His game's really stepped up since the All-Star break. Count that basket. Giannis got it a little too late. Might have hit the window first. Certainly looked like it was on the way down. And that'll be a goal 10. Two-point game. Bucks with the lead. That's with the ball. First quarter action here between these two powers. Powerhouse franchises as Jeff Green delivers another three for Brooklyn and the Nets take the lead. Brooklyn, three more back to backs as well. There'll be a couple of days uh, between their consecutive sets of back to back and then the Milwaukee Bucks with seven games remaining out of that timeout. The Nets get a three ball, two ball, make it a long two. 25 22 as Kyrie Irving has a quick nine in this first quarter. Forbes gets around Claxton and fake with a pass hat. That one denied by Irving. Excellent defense by Kyrie Irving. We're all tied at 48. 
Kyrie Irving for three. Cavs. Remember, the, the seven and the eight seed will, will have two chances to win to play their way into the playoffs. The nine and ten seeds, it's one and done. Got that March Madness feel. Here's Shannon for three. That quick release line drive knocks it down, and it's tied at 55. Kyrie Irving cut off. And pounded inside. Holiday got the strip, but Irving recovers and scores. Holiday missed 10 games in February with health and safety protocols. He has been terrific since the All-Star break, averaging 19 a game as Kyrie Irving knocks down a jumper. Here's Kyrie Irving for three. Got it. Kyrie nails another one. That's his third made three, Jimmy. He's got 20 to join Kevin Durant with 20. Kyrie Irving from Durant with an answer. Well, you know what, B.A.? Big fella in the studio. 2000-2001, the Lakers were ranked 22nd in defensive efficiency, okay? But they had Kobe in check. <laughs> so that made up for a lot of defensive errors that they weren't getting. So it can be done. Now, it's a different error, more possession. The three-point line is more relevant. But it's the ability for guys when they need to tighten it up. Can they do it? And are they going to be committed to being a smidget better defensive? Kyrie Irving, strong finish off the window. Giannis has scored nine in this third quarter. Had 11 in the first, scored 10 in the second. As Kyrie Irving, count that basket. A foul on Kyrie Irving. He'll go to the line, a chance at a three-point play. Nets have covered a 10-point deficit, which has been the biggest lead of this game. Nets' biggest lead is five in this one. That's a three-pointer, and Kyrie Irving hits another for Brooklyn. Back in front go the Nets by two. Brooklyn had a lead going into this fourth quarter. But only lost once with leading after three. But they are down now, down 11. Oh, what a shot by Kyrie Irving, high off the window, late clock just before the buzzer there, and Kyrie Irving brings him back within nine. You see how he can score quickly, and speaking about that, see, that's the ball movement for Brooklyn. They get that, you get those type of shots. But the Bucs win this two-game series in Milwaukee, and Jimmy... The Bucs go 124-118, and Giannis in the three games against Brooklyn this year, averaging just shy of 40 points a game. On a beautiful 82-degree night in Dallas, this is the American Airlines Center, the home of the Dallas Mavericks. The NBA on TNT is presented to you by State Farm. The Mavericks facing the Brooklyn Nets. Game one of our Thursday night doubleheader. Irving gets the roll on a three-pointer. Irving played by Hardaway. He fires from deep and hits. All right, Kyrie Irving with his third field goal, three of four. Griffin left open for three again. Jeff Green has come on for the Nets as uh, Irving somehow got that shot off. Looked like he was about to be tied up. There's Irving on the drive. Double team got it off and able to bank it home. What a move by Kyrie Irving. right back yes and the foul so Kyrie will be looking for point number 18 as he goes to the line Dallas up by two and a three-pointer by uh, Kyrie Irving gives the Mets a one-point lead there's Kyrie with a strong drive to the rim five on the shot clock beautiful pass for Brown Here's Irving out of the drive and gets the roll. What a half for Kyrie Irving. 25 points, 10 of 14 from the field.
And that's a three for Kyrie Irving, who leads the way with 28 points. Now five for seven from three-point land. Richardson swings in, ball knocked out of his hands, and picked up by Shabbat. Irving cuts to his right, then left, and set it up for the dunk by Griffin. Here's Doncic with a three. So he's gone cold. Doncic has missed his last six shots. Irving. Nice move off the dribble. Irving with a series of moves and then puts it home. Kyrie Irving with 32 points. Nice move by Kyrie. for a three-point play. Doncic, played by Durant. Doncic in the paint. Doncic hits. Irving down the lane and a foul. Down to a four-point lead for the Dallas Mavericks. 45 seconds to go. Oh, beautiful drive. Brunson going to the bucket, and his Mavericks are up by six. 14 seconds to go in the fourth quarter. Here's Irving for three, yes. And that's 45 points, a season high for Kyrie Irving. And uh, that should wrap it. Whoa. So, final score, Dallas 113, the Nets 109. We welcome you to TD Garden in Boston, Massachusetts. These are the 2021 NBA Playoffs. Tonight, Game 4 Eastern Conference First Round Series. The Brooklyn Nets lead the Boston Celtics two games to one. Irving is fouled. Heads up play from Kyrie Irving. He will head to the free throw line at the 1038 mark of this first quarter. Smart hot hand continues. It does. Another tray for Marcus Smart. He went five of eight from three point territory the other night. Irving aggressive on his drive to the hole. Tatum missed it on the interior. Here's Kyrie pull up three bottom. Irving with a deep shot. Smart, short. Rebound, corralled by Irving. Pep in his step. Irving attacks, blocked by Smart. Foul called, he got the call on the inside. Irving has dealt with the taunts these last two games in Boston. Chorus of boos every time he touches the ball. Irving lets it fly. Count it for three. Ball movement. A three from Smart. Rebounded by Irving. Kyrie. The handles. The left-handed finish. Kyrie Irving is a magician. The handles just so pretty. Oh, crossover. The scoop. The roll. Irving. The jumper. Bullseye. Kyrie Irving from downtown. Harden, Cutter, Kyrie. Off the hesitation, hangs and hits. Gets the angle off the glass. What a play. Boston thinks that those three guys are just going to stay posted up outside the arc, and Kyrie makes the quick cut. Yes, God! Toss back, Kyrie Irving gets upstairs. He and Blake Griffin work a two-man game, and the Nets are really putting it to the Celtics here in game four. And there was a tentativeness in game three, where 
Kyrie trying to get involved. That has not been the case. From the opening tip, Kyrie has been fully immersed in this one. Another Boston turnover as the Nets take it away. Second time in Nets playoff history they've ever had 100 through three quarters. The first time was game two of this series. Kyrie Irving! The Nets are in a different dimension offensively. Kyrie Irving. Rain dance. Irving. Oh, yeah. Kyrie locked in. 37 for Kyrie Irving tonight at TD Garden. Shot clock winding down. Harden pulls up. Tip in goes. It's Kyrie Irving. 39 for Irving, 135 for Brooklyn. The most in Nets playoff history. That's it. A major bounce back from Brooklyn. They take a 3-1 lead in the series, and they take care of business in Boston. You know, unfortunately, we have seen issues around the NBA with fans crossing the line. Somebody tossed a water bottle, and it nearly hit Kyrie as he was walking to the tunnel. Tyler Johnson noticed it and the Nets began to point out who it was in that section. There are cameras everywhere so you're going to see the toss right there. It just misses Kyrie. This is as the Nets were exiting Kevin Durant was doing the interview with Michael Grady and security began to converge and look for the guilty party. Obviously completely unnecessary and just flat out stupid. Yeah, it's an absolute shame. It's time for the Brooklyn Nets facing off against the Milwaukee Bucks. Packed crowd at the Pfizer Forum home of the Bucks. Pretty cold night in Milwaukee as they venture in to watch some NBA basketball. Irving goes inside and banks it home. Feet inside, Irving, nice dish, and Drummond, the strong finish. Irving on the pull up. Kyrie Irving knocks it down. Irving hasn't played in two weeks. Oh, nice hesitation from Irving. Gets inside, draws contact, banks it home, and the foul. I tell you what, if the mayor of New York City changed the rules, it's going to make Steve Nash a better coach. Wesley Matthews on Irving. They're letting him play. There's been a lot of contact in this one. Edwards pass inside. Tough turnaround, high harking shot from Kyrie Irving. Hey, he's a tremendous offensive player. It's a joke. Irving's jumper, got it. Kyrie Irving now 13 points in 13 minutes. Irving, nice <laughs> turnaround. He's got 15 now. Matthews up into Irving. Find some room, find some space. And Did you see the rim? Oh, oh. Did you see the move? What is going on? Wow, this is against big time defense, eliminates him, gets by, and then the escape dribble, step to the side, nothing but net. And a great cut by Irving and a nice pass by Johnson. James Johnson knocks down that three. He has the strangest rotation on his three point shot. It's just unbelievable, guys. When you think about the legends that you know, were celebrated and rightfully so moment to say thank you to some of the best to ever do it as Drummond catches that and that's how quickly people forget just how good like someone like Moses Malone is well, one year he averaged 31 points and 15 rebounds a game played 42 minutes a night the next year 25 points and 18 rebounds a game so he knocks that down and he played 41 minutes a night just one of the all-time greats Brown wide open hits a three Brown now with 12 points. That's his second three-pointer as Irving drives and finishes. Nine of his 26 have come here in this third period. Harry Irving, nice adjustment, flips it up and in. Now Curry's tied up with five to shoot. Finds Irving. Irving looking for some room. Falling away. Baseline is good as he falls down. 30 for Irving. Kyrie Irving gets free. Three-pointer. It's good. Brooklyn back up by one. Giannis on the drive. Gets inside. Blocked by Drummond. Andre Drummond rejects it out of bounds. What a defensive play. Portis back in. Lob it in at Tudacupo. Portis shot blocked again. This time James Johnson and a foul on Milwaukee. Just a great defensive play and avoiding Matthews 
High arcing shot at Tedekupo, turns, fires a three. Oh, off the back of the rim. Had a decent look at it, and Brooklyn holds on and gets the huge road win. Sunday in Boston ended in disappointment for Kyrie Irving and the Nets. But there is no rest for the weary or for the playoff hungry. Tonight in Charlotte, Kevin Durant and Brooklyn going right back at it. It's the Nets against the Hornets in their second of three meetings this season. And it's time for Nets on ES. Irving tries to jitter free, finds Brown. Brown will bank it home. What a beautiful pass from Kyrie Irving. And what a tough shot finished by Bruce Brown. Irving, catch, fire, and connect from deep. Irving cuts inside, dances free, and lays it in. Gorgeous wizardry from Kyrie Irving. Rogic attacking, dishing, extra feed. How about Irving? On a three. Here's Irving. Irving dancing, taking. He gets fouled. Back to the line goes Kyrie Irving. Irving will fire and hit from three. Kyrie is locked in. He has 17 points on just five field goal attempts. Irving will fire. You bet. Kyrie with 20 already in this first half. Durant goes cross court. Irving fingertips it in on a cross court pass from Durant. What a three from Irving. We were able to attack them in transition and then went into half court. We were able to touch the paint, kick it out, spray it out to our shooters. Irving finds Drummond for the easy finish. Curry slicing through, kicking out. Irving, oh yeah. Kyrie with 28 points. He's six of seven from downtown. Irving wants it. You bet. Kyrie is putting on a show. 7-3 on eight attempts. He has 31. Here's Irving. Gets it back to Dragic. He will take and hit from three. And a timeout taken by Charlotte. Big triple from Goran Dragic. Irving. With Rozier, his former teammate on him. Irving puts it in. 33 for Kyrie Irving. What's going to be key for Steve Nash and Brooklyn here in this frame? Same things that were key from the start. It wasn't a, a secret formula that changed throughout the course of that third quarter. It was just a lot of better looks for him. And you have that guy. And that helps. Kyrie has been sensational. 37. He's 8 for 10 from 3. Irving, good hands. Comes up with a steal. Irving. Racing into the paint, Irving able to finish. 39 for Kyrie Irving, a new season high. Irving, he's the great equalizer. 42 for Kyrie and his ninth three of the evening. Curry will fire and hit. Irving will fire a deep one. Oh, he's fouled and will shoot three nearly. Had a chance for four. Screen from Drummond. Irving, no look to the corner. Mills, cash. Irving, five to shoot. Irving trying to get some space. Two to shoot. Irving elevates and hits. He's a magician. 46 for Irving. None bigger than those two. Bridges pull up three. Short. Offensive board. Oubre, no. And Brown grabs it, Irving pushing. Irving gets fouled by Harrell, and Kyrie is going to go to the line to shoot two. Irving closing in on his third 50-point game with the Nets. He now has 48, and more importantly for Brooklyn, it's a 17-point lead. Bridges will fire short. And Irving blasting ahead with Durant. Durant to the rim, that's a goaltend. And that might be the dagger. Irving. Brown fakes, dishes, Kyrie going for the 50 piece. Irving has 50! A 50 point barrage from Kyrie Irving. See the ovation now for Irving and Durant. A lot of Nets fans in the building and Kyrie 
His fifth career 50-point game, his third with the Knicks. Brooklyn with an absolutely must-win performance in Charlotte tonight. 132-121 the final as the Nets snap their four-game losing streak and leapfrog the Hornets in the Eastern Conference play-in standing. Kyrie, your fifth career 50-point game. Given where you guys are in the standings, how much time is left in the season, how special was this performance for you? I mean, it was special all the way around. I mean, we started off the game with a great result, a uh, great game plan, and we just played aggressive the whole game. That's what feels good out here. And, uh, you know, you just want to really put your stamp on the game early and then be able to just play the game the right way. And that's what we did tonight. How big was this? You know, you talk about the sense of urgency and how important this was coming off a four-game losing streak to put the stamp on this game the way that you guys did early. We need it. We need, every, we need everybody, man. It's a total team effort. It's not about one individual. You know, great performance, but it's really about the team and us collectively getting better. What's it going to take the rest of the way to get where you guys want to be? Uh, patience, you know, on our off days to get better. But then when we step on this floor, just have fun and play free. 50 point game for Kyrie Irving. Thank you so much. Right? All right, Michael. Kyrie with a brilliant performance. Not only did he score 50, he did it on 19 field goal attempts. The man is a savant. 15 of 19 from the floor. One more time. A look at the bucket that gave him the 50 piece. We'll be back to wrap it up after a big Nets win. We turn our attention to the Sunshine State, and because we're on the road, Kyrie Irving will play tonight. He's ready to rock and roll. Kevin Durant trying to twirl the Nets into a victory. Yes, Network proud to present Brooklyn Nets basketball. There's the opening tip, and we are underway. Kyrie Irving doing the same. Triple from Kyrie Irving. 12 guys on this roster, 24 or younger. It's Kyrie Irving. Two for two from long range. Irving on the drive. The pass! Bruce Brown with the flush. That's nasty. Here's a rare appearance from Tesla Edwards who checked in the ball game during that free throw from KD. Kyrie gets it back. Three-pointer in the corner. He's three for three from three. Not to mention starting that off on the defensive end, turning defense into offense. Kyrie Irving. Timeout Orlando. 6.06 to go in this opening quarter. Nets leading 23-16. Obama again playing well, shooting the three well. Only 36%. Kyrie Irving. Oh. Here comes Kyrie Irving. 14 points already. Hey. Drummond, great position inside. Bucket and the foul. Irving working on Carter Jr. Swish. You see that look from Carter? Like, I did, I did my best. I don't know what you want me to do. Kyrie Irving, good to see. Back on the floor. No issue with the hand as he finishes off the window for the Duke. Michael waving his own right. Kyrie Irving to give him the continuation. What a play from Kyrie Irving. He is up to 23 points. And backdoor cut there. Make it 25. Oh, he's halfway to 50. Irving, crossover, inside, left hand. A magic trick. Timeout, Orlando. Oh, the mini from Kyrie Irving. He's up to 31 in the first half. Just an unbelievable performance from Kyrie Irving. His window Carter Jr. can't get that to fall. Rebound Drummond. But similar... Irving had 30 and a half. Uh, as he pulled up again and knocks down the three. Kyrie Irving. Again. <laughs> Cash App. <laughs> again. Are you kidding me? Airway center getting the show. 39 for Kai. Did I say 60? But well, let's let's push that up to 80. And Kevin Durant encouraging this crowd to get on their feet. A standing ovation on the road.
Kyrie Irving with 39. We still have 2.24 to go in this first half. Are you not entertained? And a turnover there. Irving on the move, going at Hampton off balance. It won't fall, but it'll go to the free throw line. It's a 19-point game. Nets have led by as many as 30, and there's a foul. Count the bucket. Kyrie Irving up to 45. Here comes Brooklyn Brown. The Durant inside Brown in a little bit of trouble. Quick release. Kyrie Irving, 48, and counting. Irving on the move, looking for 50. Off the window! Listen to this random crowd dazzled by this magnificent display from Kyrie Irving. Watching Kyrie Irving in this performance, the way this crowd is getting into it, and what a pass to Nick Claxton. Kyrie Irving back in the ball game, and he's still hot. 53. I know these fans came in wanting to see a Magic win, but you're basketball fans first and foremost. And you're getting a show. Kyrie Irving, 55. Irving on the move through a triple team, and he's fouled. Kyrie Irving has just matched Darren Williams for the most points in a single game in Nets history. And he's doing it in 34 minutes and getting it done on the defensive side of the ball. The quick hands. Edwards, the handoff. Quick trigger, Irving, 60! 60! Kyrie Irving! And he gets another standing ovation here at the Amway Center. Phones out. Fans on their feet. Kyrie Irving has electrified this building. This is nasty. I mean, watch the quickness of Kyrie's movements, this shot. Take a look. Woo! Bottoms. This has been a sight to see and just a gorgeous display of all the talents that we've continued to watch throughout the course of Kyrie's career, putting them all out there. Immediately pointing to the bench, had a moment with Kevin Durant. Special, special evening here that we all are getting to witness. That's four wins in a row, and what a statement tonight. 150 to 108, highlighted by the masterful performance from Kyrie Irving. 60 points, 20 for 31 from the floor, eight three-pointers, and sets a career high and sets a new franchise mark for points in a single game. Kyrie Irving is said to put on a headset right now. Masterful performance. Kyrie, uh, the, the fans chanting your name, just a, a special performance. How did it feel to be in the zone? Once again, you had 50 a week ago, but to put up 60 tonight. No, I felt good. Uh, you know, I think it, it really is a testament to the way that we've been gelling as a team and us just giving each other confidence and doing the right things. And when you could get 60 in the flow of a game and it doesn't seem forced and you're not putting up a, a, few, a few too many <laughs> bad shots and, uh, you know, you come to the bench and guys are supporting you and telling you to go after the record, then, you know, that makes basketball well worth it. We were we were mentioning during the broadcast, you know, Kevin was giving you a round of applause at your 50 <laughs> a week ago. You had a front row seat watching Kevin put up 53 yeah. yesterday and to have 60. Is there just a friendly, I mean, there's a brotherhood, obviously, but you're <laughs> one up in each other now. Yeah, no, nah, that, that's what it's about. As you see across the league, guys are just, you know, putting up crazy numbers. But when you have uh, two guys on the same team competing like that, friendly <laughs> competition, brotherly competition, of course we talk about it, but we really just want to be savants of this. We, we don't use that word lightly. You know, we, we take the game serious. We want to be efficient with it. We want everybody to feel good do it on the defensive end first, and uh, really prove to every team in the league that we're not only better conditioned, but we can be very efficient offensively and defensively. So that's what it's about. Do you feel it in your first couple of shots that it's going to be a special night? 
sometimes. <laughs> sometimes, <laughs> other times, probably not. But, um, you know, the ball was swinging, the ball was hopping, and Steve was calling my number and, you know, just making a few easy plays and uh, just getting in the paint of the defense and doing what I do. Have you ever had an opposing crowd giving you a standing ovation? Uh, in the second, they did it a handful of times. Kyle. Yeah, not, not too many. Not too many times like this. This is probably the first time it's ever happened. I'm just grateful that we had a support of the league. But, of course, when you're supporting the Nets, it feels even better. And uh, this is what the game is about, just uh, bringing the love and just performing well and doing with a humble approach. You put grateful. on the show tonight. Thank, Thank you so much. Thank you See so much. Kyrie Irving, 60 points on the evening. The Nets, their fourth win in a row. And listen to this crowd as Kyrie Irving exit the floor. It's the Brooklyn Nets facing off against the Memphis Grizzlies as we head in the home stretch of the NBA regular season playoffs. Not that far away, and we can't wait. <laughs> now, how about this guy? Well, Kyrie Irving, let's face it, we all know how great he is as a scorer. He's averaging 27 points, and... He only has played 19 games. I emphasize the 36 minutes. Everybody worries about him being out of shape. No, don't worry about this guy. This guy is magical. Irving fires away three-pointer. That's good. Kyrie Irving from downtown. Well, we said to you early on, 49% from the field, 45 and threes, 90% from the line. Brown gets inside. How does he do that at 6'4"? This guy off the bench is very, very valuable because a lot of times this year they play he and Moran together. Kyrie Irving on the pull-up. Anderson back out, Melton another three. Irving gets a running start. Look out here now. Look at him push the ball, gets inside, oh. banks it home, and a foul. Sensational move from Kyrie Irving. Well, I, I didn't you, think Clark touched it as Irving knocks down that shot. Kyrie Irving, yeah. just a smooth jumper. I want to tell you, that was, that was, that's difficult to do. As Irving drives, kicks it back out. Durant fires away, knocks down the three. <laughs> Speaking of looking sharp once again, Kyrie Irving drills the three. You can't average over 25 assists a game, and it's beautiful to watch. They have 70 points with three minutes to go without <laughs> Irving does it again without John Moran. Irving throws it up for Andre Drummond. Nice. Drummond, nice catch and put back. He's got 12 points. I see right now you look up. It's a six. Uh, you look at it. Close game. <laughs> oh, oh. Irving flips it up and in. Durant finds Irving. Irving fires away. Oh. Three-pointer is good from Irving. Another unbelievably efficient night. 10 of 16. He's got 29 points. Irving, corner three. Puts oh, it in. Boy. And the foul. Kyrie Irving nails it. It's a four-point game. And a chance for a four-point play. Yeah, they're having a tough time oh. right now. How do you set up a defense no, for that? I, look, I, you, just, just think about what he's done here tonight. He's played 33 minutes. Irving on the drive, gets inside, banks it home. 38 for Kyrie Irving. The physical play now of Memphis has controlled the way the game is going. Not only with the misses by Brooklyn, but also the forced turnover. Irving on the pull up. 40 points for Irving, so the last two games he scored 100. <laughs> oh, Claxton, tough catch, a little behind him. Irving responds with a three-pointer of his own. His sixth three-pointer. He's got 43 points. Well, the second best record in the NBA just got better. Taylor Jenkins team now 50 and 23. 25 and 10 here at home. Desmond Bain, some big shots. He had 23. Seven players scoring double figures. And even without the great John Moran, they win by 12 over a Brooklyn team that saw Kevin Durant and Kyrie Irving combine for 78 points. It's springtime in Brooklyn tonight from Barkley Center. The Nets trying to get back into the win column. Kevin Durant has been unstoppable of late, including a double nickel in Atlanta. Nets wrapping up their season series with the Houston Rockets. In fact, the last game they play against a Western Conference opponent. We've got it for you right here on Yes. Irving wins in on a three ball. On the lead feed for Irving. Head of steam. Irving. Atlantic. Irving connects from deep. Irving, pull up. Oh, yeah! A three! 11 points.
from Kyrie Irving. Irving got a three. Irving. Oh, a thing of beauty from Kyrie Irving. Irving fires and hits. From Kyrie Irving. Nets in a hurry. Irving, jumper, yes, a three. Irving has scored 25. The handles, the kick. Thomas, bottom. A three for the run. Somebody needs to break the seal. Is it Irving? Yes. Jump shot, Martin. Can't hit the three. Rebound by Mills. Up ahead, Irving. Pull up. Wow! Shangun with Irving. The fake, the lean, the steal for Drummond. Irving, oh, skimmer, first round, major highlight on a chef's kiss from Kyrie. Irving using the Drummond screen. Oh, Irving. This is too pretty. That is artwork at its best. 36 for Kyrie Irving. Irving against the big. Irving drives, slicing to the rim for two, and a foul. 39 for Kyrie Irving. A minute and change away from wrapping it up. Kyrie, a dagger three. And the Nets get a pivotal victory against the Rockets, 118 to 105. And the Eastern Conference standings are shifting every night. Beasley lets it fly again. That one sidewinds. Mark and able to save it from right to Irving. He leads Harris. Joe had a really nice shooting night last night. Irving short, follows it up, stops, fades, hits. Nice job by Irving, continue to pursue that. Irving separates, fires, and hits from three. Harris. Irving with five points, four rebounds already, and knocks down that J silky smooth. O'Neal looking to work Clarkson. Clarkson able to save it. Kyrie, shot clock reset, won't matter. Claxton quickly takes care of it. You know, what a heads up play. Nice job by Kyrie getting it to Claxton on the inside. Irving has gotten off to a hot start. Four of five from the floor, and he is two of three from three. Irving, you bet. Kyrie is feeling it. Irving able to finish. And it's a beautiful finish by Irving, but a glaring discrepancy here with a tie ball game. The Nets have yet to take a free throw. Irving doing what he can. 18 now for Kyrie. Scoreboard had it as the Nets were already in the bonus, but clearly they were not as Irving drops in another 20 and a half for Kyrie Irving after he scored 21 in the fourth quarter last night. Simmons shovels, Irving dishes, Claxton flushes. Beautiful play by Irving. He saw it the entire time. Simmons on the push. You get a stop, create a turnover, get to go on the run. Irving trying to evade two, left it short, follows it up, gets it back. Harris knocks it down from three. Beasley off on a three. Irving comes up with a rebound, his sixth. Irving insisting his way and finishing. Nets take the lead back. Irving rattles in a three. Clarkson leaves it short, got it back, put it in. Jordan Clarkson bouncing like a bunny. Down the other end, Irving finishes.
dishes on the serve from O'Neal. Speaking of bunnies, Kyrie getting up a dime by Royce O'Neal. Irving twists and hits. Kyrie continue to take over, but when you think about closing games, Durant is that dude, but now there's an opportunity for these players to figure out how to do that. Wow, my goodness. The separation is profound. I know. Rebound Brooklyn. Here comes Irving. He will pull. And hit. Kyrie is here. Irving fending off and finishing. Irving fires and knocks it down again. Crowd rising to its feet. Irving, you bet. Kyrie with the silencer. 15 in the frame, 42 on the night, and the Nets take the lead back. Big possession here, Irving, again! Kyrie in his own dimension, 45 for Kai. Timeout, Utah. That is his shot, the right wing, sidestep. Oh, give us more, Kyrie. Irving dishes, Curry, again! Seth Curry in the corner, trying to drive the Nets to the finish line. Kyrie will dribble it out. A Herculean effort from Kyrie Irving tonight. As the Nets pick up a win they were desperate for in Utah. Ah! As we sit in for what could be a heavyweight fight, the top two scorers in the NBA ready to step onto the big stage where their team's looking to make a late season statement with the playoff chase starting to heat up. American Airlines Center in Dallas for the Mavericks and the 76ers ready to get it on tonight. And we have it for you here on TNT. Second night of a back-to-back -back for the Sixers. They didn't get into town until about 1.30 in the morning. How do they fare against a Mavericks team that is going to be motivated to say the least and a good start for Kyrie as he hits his first mid-range jumper. Doncic the kick, Irving wide open. I mean, think about this. When's the last time Kyrie has had a wide open look like mm -hmm. that? And that's because of, of Luka. This is what makes it easier. Yes, look at Kyrie, look at look at lefty that. scoop and finger beauty. But you see how quick that move was? As Irving, boy, he is motivated and he is starting to cook here at the start. Ten for Kyrie. I felt a year ago he came into camp, he wasn't in the best of shape, and I kind of got on him. He got into shape as the season went on, and they went on a run to the Western Conference Final. Irving, brief little rest to close the quarter. Oh, no. Irving <laughs> taking him to the schoolyard. <laughs> Team that's in the mix as well. But doing it without LeBron James, he would be reevaluated after three weeks on the foot injury. So Melton back to his reserve role for his second straight night. He's got eight points off the bench. Irving! <laughs> My goodness! Lowest scoring average for Tobias Harris. Have to go all the way back to 2015. As Irving catches and shoot, splash! Kyrie takes the reins. Green left open. That's good! Okay, now the question, which of these two teams can tighten the clamps a little bit with their defense? Irving. Just magical. Stephanie, we're with you. We're all mesmerized by what we're seeing. Just unbelievable. Maxi going off glass, and they continue to trade punches. Irving. And the loose change corralled by Powell. Doncic. Irving. Splash. Mavericks have hit their first four shots to begin the second half. This is Bullock from the corner, oh, yeah. and they still can't miss. Kyrie carving them up, looking for more. Oh, Splits oh, two. Oh, he just can't be stopped. Remember, he took a little flag for not calling timeouts in the second half of that game against the Lakers. He called a couple, and here that is Irving putting him on his back. Dallas to go on a little. You know, 7-0 run and get this back to double digits. This is Irving against Maxi. He'll launch. My goodness. Bad pass by Harden. 
Ahead of the field, Green taking flight. Boy, Kyrie getting on the glass. Transition three. He has been magnificent. And then Kyrie sandwiched, and he's going to shoot free throws. Just incredible. What was a frantic final push for the Sixers. But it's still concerning. I mean, to be up 27 and lose to the Lakers and to be up 25, you got to do a better job of protecting leads. As it is over here in Dallas.